good YouTube? Now what I need to hear back again once again and tonight people tonight we are here for episode one of Late Night Crystal. Late Night Crystal is a Pokemon Crystal randomized Nuzlocke. More on that in a moment. But yes, this is episode one of a brand new playthrough, a brand new adventure here on the channel. If you are new here to the channel, traditionally we are very loud and boisterous. Um, but the whole theme of the late night series, how many entries do you need to make it a series? Uh, this is our second late night series here on the channel. Uh, and all that means is that it's a little bit more chill, a little bit more laid back, relaxed. Um, it is recorded at night, it is uploaded at night. Um, and the whole point is just like some late night chill retro Pokemon. Um, but we are nuzlocking this. We are nuzlocking this. So if you guys are hyped to begin a new adventure here on the channel, if you guys are hyped for some late night crystal, and of course, we want to show you supporters of Proud of the Nappy Nation. Make sure to like the button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Now, let's get this started before the music re starts. <laughs> Now, I did mention uh, in Late Night Yellow that I did want to do a, was it Late Night Yellow or was it Platinum that I mentioned I wanted to do a set playthrough? I think we're going to try it on this one. I think we're going to see how far we can get. We're going to see how far we can get. When I was a kid, I don't know why I always chose this frame right here. Don't ask me why. I think it's probably just like the most different. Out of all, no, we're gonna go with this one. This is the one we going with right here. Right here, I love it. <laughs> I love it already. Are you a boy or are you a girl? Okay, so check it out. Um, a lot of you guys, <sighs> this, is, this is how late night's gonna go. A lot of you guys were saying you were offering up suggestions for different Pokemon Crystal ROM hacks. This is the part that I was talking about earlier when I said, Late Night Crystal is a crystal randomized Nuzlocke. We'll get back to more of that in a moment. So a lot of you guys are offering different suggestions for ROM hacks. And I checked out a lot of them. And there were two or three of them that I bookmarked and are definitely in the future projects playlist. Um, but at a certain point, you know, it just wasn't working out. It wasn't doing the things that I wanted it to do. And it was far beyond my, my comprehension of how to correct it. So in, in just my confusion, this, this clear light just shown from above and I was like you know what the whole point in this is to play the old school games the randomizer and the nuzlocke is just a little bit of something to shake it up so we're just gonna play Pokemon Crystal bada bang bada boom but we have a surprise in store for you so buckle up huh huh what you woke me up will you check the clock for me what time is it so I'm gonna set it to day I'm going to set it to the actual time it is right now. What? Night? 10 o'clock? Oh my god, I didn't even think about the day night. Oh my god, this is going to be dope as fuck. Because every episode is going to be at night in the game. <laughs> I love it. Okay, so it's 10.56 right now, but I'm going to make it 10.57 because it'll probably be like 10.57. Oh, it just happened. It just happened. Never mind. <laughs> no wonder it's so dark. I was going to say in like 20 seconds it'll be 10.57, but oh, it happened right then and there. Hello. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon. People in Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon. Some people battle with them. Oh, some battle with them. But we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. <laughs> now, what did you say your name was? Oh, <laughs> Alan John? Nah. It's gotta be all caps or no caps at all. No, wait. <laughs> Mary, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. I'll be seeing you later. I like how they start this game off with Professor Oak. So, I wanted to get this out of the way. So when we did Late Night Yellow, I could not remember everything that 
I randomized the game. <laughs> like all the settings that I changed, and you remember we had to figure it out as we went. Ah, oh, good times, great times. So I wrote it all down. I'm going to include it in the description of, at the very least, this episode, but I'm going to write it all down. We changed Impossible Evos. We randomized uh, Trade Pokemon, Wild Pokemon, Static Pokemon, Trainers Pokemon. Um, we have it set so the rival carries a starter throughout the game. Um, level 40 is forced fully evolved. So at level 40, it, we're not going to run into like Weedles anymore. It'll be a Beedrill by default. I don't know why Weedle and Beedrill is the first thing that came to mind. But anyways, if we run into a level 40, it's going to be a Tyranitar and not a Larvitar. And it's just for trainers, not Wild Pokemon. Anyways. Um, the big one is we have a 30% percentage modifier, so all the levels for all the trainers in the game will be increased by 30%. So, that's gonna be a doozy. Oh, and we put it on set two? Oh, that's gonna be easy. Never mind. Did I say doozy? I meant easy. TMs are randomized, move tutors randomized, field items are randomized, and the catching tutorial is randomized. So, pretty basic stuff, but I don't know. You know, I, I wanted to jot down everything that was important. You know, everything I wanted to mention. Damn, you got shit in here. Everything that I wanted to mention, I just ended up jotting everything down. So, either way. Oh, Navi, our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted you to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear's back from the repair shop. Here you go. Pokemon gear. Pokemon gear, or just Poke gear. It's essential if you want to be a good trainer. Oh, the day of the week isn't set. You mustn't forget that. What day is it? What day is it? It's Thursday. All right. Thursday, is it? Is it daylight savings time now? I live in Arizona. We don't observe daylight savings time. 11 p.m., is that okay? It surely is. Come home to adjust your clock for daylight savings time. By the way, do you know how to use the phone? Yes. Don't you just turn the Poke gear on and select the phone icon? Phone numbers are stored in memory. Just choose a name you want to call. She isn't that convenient. Wow. I like how I said yes and she still explained it to me. Good evening, Nappy. I'm visiting. Nappy, have you heard? My daughter is adamant about becoming Professor Elm's assistant. She really loves Pokemon. Oh, you mean like you're visiting from like across the street? I thought she meant, like, from another part of town. Yo, Nappy, I hear Professor Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Oh, boy. I wonder what's on the far side of the pond in town. Did I mention to you guys that this episode is an hour of chill? <laughs> I probably should have mentioned that at the start of the episode. Uh, yes, it is, in fact, an hour of chill. Hey, bro, 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 what you doing up here, dog? So this is the f oh no 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 oh no. <laughs> so he will be our star screen because I cannot think of a better fitting voice for Silver than Star Screen. So this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What what are you staring at? Chill Star Screen, okay. Get off my back. Get off my back. Um, but yes, we have an hour of chill. Oh, we have an hour of chill tonight. Traditionally on the channel, we have hours of power. But here on our late night series, it's an hour of chill. So every 10th episode will be an hour of chill. First one being our starting episode, hour of chill. So next couple episodes all the way through number 9 will just be whatever. And then number 10 will be an hour of chill. And then we'll have 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and then we'll have a hour chill. So, we'll see what ends up happening. <laughs> I'm happy. There you are. I needed to ask you a favor. I'm conducting new Pokemon research right now. I was wondering if you could help me with it, Nappy. You see, I'm writing a paper that I want to present at a conference, but there are some things I don't quite understand yet. So... I'd like you to raise a Pokemon that I recently caught. Thanks, Nappy. You're a great help. When I announce my findings, I'm sure we'll delve a bit deeper into the many mysteries of Pokemon. You can count on it. 
Oh, hey, I got an email. Uh-huh. Okay. Hey, listen. <laughs> I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this time, it's real. Is <laughs> it? Wait. What does that, what does that mean? He just be bullshitting with you the rest of the time? Yo, bro, I found this meteorite. It's not a meteorite. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Oh, wait, I know. Nappy, can you go in our place? I want you to raise one of the Pokemon contained in these balls. You'll be the f Pokemon's first partner, Nappy. Go on, pick one. The wrapper from the snack Professor O made is in there. Damn. How many more generations of Pokemon do we need to have before that is a starter option? <laughs> so we're going to check out our starter options here. What are the odds? So you'd like Chikorita? No. Think it over carefully. Your partner is important. What are the odds? Chikorita and Totodile? Did I randomize this? So if you guys tuned in to Late Night Yellow, you may remember that I asked you guys on episode number 20 who your favorite, absolute favorite, favorite, favorite surviving team member was on Late Night Yellow. And there was a resounding tidal wave of support for a certain seafaring pirate. And I figured, you know, it's late night series. We're going to keep going as we go. It's chill. It's whatever. And I think that we should make a little tradition here on the late night series. I think for every game that we beat, we should add like a like a perk, a power up, a buff or whatever, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to let you guys choose the next one. You know, cross my heart, hope to die. When we get towards the end of Crystal here, I'm going to let you guys choose what we have for uh, Crystal to whatever the next late night series may be. I'm just ruining everything, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Spoiler alert. The whole beginning of the episode. Uh, Y'all have been here long enough. You should already know how things go. Uh, but this time around, in honor of us defeating late night yellow, You'll take Kingler. I think that's a great Pokemon too. Okay, now cross your fingers. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Cross your fingers. It's a male. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, we might have a Lady Winston in this one. But yes, Winston the Pirate is going to be joining us on this playthrough as our starter. Now, I, I thought, <laughs> should I? put him in the game like with his full move set and everything and i thought no nah, that's kind of whack we should at the very least build him up again you know winston the pirate is here he is going to be our starter this time around um uh, so this would be I, I want you guys to know that like these little perks or whatever they're going to stack as we go so like if we can make it through this whole game with winston and you guys are like fuck yeah let's keep it going Winston might be our option in whatever our next late night game will be, but for now, we're getting way ahead of ourselves. We got two regions to beat. <laughs> <laughs> That's just how my brain works. It just starts and goes and I can't stop it. But yes, we're going to choose Kingler as our starter. Mr. Pokemon lives a bit beyond Cherry Grove, the next city over. It's almost a direct route there, so you can't miss it. But just in case, here's my phone number. Call me if anything comes up. Thank you, bro. Appreciate the assistance.
I do. I do, I do, I do. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should heal it with this machine. Feel free to use it anytime. Nappy, I'm counting on you. Can I go now, bro? Thank you. Okay, so just a friendly reminder. Our Nuzlocke doesn't start until we get Blubogi Balls. Wait, do we even have a Pokedex? We don't have a Pokedex. Pokedex and Pokeballs. But we have an item on Winston. How you doing, buddy? Welcome back. Bubble, Leer, and Vice Grip. He's holding TM25. Okay. Well, I did have the foresight to make our list this time around. So we're about to find out what TM25 is right here right now. Wait, 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 wait. Episode 1, very first time we look at him. Marvel at his attack. Marvel at it. Oh my god, look at that attack. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, yeah, 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 yeah. <sighs> okay, I need that item, bro. Uh, because I need to know, um, excuse me, <laughs> I need to know what it is. me okay I'm gonna jot that down right now we have sacred fire that's TM25 that's not a that's not a bad thing to have I definitely would not say it is um, I don't know what TM25 is normally so uh, is it thunder I don't know I'm not 100% sure but I know 24 is thunderbolt so I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. But anyways, um... Navi, I want you to have this for your errand. Oh, can you give me a podium? Oh, thank you, bro, thank you. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. What the, what, what, what's one gotta do with the other? What's one, what, I, I, I don't understand what's one gotta do with the other. I love that it's nighttime in the game. I fucking love it. I love that it's nighttime in the game right now. Hey, bro. Pokemon hide in the grass. Who knows when that... Okay, so I'm going to tell you right now. <clears throat> I don't really know what a 30% increase is going to look like. Because y'all know I'm not good with math. Um, so I'm going to do a little bit of bump and grind right here real quick. While we are still uh, <laughs> not in Nuzlocke mode. <laughs> um, but yes, as you can see. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, bro. Get him out of here, get him out of here. Um, but as you can see, yes, the game itself is randomized. Um, I just didn't randomize the starters um, because it's one program versus two and a whole bunch of extra shiggity, bull shiggity. Now that I'm thinking about it, I could have just solved that issue so easily by making it so the rival doesn't carry a starter throughout the game. Imagine that. Imagine that. I've had the unfortunate uh, opportunity, <laughs> let's call it that, opportunity to replay through entire episodes that I had just played through lately due to operator error, let's say. Um, I'm not 100% uh, upset with the routes on this, or the encounters on this route either. Uh, but yes, I've had to replay a whole bunch of entire episodes again so maybe just maybe we'll do that again <laughs> um after this and then i can replay through the whole damn thing and just change the rival starter so that he doesn't carry it throughout the whole game maybe maybe i thought that guy was gonna stop me maybe not now but okay 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 i just got just got a little bit just got just got a little bit just a little bit a little bit of extra mm, there for our boy winston He's made it over. I love how he's just a, a clam. <laughs> I love how he's just a clam flopping around. We only got one Podion. Oh, we not battling right now. We not battling right now. But I do want to see what Pokemon are on this route. Ooh. Oh, wait. It, that doesn't work. Oh, wait. That is stupid. Uh, get out of here. 
Get out of here. Don't show your face anymore. Wait, bro, chill. Whoa, hold up. Are we building the B team again? When we get up here with some Pokeballs, are we building the B team? A gold berry. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, how could I? Ooh. A Sneasel. I don't know what Sneasel's level up moveset is like, but would Sneasel necessarily be a bad option, at least early game? You know what I mean? I know it doesn't evolve in this game, but still. You know Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. Okay, 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 okay. We got we got enough enough of these little gold berry. A self-restore item, 30 HP. Whoa, Winston, hold on to this, bro. You don't even have 30 HP yet, so we're gonna hold off on that. Yo, I just wanna know, I just I just want you guys to know like I had the whole thought that I was gonna bring Winston over like a week ago, you know? Not Winston, but like a Pokemon over a week ago. And I had a good feeling it was gonna be Winston. But now that it's here and like it's happening, like it brings me so much joy. It brings me so much joy to know our boy Winston, just a lonely little Kingler from the Kanto region, is now traveling with us. Look at him, look at him go. Wait, is this a Mr. Pokemon Tiles? Hello, knock knock. Oi! Hero, hero, you must be nappy. Professor Elm said that you would visit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. A mystery egg. In the key pocket. I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued. So I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon Evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm will know it. Does that music play every time he comes into the room? Aha! So you're nappy. <laughs> Alright, we're back. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon? Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon are our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of Pokedex. It automatically records data on a Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. It's a Pokemon Index. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Nappy, I'm counting on you. Oh, damn. You are returning to Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. Hey, thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. Wait, so we got a Pokedex? No Pokeballs yet. I'm depending on you. What you got back here? What's all this for? What does this do? How does this help with your research? What kind of research you doing back here, bro? <laughs> That's the wrong kind of late night crystal. Oh, I forgot we had a phone. <laughs> Hello? Nappy, it's a disaster. Uh, um, it's just terrible. What should I do? Oh, no. Please get back here now. Hey, I don't like it when people be playing on my phone. I don't like it when people be playing on my phone like that. So, if we only do this series at night, are we only going to get ghost and dark type Pokemon and all the route? Is this going to be a mischievous Sneasel Fest? Is that all it's going to be? Because I would only be down with that to start. Anything after that? I knew, I knew it. I knew it. I was like, wait a minute. Is it right here or is it back at the city? I wanted like one or two more wild battles. 
You got a, you got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste, a wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, I love it. The venom just dripping from every word. Ah, uh, uh, my arch nemesis. So he has a toted out. See, that's what I'm saying. I could have, I could have. So what I could have done is randomized the game, chosen the starter, and then swapped it to Winston afterwards. But instead, I set one of the starters as a Kingler and left the other two. I mean, I guess I could have randomized those, but then how do I know that I actually randomized those? You know, like, huh? I mean, it would it make a difference? In all honesty, would it make a difference? <laughs> I mean, I'm gonna choose uh, Kingler anyways, but. The point I was making is if I would have just unchecked rival keep started throughout game, the Totodile would disappear after this battle. But at the same time, it's late night. Who gives a fuck? Let the man have a Totodile. You act like we're not going to stomp him out every single time we battle him anyways. So let him have a Feraligator. It'll be nice. It'll be nice to see. He'll be the one. The one. Plus, I really like Totodiles. Look at his little face. He's just a baby. He's just a baby. Scratch? You scratching this big ass claw? Don't think so, buddy. Don't think so. Isn't that dope? We are rivals, but we are more alike than you know. We both have water types. Scary ass water types. Winston the pirate versus the giant gator. Oh, I'm gonna guillotine that bitch. For the end of this, I'm guillotining him. <clears throat> are you happy you won? Hell yeah. Thank you for the 420. My name's... Question mark, question mark, question mark. I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Out of my way. Hey, wait. Did you hear my Pokemon? Oh, we good. We good, we good, we good. I thought Winston picked up an item there for a moment. I was like, wait, what? Hold up. Wait a minute. It's a 22. See those ledges? It's scary to jump off them. But you can go to the new park without walking through the grass. They got cut bushes on this route too. Like, I'm gonna be pulling up, stopping, cut. Pulling up, stopping, cut. Pulling up, stopping, cut. No. 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 Not gonna happen. I really want to get Winston in his hand. I know he's right there. This Pidgey. Oh, he's not right there. Get this Pidgey out of here. Get this Pidgey out of here. Okay, so what level is the starter normally? Is it five? Yeah, we got a level five. And this time he was level seven. <clears throat> hey, <laughs> y'all making cookies? <laughs> I want some. Hey, can I have this Pokemon? Like, you clearly can't keep them safe here. They'd be getting robbed and shit. Let me take this one with me too. What is that, Chikorita? Hey, we said we were assembling the B team, did we not? I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. Apparently it was a young male with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? So just like we had Blue before, we will be squaring off this time against the one and only Silver. Okay, so Silver was his name. Thanks for helping my investigation. Anytime, bro. Anytime. We good here? You you want you want to chat? Navi, this is terrible. Oh yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Navi handed the mystery egg to Professor Allen. This? But is it a Pokemon egg? If it is, it is a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokédex? Nappy, is that true? <laughs> That's incredible! He's superb at seeing the potential of people as trainers. Wow, Nappy, you may have what it takes to become the champion. You seem to be getting on great with Pokémon too. You should take the Pokémon Gym Challenge. The closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Nappy, the road to the championship would be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. But first, bro, you didn't take your trash out yet, bro? 
I done walked all the way over there and back. Bro, you gonna stop interrupting me too. Nappy, use these on your Pokédex quest. To add to your Pokédex, you have to catch Pokémon. Throw Pokéballs at wild Pokémon to get them. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the Nuzlocke has begun. How many of them did you give me, Brew? Five Pokéballs. Okay. Well, we can get a first encounter on two separate routes and begin building the B team back up. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Where did you get it? So, you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll help too. But what can I do for you? I know, I'll save money for you. On a long journey, money's important. Do you want me to save your money? No. Be careful. Pokemon are your friends. You need to work as a team. Now go on. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it all. All right, heading out at 11.24 at night. Let's get it. <laughs> Bro, stop interrupting me. I've seen you a couple times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Would you like me to show you how to catch Pokemon? Come on, bro. Let's go. Let's get it. Show me. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. What's wrong with this guy's face? Look at this man's face. This is like the serial killer starter kit. Look at this guy's face. We got Slenderman teaching us how to catch Pokemon. That's how you do it. If you weaken them first, Pokemon are easier to catch. Okay, bro. Been done knowing that. Oh, first encounter. I hope it's that Espeon. You know what? I'll take a Blossom. Oh, you know what? That's a stone evolution. So I don't know if. I don't know shit about Gen 2. I don't know if they changed that or not, but. I would not be mad at it. I can say that much. I don't know if uh, oh we can bubble this thing. Not very effective. I'm gonna hit you with that again. It's not very effective. Absorb. Yo, we're not. We're not. We're not. We're not gonna be doing this. I only have five Pokeballs though. I'm gonna try one. Is it meant to be? Join the beat. Um, I really hope that Sweet Scent and Absorb is not the extent of your battling catalog. Oh, never mind. Stun Spore. Okay, I see you. Alright, we're, 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 we're a little bit lower. Stun Spore definitely help us build up the B team again. Okay, she thought about it. She thought about it. Yo, you're going to stop absorbing right now. Because we don't necessarily have. Oh, just use a potion. He's got. Are you fucking serious, bro? I don't have anything for this. Yo, I'm just worried that this. <sighs> Let me hit him again. Don't do it. I was going to say, don't do that again. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. This is our one and only chance, ladies and gentlemen. I know she's clicking absorb again. And she will make this impossible. Come on, Blossom. I already got a name picked out for you. Come on. Are you kidding me? She's confused from pedal dance. Don't do this. Don't do... Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do that, do that, do that. Only click that move. Are you joking with me? Are you joking with me, Blossom? <sighs> All right. Well, Winston. Oh, okay. 
We're going to get out of here. Well, the first Pokeball might have been a mulligan. Can I heal right here? Can I use this machine? Yes, thank you. First Pokeball was a little bit of a mulligan. Uh, I don't know. That's like clicking Surf on a Rhydon. <laughs> that's like clicking Surf on a Rhydon, but... I don't know. I did, why did it have to break out of that many balls? Like, come on. That pedal dance, hey, fuck off. That pedal dance would have been delicious to have. Pedal dance, stun spore. Oh, especially early on. You know, I knew there was an item up here. I I waited in this direction earlier. All right, get me out of here. I was leaning in this direction earlier, and I was like, no, nah, there's nothing up there. Oh, we can get an encounter up there too. But we need to get some Pokeballs. Definitely need to get some Pokeballs. Is there an item down here? I could swear that was. Yeah, I'm killing everything that crosses our path. We only have one Pokemon at the moment. And... Uh, 34, 34, 20, my bad. Might be able to buy a little something, something with that. Might be able to buy a little something, something with that. Maybe, 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 just maybe. Hold up, hey. Can I sell this guard spec? Thank you. Get rid of that. And we need to. Oh, fuck. We need to buy everything. We need to buy everything. Um. I'm gonna. I'm gonna buy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Three potions. And then I'm going to buy. Ten Pokeballs. For now. And I'm going to buy one antidote, just in case. I have a poison cure berry. I didn't really need to do that. One paralyzed heal as well because we just went through that. And then I'm going to buy a potion. Nope. Fuck. I was going to say a potion and a pokeball. But I should have just bought the pokeballs. Okay. I'm feeling a little bit more comfortable in my skin now. So, we need to get an encounter on route. Thirty. Now I would not mind that Sneasel that we saw earlier. I would not mind the mischievous either. Oh! <laughs> no fucking way! <laughs> oh, bro, do I click bubble? <laughs> it's like clicking surf on a ride out. Oh my god! There's no way. A lady done. Uh, if I click bubble, it's gonna die. How about vice grip? Winston, control yourself. Winston? Winston. Winston. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. You know, I had so much more faith in that than I did in any of those on the Blossom, and I don't know why it broke out immediately. Hey, stop attacking. Stop attacking. Stop attacking. We have more routes, more areas coming up, and I need these Pokeballs. Oh, my heart is so full of joy. Oh, my heart is so full of joy. You don't even know. <sighs> if we would have had that Blossom Kingler, Blossom Rider, oh my god, we would have had an incredible start. Incredible start. Stun Spore, Petal Dance. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm kind of missing that Blossom, but look at this Rider. By lightly spinning its drill like horn, <laughs> it can easily shatter even a diamond in the rough. All right, what nickname were we giving this ride on? I don't remember if we, I think we might have caught a ride on Late Night Yellow at the very, very end, but I know that uh, broke my heart. We couldn't catch that ride on. <laughs> um, so we need a lady name. I already have it. Judy. We have Jude's, the right on. I love it. Horn attack, tail whip, stomp, and fury attack. Ah, 
I love it. I love it. We have a fucking right on. Oh, I was expecting a mischievous. I was expecting a sneasel, and we were blessed. Blessed, I tell you, blessed. Do we not have a? Uh... Oh no, it's in your pokey gear. No, what the fuck? When do I get the map? When do I get the map? I want the map. Um, but speaking of getting things, um, I was kind of hinting. So should we go get that other encounter? On that route, doesn't that ruin the route when we come back to it? Not yet, not yet. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. On route 30 now, and we gotta go this way. You wanna fight, bro? You should too. Wait, we're level 10. I'm gonna try and switch train Judy from the start. Um, but in the last episode of Late Night Yellow, I had mentioned merchandise. A lot of you guys have been talking about merchandise as well. Um, and if you guys have noticed our banner and logo and everything, uh, I had an idea for some merchandise and I wanted to get your guys' initial feedback. You know, I feel like the Late Night series is a special little niche on the channel. Um, but we have some stickers. <laughs> so we have a couple stickers that match the theme of the channel. This was originally supposed to be a part of the Collection 1. Um, package and the idea is that like I don't know maybe like three or four times a year we'll change the banner and it'll be a new design so you gotta catch them all you gotta collect them all um, but I really like the purple and green one and you know I'm really surprised that more people haven't caught on to it because pretty much every canteen every single canteen that I own that I've had in the past like I don't know like two or three years has had that on it and no one's caught on to it yet. I was like, whoa, okay. Oh, come on. This is a bad omen. A bad, bad omen to start our playthrough. Winston, I need you to manhandle this black cat here. So, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, it could be the start of something much, much more, but uh, everybody I know in real life loves them. So, we'll see. We'll see what ends up happening. We'll see. We'll see. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Ah, I lost again. Doggone it. Okay, so that was Route 30. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get him out of here. Get him out of here, too. I should have swapped. I should have swapped and brought Judy out. Hello? I'm not a trainer. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. No, no, no. Leave me be. Leave me be. Leave me alone. Goodbye. Ghost Rider? Whoa. We're level five. We have Stomp. <laughs> we are going to be stomping people out in this game. I'm going to click it. Oh, it stopped me. Judy, stop it back. Yes. Look at Judy's. In game. Whoa, 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 Judy, that might hurt. Judy, Judy, Judy. Yeah, eat it up, Judy. You're a special monster. Ah, oh, yes. Hey, just for Judy. Just for Judy. Whoa, 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 Judy, 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 Judy. Get it, get it, get it out of here, Judy. Does it know Thundershock at level four? Oh, I forgot I made this thing set. Wait, didn't I set it to set? It asked me if I wanted to swap. Am I crazy? Am I going crazy? Am I not remembering things the way they should be remembered? Whoa, Route 31. Okay, it's new encounter time. Who knows what they have in the wilds of Route 31? Whoa, dark cave. If Pokemon could light it up, I'd explore it. Okay, bro, chill. Is that a good omen? A twisted spoon? Might we be seeing another team member return? I'm gonna get the Dark Cave Encounter right now because we can use it. And I don't think there's any actual reason to ever come back in here later on, is there? Huh. I'm not against it. I'm honestly not against it, but you're not gonna be kicking the shit out of my, uh, my, my, my Judy right there. Not gonna happen, bro. Get in this Pokeball. 
keep your little ass in that Pokeball. That's what I thought. Okay. We are working it out. We are diversifying the team. The B Team uh, Season 2. Or the B Team streaming now. All episodes. It's slowly but surely coming back. Or rebuilding itself. Winston will lead a new team to victory. Mankey, the pig monkey. It lives in groups in the treetops. If it loses sight of its group, it becomes infuriated by its loneliness. Same. Give a nickname to Mankey. Hmm. Mm. What are we going to name you? I think I'm going to name you... Uh, I'm going to name you... You have to let the perfect name come to you. I'm gonna name you. It's not coming to me. I don't know why. It's not coming to me. I don't know why. It's just not coming. I don't understand why it's not coming to me. Um. Fuck it. <laughs> I don't want any questions. None at all. Yo, did you notice that? When you, right before you walk out, you can kind of see the outline of the cave. This is a horrible idea, by the way. That's encounter number two? Are you joking with me? Are you joking with me? I mean, I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong, Gimli. We love you. We love you, we love you, we love you. Welcome to the team, my boy. Scratch and Lear, welcome to the team, my boy. Oh, there was a ledge there. Oh, our second encounter is also a Zapdos. Oh, excellent. And then a Tyranitar! Are you joking with me? Hey, we might not leave this cave. We might be here for the rest of the episode. Oh, fuck. <laughs> How we get... Meowth, okay. Anything but Zapdos and Tyranitar, please. Oh my goodness. Zapdos, Zapdos, Tyranitar is our next encounter. Well, I'm still happy with Gimli. B team. B team, B team, B team. That's what it's all about. It's a bitter berry, B team. Oh, 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 I walked too far today looking for Pokemon. My feet hurt and I'm sleepy. If I were a wild Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. Oh, uh, uh, oh okay. Um, but wait, we still have not gotten our encounter here yet, right? On this route. Oh, wow, look at this. Stomp him out. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I forgot. Bubble. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Bubble, bubble. We, have, we gotta be more careful. We gotta be more careful. Okay, so the set is on. I just noticed. It did not ask me to swap. So you they just send it straight out? Just send it straight out? Bro, you have way too many Pokemon. Pokedoll. We're selling that. Are there any more trainers? Oh, I'm the trainer. I'm not even worried about trainers. Um, I'm more worried about Pokemon out here. See, I don't want to waste a potion being this close. And considering we have... Oh, berries. Oh, fuck. I used it on Winston. Um, okay. We're going to have to make that work. <laughs> and our encounter on this route is... Do you know what? <laughs> We've been talking about B-Team... Uh, we we gonna make this work. We've been talking about Whoa, that ember do a lot of damage though The scary amount of damage though Don't know if I like it Okay, bro, I'm scared to click it again on you. So I'm gonna need you to hop into the pokeball like this one time Oh, but you know my cargo. I'm gonna be honest with you. You might not last that long, buddy 
you're gonna be here as a fire type because we need a fire type right now but if I have to choose between Lady Don and Lady Cargo uh, I think Judy is gonna end up sticking around but you know what I don't think I've ever used mag cargo I was gonna say Macargo. I don't think I've ever used a Macargo in a playthrough I said it anyways whatever <laughs> Lava. Its body is as hot as lava and is always billowing. Flames will occasionally burst from its shell. I would never train this Pokemon in real life. Never. Look at its sprite. <laughs> Are there enough goopy Pokemon to warrant this just one generic goopy sprite? I mean, I can only think of Grimer because it looks like a Grimer and Macargo. Who else is goopy like this? I mean, Muck and Slugma, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course, of course. I think I'm going to name him. It's just a blank. It's just a big blank tonight. I think I'm going to name him <gasps> Oh, it's a she. Never mind. I kept saying him. I was going to name him Wilson and Winston. <laughs> you know, Wilson and Winston. Um, okay, wait. We need lady names now. Um, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm just going to... Uh, <laughs> no, no, not Linda. We're gonna go with <laughs> I just saw all the, the blank spaces and I thought what's the longest name I can think of like in the moment what you got here TM 19 hold on Stephanie Wait a minute now, Giga Drain. Hey, I'm just saying so far, our late night crystal TMs are looking a lot better than our late night yellow TMs. So we have Giga Drain. Oh, and that would have been, I don't know what TM 19 is normally, but that would have been perfect for a Blossom if we would have had one, if we would have had one. But Stephanie, let's check you out here. What are we rocking? Smog, Ember, and Rock Throw. All right, pretty straightforward, pretty straightforward, pretty straightforward. <laughs> Slow as shit, pretty straightforward, pretty straightforward, pretty straightforward. Okay, Mantine, I wouldn't have been mad at that. That's a powerful B team member, and you know what? Oh, never mind. So we don't even have a water type yet. <laughs> uh, I don't even consider Winston a water type. <laughs> I really don't. He's just, he's not even a water type came too far out I'd better phone home what solar system are you from wow I can't believe we made it to Violet City already get a guy down okay so our team is looking pretty uh, stout so far I think I'm gonna try to focus on getting everyone up to 10 at least next um, so Winston will use him in dire situations um, I want to see what this trade is down here because I know there's always a train. What you want, bro? Pokemon you get in a trade grows quickly. Oh, it's not you. What you want, bro? I ain't got no Onyx. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Hound Hour? I want to trade it for my Machamp. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> what a trade. Um, yes, I would be down for that. If I had a Hound Hour, I have a Macargo. <laughs> Are you interested in Macargo? Earl's Pokemon Academy. <laughs> Earl? Earl's Pokemon Academy? Really? It's this kid's notebook. Catch Pokemon using Pokeballs. Up to six can be in your party. No. We're good. We're good. I'm taking notes of the teacher's lecture. I better copy the stuff on the blackboard, too. I thought they gave you Quick Claw here. I'm having like deja vu flashbacks like woo 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 who gives you quick, quick claw? I thought it was somebody here. And he robbed you, he scammed you, didn't he? Didn't he? 
Didn't he? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, god damn it. Who be, who's planting these trees that have to be cut down like this? Who, who is it? Can we go in the gym right now? Like, for real, for real? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hello, you are a trainer. Battle gym leader when you did? No. Is that so? Then study shall you follow me. Here, teacher, I am. Good it is you study here. Is this dude supposed to be Yoda? Bro. He looked like a anime villain. Earl, I am. Wonderful are Pokemon, yes. Teach you I will to be a better trainer. What you want to know? Want to be a winner is you? Good, teach you I will. In battles, Pokemon top on list jump out first. Change order in list, make battle easy. Maybe. More from me you want to hear? No. Oh, smart student you are. Nothing more do I teach. Good to Pokemon you must be. Alright. I just gotta say... Earl is now in my top five favorite characters from any Pokemon game. Do you see that motherfucker spin and take them corners tight as shit? Bruh, he was playing with speed up on in his own world. Like, he was going ham. I couldn't, I couldn't speed up that fast even if I tried. What the fuck? Look at him go. So, hello, excuse me. Oh, I ain't got money for nothing. Never mind. I'm leaving. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. You know, I don't be remembering most of this shit in this game. I remember these people over here. She uses the names of her favorite things to eat for the nicknames she gives to Pokemon, I mean. Bro, I'm looking for the Quick Claw. Strawberry. I, I call my Pidgey Strawberry. I call my McCargo Stephanie. Now what? Now what? Try me. Huh, Route 36. Huh, we can get an encounter here. Route 36. Is this Route 36 up there too? Do we dare? Do we dare to get an encounter on Route 36? Wait, I have an idea. <laughs> and everybody's like, what the fuck? Bro, I don't see. That's what I'm saying. I don't know how Earl did it. How the fuck did he do that? Don't they? Oh, oh not in this game. Never mind. Not in this game, never fucking mind. <laughs> Anyways, let's go up in here and run through Sprout Tower. Um, I said at the end of the last episode that I wanted to get everybody closer to level 10. So we're going to get Judy up to 10 and then we're going to start um, trying to switch train. Switch training on set is just the first Pokemon, I guess, isn't it? Well, no. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, it's just the first Pokemon, I guess. But it's okay. It'll work. Come on, bro. Come get smacked up. Poet Leo. Poet Leo, we're not stressing over you, bro. Yo, yo, yo. Chill, Jinx. Chill. The episode just started. You gonna make me run back downstairs already? And I was just about to say it. We need to get an encounter here in Sprout Tower. And you know what? You know what? I am not mad at it. I am not mad at it. I told homeboy or homegirl <laughs> Stephanie in the last episode if it had to come down to whoa, 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 rock type versus rock type, having two rock types on the team, Judy was gonna win. You know, Judy, Judy got that seniority. Judy been here a minute, minute longer than Stephanie has. Literally, a literal minute longer than Stephanie has. But <clears throat> I guess for all intents and purposes, do we? add the charmeleon to our team like i feel like there's no reason why we shouldn't it's not like we have i mean we have a pc to put power in but it's not like we're hurting for team spaces charmeleon the flame pokemon if it becomes agitated during battle it sprouts intense flames incinerating its surroundings <laughs> yeah i gotta say i'm really liking this frame that we chose that was a very spur of the moment decision. I like it. But you know what? In memory of a fallen soldier in another dimension and one not used in the last, 
we have Roger, the Charmeleon. Here, ready to go, ready to rock with us. Oh, that artillery, oh, we have a water type, fuck. I really like this frame because it makes everything look like a receipt. <laughs> look at this CVS receipt menu we have right here. Okay, Roger, show me what you're working with, bro. Show me what you're working with. Uh, we have fire rock. This could become fire flying. I'm not mad at it. I know a lot of people are like, oh, a starter. I'm gonna use another starter Pokemon. And you know, I'm not, I'm not I'm not even I'm not even like trying to rag on you or anything like that. I'm with you. I'm a, I'm I'm not gonna say I'm 100% with you because you know this is Nuzlocke. I kind of got to use what I get, but. Sometimes I'm with you, you know, you know, having them starter Pokemon left, right, and center. It does make the game a little bit easier. It does give you a little bit of an easier run through it. But if anything, that's why the B team move, old headed bitch. If anything, that's why the B team really shined in late night yellow. I still just can't get used to it. It still doesn't even feel like we're playing Crystal yet, even though I'm literally playing Crystal right now. Look at this short ass receipt. This box is. <laughs> That's a wide receipt, man. That's a wide ass receipt you got. Come on, bro. I whooped your your boy downstairs, poet Tristan. Bro, you think this is a game? You think this is a joke? We are getting Judy to level 10. Look at this muck. Ugly ass bitch. Get him out of here. Get your defense all the way up. Judy don't care. Pidgey? Get rid of this Pidgey. Next next Pidgey I see, we're stomping on it. I want everyone to have that visual of a Pidgey. Just Pidgey! Right on, stomp, boom, poof, feathers. Sorry, we've been very graphic. Last episode of Late Night Yellow, we had a pretty intense moment <laughs> with Winston and his nemesis Dragonite. Uh, but that was a little morbid. <laughs> well, <clears throat> the other one was not not morbid. Oh my goodness, are we doing this again? Are we doing this again? How, how, do, how do I speak these things into existence like this? Ah, oh, we're just missing the move. We're missing the move. Close enough. Just imagine the vice grip is the, is the, well, that definitely wouldn't happen, but just imagine, just imagine, just imagine. Yo, this set battle mode is going to make switch training so difficult. Um, honestly, I'm going to train Roger next. Um, Stephanie and Gimli. I'm gonna train Roger next and then Gimli. And then, are we even getting another encounter before the next gym? Are we? Uh, you know, I might kinda, oh my goodness, look at this mighty Gyarados. Oh, imagine if that had been our encounter. You think you can take this? No, we're running. Cause I know he's gonna have Dragon Rage. <laughs> If it can have Dragon Rage, it's gonna have Dragon Rage. Hey, a Podion and a Freshwater so far in this tower? I'm liking it. I'm really liking it. Get rid of him. Actually, hold up. Roger, welcome to the team, bro. I gotta let you know how things go around here. We put in work. Okay? Uh, let me read to you these Nuzlocke changes <laughs> that we have here so you know what you're up against, bro. So there are no questions when the time comes. Hey, do what you do best. Cook that plant. Cook that plant. Look at the experience he's getting, too. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill, chill. Chill, chill, chill. Too much all at once. You can tell that Slow King does not miss a meal ever. Ever. The dinner bell rings and he is running. Wait, who? Roger? Let's just do it, Winston. Let's just do it. Hey, bro, I gotta tell you, there's a guy down at the base of the tower who's offering a crazy ass Pokemon for that hound dog. Have you ever seen him a champ before? If you need anything on the top shelf, he's got you. Uh, yo, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm gonna go all the way back downstairs and out this bitch to heal because we got a Podeon, five Podeons, and a fresh water. Oh my God, it puts it right there, yes. Yo, generation one, what are you doing, bro? Imagine if they put out an update for gen one. <laughs> I mean, they literally did. <laughs> they put out a whole separate game, but you know what I mean. like. <laughs> 
they put out if they updated the Pokemon games patch 1.001 <laughs> all these years later we can finally move items around in the bag damn that really does show like a significant change in gaming over the years going from like a game that has such a like a basic I'm not gonna say flaw it's not that important I mean if you're super critical of your bag or your pack like I am then maybe it's noticeable or maybe it's just one of those things that everybody is just like whatever we can't fix it everybody fucking hates it but we just can't do anything about it I feel like that's more it um but imagine like <laughs> they just put out a patch and it fixed it why is the whole building shaking what are you doing over here to cause the entire building to shake you are indeed skilled as a trainer as promised here is your HM but let me say this you should treat your Pokemon better the way you battle is far too harsh Pokemon are not tools of war oh it was battling hmm he claims to be the elder but he's weak it stands to reason I'd never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. Silver using escape rope. <laughs> that motherfucker said. I'm out this bitch. Bye. A bitter berry. Well, wow, we're finding way too many bitter berries. I, I, I have an issue with this. Hey, bro. You just chilling? Let's meditate for a brief moment. Okay. Now start to wiggle your fingers, bringing yourself, your conscience, your body back to this physical form. Now slowly open your eyes. Well, hey there, welcome back. I hope you had a nice moment of introspective mindfulness. Anyway. What's up, problem, bro? So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between your Pokemon and uh, you. Come on, bro. Bring it on, bro. Bring it on. So, do you really think we can do this gym today? Or tonight? You really think we can do this gym? I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to think. What would his levels be? I think his age would probably be around like 15 or something like that. I don't know. Think we can do that? Think we can handle that? Wait, this far fetch is level 9? Roger is level 9. I said I wanted to get everyone to level 10. Bro, Roger. Oh, he's sand attacking us. I was about to say. Get him. Roger. Roger. Torch this duck. Come on. Judy is expecting roast duck tonight after this match. Whoa. I was gonna go out to Judy. Wait, did you see Roger hit level 10 just now? Yo, I cannot wait to get guillotine on Winston again. <laughs> it makes fighting other water types so easy. Oh my goodness. Deliciously easy. Roger's level 11. Come on. I love it. A quillfish. Okay. Harden all you want. Minimize all you want. You're tackling me, bro? Oh, he poisons things, too. Don't do it. Oh, excellent. Winston with the crit, too. Yes. Give me that motherfucking HM. Give me the motherfucking HM. Don't you ever ask to battle me again? Don't you know a champion when you see one? Oh, excellent. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this flash, HM. Oh, bro, you could have kept that. <laughs> you could have kept that, bro. I'm never going back into Dark Cave. Never. 
for no reason. I mean, maybe if I would that TM, but is there any other? Whoa, I'm just skipping through his entire text. You need the badge from the Violet Gym. Um, is there any other place in Johto that you need Flash for? Um, wait, it's coming to me. It's coming to me in a dream. Um. Oh, what is the name of that place? Damn, me 10 years ago, I would have known this shit. Um, it's the mountain on the way to Mahogany Town. With the black hiker, I guess, out front and inside. But what is the name of that mountain? Pretty sure you need... Maybe you don't? I don't know. I don't know. Either way, we went into Sprout Tower at charmeleon And we came out of Sprout Tower with a Charmeleon. So... I would call that a win. Um, I think it's time for us to take on the gym. I think I'm gonna stick my little piggies in the water. I'm gonna go down here real quick and check something. <sighs> Paralyzed Cure Berry, that would've been nice a little while ago. I'm not gonna lie to you, Route 32? Wait up, what's the hurry? Have you gone to the Pokemon gym? You can test your Pokemon and yourself there. It's a rite of passage for all trainers. Fine, bro. I'm gonna go over here. How about that? You're studying the ruins? I see a scientist in the making. Okay, so we can get a Ruins of Alf encounter, right? Ruins of Alf. Am I trying to get Death Fodder right now? No, not exactly. Not exactly. I'm not exactly trying to get Death Fodder, but I'm trying to get some sort of power. And if we happenstance upon some um, Death Fodder, then it's not my fault. You know, if our encounter in here happens to be a Weedle, knock on wood, it's uh, something good I can catch with six Pokeballs. Okay, a Whoopa. I ain't mad at Whoopa. Whoa, 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 bro, 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 bro. Chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. All right, Mr. Whooper, we got five Pokeballs. I need you to make it happen. Bro, it's not what I asked you for. It's not what I asked you for. I should have attacked with Gimli when he was out. Bro, why are you, why are you playing? Why are you playing like this? Bro, why are you playing like this? Excellent. All you needed was four Pokeballs for a Whooper. <laughs> That's it. Just four. You're, everyone has four Pokeballs to spare. Whooper, the waterfish. A mucous membrane covers its body. Touching its bare hand, it will cause a shooting pain. So what are we going to name this Whooper? You know what? In honor of the Whooper that never was. Whooper Goldberg. So, a Gramble? Don't do this. Don't do this, Winston. Okay, maybe we should not do that like that. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up. I was gonna say there's a Gramble, another Gramble, a fourth Gramble, a Zubat, a fifth Gramble, a sixth Gramble. Wow, imagine if all the unknown were just Grambles but their heads were in the shape of unknowns. <laughs> uh, have fun sleeping tonight <laughs> with that twisted gramble in your head. Um, okay, so I think that we are going to step our little piggies in the water. We didn't get a Route 36 encounter either. Uh, we don't have a rod, so we can't get our Violet City encounter either. But I just like saying stick my piggies in the water. <laughs> this will be the fourth time I say it. Uh, I think we're going to stick our piggies in the water and see what the gym is looking like. Now, I really like to buy some Pokeballs with this, but on the off chance 
that it is some crazy shit up in this gym. I would like to be prepared, especially since this is only episode number two. So, let's stick our piggies in the water <laughs> and see what's up here. Hey, I'm no trainer, but I can give some advice. Believe me, if you believe a championship dream can come true, you believe, then listen. A grass type is weak against the flying type. Keep this in mind. Bro, do you know this is a randomizer? Let's do it, bro. Your eyes met my earlobe. Let's battle. Okay, wow. Level 12. Level 12. Level 12 is what we're working with right off the bat here. Are we for real? This thing has absorb and is critting me? Hold on. Where is that pedal dancing blossom when you need it? He's getting crits? Chill, bro. This is the first battle and we've already used how many potions? Oh my god, he keeps critting me. Excellent. Not so excellent. Winston, my boy, I need you to get us out of this. Three leers and two vice grips later. Um, okay. Well. <laughs> I just want to frame what just happened, by the way. We just walked into this gym and were completely and almost absolutely stopped by a Kabuto. A Kabuto of all things. Let's see what this guy's rocking with. So I said this guy at the. Ooh, this is gonna be good. I said the gym leader's ace was gonna be like 15 or something. Now I'm feeling it's gonna be like 18 or something like that. Because the guy at the start had level 12. I mean, this guy's only level 9 too. I would like to train everyone, but everyone is not going to get the chance right now. Get this thing out of here. Two level nines? Am I feeling oddly inspired? Do we start late night crystal off with an absolute bang? And take on this gym right now, knowing that we're going to be crazy under leveled? Um... Let's do it. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? He's gonna have what? I think he has three mons normally. Um, I mean, it, we could we could do this now, or you know what? Wrap up tonight's episode right here, and on Monday we're gonna kick things off with a bang and take on Faulkner I think not I think we're gonna give power over to Winston and see what we can do here I'm Faulkner the violet Pokemon gym leader people say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon Fuck. I forgot to save my game. Let's see what ends up happening here. Ranger Malcolm. He only has two Pokemon. A Mankey. A level nine Mankey. Well, this is not the one I was worried about. Hootie hoo. Get it out of here. Get it out of here. Get it out of here. Get this Mankey out of here. We were worried about this? Level 12. Wow, didn't his gym trainer have a level 12? I have to get to the bottom of this now. I have to get to the bottom of this now. I was expecting such higher levels. What is happening here? What is happening here? Um... 
Where is Faulkner's team? Here we go. In gold, silver, and crystal, he has a level 7 and a level 9. Okay. 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 If his ace is level 9 and it's 30%, that makes sense. Three levels. Good to go. Okay. Well, everyone at level 10 would have worked out. But the one thing that we still need to keep in mind is that this is an Alakazam. I really hope. Winston ate that so much better than I thought he was going to. Winston, come on. Winston the pirate. There's a reason they call you this. You know what this this uh, frame looks like? It looks like Winston <laughs> took his claw, Winston the pirate, and just cut out a piece of paper. That's why they call you the pirate. Actually, they call you the pirate because of guillotine, but this works too. Winston, you got this, my boy. Winston, you got this, my boy. Winston, you got this, my boy. You absolutely got this, my boy. He came all the way from Kanto. He has taken his big ass claw and picked up one badge so far. Darn, my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. All right, take this. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr Badge. That's like the, the Zephyr. <laughs> you know what I mean? Zephyr Badge raises the attack power of Pokemon. It also enables Pokemon to use Flash if they have it anytime. Here, take this too. Oh shit, TM31. What are we rocking, bro? By using a TM, a Pokemon will instantly learn a new move. Think before you act. A TM can be used only once. TM31 contains Flame Wahil. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. So, you know, I'm, I'm gonna say knock on wood. So far, our TMs in Late Night Crystal are phenomenally better phenomenally better than they were in late night yellow giga drain nobody can learn sacred fire judy gimli don't think we'll be teaching it to you flame wheel everyone can learn flame wheel whoa whoa hold on roger you might have just uh done something here i mean attack and special attack are about the same but i mean do I teach Roger Flame Wheel right now? I think I will. Why not? What is he gonna learn soon? That is an Ember. He's gonna be stuck. Who's gonna learn Fire Spin? We're not doing that again. <laughs> We're not doing that again. I did one LP with Fire Spin. And that was all I can take. We're gonna rock with Flame Wheel because that's gonna make him so much better. I can't change his moves right now. Okay. Well. Uh, 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 ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Hello, Nappy. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? Okay, okay. I got you. I got you. I got you. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Where you at, bro? Bro, wait. No, wait, 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 wait. Where you at? Is this you? Wait, wait. Oh. You didn't hear any of that. You didn't hear any of that, you didn't see any of that. I don't know why he said Pokemart. Nappy, long time no see. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Would you take the Pokemon egg? Oh no, you can't carry any more Pokemon with you. Okay, all right, all right. So I have to ask, did they change it in this game? Can you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, just for now, I'm gonna drop Goldberg off right there. Did they change it where if your box is full, it'll go to the second one automatically? I hope so. Give me the egg. Give me the egg. You're the only person we can rely on. Please call Professor Elm when that egg hatches. What we got down here, bruh? It needs more time, though. It needs more time, though. Well, shit. I think maybe 
Goldberg should take a break for a moment and let's see what's in this egg because it's not like we're playing a Dreano game or anything like that it's not like this is an egg lock uh, so I guess the egg can chill in the squad for now it can chill here for now um, so we got a little bit of change a little bit of change we need to get some pokeballs we're good on potions I'm gonna scoop up some pokeballs and I think we are good to blow this joint and get the absolute fuck up out of here. We got our Ruins of Alf encounter. Ruins of Alf. Um, no, that's what it's called. Ruins of Alf. <laughs> we got that encounter. The Route 36 we're going to save for later. Um, so, a couple things that I wanted to do beforehand. I want to give a shout out to L. Sorax for mentioning the unknown puzzle. Um, we're going to go and knock that one out. I looked into it and you can only do the first one right now. We don't have surf. I think we need surf for the second and third one and then we need surf and strength for the last one. So I'm going to ask kindly if you all would uh, remind me when we get surf or strength. I, I feel like it'll probably be one of the things I'm going to remember, but oh well. Um, and the last thing, can anyone guess? Anyone guess what the last thing we need to do before we can head towards Azalea Town is? I'll give you one hint. Everyone and their mother left a comment. <laughs> <coughs> so, I will tell you, I, I know, I do know that the man in Cherry Grove City gives you the map card. Um, I meant to, like I made a mental note to go back and talk to him again. But I walked right past him the first time because I remember it being automatic. Maybe that's just in gold and silver. Um, but like I walked past him and I was going to mention like, oh yeah, I need to go back and do this. But I just moved on to a different topic and kept going. But thank you guys for reminding me because I would have just kept going. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then follow me. Show me, old timer. Show me the ways of the world. This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. All right, okay, cool, cool, cool. I think I've heard of them. This is a Pokemon. They sell balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. Okay, 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 okay. Emphasize the Pokeballs, the whole point of the game. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their prized Pokemon there. Well, the first Pokemon, the first trainer normally has a Rattata, and in this game, he has an Umbreon, so we're going to call them prized Pokemon. <laughs> this is the C, as you can see. I love it. I fucking love it. The writing in this game blows up my mind. This is the C, as you can see. Some Pokemon are found only in water. What is this dude doing out here? Is he no surf? How the hell did he get out there? Here... It's my house. Thanks for your company. Let me give you a small gift. Thanks. You don't know how much I checked that bitch. Pokey gear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Hell, yeah, this dude's name is Guy Gent's House. Top five Pokemon characters. Guy Gent's House. When I was a wee lad, I was a hotshot trainer. Here's a word of advice. Catch lots of Pokemon. Treat them all with kindness. Okay, thank you. And you know what? Just because I can, show it to me. Ooh, wee. Ooh, wee. Look at all these routes and cities and towns and dens and lakes. And... Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it so much. Um, okay, so Ruins of Elf is actually our next stop. We got all these encounters? Do we really get all these encounters so far? Oh, we ain't been in Silver Cave. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. Um, okay. Let's get the fuck up out. Let's get the fuck up out. Um, <laughs> we need a bike. We need a bike, bro. We need a bike. Sometime soon, bro. Like, we need to get a bike. Uh, and Renegade Platinum, we're biking everywhere. It's healthier. We're not working our Pokemon out and we're setting our Apple Watches and getting quick little workouts in as we go to and fro across the region. But we don't have a bike yet. Oh, we don't have a bike yet. We don't have a bike yet. Dang, my cargo chill. Oh, wait. 
So we were supposed to be switch training. What are we? What are we? What? 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 What are we? What are we? What, I don't remember what I said I was shooting for. I guess I'm gonna. I guess I'm gonna try and get Gimli to ten next. Um. But yeah, that's the shitty thing about set. I'm like honestly almost tempted to take. Well, no, I guess that's a part of the challenge. That's what we'll say. It's a part of the challenge. You really just put my dude to sleep. My dude. My lady, the lady, Lady Judy. You really just put Judy to sleep? Of all Pokemon, you chose Judy to sleep? Look out of here. Oh god, there's a lot of that. Don't hurt me. His nose counter. Oh my god. Uh okay, no, I'm not gonna play this game. We are going to do all we can to end this Wobbuffet right now. <laughs> You're not playing that game. Not that I didn't have faith in Judy, but you know, on the off chance, on the off chance, that that Wobbuffet would have lived a horn attack or a stomp. That would have been absolutely terrible. Okay, Guy Gent, as of right now, I'm going to put him at number five. Um, currently at number one, Earl. My boy, spinning, juking, vibing. I love it. Earl definitely number one character in the series so far our list may grow our list may change Earl may drop a place or two but for now Earl's number one hardy number one with guy Jen at number five look at this guy anyone anyone could be added to the list you're studying the ruins I see a scientist in the making thanks for the compliment bro number six he's the uh, uh, top five he's number six they are drawing on stone panels I tried moving them I wonder where they are hush don't speak to me anymore you're not even on the list um, so, yeah, we need to do the Ruins of Owl puzzles because they give you items and they could be randomized. But, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know where all of them are. I think the first one's up here. Hello. What are the rules? Welcome to this chamber. There are sliding panels that depict a Pokemon drawn by the ancients. Slide the panels around to form the picture. To the right is a description of the Pokemon. Scientists in the back are examining some newly found patterns. Tell me about this shit, bro. Recently, strange cryptic patterns have appeared. It's odd. They weren't here a little while ago. You should take a look at the walls. Patterns appear on the walls. Uh. 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 Escape. I got that one. <laughs> a Pokemon that hid on the seafloor, eyes on its back, scan the area. Okay. Oh boy. This is like Voltorb flip all over again. Um, alright, let's see what we can do here. Let's see what we can do here. Um, I don't have a how-to pulled up, but I have a picture of the final image pulled up. Um, but I mean... I don't know if you guys know this about me, but I fucking love puzzles. <laughs> I fucking love puzzles. So, no, I don't have the answer pulled up. I just have the final picture pulled up, which I mean, you have in a puzzle, you take a puzzle out of the box, and I mean, even on the cover of the box, even if they don't put a big ass picture inside on the cover of the box, you at least get to see what it is. But it's nice to have the picture because then I can, wait, that's wrong. Uh, I think this one goes down here. And then we need, boom, right there. Where's your other eyeball at, bro? Where, where's your eyeball at, bro? Why are you hiding this shit? Why are you hiding your goddamn eyeball? I think that goes there. I think this one goes here. There it is. Can't hide from me, bro. Should know better. You can't hide from me. Um, oh, well, this is going to be tricky. Are these the, the right? I think they're the right. Survey says. Bam. Check it out. Check it out. Oh shit, do I need an escape rope? Do I need an escape rope to get out of here? There's a strange presence here. 
So this is when the actual like different unknowns start popping out. But wait, if I don't have Wait, is this considered a new area or are we just include <laughs> ruins of Alpha as a whole? <laughs> I think in previous games I've, I don't think in any previous Nuzlocke I've ever visited this part of the ruins, but I think it's one area, it's going to count as just one, so unfortunately we cannot get this Steelix, but we can get some good juicy EXP off of it. Burn this dude, bruh. That would have been a crazy good encounter to add to the team, but I don't know where all these fucking items are at. Are they obvious? Whoa, 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 whoa. Um, I, okay, I guess Roger's the next to, to get leveled up. <laughs> if we fight in Steelixes, I'd really like Judy to get caught up, but I'm not gonna miss out on this good training, this good EXP. It's good for the both of them. Because it's not that I don't have faith in Winston, it's just Winston shouldn't have to carry the squad on his back. And we just got low kick. I don't know if y'all saw that. Judy, do to this Spiral like you did to that Pidgey. Yeah, get him out. Get him out, get him out, get him out. Okay, I'm kind of over it at this point. And I don't think I have the repels to get out of here. It's a replica of an ancient Pokemon. Uh, when you re-enter the cave. Oh. Now use an escape rope here. But you don't have to use an escape rope here. You can just whoop de scoop and now when you re-enter the cave hey wait low kicking the shit out this steel X. hell yeah so may we happen to be going in the right direction I know for those of you guys who know this right now you're like screaming at the screen like what to do but I'm gonna be honest with you, I have not done this unknown puzzle probably in about 20 years. <laughs> because you know, in most Nuzlocke, you just skip it. Like, there's no point in coming down here. But I figured why not for the items. But I have one other strategy that I want to test out right now before I render this topic as uh, for the future episode of Late Night Crystal. <laughs> I mean, I came down here for items, but when it comes to items versus making it to Azalea Town, I think it's time for us to move on. Cut our losses. I'll come back. <laughs> We're not that far away. I'll come back. Damn, that's annoying as shit, though. It really is. Anywho, now Homeboy will let us cross. He'll let us pass. But, I need to know, Route 32? We don't have a Route 32 encounter yet. Route 33. All right, it's time. A new encounter in Late Night Crystal added to the list. That looks kind of like a familiar face. If I've ever seen one, hot damn. Well, low kick this thing because it shouldn't kill. Bro, you gotta land it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Everybody calm down. Get in the Pokeball. Everybody calm down and get in the Pokeball. That's all you need to do. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Well, I think that anyone that has seen Late Night Yellow knows what's about to happen. <laughs> Bellsprout, the flower Pokemon. If it notices anything that moves, it immediately flings its vine at the object. Damn, okay. And would you look at that? It happens to be a Lady Sprout, too. So I think we have not one but two members from Late Night Yellow that happen to be making an appearance in Late Night Crystal. I wouldn't mind a Clefable. Even pre-Moonblast Clefable. I'm happy we didn't get that. 
Where I wouldn't have been too terrible. It wouldn't have been too bad. It wouldn't have been. It wouldn't have been. But you know, I'm honestly not mad at the bell sprout. <laughs> you guys know I'm down to use the victory bell. So, but wait, no, he turned off impossible evos. Or is he? No, he's a leaf stone, isn't he? Well, I think the topic that we spoke on before is about to happen. Cause I mean, we need this egg, don't you, don't you think? We need this egg. We need to find out what this egg is. So, I think. We are going to deposit Stephanie. Goldberg chilling in the park. I mean the PC box. Ursula, come on out, girl. Welcome back to the squad. Welcome back to the squad. Ursula, well, you know what? We were talking about how come we didn't have a Krabby. Well, we didn't go straight to a victory bell. We are a bell sprout now, so. Let's check our girl out. Rocking just fine whip. Oh, you got a ways to go. But that adds grass and poison typing to our team so we're rocking fighting rock ground water fire fire fine grass poison and egg <laughs> and egg okay i'm down for it i'm down for it i'm down for it okay my sights are now set you know that unknown puzzle really bothered me it really bothered me because i can i feel like like I distinctly remember doing it like I read the guide about it and I know what they're talking about but in the game it's just like I don't know what the fuck is going on <laughs> oh I can't talk to this man he behind a cut bush okay I haven't seen you around here before so you think you're pretty tough don't speak to me like that Let me low kick this machoke and get this experience a hair across Ooh, wow 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 well, I didn't forget about this Pokemon, but I forgot that he's in this generation. Whoa, 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 chill. 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 Well, you be doing a lot of damage. Hold up. I'm not risking it. On the off chance that that fucking flame wheel doesn't kill, I'm not saying that it wouldn't, but on the off chance, smoke screen, Roger? I'm actually down for it. Let's get rid of... For the ground. <laughs> I was actually thinking about getting rid of Ember for a second. And I was like, oh no, wait, 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 wait. Let's get rid of ground. Okay. Honestly, I think we're doing pretty good. I know I could have gone back to heal just now, but anyways, I think we're doing pretty good. Our squad looks really, really healthy. Um, I'm not sure what level Mankey evolves. I want to say it's like, I don't know, shot in the dark, 18, 24. <laughs> somewhere around there I hope it's not much later than that Judy we need to get leveled up as well so this is what I'm gonna do I'm gonna work on Gimli's level 12 but Gimli, Gimli needs a bit more of attention ah, Ursula's there too Fuck. Um, okay I'm gonna get Gimli I'm gonna get Gimli up I don't know I'm just gonna take it into 15 fuck it I'm just gonna take it into 15 hey girl let me get your number uh-uh, yeah, or uh-huh, yeah, and you know, pardon, battle, I'm on the phone. All right, but I'll make it fast. Come on, girl, I ain't got no time for you. Oh, wow, a victory bell, look at that. Oh, well, Roger, you're going to get some more experience as well, buddy. Check that out. Damn, Gimli is now the same level as Roger. Hold up, girl. I was having a nice chat, too. Oh, you're on a big journey to see the sights. Neat. Let's be friends. Can I have your phone number? I want to hear about everything you've seen. Joe. When my dude Joe calls me back. Picnic or Joe. I'll telephone you if I hear anything interesting. Okay, but only interesting things. I don't know why, but... That's like the one person that I... Oh my god. That's like the one person that I always get their number. I always get that girl's number. I don't know why, but in every single game, I always get her number. What is with Late Night Yellow coming back? in different ways what is with them coming back I know this thing's gonna have peck and ice beam don't we come preloaded oh no we have new moves in this game powdered snow okay too bad Winston the pirate had to put you down hey where the hell you getting Arcudo from I didn't know they had them in this region 
Hey, this route is actually incredible training for Gimli. My Pokemon, freshly caught. Whoa, freshly caught Lapras? Damn, Lapras flinched. Gimli, you little monster. You little monster. Gimli, don't you dare. Gimli, don't you dare. Hell yeah, Gimli, you little fucking monster. Fuck that shit up. Whoa, you made me lose that fish. Shut up. Take this low kick. It didn't affect Gimli. Polytoe flinched. Get them all out of here. Karate chop. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Look at Gimli go. This is a level 20 Polytoed? Gimli, that's enough. Come back. <laughs> Are you kidding? Um. Hold on. I have to pay attention to the parish count. Oh, I don't have anything to wake my boy up. Oh, wait. No, it's all in the same bag. Fuck. Um. Okay, well, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to heal Winston real quick, like. Right, 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 just in case. Five times. Parish count is two. Does it go one and then you die? Because I really can't send anybody else out. Parish count is one. Oh, don't hurt my boy, Gimli. You bitch! Ain't no fucking way! Ain't no fucking way! Oh, the whole Nuzlocke crew is just making appearances in this fucking episode. Um, I don't know what water type moves he might have, but I know he's gonna go for him. Fuck. Oh my god, why does the water gun do so much damage? Hold up. I don't have anything to wake him up with. Okay, so we just... I, I, I don't know what else to do. Winston is fast asleep. Parish count is two. Winston is fast asleep. Winston's parish count is one. Polytoad's parish count is one. Um, I have to go out to Gimli. Bro, I'm tired of this motherfucker. I'm so fucking tired of this motherfucker. Like, you don't understand how fucking tired I am of this bitch. Are you actually serious with me right now? This is what you choose to do? I knew you were gonna have that shit, bitch. You know, I actually haven't seen the Polytoad you No, he has Water Gun. Yeah, what does he have? Water Gun? Parish Song? Double Slap. I don't know what his last move is. Polytoad. Oh my god, this bastard. Um. Oh, this is not. I'm not gonna say it. Um, I didn't see how much HP we had just now. I think it, I think it was less than that. Parish song. Okay, that's the only way I'm gonna beat you right now, bro. <laughs> Parish song count is three. Um, I'm gonna use this potion on Winston just in case we need to go back out to him. Didn't affect Gimli. Parish count is two. Polytoad's parish count is two. I know I'm burning through potions right now, but I don't really give a fuck. I don't want anything to happen to him. Parish count is one. Parish count is one. We go out to Winston. Parish count is zero. Boom. Holy fuck, Sailor Wayne. Did you really need to do that? Hold up. We got to get out of here. Karate chop that bitch so you can get another level. Okay. Kimley is now the same level as Winston. <laughs> Let's get Judy some levels. And Roger will be the swap if we need. Ursula will get attention after that. Because <laughs> we just need more options. But whoa. Check it out. I mean, this was kind of the same issue that we had in Late Night Yellow. 
having Winston as our water type, it's rough because he's in these games, he kind of really isn't a water type. Like, we don't really use any water type moves on him. Um, but I mean, I guess I guess we just need Ursula to get leveled up. I was going to say, we really don't have much by way of water types. I mean, to take on water types. Roger and Judy are weak. Gimli is just a little manky right now. Maybe once he's a primate, he'll be able to take hits a bit better. But, oh, wait, wait, wait. We are fresh out of stock, but I know that we can sell that hoe right there. I'm going to sell this hoe right here. Um, I think I'm going to hold on to berries for now, but, uh, hey, how many, how many, wait, 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 how many do we have? We have 10. Okay. Okay. We still got two more encounters. Hold on. The potions are more important. We need to be able to heal. Okay, I like the sound of that. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Fuck that. Okay, you know what we need? Awakening. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we need. We need some fucking awakenings. And I'm going to get another one just in case. <sighs> All right. Fuck that ruins of Alf puzzle. Fuck all this stupid shit. Let's get the fuck out of here. We said we were getting to Azalea Town. <laughs> we're getting to Azalea Town, goddammit. Um, but I do want to fight that dude on the dock, though. But hold up. I want to see what this automails. What this... What, what this here? What could this here be? I think we do have a Pokemon that can benefit from that. <laughs> it is the only move that she has. The gold barrier stores 30 HP. The paralysis. I'm going to give this to Winston. I don't know if gold berries are supposed to be super rare or anything, but... I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do with it. You know, I didn't even look at the price when I sold it just now. God damn. These fucking water types. Yo, I'm telling you. They're going to be the end of me. You just paralyzed me. Get out of here, bro. Yo, this this game is no joke. Do I really use a paralyze? Look, I'm going to use the berry instead. How about that? How about that? It's basically the same thing. I'm really good at both fishing and Pokemon. I'm not about to lose to any kid. Yo, I... We need to get the squad leveled up. I'm going to say that much right now. Because these levels are steadily increasing. Um, well, no, actually, I feel like it's more just we have more Pokemon to train up. <laughs> That's all. And we need something to handle some water types. How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious Slowpoke tail? For you right now, just one million Poke Dollars. Y'all want this? No. You don't want it, then scram, shoot. Well, leave me be. Phone home. Surf mail. Don't leave home without it. Fucking surf mail. Damn, Pokemon Center right here. Just waste all them potions. <laughs> and that fucking... <laughs> that fucking paralyzed cure berry. This is a great fishing spot. You saw people fishing? How about you? Would you like one of my rods? <laughs> That's good to hear. Now you're an angler too. Hey, thanks, bro. I can go back to New Bark Town and get an encounter. Fishing is great. There's water, be it on the sea or a stream. Try out your rod. Thanks. But I don't think we're going to go back to. Bro? Went a little too fat. Bro? Stop him out, bro? What is happening here? Damn, that's not very effective. How dare you, you bitch. That's crazy how he's landing all this shit, too. Um, I don't, if it's not Judy, I don't know who the fuck else I'm supposed to go out to. Bubble this hoe. Damn, we're bugging everybody. Too bad Bubble is special. Elegant fuck. Wait, stop. Stop. I need Judy here. <laughs> No, I'm going to go out to Roger. Roger's supposed to be the backup. Quick attack me all you want, bro. Winston's level 17. Fuck yeah. 
My chop. Let's just get out of here. Let's get out of here. Get out of here. Ace trainer Mike. Oh, fuck these ace trainers. They're gonna be the death of me. <sighs> okay. 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 Egg check. Egg check. Needs more time. Needs more time. Let's give it a little bit more fucking time. Let's give it a little bit more fucking time. Yeah. Let's give it some fucking time. Let's give it a little bit of fucking time right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on now. Needs more fucking time. Okay. Alright, whatever. Union B. Union Cave! Hot damn. Well on our way. I told you we're making it to fucking Azalea Town today. But I want to get my first encounter! Gold Leaf? Did an elf passing through these mines drop this? A strange gold colored leaf. Wow. What does that give you? The golden tanuki suit? Whoa! What a surprise! I didn't expect to see anyone here. Should I fish in here? This jolly negro hiker. Should I fish in here? Gimli, can you handle this? Critical hit. Ooh. Um, we're not gonna leave that to just you, I'm sorry. Dang, that didn't even kill? Damn. Hey, they are really pushing us. God damn, I'm trying not to lose any Pokemon, but every battle is like a fight for my life. Might have to do some grinding before tomorrow's episode. And isn't it crazy that we didn't get an encounter in here yet? I almost kind of don't want to fish. I kind of just want to. It's a cave, you know what I mean? Like, I want to see what wild Pokemon are in the cave. You're into Azalea, are you? Let my Pokemon see if you are good enough to battle. Biker Antoinette. Yo, what the fuck is up, dude? What the fuck is up with all these Pokemon that you know I can't do shit to? What the fuck is up? I was only level 5. I should have just stomped it out. What am I doing? I didn't even notice that. I was just spooked. Biker Antoinette, don't ever spook me like that again, you hope. Hey, what are Pokemon in here? Zubat Super Sonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. Yo. Just like Burglar in Gen 1, my favorite Gen 2 Sprite, Fire Breather. Or, in this case, Weightlifter Joe wants to battle. <laughs> I mean, if he's a power lifter, it's still the right body type. <laughs> uh, whoa, 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 what are we critical hitting? Chill, chill, chill. I did not think that you were going to be all over Judy like that. Chill out. I know you flamed out, bro. And finally, our first encounter in the Union Cave. Would you look at that? Should have fished. Should have fished. So if you've been a viewer on the channel for a while now, um, you may remember a tale that I told of a certain Gen 2 playthrough that I did as a kid where Graveler just, I don't know, just had this, just stole the show. Well, I had one of those with Sunflora as well, and it blew my mind, like, all these years later when I learned that Sunflora is, like, actually an awful Pokemon. Because <laughs> I was like, I played through the whole fucking game with a Sunflora, it was great. Sunflora. Sun. As the hot season approaches, the petals on this Pokemon's face become more vivid and lively. Okay, so what are we naming this Sunflora? Mm, I think I'm gonna name it. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna name it. I don't know why. Just some Flora's face kind of screams Nolan. Don't ask me why. Oh, I would love to have had a Weezing. We gotta fish when we come back to see what could have been. What should have been. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, pardon me, excuse me. A Doug Trio? Wouldn't have been mad at that. Probably wouldn't have used it, but I wouldn't have been mad at that. Alright, show me what lies in your murky depths. <laughs> Not even a nibble? There we go. Show me what lies in your murky depths. 
You know, I wouldn't have been mad at that. I've never, I don't think I've ever used a, just a straight up uh, Togetic before. It's always been, had to have been a Togekiss, so I would have been down. I wouldn't have been not down. I would have found a way to make it work. Okay, Judy, you've got one job and that's to get caught up to the rest of the squad. And God darn it, we're gonna make sure you do it. With all this PP you have on a horn attack and shit, hell yeah, fuck that Venom that. Get all the experience you can get. Uh, but put the normal box in the item pocket. Open it and see what's inside. There was a trophy inside. Nappy sent the trophy home. It's got me a fucking trophy. Hell yeah. Late night crystal trophy. I don't see anybody else getting trophies. Show me where Silver's trophies are, and I'll show you a liar. Gold leaf and a silver leaf. Wow. Wow. It never blows my mind. Every time I play a randomized Gen 2 game, I just pick up a shit ton of items I've never seen before. It's like, that's how we learned what Brick Piece was. Like, who, what, what the, who the fuck invented the Brick Piece? Whoa, 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 this little Tyro need to chill out. Wait a minute. Judy's 15? Dang, the squad is getting caught up. Okay, we need Judy and Roger caught up, and then we're going to start switch training Ursula. Or, I don't know. Ursula might just have to chill until we get to uh, Azalea Town. She might just have to chill. Hey, don't be trying me. Aurora beaming me. TM-22 survey says sand attack not an awful TM not necessarily the greatest either but not an awful TM so TM-22 gonna jot it down sand attack hot fucking damn hot fucking damn you know sometimes I'd be like you're wasting so much time walking around looking at all these items but look just found herself a thick club. Now, <laughs> if this had been late night yellow, <laughs> with our <laughs> PC box overflowing <laughs> with Marowak aplenty, <laughs> might be a different story. If it's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. Ah, it's deep. Can I need to write that? That's so fucking deep. Flash, shut up. Leave me alone, bro. I'm looking for a master ball. Not Eon Mail. What the fuck? All this mail. Don't need any of that shit. Union Cave, top five caves. Completed. Mm, I love Union Cave. It's just so nostalgic. It just makes me feel like I'm right at home. Poison Cure Berry, thank you. <laughs> I finally got through that cave. It was much bigger than I expected. I got too tired to explore the whole thing, so I came outside. But this is route, bro. <laughs> I promise you, I'm not speeding up the game. Now we don't move. This motherfucker going ham. Hey, All right, come on, bro. <laughs> Biker pie. Biker P. Bro, what is with these water types? Yeah, we definitely need to do some grinding. If only to... Oh, fuck. I was gonna say, if only to... Yo, can you not? Fuck. If only to get Ursula leveled up, more importantly than anything. Huh? Damn. Okay, yo, leave my Pokemon alone. I know we have a, a whatchamacallit coming up, but I just wanted to try it out. I just wanted to try it out. So, I don't know. Oh, it's not going to be a hair cross. I was going to say, I know you can get headbutt encounters on these trees, but we're just going to get our encounter here. Fuck it. If it was guaranteed a hair cross, I would try for it because I wouldn't mind using a hair cross. But are you joking? Are you joking? Are you joking? Now, after we have Ursula, you want to show us this bitch again. Is there any rule in a Nuzlocke for that? I don't think so. I think the I think species and dupes only apply if you caught it. If you don't catch it, then 
you don't catch it. But I remember this bitch had fucking pedal storm, and I'm not falling for that shit again. I couldn't catch her without hitting her before, so what the fuck am I supposed to do now? Vine whip her? Um, what, I, 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 I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I don't have anything to hit her. Uh, attack is 37. 57, Jesus Christ. 30. So Roger's attack is less than Gimli's. So I'm going to click Scratch. Excellent. I'm going to click Scratch. Excellent. Excellent. And the redemption has arrived. Holy moly. Blossom, the flower Pokemon. When these dance together, their petals rub against each other, making pretty relaxing sounds. Okay, so let's give a nickname to Blossom. You know, I had a name that just popped into my head, and I don't know if it's going to fit. Let's Google it and see how to properly spell it. Oh, I don't think it's going to fit, but we're going to try. Maybe we can Feraligate or Victory Bell it. Pokemon didn't seem to have issues doing that in the past. No way. No way. Fits. <laughs> uh, okay, we have Chartreuse, the Blossom. So now I guess the question is, do we use Ursula or Chartreuse? Joe, the swimmer. I don't remember you. The fuck, Joe? The oh, that was the picnic girl. I was gonna say, I keep thinking of her as a picnicker. It's unsafe to go in there, so I'm standing guard. Aren't I a good Samaritan? Yes, bro. Yes, you are. It's unsafe to go in there, so I'm standing guard. Aren't I a good Samaritan? So, the only thing that I'm worried about. Hold up! 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 No, 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 stop. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, we got a little bit of moolah. We got a little bit of moolah. Um, I was going to say the only thing that I'm concerned about, but I mean, I guess I'm not. I, mean, I guess I'm not. Whoa. Wow. Charcoal? I mean, I got a Pokemon that could benefit from it, but you think I got 9,800 at this point in my adventure? Come on, bro. Super Potion. Do we even have a Pokemon that is level, oh, uh, you know, we have two Pokemon that are level 50, level 50, uh, at 50. Um, thanks to your guys' comments in the last episode, you did let me know that the Gold Leaf and the Silver Leaf are basically items just to be sold. Um, I'm going to sell them now, but it makes me kind of sad because I don't think I've ever seen these items before. <laughs> so. Only 500? Only 500? I thought I'd get a little bit more than that. I was hoping maybe we would get enough to, uh, I, I don't know, I don't know, I, I'm, I'm kind of emotionally attached to them at this point. I'm gonna get rid of them. But I'm gonna sell this mail too. Because I mean, if I'm selling shit, it's just because I need space in the bag. I'm gonna hold on to that thick club just in case. Just in case. Um, but I am gonna buy. No. Fuck. See, they get you because, like, if this was 30 HP and then this was 60 HP, then it would be a, a little different story then. But you know, I feel like it should be that way. Cause I mean, I guess you'd have to get three of these, which would be 900 to get the, at least anywhere near as much. How annoying. I know I need, nope, nope, nope. I know I need an escape rope for the ruins of Al, so I'm gonna snag that. <sighs> All right, you're twisting my shoulder here. Um, but you know what, no, I'm not playing their little sneaky game. I'm getting just the Podions for now. Just the Podions for now. Just the Podions for now. Yo, isn't that crazy? Oh, no, never mind. That charcoal for 9800 though. Has anybody ever walked into Azalea Town and just picked up the charcoal for 9800 
Like, what the fuck? Who, 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 who set that price? Who, who chose that? All the slowpoke have disappeared from the town. The forest protector may be angry with us. It may be a bad omen. We should stay in. And the forest protector is booty holing through time and renegade platinum right now, so you need to chill. Where have all the slowpoke gone? Are they out playing somewhere? Nah, uh, bro, they busy getting their tails chopped off, and you sitting here doing nothing. Nothing. Hold up. Let me snag this. A white apricot. Can I chuck that at a Pokemon to daze it? Make it so that I can just throw a Pokeball directly in its face? Hmm? Who are you? Nappy, eh? You want me to make some balls? Sorry, but that will have to wait. Do you know Team Rocket? Ha! Ah, don't worry, I'll tell you anyhow. Team Rocket's an evil gang that uses Pokemon for their dirty work. They're supposed to have disbanded three years ago. Anyway, where they're at the will. <laughs> Cutting off Slowpoke tails for sale. So I'm going to give them a lesson in pain. Hang on, Slowpoke. Old Kurt is on his way. Dang. I feel like that's another part that, like, as kids, we kind of just meandered around town until we found that shit. Because, like, is there anyone that gives you any sort of direction about that? Like, at all? Grandpa's gone. I'm so lonely. What's her text before Grandpa leaves? Hmm? <laughs> so, okay. I guess we're out to the slowpoke well first. I guess that's, that's our first objective. We gotta save Kurt from the... The evil demons in the well. Hey there, Nappy. The guard up top took off when I shouted at him. But then I took a tumble down the well. I slammed down hard on my back so I can't move. Rats, if I were fit, my Pokemon would have punished them. Ah, it can't be helped. Nappy, show them how gutsy you are in my place. What? Bro, you... This is a ladder. You slipped and fell down the ladder? I have to calm down. My exclamation is too much here. It's supposed to be late night crystal. And I'm getting a little, a little too rowdy, a little too rowdy, a little too rowdy. So as we begin this adventurous journey, some of you might be wondering, whoa, whoa, whoa. Nappy's a little bit, uh... Oh, this is the guy that fell down the well. Take my anger out. Oh, you! Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Nappy's a little dappered up for tonight's occasion. Um, Hector and I went out for my birthday dinner tonight. Oh, I was supposed to be training Ursula. Can I restart? <laughs> Can I just load the ROM? Um, and this goddamn polytoad, why does everybody have fucking polytoads? Jesus, get it out of here. Get it out of here. All right, never mind, bring it back. I would rather have the polytoad. <laughs> what? Where did you get this thing from? Your Team Rocket has level 12 Raikus? <laughs> Judy, don't be flinching. Judy, don't be flinching. Get it out of here. Get it out of here. Hold up, Kurt. I need to be right back. Um, but yes, tonight Hector and I went out for my birthday dinner. And it was great. We went to a local little Italian place. And um, food was alright. I've had better Italian, but we've never been there before. So it was a nice little uh, try. A little try out. Um, it wasn't awful, but I liked it. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Um, but for my birthday... Today, one of our friends gave me a pocket Maya Angelou wisdom book. And I know I tried to do the, uh, what was it, the Fitlock? Uh, last time I was uploading the Fitlock with the little calendar shit. But I think I'm just going to do this at random. You know, I feel like it might be a late night crystal thing. It might be a Renegade Platinum. It might be anything else we do, but... Um, it's just quotes 
it's nothing super long or anything so i think for late night crystal to just for us to have a moment you know what i mean uh so the first quote the first chapter is self-empowerment and the first quote is if you don't like something change it if you can't change it change your attitude You know, I had a conversation with a friend um, like two or three weeks ago. And they were talking about going to work. And they were saying, like, uh, they saw some, I don't know, it was a documentary. Damn, that bitch got go go gadget glasses on. What the fuck? Something tails. She can hear from outside the well. What the hell? Um, <laughs> what the fuck? Fuck us up with all these polytoads. God damn. I'm trying to have a moment here. Uh, I still didn't swap Ursula. Um, but <laughs> my friend was saying that they had heard this podcast or saw this video or something where they were talking about, like, um, I guess self empowerment and like positive reinforcement. And they were talking about how they said to change the things that you don't like into things that. Like, I, 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 don't, I don't know, I don't remember the exact, like, I'm paraphrasing here. I don't remember the exact wordage that they use. Is wordage a word? <laughs> like, yardage, wordage, verbiage that they used. But it was something along the lines of, like, um, like, instead of saying, like, oh, I hate going to work today. You know, instead, have the, the thought process of, I get to go to work today. You know, like... I don't want to go into any more detail than that because I feel like paraphrasing it doesn't do the point justice that he was trying to make. Um, but it was something along those lines, like just train your brain to think like that instead of like dreading something, try to find the silver lining. And I really resonated with that because I feel like I do that a lot. You know, like if I lose one or two mods in, in a squad, you know, after all the hooting and hollering and flabbergasting you know it, it comes down to like well okay at least we get to use new pokemon now you know like there's gotta be a silver lining to everything in life so i don't know we rebounded off a couple different things and just found a stick what the fuck <laughs> what the fuck an ordinary stick sell low So what's the difference between a thick club and a stick? <laughs> Why did they even put these things in the game? Is that supposed to be like a fashion accessory? Were they playing in contests long before they came out? Quit taking slowpoke tails. If we obeyed you, Team Rocket's rep would be ruined. You guys like how I describe my attire as dapper when all I'm wearing is a fucking polo. <laughs> Uh, okay, Porygon 2? Choo 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 choo! Fuck, I still forgot to swap Ursula. What the hell? Uh. <laughs> Why? Can I ask that? Why did you turn into the ghost type? Whoa, 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 Electrode. Roger needs. Fuck, that was a crit, bro. You suck. Okay, chill, 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 chill. Roger, you got this, bro. You got this. Why, why did this random ass Team Rocket Ground all of a sudden just pull up with absolute heat? What the fuck? Is this my first encounter in the Slowpoke well? I don't think there's a single thing Judy can do to this thing that would not absolutely deflate it. Ursula? <laughs> <coughs> I said it was your time to shine. I said we wanted to get you some... Uh, okay, Ursula, no, we can't do this. 
The Jigglypuff's defense is going way up. Ursula. Okay, okay, okay. I like where this is going. Can we make it happen? Lit. Okay, so we caught a Jiggles. Jigglypuff, the balloon Pokemon. It rolls its cute eyes as it sings a soothing lullaby. Its gentle song puts anyone who hears it to sleep. Jigglypuff is 12 pounds. Wow. I mean, I know 12 pounds isn't heavy, but it's a lot heavier than I thought she weighed. What are we naming this Jigglypuff? I think I'm gonna name this Jigglypuff. I've been watching <laughs> House of the Dragon, and I really like the name Allison. I don't know why. Like, it's just dope. I like it. So I'm going to name that Jigglypuff Allison. And yes, I'm going to walk my happy ass all the way back to the Pokemon Center and heal, because I don't know if you know, but we get the fuck out of the way, bro. We kind of broke right now. So we're going to go ahead and get this free health care and move about our business. Is the gym actually open right now? Can we just walk in there and challenge Bugsy? I kinda just dove head first into this shit as I was exploring Azalea Town. I mean, it's not like I didn't know that Kurt was there, you know what I mean, but. Are you befuddling me at the moment? You're telling me we could have had a Porygon 2? I mean, I guess we didn't check what else was here, but Porygon 2? That would have been a Perfect fit for our team. Classic Generation 2 Pokemon. Ampharos, I would have loved it. I would have welcomed it with open arms. Pidgey, wouldn't have been mad. The trio, uh, power in the PC. Jigglypuff. That's what we ended up catching. But you know what? If you don't like something, change it. If you can't change it, change your attitude. I'm not going to say I don't like Jigglypuff as my encounter. I'm down for a Jigglypuff, but obviously an Ampharos would have been better. So I don't like that I didn't get an Ampharos, and I can't change it because it's a Nuzlocke. So change your attitude. So maybe we'll encounter an Ampharos later on. Maybe it'll be a higher level and no better moves. So fingers crossed. Let's go save these fucking slowpoke. <laughs> what you doing, bro? A slowpoke with his tail cut off. Huh? It has mail, read it. Be good and look after the house with grandpa and slowpoke. Love dad. <gasps> Is that Kurt slowpoke? A slowpoke with his tail cut off. You ain't got no mail, bro? Bro, how can you spot me? I came here to you. What do you want? If you interrupt our work, don't expect any mercy. Don't expect any mercy. So before I started recording tonight's episode, I went to check out last night's episode to check out all the comments and everything, make sure I was caught up. I still did not put this fucking bell sprout first. Why? Oh my god. Um I'm gonna go Gimli for this. Never mind. I'm gonna go Winston for this. <laughs> Never mind. That's all you had, bro? Yeah, Team Rocket was broken up three years ago, but we continued our activities underground. Now you can have fun watching it stir up trouble. Oh, your back's fine now, bro? Way to go, Nappy. Team Rocket has taken off. My back's better, too. Let's get out of here. Hi, Nappy. You handled yourself like a real hero at the well. I like your style. I would be honored to make balls for a trainer like you. This is all I have now, but take it. Thanks, bro. I make balls from apricorns. Collect them from trees and bring them to me. I make balls out of them. You have an apricorn for me? Fine, I'll turn it into a ball. 
Which if you're going to have to take it, bro. How many should I make? I only got one. I'll take it. It'll take a day to make you a bottle. Come back for it later. I don't think I'm ever going to come back. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Maybe we'll finish all of Azalea Town tonight and then I won't ever come back. But if we don't, then I'll have to come back. So I think... It must be close to hatching. You know, I really should have known that this was going to happen, but in that split second, you know, the fucking speed up button in Gen 1 and 2 games, it just goes so fast. It goes so fucking fast. I, like, obviously I remember that Silver is over here, but I just wanted to hatch that egg real quick, and the moment I went to the right, I thought, oh, fuck. And then went to the left and <laughs> And now here we are. So I guess we're gonna take on silver now. Instead of hatching this egg. I was actually gonna take on Bugsy next. I was gonna say I'm pretty comfortable with our levels to take on Bugsy, but I mean this can only help. So tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? Was he Starscream? I don't remember. Tell me something. Is it true that Team Rocket has returned? What? You beat them. Ha! Quit lying. You're not joking. Then let's see how good you are. So late night yellow, I feel like that would have been a really, really good star screen voice. If I could put more. I just said yellow. Fuck. Pop and silver. In an alternate universe somewhere, you end up as Cyrus. Spoiler alert. Ursula, I really wish I could leave you in right now to smack this thing. But we're gonna swap you out. Don't be great no get no critical hits. I'm on Pokemon, bruh. How dare you? How dare you? But you know, at least we know that he's going to have a Oh, he's level 16. He's gonna have a croconaw. Whoa! Ursula grew through three levels from that. God damn, I should have been training her this whole episode. Uh, bro? What have you been up to since Cherry Grove? How in the fuck does... Okay. So, Entei is special. So, I mean, fire is special. So, special defense is 26. 26 there as well. All right. Well, Winston, I'm going to hopefully let you handle this one, bro. Um, didn't really sign up for this. Just gonna throw that out there. Didn't sign up to get critted immediately either. Stop! Oh, you were joking with me. Winston recovered using a fucking gold berry. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, okay, so far, nothing you used is physical, so... Oh my god, that does nothing. Oh my god, that does nothing. Should I click Harden? Now, you know what I'm gonna do? This will make the gold berry useless. I kinda wanna go out to Roger. No, because Roger doesn't have... I mean, not Roger, um... Judy. Good thing I caught that. I wanna go out to Judy. Um... But Judy can't really do anything in return. I mean, we hit... Do we hit harder with Judy? 52? I don't think we do. I think Winston, 57. Uh, but we're using... Uh, okay, I'm going to click Leer. Defense, Entei's defense fell. All right. We are going to have to finagle this for a moment here. I know I just used that fresh water. I was gonna click it again. Harden, I mean, and Lear. I wanted to hit him again with it. 
God damn, this is awful. Cause this is not, he's gonna attack me again right now. 20 HP is not enough. Okay, Judy, we gotta tag you in. Winston, you did great. Winston the pirate, you did great, but we're not trying to lose you in this battle, bro. We are not trying to lose you in this battle. Stomp on this Entei's face. Yes. I want you to leave footprints. Leave footprints on Gimli. Look at Gimli hitting 18. Look at everybody leveling up. Oh, damn, Judy. Oh, wait, Judy, wait. Wait, Judy, wait. Wait, Judy, wait. Level 21? Well, Winston is who I'd want for this, but... I hope he uses water gun. But he's not going to do that again. Uh, he's definitely not going to do that again. Maybe we should have bought those super potions. What the fuck did he just use? Did he use bite? Does exactly half. <laughs> <It does. laughs> okay, that did less that time. Doesn't really matter. Kind of feels like a free turn. Winston, you are not up to snuff yet bro Winston the pirate you're not at that pirate level again yet we need to get your guillotine god damn fuck What do, what do, what can we do? We got into this battle on accident. What can we do? This is giving me flashbacks of Geodon and my Nuzlocke. Um, let me think for just a moment. Let me think for just a moment. Let me think for just a moment. So he's gonna go for a bite, which does roughly 17 points of damage. Uh, on Winston. But I know he's going to outspeed everybody else. And everybody else... Gimli's not going to leave two hits from him. Damn, see, this is what I hate being in this position in Nuzlocke. When you swap Mons out without healing them. It takes me to 12... 17, 22, and then we get critted. <laughs> but I mean, I just can't be there. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't have anyone else to swap out to. Like, it's, uh, I mean, even if I click vice grip now. This thick ass Flintstones trash can is just not letting us live. Um, I don't think a water gun is going to kill Roger. One singular water gun is going to kill Roger. But the only issue is, what do we do? Do we click smoke screen? Do we just click scratch from the get go? Um, let's see what happens. Let's see how this will heal spam. Well, I definitely think a water gun could kill from there, being five above. I don't think a scratch is going to kill from here. <sighs> Do we click smoke screen?
Do we click smoke screen in the hope that the water gun misses on the first turn? Well, let's see. I was going to say, let's see if we outspeed him. That did nothing. Fucking nothing. I should have clicked smoke screen. If I was going to live on one, I should have clicked smoke screen. <laughs> I should always trust my gut. I should always trust my fucking gut. What am I supposed to do here? What am I? What? 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 What is the play? What is the play? What do we do here? Somebody has to die. Because I got into this battle on accident. Because I didn't do grinding. Alright, this is it. <laughs> We've just wasted all that shit. Gimli, my boy. Roger. No fucking way. I mean, I'm clicking flame wheel at this point. I should have clicked smoke screen again, actually. That was a crit. No fucking way! No fucking <laughs> Oh my god, yo. I'm just gonna say it right now. That was my bad. Uh, that was my bad. I shouldn't have wasted all those potions. I shouldn't have gone for that at all. I should have done any of that shit. I was just, I was acting without thinking. And I said it, I should have clicked smoke screen. I clicked it once and he fucking uh, missed move twice. Gimli didn't deserve that. I really wanted to use that primate. That was, uh, Bad decisions, bad plays. The fact that I didn't grind, bad decision. The fact that I sped up trying to hatch an egg and got into a battle, bad decision. The fact that I chose to heal spam, bad decision. I wasted potions just to get critted, which I say all the time is that that's what you're begging for. Um, I should have just clicked smoke screen. I should have never gotten into the battle. I should have grinded. <sighs> Well, at least Silver was defeated. <clears throat> Useless Pokemon. Listen, you. You only won because my Pokemon were weak. Actually, bro, you had me puckered the whole battle. I hate the weak. Pokemon, trainers, it doesn't matter who or what. I'm going to be strong and wipe out the weak. That goes for Team Rocket, too. They act big and tough in a group, but get them alone and they're weak. I hate them all. You stay out of my way. A weakling like you is only a distraction. Bro, I just beat you, dog. I just beat you, bro. I just beat your ass. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Well, I feel very, very bad. I do. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Gimli did not deserve that. He really didn't. Um, and that was just poor Pokemoning on my part. But we have our first death to add to box 14 which is officially known as the pastures we're gonna head back to box one and see oh, what's in here so we have Alicent, chartreuse nolan goldberg stephanie um, I think we had the TM for gear drain somebody was saying to put gear drain on nolan with miracle seed but uh, the TM, I don't know if Nolan can learn that TM or not. Um, and we kind of have Ursula at the moment, but you know what? I honestly would not mind using Nolan. 
I'm gonna see. I'm going to see. Just for, I mean, I don't know, it's Ursula, you know? She was in the last LP. Uh, and I feel like people started to warm up to her kind of towards the end there. But can Nolan learn it? Nolan can learn it. Ursula can learn it. Wait a minute. Okay, hold on. Well, I was going to say the stats are going to be skewed because, of course, this is a Sunflora. 15. Special attack is 16. Wait a minute. Special attack is 18. I don't know. You're really tempting me here. You're really tempting me. I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Do you think we should use Ursula or Nolan? I mean, on one hand, Ursula was a part of Late Night Yellow, and it's just by chance we happen to run into a female Bellsprout at the same time. So Ursula and Winston are kind of tag teaming Crystal as the OG Yellow squad. Um, but technically, Nolan is the very definition of B team I think Nolan is the B team's B team so I have played through Gen 2 with the Sun Flora before and I enjoyed it so I mean it's honestly I'm gonna leave it up to you guys do we let Ursula continue to shine or does she become power in the PC and we let Nolan take over I'll leave it up to you guys you guys let me know um, but for now, I'm going to deposit Nolan because he's not officially a part of the team. Um, honestly, we don't really, Alicent would be the only thing that we'd really need to scoop from the PC box. So I think we're going to add her for now, just because she's the only not duplicate typing. Uh, but we're going to check her out here and see what she's rocking with. We have C and Defense Curl. Oh my god. You can tell me you're gonna learn Pound at level 7. But what I really want to know is what's inside this bitch? What's inside this bitch? What is inside this egg? We're gonna find out right now. See, this is what I should have done. Is over here. Because it says it must be close to hatching. Bro, hold up. Don't be doing that shit. Don't you dare be doing that shit. God damn. You're trying to take my Pokemon from me. You know, it's really funny. Uh, in Platinum and in the late night series. I know y'all can hear me fucking spamming these fucking controller buttons. It just happens. <laughs> It'd be like that. Be gripping this bitch. But we're going to find out. I think if Jigglypuff was a fairy type in this game, it would have secured its position on the squad. But I believe that we have a Lickitung, a lady Lickitung. And I believe there's only one name, Madam. Is our Lickitung and you might wonder why I named it Madam fun fact my first ever four star 100% in Pokemon Go was Lickitung and I named him Mr. President so now we have Madam President Lickitung who only knows Lick well okay so I think we're going to drop Allison back off in the PC because we don't, I mean, it's two normal types, would it necessarily hurt? But I think we're going to leave it open to, I think we're gonna stick with our solid little squad here. We need to train up Ursula and Madam. So I said I couldn't see all the comments, but I did see some of your guys' comments and you guys said stick is for Farfetch. So hot damn. We got a stick in case we ever find a farfetch. Um, but 
Okay, we already had antidote paralyzed heal. Excellent. Look at us go. Look at us go. Look at us go. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I know you guys are waiting for the gym battle and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're we're going. Whoa, 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 whoa. We're gonna go. We're going to the gym. 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 The forest is watched over by its protector. Stay out of mischief. Okay. Okay. Ilex Forest. We need to get an Ilex Forest encounter before we head to the gym. Survey says it's a Nido Queen. It's a Nida Queen. <laughs> Uh, I'm not mad at that. I mean, it's a stone evolution, so it's not gonna learn anything by level up, but It knows a lot of TMs or it learns a lot of TMs um, But I know that you are a Pretty hefty gal You live in this scratch Huh? <laughs> Actually, you know what we can do? You don't scratch me. I can do that. Um, honestly, I don't want to attack it <laughs> with anything. All my Pokemon, I think, are too high level. So I'm going to need you to just, uh... I'm going to need you to just hop in this Pokeball. I mean, do you think? And I think this works well as well because I think it's the only encounter we have until we beat the gym. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, chill. Chill, chill. Slow your roll. So we can use the money from the gym to buy more Pokeballs. Does this Neo Queen want to be difficult? Okay, Neo Queen want to be difficult. Is the rep? Is the is the rep? Okay, I didn't do shit. <laughs> I did one point of health. All right. Um, in the Ursula versus Nolan debate, there was a debate in the voting. <laughs> there was uh, a couple people that were pro chartreuse. <laughs> you guys gave me a good chuckle. Pro chartreuse. <laughs> Justice for chartreuse. Um, Chartreuse, I would actually not mind using either. However, yo, this Needle Queen. Are we gonna get a Needle Queen six encounters from now, like we did uh, with Chartreuse? Oh my god. Needle Queen, are you being a diva right now? Oh, broke my heart. I mean, I'm gonna try it. Why not? Why not? Why not? Oh, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. You know, I really screwed myself with this because I intentionally didn't buy Pokeballs because I said I was going to the gym and then I thought I was gonna be real smarky and fuck everybody up and go. <laughs> I should have just gone to the gym like I originally intended and not screwed everything over and blew a fucking Needle Queen, but... Oh well, would that have been... No, we already got a ground type, so... I mean, it would have been nice power in the PC, but... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, you thought we were going to the gym? No, I committed to this lifestyle. <laughs> I committed to Ilex Forest. 100,000%. Oh my god. Pro Chartreuse, all right. A gold duck? I wouldn't have been too upset with that. Oh, man. My boss is going to be steaming. The far fetch that cuts trees for charcoal took off on me. I can't go looking for it here in Ilex Forest. It's too big, dark, and scary for me. Oh, it's okay, bro. This tree can be cut. <laughs> How exclamatory of you. Whoa. All right. Do we have a question today about puzzles? Let's see if I can figure this one out. 
It's the missing Pokemon. Wow. Hey, bro. Can we chat? Can we chat? Bro, 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 bro. Come back. Bro, whoa. Hey, nah, nah. You had your chance. You had your chance. You had your turn. You had your time. And you chose not to. It would have fit right in. I bet you would have caught that little bitch, too. Oh, look at how peaceful. This reminds me. We have our pocket Maya Angelou late night wisdom. One moment. Uh, we are still in chapter one. This is day two. Um, but chapter one is self empowerment. And the quote for tonight is We may encounter many defeats, but we must not be defeated. We may encounter many defeats, but we must not be defeated. Oh boy. Wait till you guys see tomorrow's Renegade Platinum. <laughs> oh, you know what I just realized? Like, if anyone were to so i'm gonna break i mean i guess we break the fourth wall all the time in this in this series in every series um but i'm gonna like warp time and space Are you ready so there are those of you guys who are watching this series oh shit yeah give me this calcium fuck yeah oh it's all in this bag Oh, yeah, we're gonna up these special stats. Fuck, yeah. Yeah. Um. I'm putting it all into Roger on this one. Um. So, yeah. I'm gonna break the fourth wall. Like, from different sides. Bro, I'm gonna need you to go this way. So, there are those of you guys that watch this series, like, as it comes out. Shout the fuck out to y'all. I see y'all. I appreciate y'all. Y'all know I do. I love y'all. Uh, wait. Do I do it from this side again? Excellent. Uh, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for your support. Um, there are those of you guys who watch this, like, maybe, like, at the end of the week or something like that, you know, as you go along. Uh, whenever it suits you. I love y'all. Shout out to y'all. Y'all are awesome. But, think about when someone watches this, like, two maybe three four five six years from now i get people that comment on let's plays from years back and like i'll see their comments pop up like on every single episode and like sometimes they'll say like uh hey you know i'm really late on this but this is what i think your team should be for the next episode and i think it's awesome like i think it's great but the reason I bring it up is because I reference <laughs> Renegade Platinum so much. Like, I wonder if somebody, like, four or five years from now is going to have to watch Renegade Platinum, like, in order. <laughs> in order to understand which episode happened when. <sighs> Damn. I was going to say, I should just make one playlist with them all, but that's just called your uploads. <laughs> All right, you little bitch. Oh, come on, Chartreuse. My Pokemon's not even called Blossom anymore. It's Chartreuse. Wow, thanks a whole bunch. My boss's Pokemon won't obey me because I don't have a badge. Ugh, oh, my far-fetched. You found it for us, kid. Without it, we wouldn't be able to cut trees for charcoal. Thanks, kid. Now, how can I thank you? I know. Here, take this. I mean, I guess I can give it to my Kingler. I don't really want it. That's the cut, HF. 
teach that to a Pokemon to clear small trees. Of course, you have to have the gym badge from Azalea to use it. So see, this here was my original plan. Was I was going to do this part first, go back, take on the gym, and then scoop up the charcoal, and then, oh, I can get that right now. I actually slapped that on Roger. Scoop up the charcoal, take on the gym, and then head all the way through Azalea, or Azalea, through the Ilex Forest, straight to Goldenrod, right? Bing, bang, boom. But then I don't know what the fuck happened to me. Just decided to go get an encounter. Or no, I decided I was gonna take it on the gym first, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know where the error was. I think the original plan is what should have happened, but then I decided to go get an encounter, so whatever. Alright, Roger. Hold on to that for me, bro. Can I give this farfetch this stick? Cause I don't know. I don't know. But what I do know. Cause it's time to take on a guy, damn, time. Yo, Challenger, Bugsy's young, but his knowledge of bug Pokemon is for real. It's going to be tough without my advice. Let's see, bug Pokemon don't like fire. Flying type moves are super effective too. Hey, thanks, bro. Thanks. Ah, <gasps> is this a Duble battle? It is. Oh no, <laughs> dumb. Never mind. Get this out of here. This Cleffa out of here. Get this Pikachu out of here. Ma and Pa, Stu and Nick, Amy and May. Oh my goodness. What? <laughs> Excuse me? What? Whoa, this motherfucker actually has a bug. That's a pretty strong bug, too. Hold up. Chill, chill, chill. Chill, chill, chill. Get that thing out of here. Damn, level 19? My Charmeleon still hasn't evolved yet? What the fuck? Oh. Um, can this thing do anything to Judy? Growl. That's your big play. Growl. Stomp him out. Lower my attack. I just want a rock type move. Can we get rock throw? We will slaughter people with Rock Throw. Judy, I need you to learn Rock Throw. Where do you get the protector in this game? Hmm. Yo, yo, yo. You fuck with my Pokemon. My hard trained Pokemon. Whoa, whoa, what? Whoa, whoa, chill. You know that guy, Earl? Is this Earl's son? I think it's Earl's son. A Meryl? Get this thing out of here. Get this thing out of here! What? Oh. I got rid of poison powder. I had poison powder on Ursula. I'm gonna stun spore it. Don't tell me. It has destiny bond. Okay, chill. Amy Wobbuffet is fully paralyzed. <laughs> chill, don't tell me it doesn't affect. Stop! Okay, chill. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I know it has everything. I don't want to get rid of any of these Pokemon right now. See, this is why you always have a six. Stephanie should be here right now for moments like this. Damn. Um. <laughs> this is like Russian roulette. Yeah, hurt yourself in confusion. Oh my god, don't wait, 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 wait. Yeah, this is what we're gonna do. But I have to keep an eye out for Destiny Bond. I'm gonna swap just in case. I sped up just a little bit at the start. I'm gonna swap just in case. Motherfucker has counter. Don't you dare, bitch. Don't you dare, bitch. I know you won't do. I know you won't do. 
I know you won't do. Okay, I'm acknowledging the Destiny Bond. I see it. It's here. Do you think this Wobbuffet's defense is low enough? I mean, I know I was like <laughs> six levels above it, but still, it's a wobble fat. It has me on my toes. Oh, come on. This purple face. Uh, oh, no. A confusion's gonna hurt. Oh, but you know what we can do? Oh, surprise, surprise. Little jinx. Ooh, I read the lick. Pound. Not even confusion. <laughs> His hands up. It looks like he's summoning the fire. <laughs> Madam President is a firebender. What the fuck? Oh, get out of here. Okay, hold on. You're just running my team right now. Wait, how many more trainers are there? I'm going to leave with Judy on this one. Is there just one more? Okay. We're going to go heal after this. Oh, perfect. Beedro, get pumped all you want. Get pumped all you want. All you want. Get as pumped as you need to be. Okay, we're gonna go heal and then whoop Bugsy's ass. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm expecting to do here tonight. Mmm, I can smell the fresh field. Move! I can smell the fresh field outside of Goldenrod City. Mmm. Mm, it smells like smog and car exhaust. How come they don't let me? Oh, never mind. Oh, man. Y'all made this tree all wrong. You should have made it bigger. How come we can't pose on each side of it? Bugsy, look at me. Don't you know this is the part where we take the screenshot for the thumbnail? And you're sitting here with your back turned? Thank you. Hey, see? Sometimes you just gotta ask politely. I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. <sighs> I should have done my studies and watched an like, episode, whatever, <laughs> episode of the Yu-Gi-Oh! anime and remembered how to do Weevil's voice. Alright, Ranger Joe. Are we leaving with Judy? Oh, no. Um, okay, hold on. Hold on, one moment. Time out. It's not funny anymore. Um. Oh, why did I do that? I did that because she's a poison type. But I don't like this. I don't like this. I just want to stun spore you. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe it can't attack. <laughs> Instantly attacks again. Um. All right, we're going out to Winston. We've stun spored. We should just leave with Ursula from here on out. Because Ursula can stun spore all we need to. Woo, 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 woo. Yeah. The motherfucking pirate eating them hits. The motherfucking pirate eating them hits. Hey, bro, chill. Chill. You saw what happened last time when I used focus energy? Whoa, 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 whoa. Where's this whole paralysis thing coming into play? That was supposed to be a strategic move. Wow. We got the credit. <laughs> okay. Look at that. Share the love. Everybody get 184 EXP points. Well, we're going to share the love. Come on out here, Roger. Watch this Metapod use <laughs> Fissure <laughs> and land it. Who are we kidding? This little bastard is not using no Fissure. Get the fuck up out of here. Ooh wee. Ooh wee. Rage, bro, no. Absolutely not. No. No, not a late night yellow, bro. We have no rage here. We have no rage here. We leave that for the daytime when the sun is out. Bro. You know, you can't say he didn't have bug types. It's a shame that his level 21 
ended up being a Caterpie, but you can't say he didn't have bug types. <sighs> All right. If that Machoke had been the level 21, we might have been spooked for a short while, but damn. At least he had bug types. At least he had bug types. Whoa, amazing. You're an expert on Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this patch. Hey, shout out to you. I will gladly accept this Hive Badge. Do you know the benefits of Hive Badge? <laughs> if you have it, Pokemon up to level 30 will obey you, even traded ones. Pokemon that know Cut will be able to use it outside of battle too. Here, I also want you to have this. Hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Late night crystal TMs. So, all right. TM forty nine contains rest. Isn't it great? I discovered it. <laughs> you discovered rest. Okay, bro. Okay. 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 I believe you. I believe you. You put my name on them pillars? Did they actually put my name on them pillars? Is Silver not doing the gym challenge? Is he just like, God, Mom, fuck the world. Fuck you too, Dad. I'm gonna go out and just rob people. There's nothing you can do to stop me. Cause like, don't you still Pokemon? Boom. All right, we're all in. Next encounter we get, we not missing it. We are not missing. Oh wait, you know what? Hold up. Ah, oh, Nuppy, I just finished your ball here. Ah, oh, damn. That turned out great. Try catching Pokemon with it. But I want to know what a ball for catching fast Pokemon. So like if my next encounter is Sonic the Hedgehog, <laughs> I can use a fast ball on it and catch him. Okay. Oh, I just realized we've come. We've come to this point. Someone must learn cut. And you know what? Wait a minute. It's kind of fucked they don't show you the stats of the move before you have to teach it to a Pokemon. Um, well, we're not teaching it to Roger. Madam can learn Cut? Hmm. Uh, well, we gave it to Winston last time. I feel like Strength is stronger than Cut is. So... I kind of want to save strength for Winston because he'll have he'll basically have the same moveset as he had in late night yellow he'll end up with surf oh we need a waterfall user um but he'll end up with surf strength slash and guillotine he's definitely gonna know guillotine I don't want anyone talking me out of it either he's gonna learn guillotine damn it so I kind of think I want to teach it to Madam. Just because Ursula, like, we have a chance to actually kind of craft a moveset with her <laughs> this time instead of being stuck with what we had. So, Madam, I think you're going to have to... I think I'm going to get rid of... I don't know. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I'll keep like, who cares? This tree can be cut. Let's use cut. Whoa, chill, chill. Ilex Forest Shrine. It's in honor of a forest protector. Would anyone like to elaborate on that a bit more? Please, thanks. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chartreuse, it's not happening, girl. You chilling in the box for now. That is one step closer to a leaf stone. We didn't have any evolutionary stones before, and now we have one. 
Energy powder, ha damn. <laughs> None of these are items that we can particularly use, but, oh, I'm gonna let the tension ride out on that one. What is that item, what could it be? So I know this dude normally gives you a headbutt. So what you got for me now, bruh? What am I doing? I'm shaking trees using the headbutt. It's fun, here, you should try it too. All right. Late night crystal tea. Rattle trees with headbutt. Sometimes sleepy Pokemon fall out. Is it actually headbutt though? Because I would not be mad if it is. Swagger. Okay. Well, I almost would have preferred headbutt. <laughs> you know, we had a nice run with TMs there for a moment, and it seems like we are floundering just a little bit. Just, just a little bit, just a little bit. <sighs> All right. All right. Don't sneak up on me like that. You frighten a Pokemon away. Whoa, I didn't know there was trick. Okay. I didn't know there was a trainer in here. I didn't know there was a trainer in here. So, like our inspirational quote from tonight said, We may encounter many defeats, but we must not be defeated. A second stick is not stopping this train. Uh-uh. We keeping it going. We keeping it going. All right, finally. Fresh out. Fresh out of here. You know what? It watched over the forest from across time. I think that must be a grass type Pokemon. Would they be dropping little hints? Oh, honey. <laughs> oh, honey. You're making a Pokedex. It must be hard for Pokemon on a pier. Try using this TM. I will never forget that sweet sentence right here. It's water gun. <laughs> it's normally sweet scent, but this is water gun. Use it on enemy Pokemon. Uh, let's see here. TM 12 Water gun Um, I actually would not mind teaching this to a Pokemon right now Ursula can learn water gun Wow Imagine against fire types Oh Hold on. We're not committing to that just yet. Not just yet, not just yet. Route 34. Oh my god. Oh my god, what do I do? What do I do? Oh my god, what do I do? This is where I do my training. Bro, how do we go from... Oh god damn. God damn. God damn. No, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this position that we are in here. But you have put us in. Oh, I forgot all about Quiltfish, too. Yo, everyone's level 20, but Winston? Hold on. We need to rectify that. But we also need to get a first encounter. <gasps> I want that item. What? 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 Where, where, where are y'all getting these Raikus from? This is the third Raikou. Oh, Winston's level 20. It's the third Raikou I have seen thus far. Madam, come on out. I know you got this. Did you really? He has Aurora Beam? He has Aurora Beam. I want to go out to Ursula, but he has Aurora Beam. I don't think I'm killing, though. That's the thing. We have to tough it out. I'm not going to lie. I really thought that that was going to be it. <laughs> I really thought that that was gonna be it for a moment. He got a crit too. 
Okay, chill, 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 chill. This goddamn cloister. You're making the episode longer than it needs to be. I think we got a crit just now. Come on. There we go. Get him out of here. Should have just relied on Winston from the jump. Should have known Winston the pirate would have carried us to salvation. Get this Amphros out of here, bro. Dang, you just fucked up the whole vibe. I'm ready to end the episode right now. All because of this bitch right here. Um, I can't remember if it's in this game or a different game. Maybe it's Sacred Gold, but I'm pretty sure I remember there being a rival battle up here. So I'm kind of weary. I know I just dumped a lot of potions. Oh, these electric types. I know I just used a lot of potions and healing items and whatnot, but I can't remember, so I just want to be ready. That's all. But, oh, I gotta clear out one more nerd. One more nerd. Hold this bubble. I'll see you in a little bit, too. See what you want to end up being in this LP. See if we can catch you and utilize you. That would be great. So normally I always get the encounter on this route down there. But I think I'm going to get it right here this time. Survey says... Bruh. Damn, ain't that a bitch. <laughs> ain't that a bitch. Wow. Um... Well, that it was released from rap. Um, can you just be caught, please? And not be bothersome? Thank you. Dang, didn't we catch a ditto in uh, Late Night Yellow too? But I don't remember what I named him. He is nine pounds. Is he like one of those uh, weighted blankets? <laughs> I feel like it's a lot <laughs> for his size. He's only a foot tall. When it encounters another ditto, it will move faster than normal to duplicate that opponent exactly. Okay. Um, I'm going to call you Otto. There we go. So I'm just going to throw this out there. I am not adding auto to the party at the moment. Could have had a, another Comex. A Mischievous. I would have welcomed a Mischievous. Bioplume wouldn't have been bad either. I know there's an Entei hiding on this route. Oh, I would have loved Quillfish. Oh, I would have loved Quillfish. That would have been delicious. Okay. Well, at least we got the chance to see what else is there. So yeah, I don't think that auto is going to be added to the list, per se, or to the squad, because I think I'm going to use that PC right now and drop him off. I'm the daycare man. Do you know about eggs? I was raising Pokemon with my wife, you see. We were shocked to find an egg. How incredible is that? Well, wouldn't you like this egg? Then fine, this is yours to keep. You have no room for this. Come on, bro. Out of the party, bro. Out of the party. You were just not what we expected that's all go ahead i found that when i was caring for someone's pokemon before but the trainer didn't want the eggs so i'd kept it around all right looks like our good friend egg is back on the squad hot damn wonder what's inside needs more time though Egg is back on the team. I'm the daycare lady. Do you know about the eggs? My husband and I were raising some Pokemon. We were shocked to find an egg. No. Ain't leaving no Pokemon with you. I ain't got no money for that. Who goes there? What are you up to? <laughs> Bro. Slow your roll. Faint attack Ursaring? Uh, them Fury Swipes is a little scurry. Madam President, I need you to summon that Sacred Fire and get the burn. Excellent work. Stomp him out now. Oh, that's still special. 
Stomp him out, though. That's such a dope animation. <laughs> I know it's old school as fuck, but that's such a dope animation. This whole bear just... I got a crit, too. Whole bear just... Dip straight out. Gone. Whew. Well, I ain't messing with that guy. Dang. In case we need madam. Bro, how many more? How many? How many? How many more? How many more? How many more? Trainer? How many more? How many more? How many more? All right. I've convinced myself that I don't think it's this route. No, it's not. That was in heart gold or sacred gold. That's what it was. Cause it's the um, what's her name? What's her name? It's not silver. It's the other chick. Oh, I can't remember her name right now. So we need to get that egg hatched and see what's inside, because that could be another encounter that we could utilize. Um, speaking of Ursula, though, a lot of you guys are saying that some chick down here south of Goldenrod, if you add her on the phone, then she'll call you and give you a leaf stone or something. Picnic or Gina, Camp or Gina. Um, the only issue is, is all their names are randomized, so... Whenever I see a strong trainer, I want to be their cheerleader. When I'm on a walk, I sometimes pick up items. If I get anything, you can have it. Want me to give you your number? I'll call you as soon as I get anything. Well, she's Rachel in this game. I'm going to assume this is her. But I wonder if the items that she gives us, will that be randomized as well? Who knows? Who knows? Oh, but you know what? Before we head back into... Uh, goldenrod what we should do really quickly uh, because like i was saying uh someone left a comment talking about items that we missed out on token native token native token native here we go shout the fuck out the token native four hidden items you walked past by in the forest to the left of the first wooden sign after the cut bush the corner to the right of the guy who usually gives you headbutt. Top right of the pond below the trainer in the forest. Oh, and then the last one's in the daycare. We'll get that when we come back. Okay, so I'm going to do these backwards because we're going through this backwards. Top right of pond. <laughs> below the trainer in the forest. Below the trainer in the forest. Here? An ice berry. Oh, Wow! Oh my god, an ice berry. A self heal for burn. Hold. Okay, god damn. Uh, okay, top right of the pond, we got it. The corner to the right of the guy who usually who usually gives you headbutt. Hey, can this gold up? Fuck off. Right here. Bro, you scared the shit out of me. Hold up. The corner to the right of the guy who usually gives you headbutt. I don't know what to tell you. Did we get this one? He said I missed it. This is the headbutt dude, right? Bro, bro, bro. Come on, chartreuse. Come on, chartreuse. Well... We're going to have to skip on that one. To the left of the first wooden sign after the cut bush. First wooden sign after the cut bush. Was that it? Does that count as a wooden sign? Chartreuse! Come on. To the left of the first wooden sign after the cut bush. A mystery berry. Oh, wow. A self-restore for PP. So it's like a... Elixir? Old. Oh, Rachel. This girl from the route, right? Nappy? It's Rachel. Got time to chat? <laughs> I picked up something nice today. I want you to have it, so I called. You will come for it, won't you? Route 34 is where I am. Wow. I didn't know Rachel worked that fast. God damn. She's already on her shit. What the fuck? Hold up, Rachel. I'm coming. <laughs> I'm barreling over these needle queen. I'm on the way. Hold up. Ooh, I would love to have a flurry on. What are you talking about? We got Roger. So you're finally here. Damn, does this bitch live in hyper time? I think this will make you happy. 
It's not randomized. Yo, shut the fuck up to all of you guys who said talk to this chick down here. Wow. You guys just made Ursula able to reach her full potential. You didn't just get her a leaf stone. You got her a mega stone. <laughs> So, when the time comes, Ursula will be ready to evolve. I need to check Weeping Bell's moveset to see if there's anything we need to wait for or if we can just evolve it right away. But, god damn. Isn't that a bad bitch? Okay, we got one more item. Top right of the pond. Whoa. <laughs> In the daycare, corner before the pond. In the daycare, corner before the pond. Talking about down the whoa, what the fuck? Talking about over here, so we can go down here. Corner before the pond. A black belt. Hot fucking damn! Boost the power of fighting type moves. Oh. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> don't ask me about it. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Let's see what's popping in the mart. I don't know who wants to give me shit and who doesn't want to give me shit. Who wants to talk and who don't want to talk. It's the staircase. Point me towards the staircase because we're going up float by float. How may I help you? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. So, we ain't got no super podions? What are HP looking like? Uh, we're right at that weird phase where we kinda need super potions. Uh, I guess I'll get five of them. Fuck it. Oh my god, wait. Wait. Okay, we have 12 Pokeballs. I was gonna say, did I? <laughs> I said I was gonna get these encounters in tonight's episode. I just go and buy super potions like I'm taking on a gym. I ain't taking on no goddamn gym. Um, okay, so, all these berries, ew, what the fuck, get these hold items together, get these stones together, get these berries together, honestly, I could get rid of this energy powder, I'm never gonna use it, what you in here for, bro? Pokey gear can store up to 10 phone numbers. It's hard to decide which numbers to keep. <laughs> you better reply when I text you, because if you don't, bro, you out. I got my app at the game corner. Now it's my best partner. <laughs> this department store makes me realize that Goldenrod is a big city. The selection here is unmatched anywhere else. That's crazy. They code all this shit in the game and they did nothing with Zygarde. Wow. How may I help you? Oh yeah, great balls and flower mail. Crazy. I'm really impatient. I use X speed and battles to speed up my Pokemon. Imagine if you could use an item to speed up the turns. <laughs> I'm gonna go twice, then you decide what you want to do. Hey, when you use battle, do you use X special? It really jacks up Pokemon special attacks. Is that all you sell here, bro? Oh damn, bro. This is going to be the one and only time we meet. <laughs> I'm sorry to tell you, this is going to be the one and only time we meet, bro. How may I help you? <laughs> I'm going to tell you what I told the homeboy downstairs. This is going to be the one and only time we meet. Protein to crank up their attack. Damn, they call them vitamins, but sound like a little more than that. Only by being traded. I don't know how to tell you this, but I got a Graveler in a different multiverse right now. And, uh, I didn't have to trade him to evolve him. So I don't know what you got going on. You can't rename a Pokemon you get in a trade. The name is a reflection of the original trainer's feelings for it. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Kabuto? Want to trade it for my Hoppit? Let's see. Do we have Kabuto? I know in an alternate multiverse we do, but I feel like we have like no encounters <laughs> in this game so far. I don't know why we have so few encounters. Well, the Ursa Ring and the Needle Queen we didn't get, and the Blossoms first time we didn't get. 
Uh, but I'm sad to report that no, we do not have a Kabuto. But you know what? I would trade it. I would trade it. Pokemon Go has me in love with Jump Love. In love with Jump Love. I would love to use Jump Love and play through. I feel like I think once a long time ago, I think I had a Jump Love for like an episode or two in some playthrough. I know that's not very inspiring for using a Jump Love ever again, but I really like Jump Love. It's dope. On Sundays, a lady comes to check out Pokemon. She even gives away TMs. On Sundays? Damn, this is a Monday through Friday series. <laughs> this will be the one and only time we meet. <laughs> oh, what you got, bro? Whoa, 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 whoa. We don't have any money. Oh, my God. Oh, I spent all my money on the first floor. It's a lot of money, too. Damn. Two, three, four. Okay, so you have four TMs here. So do we know what any of these are already? TM02 is Swagger, so we don't have to buy that. TM41, we do not know. But I'm gonna jot down here. I'm gonna jot down here Goldenrod for 3K. Um, that's TM41. TM48, we also don't know. So I'm going to jot down Goldenrod 3K. And then TM33, we also don't know. So, plot twist. I'm going to jot down Goldenrod for 3K. So, there will come a time when we either. <laughs> figure out what the fuck these are or we're gonna come back here and buy them but at least I know if I want to figure out what it is I know there's an option at least do you listen to lucky channel if you want to win trade Pokemon with as many people as possible to get different ID numbers if you're tired try the vending machines drinks your Pokemon will love them too dang is this cactus the fuck is this supposed to be but oh, I was gonna say stuff in the vending machine but you know what we ain't got no money <laughs> we don't have any money so never mind we can't get anything from the vending machine okay all right well we saw the <laughs> region famous goldenrod city department store uh can we do something to go make some money now <laughs> because we ain't doing nothing else your playground, Golden Rod City Game Corner. Nope, we ain't going in there. Not yet. Whew. This is one big town. I don't know where anything is. Look at this. Look at this right here. This is like another... Oh, I wish I could stand right here in the middle. This is like a perfect spot. Let's have a moment of meditation once more. Close your eyes. Either hold your palms at your heart or down by your side breathe in deeply and exhale Now wiggle your toes and open your eyes. Bring yourself back to consciousness. Wow. It's normally more than just that, but we out here. <laughs> oh, are you collect Pokemon? My son Bill is an expert. He just got called to the Pokemon Center in Ecrotique City. My husband went off to the game corner without being called. What? Are you a trainer? I've got a useful phone number for you. Billium? My big brother Bill made the PC Pokemon storage system. Hey, can we call him right now? Let me call this dude. Good evening! This is the Pokemon Storage System Administration Service. Who's calling? Nappy is it? Hang on a sec. Thanks for waiting. Nappy, your box has room for 
14 more Pokemon. Get out there and fill it up. Hey, this chick knew just what we needed. She knew just what we needed. God damn. Underground entrance? <gasps> there are some shops downstairs, but there are also trainers. I'm scared to go down there. Let's go fuck it up. Let's go fuck it up. I got booted out of the game corner. I was trying to cheat using my Pokemon. Schoolgirl Noel. A Remoraid? Get this out of here. A Porygon 2? Get this out of here. Grumble. Okay, but wait. So we're at 22. I think we're going to try to train evenly. Let's get Ursula up here in action. My Pokemon just got a haircut. I'll show you how strong it is. Hey, Ursula. Whoop this Dratini. Whoop this Dratini. Ay! Excellent work. Keep it up. Damn, somebody left their wallet down here. <laughs> I guess it's mine now. <laughs> ah, damn. Shit. Welcome to the Pokemon Salon. I'm the younger and less expensive of the two haircut brothers. I'll spit up your Pokemon for just $300. So how about it? No, no, no. Yes, I know. How disappointing. Do you consider type alignments in battle? If you know your type advantages, you'll do better in battle. I've never heard someone call it a type alignment. Hey, chill, chill, chill. How, how do you mean it doesn't affect? How do you mean? I don't like how the status covers up the Pokemon's level. Damn! Yeah, fuck that. Fuck that comic punch. I know why you missed it. Oh, shit. Wait, 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 time out, time out, time out. Egg! Egg! <laughs> I need your help! Winston, you got this, buddy. Constrict? Oh, ooh, shit. Fuck it up, Winston. An O-Master? Oh, you know what? This is where Ursula will shine. Ursula. Come on out. It used bit. Why does this, the Giga Drain sound effect sound like the beginning of the game? Is this just me? Did you hear that too? Oh, whoa, 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 wow, wee, wow, wee. Blastoise. Level 9 Blastoise. Blastoise looks like he's reaching out to give you a hug. A very angry hug, but still a hug nonetheless. I'd hug a Blastoise. Ursula, hi. Damn, look at that, level 22 already! Shit, hey, we might end up taking down the gym tonight, but damn. What? Bellsprout? What? You little dweeb. I didn't know you could evolve. Dang. You know that motherfucker just <laughs> all the time. All the time. Hey, I like that. I like that right there. Swing that swing that uh that leaf around. Swing that leaf around. Should I give you the mystery berry and restore your giga drains? Um, okay. So I guess Madam's up next. <laughs> We're just rotating them out. Needs more time. Egg needs more time. No entry beyond this point. Door is locked. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. I think you have some rare Pokemon with you. Let me see them. This fucking Smochum. Get rid of this thing. Sacrify it, Lickitung. <laughs> Wipes out Smoochums on the daily. Hold on. This is too... <laughs> All right, Madam has this. So here on Late Night Crystal, uh, is it a trend yet? <laughs> is it a trend? This is uh, day three. For my birthday, one of my friends gifted me a Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom book, which is inspirational quotes. We are still in chapter one, which is self-empowerment. Look at that, Madam is level 21. 
So tonight's quote is, wait, 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 a Weedle? Okay, all right, we're not gonna, we're not gonna do, we're not gonna do all that. We're not gonna sacred fire the Weedle. So tonight's quote is, I've learned that people will forget what you said, people will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel. I've learned that people will forget what you said, people will forget what you did, but people will never forget how you made them feel. God damn. I feel like she's talking to me every single time. This is only number three. And here we are already. God damn. There are so many inspirational people in my life that that applies to and it's just like whoa wow wow so I should have done that during the moment of meditation that's what I should do I'm not gonna do a moment of meditation every single time I'm not but it was just an idea maybe when I get the inspiration for a moment of meditation and I can remember I'll read the quote first and then we can meditate about the, the quote next time I couldn't win at the slots, and I blew it on card flipping. I got so furious I tossed up my coin case in the underground. Sorry, bud. I taught Blizzard in my Pokemon. It was hard to get coins for it, but it was worth it. Oh, shit. There are TMs here. Do you need some coins? It cost a thousand for 50 coins. Bro, I'm not strapped like that. Chill out. I won't quit until I win. Anybody got some coins for me? Nobody, ain't nobody, ain't nobody got no coins. It's a thousand dollars for fifty coins. I could blow fifty coins in <laughs> four games. <laughs> this is like me at a casino in real life. It's so accurate. I just love this new slot machine. It's more of a challenge than the ones in Celadon. What do you mean? It's all chance. It's RNG, or <laughs> it's as much chance as you want to believe. Wow, the coins keep rolling in. Is this Wario over here? Wow, wow, wow. Life is a gamble. I'm going to flip cards till I drop. Card flip. I prefer it over the slots because it's easier to figure the odds, but the payout is much lower. Alright, show me what you got, little mama. TM25. So I'm going to jot down that it's at the game corner. So TM25. Sacred Fire. We can get another Sacred Fire one. I'm going to jot down GC. TM14, we don't know. So I'm gonna put a GC next to it. And then TM38, we don't know. So I'm gonna put a GC next to it. So it's good to know that Sacred Fire <laughs> is at least another way to get it if we really want to. What you got over here? Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. That wasn't even speed up. That wasn't even sped up. What, 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 are, you, what are you doing here? Wow. No way, ain't no, ain't no way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to check out Crobat's Gen 2 Learn Set. We have evolved from level up set. We are talking about Learn Sets now. So we could rock Bite, Wing Attack, and Confuse Ray. Well, I mean, we'd have a Flyer, and we'd have a Crobat. It's only a hundred coins, and normally when we do Nuzlocke, we count the game corner as a static encounter, like you get one encounter from the game corner, you know? So he's, a Crobat's only a hundred coins, so, <laughs> I mean, we have to wait on some TMs, but, I mean, Rachel, 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 I'm busy, up in the middle of a transaction. My cloister and I are getting more in sync with each other. We battled a wild ditto and managed to drop it in a close match. We're getting into the groove. Bye, let's chat again. So, can she give me more than one leaf stone? Or can I delete her now? I would like to do that. Oh wait, wrong one. Shh, don't talk to me. Welcome. Hey, I'm back. I can't carry anymore. Oh, fuck, I forgot about egg. Okay, egg. 
bro, this speed up is wild. Egg, I'm gonna need you to tell me. Be honest with me. Okay, you need more time. Um, all right, Mr. Egg, I'm gonna need you to chill just, just for a moment, just for a brief moment, while we go and snag what could possibly be your replacement. I mean, just for now. Wow. Wow. We just got a crowbat. This is crazy. This is crazy because I have a crowbat sized hole in my heart. I do. I do, I do, I do. So I'm going to jot down for our encounters. Crowbat. So that we can keep track of duplicates as well as species. Damn, Crobat is 165 pounds? Shit. As a result of its pursuit of faster, as a result of its pursuit of fa oh, faster yet more silent flight, a new set of wings grew on its hind legs. Wow. I think. It's a lady bat too. I think there's only one name fitting for a lady bat. And I believe it is in fact Romla. Yo, look at that sprite. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. 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 Wow. Screech, Leech Life, and Supersonic. Damn. So we're gonna get bite at 12, confuse rate at 19, wing attack at 30, mean look at 42, and wait for it, haze at 55. Oh, shit. Um, okay, well, I would really like to add, I mean, we have a poison type already though, fuck. But I mean, we could use this more so for flying. Wing attack is level 30, we're not quite there yet. Um, but I don't know. I think I think I'm gonna I think for now we're not going to add Ramla only because oh, hold on I know you guys are are losing your minds right now spazzing out Ramla is back Ramla is back and I'm not gonna lie so I'm I'm gonna have it like oh. but only because I want to hatch this egg and Ramla's level five so I'm gonna hatch the egg. And well, if we're gonna be doing some walking today, we set a workout on our watch. We're walking around the uh, today, tonight, walking around the uh, Goldenrod City here. Do you know that's where we're at? Goldenrod City it says it right there. The festive city of opulent charm. Wow. Oh wow. But since we're walking around Goldenrod City, might as well get these steps in. Bike shop, bro. You're right here next to it, my guy. You don't know. If you treat your Pokemon nicely, they will love you in return. Oh, let me see your look at tongue. It's friendly towards you. It looks sort of happy. It's very happy. Thank you. Thank you. Maybe that's why my Pokemon don't like me very much. It acts really glad. I like how they just subliminally give you these messages. Hey, don't let your Pokemon faint. The world is a cycle path. The world is a cycle path. I see what you did there. Oh, I moved here, but I can't sell my bicycles. Why is that? Could you ride a bicycle and advertise it for me? Really great. Give me your name and phone number, and I'll loan you a bicycle. Oh, thanks, bro. My bicycles are first rate. You can ride them anywhere. Hey, thanks, bro. I appreciate that. Appreciate that, bro. Let me check it out. Hey, bro. Guess what I found? <laughs> You'll never guess what I found, bro. I found the bike shop. Motherfucker just gave me a bike. <laughs> Didn't even have to ask. Is that man in black dressed up like a Team Rocket member? How silly. Homest. They built a new radio tower to replace the old creaky one. Oh, I'm gonna tell you guys right now. I cannot wait. To do the radio tower on late night crystal it is like the perfect episode the perfect vibe when i think of gen 2 i remember staying up late as a kid playing through the radio oh my god oh 
the joy in my heart right now reminiscing about late night radio tower i know that's so weirdly specific but it's like i feel like if you didn't play pokemon as a kid you just wouldn't know i'm sure a lot of you guys did but i mean still either way i don't know so this is the radio tower oh no that's team galactic what do you want pest scram don't speak to me like that bitch i just said i can't wait for this episode where i get to whoop your ass the train hasn't come in I know, I'll carry the passengers on my back. <laughs> that won't work. <laughs> Dumbass. I'll carry the passengers on my back. <laughs> Alright, let me know how that turns out for you, bro. The man at that house rates your Pokemon names. He can even rename your Pokemon. Is he the name raider? Hello, hello, I'm the name raider. I rate the names of Pokemon. No. Okay, then. Come again sometime. Yeah, let me be, bro. Why is this how why is this sign up next to his house? Oh, we didn't go back up, did we? Hey bro. I was challenged to do a battle downstairs. It's rough down there. You better be careful. Bro. I fucked them all up. What do you mean? Yo, we can go to the gym right now. No, 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 no. We're not ready. We're not ready. Blooming beautiful flower shop. Oh wow. Have you seen that wiggly tree that's growing on Route 36? My little sister got all excited and went to see it. I'm worried. Isn't it dangerous? You ain't got a cash register in here? You running this business out of your home? You got a license to sell flowers around here, little lady? Once while I was battling, my Pokemon couldn't make any moves. The power points or PP of its moves were all gone. Damn. Training never ends. Sometimes a healthy Pokemon may be unable to use its moves. If that happens, heal to the Pokemon Center or use an item. I just want you guys to know I'm only talking to these NPCs for you guys. You know, sometimes, you know, we all, we all need to brush up. We all need to brush up on our uh, in-game knowledge. <laughs> a strange tree is blocking the road. It wriggles around if you talk to it. I heard it became weird when someone watered it with a squirt bottle. I'm telling you, everybody just tells you what to do in this game. I wonder how many kinds of Pokemon there are in the world. Three years ago, Professor Oak said there were 150 different kinds. Damn, now they're foreshadowing that there's new Pokemon in this game? What? What? Excuse me, kid. Can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? He's on Route 31. You will? Perfect. Thanks, kid. My pal's a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. You'll recognize him right away. What? Take a Pokemon with mail? Okay, hold on. I remember it's the guard guy. Route 35. Oh shit. Are you going to the gym? Me too? You mean the next gym? Because I haven't done the last one yet. I'm not trying to get whooped tonight. Hey. This is a blood sacrifice right here. Fortress has blood inside, right? Well, no one knows what's inside its murky depths. What could be inside there? Who knows? Hey, I love how Madam is stomping everything out. Like, quite literally stomping everything out. Hey, don't ever poison Madam President ever again. She said my boyfriend's weak, so I can't really rely on him. Damn. Okay, Madam President, let's get you back here. Judy, you're up next, girl. You're up next, Judy girl. Stomp out that Sunkern. Stomp out that Krabby. Look at that, Judy. Whooping Mons that are super effective against her. Crazy. It's crazy. Who, who, who let the dogs out? Who told her to do that? I'm practicing my fire breathing. Come on, bro. Whoa, that water gonna hurt, though. Okay, wait, chill. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, wait, chill. Never mind. Never mind. Hey. Let me step forward. Ooh. God damn. Okay, Judy. Let's do it again. Oh, fuck. oh it's a level three Quillfish? A level eight Hoppet? A level 13 Mr. Mud? A level 18 Spinarak? What does he have? A squad of Magikarp normally? A squad of Caterpie normally? Judy at 22 as well? Hey, little bitch ass, uh, you need to hunch. Roger? You last one to get leveled up, bro. Danger lurks in the night. 
Woo, 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 woo. This far fish here. Woo, 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 woo. So I feel like here on Late Night Crystal, we have uh, formed a little woo metronome egg bomb stopping me in my tracks. Chill, chill, chill. Cleffable. Chill, chill, chill. I was gonna say, we formed a little community of sorts. Um, you guys are very, very interactive in the comments and I really want to thank you guys for that. Um, I know before I mentioned, uh, I alluded to merch that may be coming soon. Um, and I talked about these stickers. I don't know why I talk about these things so late in the video. Talk about these stickers that, uh, I think they will be available very, very soon. Um, but I think what we're going to do with them is I want to make them like available for limited time, you know, there'll be a new color scheme available, but I think we may have a couple different ones to start with, but I don't know. Oh, this is our first encounter. Time is of the essence. Um, so we'll see. Oh, wow. But I wanted to give you guys an update, you know, I'm not going to sit here and act like I'm just teasing you over and over and over again, but I wanted to give you an update, um, because I feel like it's like every other day somebody's asking me, what's up with merch? What's up with merch? Where's the merch at? So it's coming, it's coming, it's coming. I don't know if we're going to have a t-shirt or anything like that, uh, right now, but maybe just the stickers for now. Plus I feel like t-shirts are a thing of the past. We have so many t-shirts. Not to say we'll never do t-shirts again. I'm just saying, like right now, let's uh let's do something a little uh I say outside the box. It's just fucking stickers. Anyways, let me catch this goddamn crocodile. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> catch this goddamn crocodile. Yo, why? Why everything you do do so much damage to me? You are level 12. You are level 12. Yeah, get pearlized. Get pearlized. Madam President, thank you for talking down the enemy here. Well, we say the enemy, but it's only because it hasn't been caught yet. Hey, but you know what? I will gladly accept a crocodile. Act like I won't. Act like I won't. Imagine we take on silver. It's our for alligator versus his. But is there even enough room for two hench ass water types? Like a crocodile and a kingler? Or a for alligator and a kingler? I feel like that's a lot of infighting right there. Yo, are you being for real right now? Can you stop doing all of that? Can you stop, like, slowly chipping away at my HP as well. It's not needed. I just need you to stay in the ball. Uh, stop doing that. Like, right now. Stop doing that. <laughs> stop doing all of that. And why are you not staying in the Pokeball? Like, I get you're a starter, but, hey. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Hey. Croconaw, the big jaw Pokemon. The tips of his fangs are slanted backward. Once those fangs clamp down, the prey has no hope of escape. Damn. So we have that Lady Croconaw. What do we name Lady Croconaw? I think I'm going to name her... I've used it and wasted so much time to come up with the most basic names. I think I'm gonna name this Lady Croconaw. Patty. Oh, I just realized it's spelled like a hamburger patty, but that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant at all. He said, I'll go anywhere. Bug Pokemon appear there, you little weirdo. <laughs> What's wrong with you? 
So what else could we have gotten here? Is this just a oh shit, ditto. Mischievous. We're always right behind the mischievous lady and wouldn't have been mad, wouldn't have been happy with it. I think the crocodile is the best thing in the grass. Unless there's an Ente hiding in here somewhere. But I don't see no Ente. What kinds of balls do you use? Don't you worry about it. Get your alpha parasect out of here. Get this Persian out of here too. Are you critting me? Everybody is level 22. Look at that. I love it. 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 Okay, so Judy, you slide up here. TM44? That looks like a new TM to me. Where's the TM case? Here we go. Spore. It's a move that induces sleep. TM44 is Spore. Okay. Not the worst, not the best, but we'll take it. What's up here? There ain't nothing up here? How fishy. How fishy indeed. So, I don't know how far north we want to go. Oh, there's artillery in here. Considering that we don't have... Oh, Madam has cut. I was about to say, what the fuck? Considering we don't have any more Pokeballs, Route 36. I can't get any of these encounters. These trainers are up here. I think what we're going to do is I think, oh, we need to do the bug catching competition too. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, there's so much to do here. So I think what we're gonna do is in the next episode, we're going to do the bug catching contest. We're going to explore up there on Route 36 and whatnot and see about getting the pseudo Wudo and then take on the Goldenrod Gym. Because you remember I was saying at the start of this episode around 24-ish, I'd be a lot more comfortable going to the gym. Well, we got everyone to 22 tonight, so we're well on our way. What can I say? Homeboy Egg here, he's not trying to hatch. But I think here is where we are going to wrap up tonight's episode of Late Night Crystal. We explored Goldenrod, we got some hidden items, we cleared out the underground, we got a bike, and we got some pretty decent encounters. We got a crocodile and a crowbat today, which I can't be mad at. I can only imagine what's in this egg, and I can only imagine what the pseudo is going to be. But we're going to wrap up tonight's episode here. If you guys enjoy tonight's episode of Late Night Crystal, and of course, you want to show your support as a proud member of the Navi Nation, make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support's greatly appreciated. Right in the nick of time. <laughs> a Charmander came out of the egg. Okay. Give a nickname to the Charmander. I mean, it's duplicates. It's species. I mean, I can't be mad at it. But I don't think I'm going to have two Charmanders on the team. I think that basically means that Lady Ramla is back. Wow. So what do we call, I can't name it Roger, uh, I'm going to name it Fiona. We have Fiona, a level 4 Charmander, Ember, and Dizzy Punch. Wow. <laughs> Was this supposed to be, what, an Igly buff? Oh, well, no, what's a, what Pokemon is Dizzy Punch? Is it Igglybuff? I feel like it's Buneri, but that's the wrong gen. Anyways, we got Dizzy Punch Charmander, so that's what the fuck is up. So, we have not done anything with Ramla yet. I think it's because we are good, good to go on the next gym. I think we are going to try to switch train her a little bit. I know we're playing on set, but we'll see what ends up happening. We'll see, we'll see what we can do here. So I'm gonna go up in here real quick, like, and buy something, bro. This speed up button. 
and buy some podions. You selling you selling that good shit, bro? You selling that good shit, bro? I don't need 63 of these motherfuckers. Take this shit back to zero. This speeder button is redonkulous. They should let you change it. Like I get it, it's an old game and like it can zoom super fast and shit because of that, but like relax. Relax. Actually, wait, 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 wait. I mean, this is like the situation with Azalea Town all over again. I'm not going to waste any more money. <laughs> Hold on a moment. Let me go get another encounter here real quick. Oh, but you know what we need to do really quick, like, before this? I almost forgot. I almost forgot. Um, there is homeboy. I'm going to deposit Ramla real quick. Shouldn't have done that. Should have kept Ramla. Anyway, homeboy up here at the <laughs> guardhouse that I just fucking went through. <laughs> this speed up is crazy. Excuse me, kid. Can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon's mail to my friend? He's on Route 31. You look perfect. Thanks, kid. My pal's a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. You recognize him right away. Okay, so I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, wait. You can read it, but don't lose it. Route 31. Oh, yeah. There was a weird tree blocking the road. I wonder if it's been cleared. Oh, this shit is after? Is this mine? Do I get to keep it afterwards? Do... Uh, is it... We have a... I'm start? Dark K leaves to another road. Signed, Randy. Okay. Um. Well, do we have to touch the tree? <laughs> I'm trying to remember. I know we came up here last time. Oh, it's a cut bush. But wait. Madam has cut. <sighs> Playing the wrong game here. Route 36. Oh, wait. I didn't battle these dudes in the last episode. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on. This is not cool because. Ramla is not here to benefit. It's a fruit bearing tree. Okay, hold on, time out. <laughs> I literally just said that this was going to happen. No, I'm not doing this, I'm not doing this, I'm not doing this. I just said that this was going to happen. I was going to get distracted. <laughs> We're going to go and take on the gym. Before we do the pseudo wudo, I thought we could jump down here. Before we do the pseudo wudo or anything else, I just bought the potions for this. What am I doing? What am I doing? I, I, all right, so back to your regularly scheduled programming. We're going to drop this Kenya off in the... Wait, can I not? Oh, remove mail. Give me that shit. I'll give it back to you. Send the remove mail to your PC. Well, if we never end up delivering that mail... Do we still get to keep the Amstar? <laughs> like I don't, I'm not understanding the the full terms of this agreement here. Okay, Ramla, we're gonna try this again. All right, we're we're back. We're focused. We know what we're doing here. We have one objective, and that is to head up in this gym and get a new gym badge. Yeah, let's do it. So, anyways. Oh, put a pin in that real quick. <laughs> Yo, champ in the making. This gym is home to normal type Pokemon trainers. I recommend you use fighting type Pokemon. Unpin. So, I know we didn't have an episode of Late Night Crystal last Friday. Um, and that's a little bit my bad. I mean, look at this fucking crowbat. A little bit my bad. It can't be anybody else's bad. Um, 
No, I was thinking about doing two episodes on Thursday night. Um, because I was pretty sure I wasn't going to be around on Friday night to record. Uh, I just ended up going out um, for my birthday with a bunch of friends. My birthday was on a Tuesday. So on Friday, I ended up going to the skating rink. And I have not been roller skating in like 15 years. Me and my mom used to go all the time, all the time, like every Saturday morning, we would go to the skate rink for like three, four hours, every Saturday morning, and when I tell you, it's like riding a bike, <laughs> you know, once you learn, you never forget that shit, you never forget that shit, stomp, are we stomping, well, I'm never gonna clean either of these, so why not? <laughs> it was just, it can only help with grinding. It can only help with grinding. Um, wait, what am I doing here? Against this. We need Winston. Alright, Winston. Hold on to this spray. But yeah, I have not been roller skating in a long, long fucking time. And I only fell once, and it wasn't even my fault wasn't even my fault bro I was clicking bubble again anyways so like I was skating along right and you know like at the skating rink it's like a fucking NASCAR track <laughs> you know like it's just a big oval um, and like everyone's going in one direction so I'm going along I know where this dude comes like completely what is this perpendicular completely like against the flow of traffic and everything and we kind of just like boom hit the ground like it wasn't like anything dramatic or anything and we helped each other up and we laughed it off and moved on but I didn't fall not once that's why I was saying it's like riding a bike I completely forgot like whoa look at me go god damn but it was a ton of fun I loved it 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 I loved every minute of it when my boy can you make it through this gym I mean until we go back to heal that's what that's that's really what I mean um yikes Ursula I'm gonna need you to come through on this one girl whoa that jump kick was spooky rolling kick oh chill Wait, hold, on, hold on top of this trainer got level 23 hip only admittedly having Ramla leveled up right now would do wonders it would do absolute wonders. Let's get some of that HP back. Ursula, show us how strong you are, girl. All right. <laughs> All right. But you know what? I mean, Ursula doing the damn thing. You can't say she ain't. You can't say she ain't. She did do the damn thing. Holy fuck, that him only wrecked us. I'm not having fun anymore. I want to come home, Mom. <laughs> this isn't fun anymore. I just watched my plant get karate kicked in the face. <laughs> I'm not having fun anymore. And plus, I didn't want to use up all our super potions because we don't have a lot. Mm mm. Mm mm. Mm mm. Okay. Knock, knock. Let me. Mm. Knock, knock. We're back. Don't speak to me, bro. I already spoke to you. We are back and, uh,. This chick right here, don't look at me, don't ever speak to me again. You treated my Pokemon very rudely, might I add. Ugh. So, I did want to also update you guys on merchandise. A lot of you guys have been asking about merchandise. Um, what the fuck am I doing? Um, a lot of you guys have been asking about merchandise coming up on the channel, and I mentioned the... Um, stickers, canteen stickers and whatnot, and you know, I gotta tell you, these stickers are fucking bomb. Like this material, it's so fuck. I don't want to say if you're a fan of, if you're a, a, a big part of sticker culture, if you're sticker woke, then you know like there are some good stickers and there are some shitty fucking stickers. But these stickers are pretty goddamn good, so I'm really happy with them. Um, but I have a few other machinations that I would like to work on prior to release 
prior to release. So I want to spend a little bit more time and I think I may coordinate that with the launch of a new series on the channel here soon. So you guys have to, cause this is, this is for late night crystal ears only. Late night crystal ears only. Okay, so show me Ursula really quick. Like we have three, I'm gonna go back. See, this is what I was talking about at the start in the team recap with Razor Leaf. I mean, I know like Vine Whip has 10, I think what Razor Leaf has 15? Razor Leaf have 25, something like that. But Razor Leaf has a chance to crit, whereas Vine Whip will forever do what 40 damage. Does it show me? Doesn't. Um, so <laughs> would I mind having a victory battle with Vine Whip the whole time? No, but Razor Leaf is just, I mean, come on, let me tell you the truth, it's just because Razor Leaf is cool. You know, when them leaves hit, it's like, shh, shh, shh. what was Vine Whip? I don't want to be anywhere near whipping. <laughs> okay, I'm going to save my game. Because as you know, only you can prevent lost save data. So. Hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so like, I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You want a battle? I'm warning you. I'm good. Are you good? Or is that Miltank good? And Miltank is a Pokemon that cannot evolve, so it's a base, basic Pokemon. So it means that the randomizer is going to randomize it out for another basic Pokemon, right? Is that how it works? Ranger Joe, show me what you got, little mama. All right. Look at this goofy ass dude. Why does he look like he's still in Pokemon Yellow? <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he is still in black and white. He's still in Gen 1. Like, I get it. He's a fossil. He's old. He's gray. But. Wait, when did Aerodactyl get purple wings? Does he not have purple wings in this game? Because Aerodactyl now, he has like a purplish hue to his wings, right? Am I am I am I tripping? Am I crazy? I I'm pretty sure Dacto has purple on him. But wait, Rama, not you, not yet. Um, Winston, we have a another pirate here who has pulled up alongside us and is attempting to board. I need you to. See, this is when we need guillotine. This is when we need guillotine for times like this. Wait, I had to open up Pokemon Go. Hell yeah! Aerodactyl got some purple ass wing. To be honest, all of Aerodactyl is kind of purple. <laughs> like, even the gray in his skin has like a purple tint to it. And then his wings are purple as shit. Hey. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Top 5. In tonight's episode, we are doing Top 5 Purple Pokemon. The number 5 slot, we have Aerodactyl. Yo, that bubble did nothing. Actually, nothing. Um, okay, so here's the plan. What I think I'm going to do is I'm going to... Hmm. I'm considering clicking I mean I know it's normal type on a rock type but I mean it's doing basically just as much as bubble did and now we're confused and now we're hurting ourselves in confusion okay so what my original plan was was to whoa 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 Winston oh whoa 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 Winston that's why he's a pirate. God damn, hold up. Aerodactyl get pursued. Um, okay, so I'm gonna do what I was intending to do the entire time and just go out to Judy. But to be fair, Winston did put in work. Now, Judy, I know from the comfort of your Pokeball, you just saw how much damage Winston the Pirate Stomp just did. 
Judy, come on, no, Judy. No, we don't do that here, Judy. Come on, Judy. Hell yeah, Judy. Do it one more time, Judy. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Judy, don't be scared. Judy, don't be scared. There we go. There we go. It's okay. It's only our third gym battle. She's still a little bit nervous. A little bit nervous there. A little bit nervous. Um, but... Ranger Jill sent out Eevee. Oh, my lord. Okay. 26. Whoa. 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 I was expecting them to be like... 23, 24, maybe. God damn. 26 Eevee, what the fuck am I supposed to do? Um, Madam? Why should I go out to Roger? <sighs> Roger's gotten like no screen time in this episode. We're gonna get him some screen time after this. Everybody, get excited for Roger. Get excited. He'll be on right after this word, <laughs> right after a word from our sponsor. <laughs> right after this commercial break. Alright. Get this shit out of here. Get this shit out of here. Judy, you evolving? No? Okay. Just want to be sure. <laughs> You're me. You shouldn't be so serious. You, you child, Jim. Where? Where? <laughs> you me. Where? Can you give me this damn badge? Oh no, you made Whitney cry. The girl on the well around the way over there made me cry with that goddamn hip only. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. What? What do you want? A badge? Oh right, like I forgot. Here's plain badge. What do you want? A badge? That's how this works. What the fuck do you mean? Plain badge lets your Pokemon use strength outside of battle. It also boosts your Pokemon's speed. Oh, you can have this too. Is this a new TM? It is indeed TM45. Survey says. <laughs> okay. We have milk drink. Who wants it? How ironic. Isn't it just perfect for a cutie like me? Alright. Well. So she had level 26s. So I can only imagine what Mori will have. I have to imagine it. Because you know I can't do that math. But okay. I think the best part of that gym is that we got Romla to level 11. Um, homeboy with this Amistar, um, once we get to where we're going, I'll come bring him his shit. <laughs> once we get to where we're going, then I'll do all that. But wait, 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 wait. Before we proceed, I need to, uh, pick up a few more items once more. Hello, my good sir. Um, I don't think we need... Nope, 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 nope. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to you. I think that we need... I'm going to snag... 20 Pokeballs. 5 Great Balls. You know, in case we run into some big shit. And then... 3 Super Podions. And we're going to call it good. And we're going to call it good. Oh, I was going to say, while they're filling our order, we have to get our nightly dose of pocket Maya Angelou wisdom. So before we step in here, let us take a moment. So we're still in chapter one, self-empowerment. And the next quote, it's one of the greatest gifts you can give yourself. To forgive, forgive everybody. It's one of the greatest gifts you can give yourself to forgive, forgive everybody. 
I forgive that trainer in that gym with that busted ass hip on me that tried to end my nuzlocke just now. <laughs> so in order to begin this, have you seen that wiggly tree that's growing around 36? My little sister got all excited and went to see it. I'm worried, isn't it dangerous? I was gonna say, do we actually have to see the wiggly tree first? Like, do we, oh, I mean, I guess she just asked us, have you seen? Have you seen? And speaking of forgiveness, Hector and I watched Rings of Power tonight. We missed out on last week's episode, so we watched last week's episode, and no, no, I don't care about your awesome discovery. We watched episodes five and six back to back, last week's episode and this past week's episode. I know it's confusing. The most, the last two most recent episodes. There we go. Um, wait, 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 wait. I know that last time I came up here and I was like, oh, no, 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 I don't want to get this encounter here, but. Is this Route 31 outside of this city too? Cause I don't remember. I don't remember. I don't remember. I'm gonna fight this guy and stop running from him. I just want to know if this route and the route on the other side are the same route, which I think they are. But either way, we're guaranteed to get two encounters. So I know we didn't get one before, and I don't know if we get one now in the Sudowoodo. But send out your Raichu. Damn, that's a fat ass Raichu. God damn, that's a thick boy. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, he looks uncomfortable. Like, uncomfortable to be. Like, what the fuck? Hey, did you see that? Lady Ramla just learned to bite. We're on our way. We're on our way. Um, but anyways, yes. Oh, this is the little sister. Put a pin in rings of power really quickly. Forgiveness in rings of power. Put a pin. Put a pin. I'm the flower shop's Floria. Listen, listen. When I sprinkled water on that wiggly tree, it jumped right up. It just has to be a Pokemon. I bet it would be shocked out of its disguise if you soaked it. I know. I'll tell my sis and borrow her water bottle. What's up, bro? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Um, anyways. So, yeah. I feel like everybody should forgive Rings of Power. Now, I know I'm in the minority when I say this. I know I've mentioned this before as well. But, I actually kind of like Rings of Power. <laughs> Like, I see the reviews, you know, I know what people are saying about it, but, like, that still doesn't really deter me. I don't know what it is about it, but I really like the show. Like, I don't think it's the best thing ever made, but, I mean, at least I look forward to it every week. And, like, I understand, like, reviewers and certain people are just being reactionary for entertainment purposes, but I really don't think it's as bad as everyone says it is. And you know what else puts me in the minority? is I don't think House of the Dragon is all that great. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm not calling it bad. I just have my own qualms with the show. And I, I am more frustrated every week after an episode of House of the Dragon than I was the week before. I don't know. It's a lot, but I don't know. I definitely feel like I'm in the minority with Rings of Power, but I just, I really like it. I really like it. They said they spent a billion dollars on five seasons, something like that, something like that. So, I mean, I feel like if they know they have five seasons, then they're telling a story that's worth five seasons. Does that logic track? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. La 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 Have plenty of water, my lovely. You're not gonna give me the water bottle? 
When I told my sister about the Jiggly Tree, she told me it's dangerous. If I beat Whitney, I wonder if she'll lend me a water bottle. I thought I got rid of her. Nappy, it's Rachel. Got time to chat? My Raikou and I are getting more in sync with each other. We battled a wild ditto and managed to drop it in a close match. <laughs> drop that bitch. <laughs> We're getting into the groove. Bye, let's chat again. Okay, never mind. This is Leafstone Girl, south of the city. Okay. Not the picnicker from before. Oh, you're better than Whitney. You'll be okay then. Here's the squirt bottle. Hey, thanks. Appreciate that shit. All right. So yet again, another item that has a singular purpose that will soon be boxed. <laughs> okay, so for the 17th umph time, let's head up here. I think Route 36 is the same as Route above it, not to the east of it. Anyways, look, it's a weird tree. Use the squirt bottle. Hell yeah, use the motherfucking squirt bottle. The weird tree doesn't like the squirt bottle. The weird tree attacked. Alright. Sudowoodo stack encounter is. Species. Uh, I mean, I'm not mad at it. I'm honestly not mad at it. I mean, it just means we have another chance. This is not what I meant to go out to, by the way. It just means we have another chance to bat battle it. So here, catch this great ball since you were still in the orange. This is just nothing but power in the PC. Bro, do you know wing attack? Cause if not, I'm gonna send out this grass type that I have that knows. Bro, I'm done attacking. You ain't gotta worry about me. This grass type that has stun spore. Never mind. You know what's good for you, bruh. That's good. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Golbat, the bat. <laughs> when it plunges its fangs into its prey, it instantly draws and gulps down more than 10 ounces of blood. Wow. 10 ounces of blood. So now we have a second Lady Ramla. So... Let's see here. If the day ever comes, Ram, Lady Ramla's daughter, Ramalina, <laughs> will be here. Is this the dude? Did you clear that wretched tree? I'm impressed. I want you to have this. Oh, shit. TM08, we ain't got neither. That happens to be Wing Attack. Wow. Well. I need to know if we learn wing attack by level up. If not, I'll teach you that to Lady Ramla right now. If any rocks are in your way, find rocks man. Oh, that's what he was supposed to give me originally. Okay, but hold on. Day don't day. Route 36. Okay, so it's the same all the way across the route. And up as well? I believe so. Oh no, this is Route 37. Okay. So we're gonna get three encounters tonight. Oh wow, everybody clap, clap your hands this evening. All right, I think we're gonna get a Route 36 encounter here. After all that teasing on the other side of the route, we're just gonna... Oh really? I just wanna get it over here because I figured it'd be high level. <laughs> Survey says, do we make a Judy Lena? <laughs> so technically that species. I think we have, what? A hundred plus more Pokemon in this here game. I don't think we need to necessarily keep all of the same ones. So we got a gold badge just now. Ramalina. Um, but I don't want this Rhyhorn, he's level four, so I'm gonna go over here anyways. Why are they level 4 over here in the grass? What the fuck? <laughs> Whitney had a level 26. 
which we actually did get kind of lucky with because if that had been anything it was it did get randomized into a basic pokemon i just realized that whoa what is up with this region god dang you just got rhinos everywhere well we don't have one of those <laughs> that's definitely not species but how do we catch it I can paralyze it. Hell yeah. I can look it again. Yo, I was this close to clicking stomp. I completely forgot it is, in fact, level 5. <laughs> I was about to click stomp thinking, oh yeah, it'll live this. No, no, it won't. Alright, how I'm doing? I know. I insulted your honor by using a pokeball this is where we bought the great ball so that if we run into any sort of beast like this we'll be good to go oh come on bro i literally can't do anything more to you i think the next lick will kill i think it will um and i don't think anyone else is low enough level I think I can click Leech Life with, uh, oh, definitely, well, I don't know, it's, bug, bug, it's physical, right? Okay, here we go. Okay, well, Lady, Lady Ramla, no, no, no. Madam President, we're gonna need you back out here. Bro, don't tell me this is gonna be, like, the Blossom. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Come on, bruh. We, we don't have that Pokeball money right now. I need you to get in this Pokeball and stop wasting these Pokeballs. Houndoom, the dark Pokemon. The pungent smelling flame that shoots from its mouth results from toxins burning in its body. Toxins burning in its body? What do they even mean? Like, he just, he's just, he just got bad gas? <laughs> the gas is that hot? He just has really, really bad gas? Um, so what do we name this thing though? I think I'm gonna name him. Hmm. I think I'm gonna name him. Leave me alone. <laughs> leave me alone, okay? Leave me leave me alone, okay? Gimli, may he rest in peace. Didn't quite make it all the way through. I just wanted I just wanted to have someone else. That's all. Um actually I'm gonna go over here. Um and can I just point out that that Houndoom is not a bad get? Do we go up here? Do we get this item? black glasses hell yeah that works well with the houndoom we just got um houndoom is not a bad get by any means and what the fuck we're kind of lucky to get that i mean i know we have a um oh, we have such duplicate typings right now and that's not necessarily good because once roger evolves we'll have two flying types roger and rama uh, um and then we'll have two poison types ursula and rama Hmm, I hope we can, I don't know, we might have to do a little bit of rearranging, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I said we had three encounters tonight to make, and I intend to make good on that promise. We need to get our third encounter and serve it. Damn, we ready, ready. Okay, survey says Route 37. <sighs> I did say before in a previous episode I would be big down for an Elekid, so I'm not mad at that. But how am I supposed to attack this thing? I don't think he's. Uh, I, I can't do anything with him here. Um. Damn, where's wing attack when you need it? Um, I could try to click on. Can you stun spore? and electric type <laughs> uh what if i 
know. I feel like rap's gonna do too much. He's just, it's just a baby. It's just a baby. It's just a baby. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna click it. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna let the rap do his damage. Whoa, 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 why is this motherfucker doing so much damage? Chill out, make me waste a super potion. No, get your little ass back in there. Hold up, hold up. Now get in this Pokeball and stay in this Pokeball. Hell yeah. Caught that motherfucking little bitch. Okay. Elekid, the electric Pokemon. Damn, he's thick. 52 solid ass pounds. <laughs> it loves violent thunder. The space between its horns flickers bluish white when it is charging energy. Wow. So, do we give a nickname to this lady, Elekid? I think I'm going to name her. Mm, I think we're going to name her. So that Penelope and Stephanie can chill in the box together. How about that? <laughs> Penelope and Stephanie can go and chill in the box together. So I don't know about you guys, but I did not even think about, oh hey, but the pack is full. Get the fuck out of here. I will toss this shit. I will toss this shit and not to pick up another acorn because I'm not going back to make fucking pokeballs um but i don't know about you guys but i was definitely not expecting to whoa <laughs> definitely not expecting to get to equity city tonight but i think since we're right here i think we're just gonna go do it hey what is it what is this thing doing hold up what the fuck is took aim What the, what the, what the, what the, get this, get this, get this Clefable off my screen. Get this goddamn Clefable off my screen. This Clefable in here just fucking with people. Pokemon can't do a thing if they're asleep. I'll show you how scary that is. Bro, I just learned how scary it was. Were you not there? Oh, you almost got me. Whoa, 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 whoa! Damn! Hold up, my attack fell too? Oh, this is no good. Where is the elegant when you need it? This is no good because this, uh, Slowbro has confusion. And he's going to click confusion on Ursula. This is no good. Um, uh, we're weak, we're weak. Let's see here. Jesus Christ, why? Why do you keep lowering my attack, bro? Oh, I knew it. I was about to say, I know that's why he clicked tackle on me. Okay, well, we didn't crit that time. Okay, just for shits and giggles, let's see what ends up happening. <laughs> what is this little motherfucking pirate? He is a motherfucking pirate if I've ever seen one. Okay. Alright. Ooh, a magneton. I wouldn't have been mad at that. God damn. Well now, would you look at that? Ladies and gentlemen, we made it to Ecritic City. Hi, I'm Bill. Now, who are you? Hmm, happy, huh? You've come at the right time. I just finished adjustments on my time capsule. You know that Pokemon can be traded, right? My time capsule was developed to enable trades with the past, but you can't send anything that didn't exist in the past. If you did, PC in the past would have a breakdown. <laughs> so you have to remove anything that wasn't around in the past. Put simply, no sending new moves or new Pokemon in the time capsule. Don't you worry. I'm done with the adjustments. Tomorrow, time capsules will be running at all Pokemon centers. I have to hurry on back to Goldenrod and see my folks. Bye bye. 
we're going to head back and snag a few different things. So I think we're going to head to the Ruins of Alf first. Uh, because we never finished that escape rope shit. <laughs> and if I'm not mistaken, I think we do have an escape rope. So if I'm understanding this correctly, I believe that it's this one. You're supposed to use the escape rope in this room? In the room that has the writing on the wall. Patterns appear on the wall. Escape. Okay, so I'm going to use the escape rope. Deuces. And then we go back in. Whoa, damn. Moving and shaking. Oh damn! Look at this shit right here, motherfuckers. Excuse me, bro. Look at this. Whoa! All the riches I get by. Me first dollar. Oh. <laughs> 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 cannot make this shit up, man. You cannot make this shit up. Yo. What the fuck? The legendary brick piece. Right when you need it. Right when you need it. A Poké Doll. Wow. I wanted to come in here because these items could be randomized into anything. Anything. They could be randomized into anything at all. And we get a brick piece. A Poké Doll. A Master Ball. Blue Sky Mail. Okay, well. Fits the aesthetic. And a paintball. Oh, can't hear any more items. <sighs> this old nemesis. Um, I'm honestly never gonna use this Poké Doll. <laughs> um, the pink bow. Doesn't the pink bow like increase normal type moves or something like that? Wait a minute. A rare chunk of tile. I'm not tossing that. Not tossing that. Mm mm. Or does the pink bow not do that at all? Powers up normal type moves. It does. Okay. Um. We could give that to Madam right now. <laughs> we could. She has stomp and it's stab. But you know, honestly, it would probably be better in the hands of Winston since he clicks stomp and slash. Judy as well. Damn, I'm sorry. Winston the pirate now has a pink bow in his hat. <laughs> It's 2023. It's 2023, okay? I forgot all about all these fucking items we got. God damn. Can anyone use this? No? No one's racking psychic type moves? Okay. Okay, just checking. Just checking. Alright. Whoa. Whoa. Words. C. Words. What was the E? Words. I don't even know what the fuck this is down here. Whoa, 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 whoa! Our words. Oh my god. Oh my god, I felt so fucking stupid trying to figure out what the fuck is that word? S. <laughs> what? What? Our words shall. <laughs> sha, sha. Our words shall. It's like playing hangman. <laughs> you know, like I have like four of the letters figured out and I'm like, oh. Our words shall remain here for the. Ages, I'm gonna guess this is a G. I don't know what that is, but I don't really know where I am. What the fuck? <laughs> Our words shall remain here for the ages. Okay, really spooky. Really spooky way to kick off. It's almost October, I guess, but a really spooky way to kick off tonight's episode. Let's fucking get it, Ruins of Al. 
Scare the shit out of everybody. Our words shall remain here forever. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to take like a... Uh, Arceus up there or some shit? Could you imagine? Okay, so next on our route. We have to deliver this fucking mail. We have to put it on a Pokemon that we don't want. So like, is there another Pokemon on, on our PC? I know we just looked at it, but I want to double check. Because, uh, I mean, it's not like I'm saying Amistar is an incredible Pokemon, but I'm just saying this is Generation 2. So, Amistar could have the potential to be a better Pokemon. <laughs> Since there are fewer Pokemon. You catch my drift? Um, Alright, so I think where we're headed to next is Goldenrod. And we are definitely not going through Azalea Town to get there. But, I mean, that was cool. All that shit that we just did there, that was cool. Whoa, Rachel, swimmer, nappy. It's Rachel, got time to chat. Would you be my practice partner again sometime? I'll be winning on Route 34. Could you take it a little easier on me next time? Bye, let's chat. Fuck no. Absolutely not. Red didn't get any better by having people take it easy on him. Uh-uh. Actually, you know what I think we're going to do next? Since we're here now, we might as well. The bug catching contest. Now, I don't remember. Do they let you do this shit during the day? Today's Tuesday. That means the bug catching contest is on today. The rules are simple. Using one of your Pokemon, catch a bug Pokemon to be judged. Would you like to give it a try? Sure. Uh oh. You have more than one Pokemon. You'll have to use Crobat, the first Pokemon in your party. Is that okay with you? No, 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 no. Please choose Pokemon to be used in the contest, then come see me. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, alright. Bug catching, bug catching, bug catching, bug catching. Um, Roger, Judy, Winston. Um, Madam, perhaps. Madam can eat up hits, and we have Cut. <laughs> I was gonna say we have Lick. Um,. So we don't have to worry about killing the bug, we can catch a nice big fat one. Mm, yes, the fat all bad. Okay, let's do it. Yep, 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 yep. Fine, we'll hold your other Pokemon while you compete. But wait, can I go see that PC real quick? 20 park balls. Cool, 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 cool. Great, awesome. The person who gets the strongest bug Pokemon is the winner. You have 20 minutes. You run out of park balls, you're done. You can keep the last Pokemon you catch as your own. Go out and catch the strongest bug Pokemon you can find. I'm not so clear on the rules here. Okay, so wait, time out. Hold on. Hold on. Does it pause? Is it paused? I don't know if it's paused. But hold on. Time out. So I'm participating in an event right now. And he said the last Pokemon you catch, you get to keep. Whatever. Um, I'll figure that out when we figure it out, but the way I'm viewing this is like a static encounter. It's a part of this event, and then we'll come back and get a National Park encounter afterwards, right? Right, 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 right? So let's get out there and catch the fattest bug Pokemon we can. <laughs> There's a bug type right here, wow. I mean, honestly, I wouldn't mind having Damn, motherfucking Vaporeon. As it uses the fins on the tip of its tail to swim, it blends with the water perfectly. Do you catch everything in here? Caught Vaporeon? So technically, okay, so we'll figure it out. If we catch everything in here and it gives us everything or whatever, then we'll count, I guess, the Vaporeon as our static encounter. I don't know. That's a bug. Look it. Hey. Madam was a great idea. Madam was a great idea. It flits from flower to flower, collecting honey. It can even identify distant flowers in bloom. You already caught a Vaporeon. Oh, so the last Pokemon you caught. Okay. Um, I don't know how they judge this. Are they actually looking for actual bugs? Because I would go with Butterfree, but I'm gonna, in my opinion, I think Vaporeon is a better Pokemon, so I'm gonna say no. We're not gonna switch Pokemon. I wanna know what's the rarest thing in here. I know it's not this thing. 
I know it's not this thing. Oh wait, I can't heal? Give me away. I can't heal? Does this mean Lickitung is at risk? That's a fucking Kangaskhan. Does that mean that Lickitung- That would've won me the fucking contest right there. If Lickitung is at risk, I don't want to do this. If Madam is at risk, we have to protect the president. And I don't know if I want to- Ugh, fucking chartreuse. Oh my god, yo. Chill. I don't want to risk Madam in this process. That almost thought was a bitch. But if I see another- Oh, god damn it. I can't do anything. He's level 18. Yo. Chill. No, I'm not gonna do this. Yo, get me out of here. Get me out of here. I don't want to risk Madam at all. I'm good with the Vaporeon. You still have 17 minutes left. Do you want to finish that? <laughs> no, no, no. We're gonna wrap this one up right here, bro. We will now judge the Pokemon you've caught. We have chosen the winners. Are you ready for this? Placing third was Sailor Sonia, who caught a Kakuna. Oh, we're crushing that. The score is 316 points. Placing second was Navi, who caught a Vaporeon. This motherfucker better caught a Kangaskhan. That's the only way you beat me. 317 points. This bug catching contest winner is Gent Joe, who caught a bu can't make it up bro you just can't make it up but you know what at the end of the day if we're gonna consider the mon that we caught as a static encounter <clears throat> in my opinion who's the real winner here we are we got a fucking vaporeon and this contest is rigged never the number two finisher wins everstone i'm never stone gonna use that <sighs> please join us for our next contest yeah 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 Give a new name to the Vaporeon you received. Hell yeah. What are you gonna name this boy? Let's name him. Hmm. Let's name him. Wait. It's it's almost here. It's almost here. It's it's going like the thought process. The neurons are firing. Let's name him. Sinclair, your party's full, so the Pokemon was sent to your box and Bill's PC. Alright, clear out, losers. <laughs> clear out, losers. Okay, let's see here. Let's check out Sinclair. Um, well, this is definitely power in the PC. Take a tail with sand attack. Ah, it's a stone evolution, but I mean, we can teach it surf. That's all we really need. <laughs> surf and ice beam. That's all I really need. Everything else will come with it. But I mean, just look at this right here. Look at this fucking look at the box. Fucking there's no Electivire in this game, but Electabuzz, uh, Houndoom, Crobat, for Alligator, Blossom. Yo, look at this in one, two, three, four, five. Let us down, Goldberg. <laughs> but Stephanie could be six. Oh no, we already have Fire and Sauron. I don't know who we had. Allison? Yo, that's crazy. We have so much power in the PC. So much power in the PC. Definitely let me know what you guys think we should do with the team. Definitely let me know. I'm gonna make that the question of the day. I hate making like cliche question of the days like that. That's why sometimes I try to uh, asked like the most abstract question of the day is like just anything to stir up thought you know and then sometimes it's just like are you to me <laughs> help me out real quick hold on pause pause all that question shit uh, but you know what I really need to do really quickly let me do this right now since this the the mo um, self cure for confusion. I'm gonna deposit that. 
I'm gonna pause it that until we need it. I'm gonna pause it that until we need it. A leaf stone, I mean, we can keep it on us. We can keep it on us. Black belt, we don't need it yet. Black glasses, we may not need it yet. This brick piece, absolutely. Actually, you know what, no. I'm going to withdraw that brick piece. Because if we only have so many spaces in our bag, we are going to keep our lucky brick piece in the bag with us at all times. We're gonna put it all the way up here at the top so we will never lose this brick piece ever again. Ever, never, ever, never. Um, this is not a Pokemon Center. I keep trying to heal my Lickitung <laughs> and I can't. But I want to, actually, you know what? Wait, 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 wait. Before we do this, before we do this. All right, so we got an event Pokemon in the National Park. Um, so now what I'm going to do, uh, I think we're going to get Madam out of here. But, you know, we had her like that. I don't really want to waste that money on potions because she can use Lick. But anyways, now we need to get an actual regular encounter in this area. Yes, see? That's what we're going to do. Excellent. Survey says... Is it all the same Pokemon? <laughs> no way. No way. Hold on. 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 I know you got stun spore, yes. Hold on. Hold on. Whoa. Where was that during that little event? What the hell? Stuns for him. My defense sharply fell. Quit leering. I'm not a fan of how many times. Oh, he used bite. That's special. Sandstorm? Why are you hitting me with that shit, bruh? I don't want to hit it with anything. I don't want to do anything. To threaten this wow okay yes definite question of the day <laughs> what do you think <laughs> should do but we have judy and i really like judy though <sighs> i know we're just waiting for judy to learn earthquake which to be fair she probably will learn it by level up before we get the chance to find it well then again i mean all tms are random i was thinking about where it actually is isn't that weird i can't remember shit but i can remember where the fuck earthquake is Anyways, um, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? Uh, let me check. Oh, Lord. Okay, yeah, we, we need to whittle this down, but I can't click anything else. Um, oh, no, 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 I was going to swap because... Judy? Judy, I'm trusting you with this. I am trusting you with this. Oh, whoop. I am trusting you with this. You cannot. Excellent. Excellent. But hey, 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 chill, 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 chill. Control. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just getting the Pokeball. Aren't you envious of poking all the trainers? You have no HP and you're paralyzed. You're laying on the ground, not even moving. <laughs> Come on. Just do it. This is bananas. This is actually bananas. Come on now. I'm trying not to think about how few Pokeballs we have left. <laughs> Come on, little Pupitar. Oh my fucking god, get the fuck out of my mouth. Is 
This is insane. This is insanity. I don't think I've ever had a Nuzlocke where I've had this many encounters run from me because I ran out of Pokeballs. <laughs> I think this is number three at this point. Come on, little pupitar. Why? 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 Like, you're, you're, you're killing the vibe so hard right now. You're killing the vibe so hard. You bastard! You know, I knew it was going to be too good to be true. <sighs> it's because we have so much power in the PC already. That just wouldn't be fair. You're right. I'm not even going to do nothing with it. God damn. <sighs> that would have been bananas. Bananas to catch that. Oh, That would have been such a... Pay attention, please. Oops. I have to quit thinking like a teacher all the time. You must be a Pokemon trainer since you're working so hard. I want you to have this. Thanks. I'll take that. Let a Pokemon hold that quick claw. Sometimes it will strike first during battle. You know, honestly, I think this is probably the root. This lady right here is probably the reason why I talk to everybody in every Pokemon game. The reason why I play open world or <laughs> games and run around and talk to everybody and do everything because I have such a vivid core memory as a kid because you know like back in the day there was no internet you know there was none of that either you had the guidebook or you didn't so like if you knew that one little piece of information and you could share it with somebody else like that was big shit you know like that was so cool and I remember talking to this lady and for the longest time nobody knew hey did you know you can get quick call here like just the dumbest shit, but I will never forget this chick. <sighs> I played a lot of first and second gen, <laughs> if you can't tell. <laughs> I played a lot of first and second gen because I have memories of like every single thing. I don't know why I'm talking to you. Stickers I printed from my Pokedex. I remember that too. Damn! Damn, I'm so old. Shit, my knees start hurt just now. <laughs> uh, but I know that there's a little uh, sneaky, sneaky place. This is mail I got from my daughter. It cheers me up. Get away from me. Where is it at? Oh, it's right here. I'm printing out my Pokedex. You can also print out stuff like mail in your PC boxes. Fucking Nintendo came out with a receipt tape printer. <laughs> We got a sunstone. Fucking lit. That's actually kind of dope because if you asked me, like, where in Gen 2 did you get a sunstone? I don't know. I feel like it's probably some real vague method, like a radio contest or something. Did, did they do that? Did they do that? I remember a lot of shit, but I don't remember that shit. I never turned the fucking radio on. I think I turned the radio on? Never. TM35? Isn't that normally flamethrower? But tonight it is Are we? Are we really are we really gonna do this? Now I'm pretty sure that Judy would learn this by level up but should I give it to Ramla? <laughs> should I give it to Ramla? Because technically she's the fastest on our team. Should I give it to Ramla and just start clicking Fissure? <laughs> on everything in front of me? Fissure, 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 Fissure. <sighs> um. Honestly, I really just want to teach it to Judy. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like she's gonna get it by level up though. Okay, I'm gonna check real quick. 
feel like I have to. I feel like I have to. It doesn't take that long. When it's at Gen 2, it does not get it by level up. So, I'm going to teach it to Judy. Now, I would normally, I would teach it to Ramla, but Ramla has her own path. She has her own purpose here on the team. But we are going to get rid of Tail Whip, because <laughs> we're never going to click it. And now we have Fissure. Wow. Judy is here. She's not playing games. She is not playing games. Mm-mm. Winston is rubbing off. Winston's rubbing off on Judy. Uh-oh. <laughs> but, all right. We did our amulet coin, too. Oh, wow. We did our little scouting of the National Park, and we did our bug catching contest, too. So now we're... Oh, these motherfuckers want to fight. I was going to say, you know, I don't remember. <laughs> I'm sitting there gassing up all the things I do remember. I don't remember anybody being useful over here. Roger, get this thing out of here. Come on, bro. Get this thing out of here, too. Get this thing out of here. But you know what? If they want to fight, I'm kind of down. But I need Romulo to be up here. I'm kind of down. I know I saw a homeboy over here. No, 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 no. A little spinner rack. No, 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 no. You trying to brawl? Oh, we really did get like the best. Ah, it's so upsetting. We really did get like the best encounter in here. What's with this fully paralyzed over and over and over again? Evasion fell. Yo, Roger, get this out of here. <laughs> I tried. I tried to give Robin a chance. I know all these people want to throw hands. Um, okay, hold on. Winston, handle this shelter. Winston, handle this shelter. Will Winston handle this onyx? Excellent, excellent, excellent. I love how the squad is just thriving. Oh, it's itchy up. Whoa, can't escape. I, 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 I. Hold up. Winston, I need you to come in here and intimidate date this Pidgey out out of here okay so now Golden Rod City <laughs> what do you mean I can't escape from <laughs> fucking Spinarag leave me be does she want to fight too because she looked like she want to fight okay hold on put a pin in Golden Rod City real quick the sun floor perfect I wanted to train Roger anyways recovered using a berry my ass Okay. Round level 15, 24, 24. All right. All right, we're done battling, we're done battling. If there's anybody else over here, we'll have to come back and sweep later. But we're done battling. Give me the fuck up out of here. Damn! That speed up just zooms right back. Um, but I definitely want to heal. And you know what's crazy? Is I think it was two episodes ago, I sat here, I know we did like a full on sweep. Full on sweep. Oh wait, we got the quick claw. Uh, a full-on sweep of Golden Round City, and I literally hit every single building except for the radio tower. And I'm gonna say that I probably feel like that was more of like a subconscious thing. You know, like, I just thought to myself, like, oh, I'm gonna do that later. You know, I'm gonna get to this part later in the game or something like that. Let's give Judy the quick claw, and let's give Madam President the amulet coin. You know, maybe like that was the logic, like later on in the game, I'll go ahead and use it. But I don't know. Or later on in the game, we'll go there. But I don't know. But you guys did remind me that we need to go and check out. Oh, you know, hold on, time out, time the fuck out. We do need to go and get the radio card uh, and visit the radio tower in and of itself. The fuck? Um, okay, so I should have I should have bought that fucking energy powder and sold it. Um, so I'm gonna buy five of these, and then I'm gonna buy ten of these, and then I'm gonna buy. Damn. 
All right then. <laughs> and that's where we're at. Is there anything we're still holding that we could sell? I don't like selling the berries. Oh no, we can never sell the brick piece. No, 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 no. Okay. I know there's some shit in that PC I could sell, but later, later on, later on. When I, when I do grinding tomorrow, we'll do it. We'll take care of it. Uh, fuck. Better go back down here. Get out of the way. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Excuse me. We went to the train station too, didn't we? So this is the radio dial. What do you want? No, I remember coming over here and talking to them. But we just didn't go in? What the fuck? Welcome. Oh, that's all you got to say? Hi, are you here for the lucky number show? Want me to check the ID numbers of your Pokemon? If you get lucky, you win a prize. This week's ID number is 64788. Let's see if you have a match. Big money, no whammies. Nope, none of your ID numbers match. Okay, thanks. We have a special quiz campaign on right now. Answer five questions correctly to win a radio card. Slide into your Poke Gear to play the radio anytime, anywhere. Would you like to take the quiz? Yes. Question one. Is there a Pokemon that appears only in the morning? Yes. Magmar. Correct. Question two. Is this statement correct? You can't buy a berry at a mart. Y yes? Bullseye. Question number three. Does HMO1 contain the move Flash? Yes? Nope. <laughs> Is HMO1 cut? Yes, HMO5 is flesh. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay, give me the question. Yes. Give me the question. Yes. Give me the question. No. So far, so good. Question number four. Is Falconer the Violet Gym Leader who uses bird Pokemon? Well, not in this game, but yes. Wow, right again. Here's the final question. Do Golden Rock Game Corner slots have Charmander on their reels? Oh, you're... <sighs> messing with me. You are messing with me. Bingo, you got it. Congratulations. Here's your prize, a radio card. What, do they have Cyndaquil on their slots? What? Navi's Poke Gear can now double as a radio. Please tune into our radio shows. All right, let's check it out. Check it out. How do I? How? How? Um. Uh. How? How do I don't. I don't remember. Oh. Oh. I sure got a podcast. <laughs> DJ Ben? Today's Tuesday, so let us jam the Pokemon March. Yeehaw! How y'all doing now? Whether you're up or way down low, don't you miss the lucky number show! Bang, 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 bang. Hell yeah! 647880, I'll repeat that. This is not a character for late night yellow. <laughs> Late night yellow. No. Uh, late night crystal. Chikorita. Don't forget it. I'm in Goldenrod's radio tower. Point up. Point up. Where the? Where, where, where's she at? Buena. I I know the password. That's the lucky number, dude. Do you know Buena? Is this Buena? Where is Buena? Buena! Is this Buena? I know the password. Hi, I'm Buena. Do you know about a radio program called Password? If you can tell me the password from the program, you will earn points. Save those points and trade them to that sweet young lady over there for some choice prizes. 
Here you go. It's your very own point card. Okay, 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 okay. But I know the password. I know the password. I know the password. I know the password. Tune to my password show. I know the password. Do you remember today's password? Yes. Oh, wow. Thank you. What was your name again? Navi, okay. Come on, Navi. Join the show. Everyone ready? I want to hear you shout out today's password for Nappy. It's a chikorita. Yippee, that's right. You did tune in. I'm so happy. You earned one point. Congrats. Yep, our contestant was Nappy. Thanks for coming. I hope all you listeners will come too. I'll be waiting. Lit. You can cash in your save points for a lovely prize of your choice. Ultra Ball. Full restore, nugget, and rare candy. Protein, iron, carbos, calcium, HP up. Wow. Okay, a little Buena Boutique over here. Well, I'm definitely not going to do it on the Ultra Ball. Um, but that nugget wouldn't hurt. That nugget would not hurt. Jiggly, jiggly, jiggly pup. So I don't remember anybody, I was going to say, giving you anything in the radio tower right now. That's why I was thinking, like, I'll just do it later. Sorry, authorized personnel only beyond this point. It wasn't that way before. There's something wrong with the director. Okay, buddy, okay. Okay, buddy, okay, okay, okay. Um, so the last thing on our list for tonight, at least, is we need to make our way to Route 30. Oh, no. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There's one more thing on our list tonight. Before that, hold on. We're too far up, too far up, too far up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to deposit Romla really quickly because if I'm not mistaken, I think this Bill's house, isn't he supposed to give us an EV? Oh, it's the underground entrance, hold up. Sorry, 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 sorry. Hi, Nappy. Do us a favor and take this Eevee. It came over when I was adjusting the time capsule. Someone has to take care of it, but I don't like being outside. Can I count on you to play with it, Nappy? I knew you'd come through. Way to go. You're the real deal. Okay, I'm counting on you. Take good care of it. Is it actually an Eevee, though? Give a nickname to the teddy ear so you receive. Aww. It's just a baby. It's a little teddy ear, so I'm like, why? Um, I think I'm going to name him, let's name him, how do you spell rutabaga? <laughs> <laughs> you thought I was serious? <laughs> Uh, I just noticed it's a lady bear. I mean, we can still call it Rutabaga, but um, I think I'm gonna call her. No, I think I'm gonna call her. Is this cliche or is this smart? I mean, I know Winnie the Pooh was a boy, but is that how you spell Winnie the Pooh? Winnie, yeah, it's W-I-N-N-I-E. It's not W-I-N-N-Y. Is it Winnie the Pooh? Um, but I've seen like female characters in books and movies before the name Winnie. Professor Elm claims Evie may evolve in new and unknown ways, but that was the idea that it's like. Winnie as like a woman's name and Winnie as in like Winnie the Pooh. You know, like that's why I said like is this smart or cringe? Scratch clear lick and fury swipes. Okay. So we got even more power in the PC today. So the last thing that we had on our to-do list was to deliver that Pokemon to that guy on Route 36. Um, but in all honesty, uh, I'm not stressing over it just too much just yet. Um, we didn't even get to 
go and explore equity you didn't even make it all the way back but oh well we are we're in no rush here on late night crystal um and you know i think no i'm not gonna do it i was gonna say you know i think let's kick this episode off with a brand new encounter but no ah you're on an adventure with your pokemon well that's an adventure without treasure hunting am i right or am i right sure Good, you understand the true spirit of adventure. I like that, take this with you. Hey, thanks bro. There are many items lying about that aren't obvious. Use item finder to check if there's an item on the ground near you. It doesn't show the exact spot, so you have to look yourself. Oh yeah, I heard there are items in Ekertik's burned tower. Oh, don't you worry. We'll be getting to the burned tower. Don't you worry. But, uh, whose house is this? I was gonna say I was gonna go to both these routes and get an encounter, but wouldn't that just be, wouldn't that just like defeat the purpose of all the grinding and everything else that I did to get up to this point? Like, oh, okay, whatever. We have 90 Poké Dollars. I gotta get some of that shit out of the PC, cause that's crazy. Hello, a critique dance theater. Did they have this in the old game? <laughs> Did they have this shit in the old game? I don't remember this shit in the old game. Not only are the Kimono Girls great dancers, they're also skilled at Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I've never even left a scratch. Lad, if you can defeat all the Kimono Girls, I'll give you a gift. Oh, yes! That's a Rhydon that's dancing? Go, 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 go! Oh, yeah! Hey, I got a Rhydon too. So normally they have all the evolutions. So this is the new evolutions. The new evolutions. You may have lovely Pokemon. May I see them in battle? The old evolutions are out the door. They don't exist anymore. Eevee now evolves into a Porygon. And you don't have to use any stone for that. <laughs> you don't have to use any stone for that. Winston, come on Winston, come on Winston, don't do this, I know he used, I was gonna say I know he used uh, whatchamacallit, but it's okay, you know what, it's alright, it's all right. Winston, he's on stage, it's his first time using guillotine on camera, maybe he just got a little bit of stage fright, but now Sauron I think is ready, he converted into the psychic type? I was about to say, you click Roar, can I just end the battle? It's like a wild Pokemon battle. I always dance with my Pokemon. Of course, I also train them. Train them up, girl. So, you don't need a stone for Eevee to evolve into Porygon. But, Eevee now also evolves into Slugma with a Fire Stone. You might not believe that, but... It's true. Damn, they upped the animation. It went from just one to three all at once. I liked it better with the one, at least for Winston the Pirate. Because he's like, big ass claw, you know, just shing, cut him in half, cut that Dragonite's head off. All right, so you don't need any stone to evolve Eevee into Porygon. Eevee does not evolve into Porygon by level up. Don't make any assumptions. It doesn't evolve into it by level up, and you don't need a stone. But Eevee now evolves into Porygon. With a Firestone, Eevee will evolve into Slugma. Isn't my Barret pretty? Oh, a Pokemon battle? And now, if you use a Leaf Stone on Eevee, it will, in fact, evolve into a Sun Current. So we have No Stone, Fire Stone, Leaf Stone. I keep wanting to say Grass Stone, and I know that's not a thing. It's like grass punch. Why don't you make a grass punch? Okay. Now, if you use a leaf stone on an Eevee, this is. I got nothing for this one. <laughs> I was trying to think. I was trying to think, and I just I couldn't I couldn't get to it. I couldn't get to the goal fast enough. Uh, yes, if you also use a Leaf Stone on Eevee, you can evolve it into a Meganium. I don't know if you guys knew that or not, but Leaf Stone works both ways. It's kind of like Dustox and Beautifly, you know, kind of just, a, well, 
I guess, Silcoon and Cascoon. Because that's not male and female, right? Like, that's, that's something to do with Wurmple stats. Uh, it's like Tyrogue. Depends on the Eevee you get. Do you like my dancing? I'm good at Pokemon too. Well, he asked you about either of them. I'm just here to get some money to buy some potions. <laughs> Farfetched. Okay, if you use a stick, if you hand Eevee a stick while leveling it up, it will evolve into Farfetched now. So you don't need a stone to level up Eevee into Porygon, to evolve Eevee into Porygon. You need a Fire Stone to evolve it into a Slugma, a Leaf Stone to evolve it into a Sunkern, and a Leaf Stone to evolve it into Meganium. And then, the fuck was this? I don't remember the Pokemon we just fought. What did we... What did I say? A Dawnstone? <laughs> it doesn't matter. It, it doesn't matter. Those are Eevee's new evolutions. So for all of you guys out there that are just super big evolution fans, especially those of you guys that have tattoos, I don't know what to tell you. You need to get that tattoo fixed. <laughs> With the proper evolutions on it. I heard a rumor about Olivine Lighthouse. The Pokemon that serves as the beacon fell ill. Sounds like they are in trouble. Oh yeah? Well don't worry. We'll get there one of these nights. Is there really a Pokemon that big? If it exists, it must be powerful. Oh, was I supposed to talk to this guy first? This happened when I was young. The skies suddenly turned black. A giant flying Pokemon was blocking out the sun. I wonder what that Pokemon was. It was like a bird and a dragon. Oh. A bird and a dragon? Is he talking about Ho-Oh? He's talking about Lugia. I hear Pokemon are rampaging at the Lake of Rage. I'd like to see that. Oh, don't worry about that. We'll get there in a few nights. A couple episodes. We'll get there. Don't you worry about it. Knock, knock. The tower that used to be here. Grandma told me it used to be much taller. Wait a minute. Oh, no, we good. Okay, look at that little squad here. Okay. Knock, knock, bitch. Let me in here. Oh. <gasps> No, wait, that's Renegade Platinum. The gym leaders are never there. I was like, wait, I didn't even go into the gym. My name's Yusin. I'm on the trail of a Pokemon named Suicune. And you are? Nappy, glad to meet you. I heard rumors that Suicune is in this burn tower, so I came to look. But where exactly could it be? Don't talk to me, bro. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Acritique's gym leader has to study... What are said to be the legendary Pokemon, Suicune, Entei, and Raikou. Yusin is here, so I've decided to investigate the tower with him. Alright bro, do your thing. <laughs> Yo, I'm telling you, always... I'm telling you, if it doesn't make sense, click on it. Why would they let you walk up here into this little nook that leads to nowhere? I wonder what that item normally is. Wow. Oh, look at this bitch. Oh, it's a first encounter. I really wish my first encounters were downstairs, but I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. It's all random. Um, well, we don't have an Onyx yet. You know, I really have not been keeping track of our encounters. Elekid, Penelope, but I know we got Winnie, we had, Elekid was Pen Penelope, I didn't write down that fucking, uh, we got a Croconaw, I don't even remember what the fuck I named that bitch, uh, and we got a uh, Teddy Ursa, which is Winnie. But now, we're about to get this Onyx. I'm gonna click bubble. Do you think Onyx could live a bubble? I mean, like, 
I know he is quad weak to it and like I know I'm twice his level but it's just bubble like our special attack is low enough and his defense well special defense I don't know he might should I click it this is like uh <laughs> clicking surf on a right on Wow. Come on, please, please do me right here. Do me right here, Winston the Pirate. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, I refuse to use anything higher than a Pokeball on you right now, Mr. Onyx. Do I need to... Oh my god, I wrote these two backwards. Bro, what, 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 what goes off in your head that says, yeah, I'm gonna break out? Bro, you're an Onyx. Shoot, it was so close too. Get that out of here. I only have 10 of these. What What is going on in this game? Why can I not catch Pokemon? I mean, like, I know I've caught quite a few Pokemon so far, but still, like... Bro, oh, my list is so fucked up. I'd be writing all these different Pokemon names backwards. I'm gonna end up catching, um, dupes here <laughs> soon enough. I need to rewrite this list. But, like, I don't understand. It's level 14 Onyx in the red. Like, what? I, I don't... Okay, here. Have a Great Ball. It broke out of a Great Ball. I... Why? 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 Why did it take so many Pokeballs to catch a level 14 Onyx? Why? I don't understand. Rock Snake. As it digs through the ground, it absorbs many hard objects. This is what makes its body so solid. How many Pokeballs did I have? What did I have? Ten Pokeballs? I think I had three left. I'm gonna name you Seven. Oh, this is gonna be confusing. Like Savon. I'm gonna name you Seven. And I hope that... Oh, it was nine. Fuck. <laughs> I was gonna say, I hope that it was actually seven. I don't know where I got that from. I think it's because I sped up the last two. But the name is definitely not seven. It's nine. <laughs> it should be nine. So, one of these days, one of these days. Wait a minute, we didn't go. Hold up, hold up, hold up. <gasps> two towers, two Pokemon. But when one burned down, both Pokemon flew away, never to return. The Tin Tower ahead is a nine-tier tower of divine beauty. It soothes the soul of all who see it. Damn, bro. There ain't even no text. It's just a mystery. Hey, I may not remember it. I remember a lot, but I may not remember it, but... I don't know, the first time we came back and actually got to go past that dude back part of your head tingles up and you're like oh my god what is this what is this what is this i just found something new pineco okay i'm not mad at the onyx nothing nothing at all you only hide nothing around here i mean they did say there was lots of items hidden in the tower we should use the item finder but sorry mr onyx oh the next onyx i see i'm clicking bubble on i want to see oh we need rock smash for the tower do we fight him here? Oh, well, I guess we got to find out. <sighs> oh, it's you. I came looking for some legendary Pokemon that they say roosts here. But there's nothing here. Was he Starscream? Nothing after all the trouble of coming to this dump. No way. It's all your fault. Oh, God, bro. Okay, well, at least we know that he will have a Croconaw. All right, Silver Buddy Boy. Oh. <laughs> oh do we click guillotine? Oh, fuck. Well, I'm not clicking it no more. Hold up. You use that. Why did I click guillotine on an Articuno? Why did I click guillotine on an Articuno? Okay, he has powdered snow. Okay. 
I, w I was honestly already prepared to battle Ice Beam. But I think they changed it. I don't remember. I feel like we got Ice Beam really early on Filiberto. Did we? But I know Powder Snow wasn't a move in Gen 1. So I don't think they had any other option. But they might have put Ice Beam lower or higher on his learn set because of Powder Snow. Oh, here come the Kroganol. <laughs> I can't swing my arm like him right up. <laughs> Getting ready to beat the fuck out of somebody. Okay, so this is his ace. Does he get Thunder Punch? <laughs> Winston the Pirate. My boy. He... Winston is our starter. He knew. The moment this crocodile came out, he was like, wait a minute. I remember you. Hold the fuck up. Hold up. God damn. Winston's not playing any games. A Vulpix? Yo, why is your whole squad just get smacked by Winston the Pirate? I have never seen a Kingler run through an entire team before. <laughs> Feraligator and a Typhlosion this time around? He's leaving me. Oh no. Smokescreen and it failed. I have never in my life before watched a Kingler run through an entire battle before. Like, <sighs> craziness. This is like a perfect example. I mean, I'm not going to say that Kingler's like some incredible Pokemon right now in generation two or anything, but Kingler is a lot more viable because there are less Pokemon that can whoop its ass. <laughs> but it's crazy. <clears throat> this is why I hate battling wimps. There's no challenge in it. Oh yeah, there's no, there's no challenge in it. Oh, whatever. You would never be able to catch a legendary Pokemon anyway. What are you doing falling into a hole? Some genius you are serves you right. I want to go up behind him and check. I know there's going to be items there. Wait, hold up. Hold up. I've played this game before. I don't mean this. Well, yes, I've played this game before, but. That's Zapdos. Hush. Oh, Gotta bring it down. Gotta bring it down. Shh. Suicune, I didn't notice it until that cry. And now thinking back on it, I can't remember the first two. I know that Raikou's cry I recognized. I think Entei is like Rattata or something. <laughs> Which makes me really sad. But Suicune, I'm pretty sure that's Zapdos. But I could be wrong. But I think it's really cool that it's randomized and the cries in this cutscene are randomized too. But I wonder if it'll stay that way. Because, you know, like, we're not going to run into them for a long, long time. Uh, how will we ever know if we run into them? <laughs> I mean, like, Zapdos is obvious. You know, I get that one. If, that, if it really is Zapdos, you know we'll recognize a Zapdos in the wild, but I mean, will we? If he doesn't pop up in the bush anymore, it's not a common encounter, but we won't know that until after the fact. You know, like if I walk into this patch of grass and Zapdos pops up, is it a part of that patch of grass or is it Suicune? You know what I mean? Uh, I'm pretty sure there's an event for Suicune anyways, but the other two, you know what I mean? Like, how are we ever supposed to know? Because <laughs> they just run around, run around, run around. If Entei is a Rattata, and, I mean, I guess maybe if I'm grinding somewhere. Why is this motherfucker just standing here, bro? If we're just grinding somewhere and there isn't Rattata, and then all of a sudden a Rattata pops up. Oh, wow, it's Entei. <laughs> I dug a hole here, too. 
I was shocked. Suicune raced by like a blur, right in front of my eyes. For ten years I chased Suicune and I finally got to see it. I'm all choked up. Nappy, I owe this all to you. Thank you. I heard that the legendary Pokemon of Ecruti test chosen humans by allowing them to get close. I'm going to track Suicune. Nappy, let's meet again. Farewell. Bye, bro. But, you know, you ain't really gotta bother me. You really don't. You really don't need to bother me. At all. So, like... I wish you best of luck. I wish you safe travels. Oh, we can't get back here? Get to this item? Because we need shrunk. We need shrunk. Oh, we didn't talk to homeboy. We didn't talk to homeboy in the Kimono Girls place. I know. There's about 800 people that have left comments about that. You didn't go and uh, talk to the guy in the kimono lady's place. I can't believe we got a fucking Master Ball. We need Rock Smash for that one. Maybe a Pokemon can break this. <laughs> Harder, or maybe. Oh, oh, went downstairs. Hold up. Hold up. Just trying to get up here. Because I want to see what's... Oh, Tony Dial. Nope, don't want to fall in there. Hold up. Yummy. Dinner is served. God damn. That apom looks terrifying, by the way. I don't know if you guys saw that. Look at that apom. This is the generation he debuted. <laughs> the purple markings around his eyes really make him look like a monster. <laughs> Whoa, bro. Link? <laughs> is this you? In the distant past, this tower burned in a fire. Three nameless Pokemon perished in it. A rainbow-colored Pokemon descended from the sky and resurrected them. It's a legend that has been passed down by equity gym leaders. Me? I was a trainer way back when. <laughs> yeah, right, bro. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Okay, so hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Not only are the Komodokos great dancers, they're also skilled at Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I've never even like watched them. It was a rare trait to see. I want you to have this. Don't worry. Take it. I thought for a hot second he was repeating this shit before and I was going to fight them again. That's Surf. It's a move that lets Pokemon swim across water. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I know that we're going to have to use it. Oh, I forgot Judy can learn Surf. Um, but I'm gonna teach it to Winston right now because uh, What does he does he get bubble beam? I don't know what other water type move he's gonna get but it's inevitably probably going to be deleted by surf so But you know, maybe I should have taught it to Judy Cuz I mean, what is she gonna have earthquake rock slide and the other two moves don't really matter We could have taught that to her and then taught um, Winston the pirate waterfall when the time comes but oh well well we have two choices here now we can either go to the east and west of Ecruti and get encounters or we can go in this gym now I know I said I was thinking about testing the water dipping my piggies in the water let's do it the trainers here have secret motives if you win they may tell you some deep secrets about Ecruti Oh, I don't remember this shit. Can you inflict any damage on our Pokemon? I'm gonna try, Poet Anne. Level 21. We're trying. We're trying. Can't say we're not trying. Level 21 with a bay leaf. Alright, we're gonna go out to Sauron. And give a little bit of uh, help here. Ursula, come on out, Ursula. Giga drain this artillery. <laughs> A Jinx? Whoa, 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 Jinx, chill. Powder Snow? Whoa, 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 whoa. That scratched a lot of damage, but so did you. Zauron? Fight this Jinx. Ooh. Ooh. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Don't be doing this. Magnitude 5. Oh, wait, why did I do that? So I can do this. Oh, Judy. Judy, 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 Judy. That's why I said, why did I do that? Why did I do that? Winston, come on back out. Come on back out. Sir, this is you, dude. Come on, get him, get him. <sighs> okay, level 21. Um, I know what you're thinking. Oh, you have level 30 already. Yes, but 
I have this sneaking suspicion that um, I'm gonna use Winnie. We need to get Winnie involved, anyways. <laughs> I have this sneaking suspicion that his ace is probably gonna be like 29, 30 ish area. Because what's her name? Um, yeah, right. What's her name? Um, yo, what the fuck? Whitney was 26. So it's like, the fuck? You know what I mean? I didn't expect her to be that high. I thought she was going to be like 25 or something like that. But 26? Definitely not. Damn, look at Winnie. Look at Winnie. Take me back. Oh, wow. We went all the way straight down? Take me back. I'm not wasting a few potions that I have. Oh, speaking of potions. Speaking of potions. Speaking of potions. Speaking of potions. We did whoop all them kimono girls' asses. Damn, look at all this money we got. Look at all this money we got. How many can we get? Can I get a solid 10? I think we'll be good with that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I would like to get some more Pokeballs, even though apparently they do not work. I don't know where y'all got these Pokeballs from, but they really do not work. <laughs> I'd be throwing them at Pokemon, <laughs> and Pokemon just be popping right out of them. A lot of you guys said, oh, we can sell this Slipbook tail, or should we honor it next to the brick piece? Um, a lot of you guys are saying we should put the amulet coin on madam never got the chance to do so never got the chance to do so um we can give this charcoal to oh fuck i'm gonna give me that back sauron you buddy hold that charcoal oh we have black glasses too do we give him the charcoal or black glasses i think i put the black glasses in the pc actually it's charcoal for today, buddy. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. For you, Winnie, I'm going to give you this amulet coin. And Ramla, I don't know what the, how else to tell you this, girl, but I don't think... I can't give you the brick piece, girl. <laughs> Yo, Rachel, are you serious? Stop calling me. You call me again, we will have problems. I wanted to get a great ball, but we ain't got the money for it. So maybe we should fight this next trainer. Somehow we already got fucked up. So if I'm not mistaken, oh. It's hard to judge. See, that's how as far as you go. That's what I thought, tricky bitch. You go up here. Oh. So it's not in front of her, and it's not one away from that. Fuck, it's so hard to tell. One, two, that's where you go up. Do I just keep going? <laughs> I spent the spring with my Pokemon. A Hypno? He's got a level 29 Hypno. Whoa, this motherfucker just headbutted the shit out of me, bro. Hold up, Sauron, bite him. Are you? For kidding me? Sauron and him. Don't be letting him attack. Don't be letting him attack ever. For any reason. Under any circumstances. What? Winnie is evolving? Hello? Why does it look like he's playing an air guitar? Why? He's scratching his stomach like that. Ursa ring. What's poppin', buddy? We're gonna get you into an Ursa Luna. Look at Winnie. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Strongest scratch in all the land. Look at that attack stack. God damn. God damn. Okay. Well, I don't think we go up here. Okay, wait. We got this. Fuck. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't ask any questions. Fuck. It's so annoying because it takes so long to even get up here. Aha! I shall win. You're right, bitch. You know who you just met? 
you come face to face with Winnie. Look at Winnie's shoulder pads. Ooh. Oh. Leader Donna sent out a Mewtwo. Isn't that just great? Isn't that just great? Um, well, this Mewtwo's gonna have Swift, which is gonna hurt. Um, I'd like to go out to Sauron to click Bite. Confusion. Oh, no, 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 no. It's level 26 Mewtwo. Okay, that doesn't do a terrible amount of damage. Hey, look at Winnie, though. Hold up. But wait, we need to heal these issues from you. Whoa. Swift, chill. I really don't want to use... All my super potions right now against this Mewtwo. But Sauron. Sauron. Excellent work. Excellent work. Look at the team doing good work. Sauron, torch this bioplume. Don't care about things like that. We don't care about things like that. Leader Donna. Basically was like fighting the gym leader. Oh, you can just go straight up. I'm gonna go back and heal, of course. <laughs> but it's good to know you can just walk straight up from there. But I don't remember that last little part. Fuck, 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 fuck. Um. Here we go. Bada bing, bada boom. Realest dudes in the room. I'm gonna save my game because only you can prevent lost save data and. I forgot our pocket my Angelou wisdom in the last episode. Um, there was somebody that left a comment uh, continuing it. I want to send a special shout out to you, Muchas Gracias. Thank you so much. Um, I knew it after the episode. Like I looked over at the book and I was like, "Fuck!" So tonight, before we get into this gym battle, let's hit up two of them. We've been doing one of these every single night. We're still in chapter one, self empowerment. Um, so last night's quote was the thing to do it seems to me is to prepare yourself so you can be a rainbow in somebody else's cloud somebody who may not look like you the thing to do it seems to me is to prepare yourself so you can be a rainbow in somebody else's cloud somebody who may not look like you I think we'll read the second one after the gym battle. Let that one sink in for a moment. Good of you to have come. Here in Ecritique, Pokemon have been revered. It's said that a rainbow colored Pokemon will come down to appear before a truly powerful trainer. I believe that tale, so I have secretly trained here all my life. As a result, I can now see what others cannot. Just a bit more. With a little more, I could see a future in which I meet the Pokemon of rainbow colors. You're going to help me reach that level. I got distracted with the wisdom and uh, kind of jumped into this gym battle here. I mean, I guess the trainer had a level 29. So I hope that Ranger Maryland's not out to whoop our ass. Okay, level 27. Winnie. Actually, Winnie, I'm going to swap you out right now. And we are going to go into Winston. Sand attack me, ho. I'm clicking swipe. You all thought I was going to click gear, dude, didn't you? <laughs> you thought I was going to click gear, dude. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. On the next one. A Marie, bro. All right, Judy Judes, come on out. You got this. I have faith in Judy. Ooh, you ain't meet no rainbow Pokemon like this. Fuck, Marie's unaffected. Marie's unaffected. 
Leave me be. Even when I know it's not gonna hit, I still click it in just the hopes. It's like that half second beforehand when you're like, you're staring at the Mareep and like your eyes are burning for that half second because you don't wanna blink and miss it. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so that was a level 30. I'm trying mentally to keep track of this. So that was a level 30. A shelter. Oh, wow. Level 27. So was his ace 30? Because I was pretty much... Ursula, it's your... Ch oh, 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 oh. Ursula. Ursula, 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 Ursula. That's okay, Ursula. And the light screen's gone. Oh, it's time for you to feel pain. It is time to feel pain. Imagine having the entire life force sucked out of you. Whew. Almost got all that HP back too. God damn. A Doug Trio. Doug Trio, Trio, Trio. 33. His ace is 33. Oh my god, this motherfucker. You really click dig. Who you hitting with dig, bitch? Who you hitting with dig, bitch? Sand attack. You gonna do it again? He growled. Whoa. Whoa. He growled. He lowered my attack. Okay, so level 33. I'm not mad at. I'm really not mad at. Oh, he lived? Since when? <gasps> A magnitude nine. Are you kidding me? You know, I think I said this in late night yellow. You know, sometimes it really sucks having a grass poison type for that reason. I mean, at magnitude nine, I mean, that's still really high, but god damn. Ugh, Ursula. We had a leaf stone for you and everything. Had a leaf stone for you and everything. I was just trying to get everybody a little bit of shine, you know? Get the fuck out of here, bro. You didn't have to kill my fucking victory bell like that, you stupid ass. I'm not good enough yet. All right, this badge is yours. Didn't have to kill my fucking weeping bell. We had a leaf stone we were gonna use. By having fog badge, Pokemon up to level 50 will obey you. Also, Pokemon that knows Surf will be able to use that move anytime. I want you to have this too. Bro, all I want is my weeping bell because it was from late night yellow and now it's gone. TM30. Survey says we don't know what it is. Hydro Punt. Would you look at that? TM30 is Hydro Punt. Jot that one down for the records. Use it if it appeals to you. You know what doesn't appeal to me? Having a lost Pokemon. Ugh. Ursula of all mons. You know, I guess I spoke it into existence. I said we couldn't fit the Elekid, couldn't fit Penelope on the team because of Ursula. Well, well, looks like Ursula is headed to the pastures. Only catch me a 15 mile in the PC? What the shit? Um, so if we were to consider replacing, I know that Penelope is a, a favorite option. Patty. This bitch Patty. <laughs> How could I forget the lunch lady Patty? Let me jot her name down real quick. How could I forget Patty of all Pokemon? Chartreuse. <laughs> Everybody wants us to use Chartreuse as well. Nolan is there. Ugh. I'm just gonna put Madam back on the team. Do we really rock out with Penelope? 
I should just use the fucking leaf stone. I had Giga Dream. God damn it. Stupid fucking thing. Stupid fucking thing. Mmm. <sighs> I don't know yet. We're gonna wait and see. Because we have two encounters coming up on. Actually, we have lots of encounters coming up. Anyways. Let us make a quick accounting of what we have. We have plenty of Pokeballs. Uh, we have plenty of money, too. Hold up. So, you know what? I think I am going to save that encounter. I remember talking about that last night. I was going to say, um, <laughs> am I going to get that encounter to the... Actually, you know what? We should do it. I'm talking about to the east of Ecritique, but we should because I'm pretty sure there are trainers over there. And... If we wait until later, we're just going to stomp them out. So it's like, if we're going to do something, we should do it now, you know? Um, so, wait, I'm not going to buy any more of these. I'm going to buy a couple of these right here, just in case you never know. But I'm not going to buy any of those because I'm pretty sure, aren't we going to get Moo Moo Milks soon? Are we going to get Moo Moo Milks sometime soon? And if that's the case, I don't want to spend no more money on those Super Podions. Route 40. Two. Oh wow. Imagine imagine if we would have waited until later in the game to come get that damn ice berry. This was the mountain Mount Mortar. Couldn't fucking remember the name of this goddamn mountain. Mount Mortar. That's what it is. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's the trainers in Mount Mortar. Oh, we can surf here too. Whoa. Okay, so we need a Route 42 encounter. Everything's randomized. I'm just gonna surf. If we get an encounter, we get an encounter. Oh, we didn't get an encounter. Yo, we are exploring. Are we about to go to a uh, mahogany town? Are they really gonna let us just go to mahogany town? Like that? Like it's nothing? Uh, we're gonna get a Mount Mortar encounter as well. A potion. Get the fuck away from me. So we... Ah! This is our Route 42 encounter, survey says. I'm not mad at that. We did just lose a Grass Poison type in the last episode, and we said that we were gonna wait to see <laughs> what we ended up with before we decided on our new team member and would it hurt to replace a grass poison type with another grass poison type i don't think so i don't see the harm in that i don't think so at all <sighs> do i do it again do i do it again winnie 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 there you go winnie we're poisoned says who <laughs> Says who? I forgot we have Master Ball as well. Excelente. So that means that I'm really looking forward to tonight's encounters because it doesn't matter what we end up with. If it's something that we really want, we're getting it. I really don't want to use all my Great Balls on this Ivysaur though. God damn. Ivysaur's data was newly added to the Pokédex. The bulb on its back grows as it absorbs nutrients. The bulb gives off a pleasant aroma when it blooms. Wow, what a what a sturdy Pokedex description. Um, so what name are we going to give to this Ivysaur? This male Ivysaur. I think I'm going to name him. You know what? I think I'm gonna do it. I just said it and the name just popped into my head and I don't know if it's because I have already convinced myself. I don't know if it's because I've already convinced myself that I want this as his name. But it fits, weirdly enough, it fits. So I'm not going to say in full confidence that Mahogany is on the squad right now. I'm not going to say that just yet. I know I joked about it and oh, 
Whee! We could do a lot with that. We just need a sludge bomb. That's it. That's all we need on you. The poison type move. We're good to go. But I'm not going to say Mahogany's on the squad just yet. I said that we were going to wait. We were going to check and see. Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I caught. Bro, I was not ready for this. Get him out of here. Do we even have an antidote? I'm going to use it on Winnie because what the fuck? See, this is what I really wanted. I wanted to get to the patch of grass to see what was over here. Hey, this is my secret place. Get lost, you outsider. How about you get lost, bro? What the fuck? Um, so hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We've got team members leveling up and other team members not being shown appreciation. And we need to fix that. Bro, why is this motherfucker just standing here? Bro, why do you have an Entei? Why did you have an Entei? But see, this is what I was saying. We should come over here right now because he has a level 18 Entei. Why was I sweating any of these Pokemon with any of the Pokemon I had out? News to me. So we could have had a Snubble. We could have had another Snubble. We could have had a third Snubble. Could have had dupes. A Vile Pluma wouldn't have been mad at. Is that really all you got over here? But what about in the water? Parasect? Ooh. Ooh. I think we got the better end of the fire. Fire. Of the grass poison types on this route. We really can't whole ass go to Mahogany Town right the fuck now. Are you off to see the Gyarados rampaging at the lake? Can we go? Is there an item here? No? Can we go see the Gyarados rampaging? We can go see the Gyarados rampaging at the lake. Okay, well, shh, wait, no. Okay, I didn't get an encounter. I'm gonna save that for later. <laughs> Don't ask me why we're in Mahogany Town already. Bro, what's the reason? Since you came this far, take the time to do some sightseeing. You should head north and check out Lake of Rage right now. Well, what if I already did? What if I already went there? Nothing? Nothing over here? Nothing back here? Okay, I'm gonna hit my Pokemon and be on my merry way. Okay, so... I'm not gonna do that. I was gonna say, I'm gonna deposit the Ivysaur, but then I'll just have to keep depositing everything, so... It's whatever. The uh, Ivysaur is not on our squad right now. Just letting everyone know. I heard that a red Gyarados appeared at the lake. That's odd, since even ordinary Gyarados are rare at that lake. What the hell? I say Pokemon music. I thought someone gave you something in this house. I know this motherfucker's gonna try and sell me. Hiya, kid. I see you're new in Mahogany Town. Since you're new, you should try a Yummy Rage candy bar. Right now, it can be yours for just $300. Do you want one? Fuck it, why not? Good, savor it. Bro, you just forced me to buy Rage Candy Bars? <laughs> you stop everybody? Hey, I see you're new in town. <laughs> Shut this Rage Candy Bar. Okay, so we're gonna get our Mount Mortar encounter. But, however, uno segundo, por favor, before we do this, I want to leave with Winnie so we can lick. I want to go in this one, the middle entrance. Oh, no water. Okay, we're not surfing. Whoa. We're really going to get our first encounter surfing in Mount Mortar? It just doesn't feel very cave-like. It, it just doesn't. Wow! Look at this! Big mama right here. Look at these two big mama squaring off. Hold on. Kingler, Rhydon, Mad Cargo, Mankey, Charmeleon, Wooper, Bellsprout, Sunflower, Crobat, Golbat, Houndoom, Elekid, Croconaw, Teddy Ursa, Onyx, Ivysaur. Okay. Just being sure. Got a lot of golems and a lot of different LPs. <laughs> Not sure. <laughs> I was going to say, not sure which one I have them in and which one I don't, but I guess I can say this one, I don't have a golem in. 
Because we got a critical hit. Because why not? Why not? Hold on. I want this item. You won't let me have a golem. But can I have this item? Oh, it's an XP. Oh, just what we needed. Didn't get a golem. But we got an XP. I guess we don't really need a golem. We do have Judy. I'm sorry, Judy, if you heard that. I'm sorry. I apologize. Bro, how do I get this item? That's all I'm interested in at the moment. I mean, we've come this far, why not? What is with all these shitty items? Oh! oh. That would have been nice. <laughs> would I have Master Ball to Celebi? Probably. If it was my first encounter, I probably would have Master Ball, I'm not gonna lie to you. An upgrade. We have a Porygon too. We have a Porygon Z and Renegade Platinum. <coughs> Sometimes you just inhale and the spit go down the wrong hole. <laughs> That's what she said. So we don't have strength yet. Can't move that bitch. Um, I know I said that we really don't have a plan for tonight's episode. And that has really, in all honesty, kind of led me to just meander a little bit. <laughs> like, I definitely did not think... Oh, you're joking with me, right? Get rid of this. Get rid of this. For now. Metal powder, welcome aboard. It really has led me to kind of just wander a bit. Just to see like, oh, what's over here? We can go over here, we can do that. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so that takes us back. Um, but yeah, I really don't know why I'm walking around here in Mount Mortar. <laughs> Ain't got nothing to do in here except collect items. Hey, fuck that Wobba Fit. Little blue male from a little blue Pokemon but I mean hey to be fair we pretty much cleared out this whole area so well we don't have strength so I guess we didn't I guess we didn't and we don't have waterfall all right well fuck this bitch I'm out okay so back to your regularly scheduled programming we need to head back through Ecruteague City and continue west. Um, last episode we went into the Burn Tower and it was really cool because the cries of the three legendary beasts came out. And you know, I had my speculation and all this and all that. Um, but a lot of you guys are speculating in the comment section so I went back and I rewatched it. And I gotta say, I think Entei is a Snorlax. Now my initial impression was that, you know, I think Maybe Raikou is the Snorlax. Whatever the second cry is, to me it sounds like a Zapdos. But I saw someone in the comments said it sounded like a Zubat. And I was like, hmm, maybe. Um, and then Suicune definitely agree as a Weedle. So, <laughs> I mean, I guess if we keep an eye out for any level 40 wild encounters, which you guys pointed out as well, that could be a way that we could catch on to what the level is. But you know... I just did the encounters on the other side of Ecruteague and I didn't pay attention to what the fuck the levels were. <laughs> so fingers crossed that we do! Oh, the fucking pack is full. What what the fuck is it full of? What is it full of? Brick piece is not going anywhere. Don't even try it. We got all these bearings. Slowpoke tail. Miracle seed. These apricorns. Apricorns. Uh, I'm gonna toss these to be honest because even if I put them in the PC it would be a waste of space in the PC I'm not ever gonna go back every single day and have homeboy make me a brand new fucking pokeball nah I don't think so I don't think so metal powder raises defensive ditto isn't that about a bitch <laughs> because we have a ditto <laughs> I should give it to him <laughs> No, you can't put them in the PC if they're holding an item in this game. Fuck. Dratini print mail. Hold. Okay, well, Dratini print mail may or may not last much longer. But we still need a first encounter. How do we make it through the whole patch? We still need a first encounter over here. Survey says. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at you, Big Mama. 
Okay, okay, okay. Winnie, I need you to lick him. Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> we have one chance. I'm not master bullying a, a, a Gyarados. There are bigger fish to fry, pun intended. Why? Why does no Pokemon get caught in this game? Are you for real? Can you stop being confused? Can you not click thrash? Oh, thank you. Oh, I was thinking it. I didn't want to say it out loud, but I was going to say, like, are you serious? We're going to lose a Golem and a Gyarados encounter in this episode. Hey, but you know what? Our encounters so far have been pretty fucking wild. Ivysaur, Golem, and Gyarados? The atrocious Pokemon. It appears whenever there is world conflict, burning down any place it travels through. Damn, bro. Damn. Well, you already know. I gots to. You already know I gots to. My homegirl Magnolia. She wouldn't be a horrible addition to the team. And I know we have Winston the Pirate, but still. We've discussed adding multiple water types in the past. And oh, I could have had a Geo dude. Are you kidding me, bro? Um, and we could have Bro, what the fuck? I'm not playing this game with you. I'm not playing this game with you either. But that would have been would not have been horrible. A Nido Queen. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. But yes, we need to keep an eye out for level 40 wild Pokemon. I need to take note of what are their levels right now? 16. Okay. Okay. Can we just go back and forth until we find it? <laughs> until we get it? Hey, look here, little girl. I know you're trying to fight. Let's go. Whoa. Big boy. Whoa. Scared me for a second. I thought that was self-destruct. Make that Needle Queen flinch. Pain attack. Oh. Never gonna fucking click that. But faint attack, we will click. But I don't wanna. I can't do it now. I have to do it later when we're in battle. I don't wanna forget about bite though. Damn, this motherfucker waiting on me over here. That's way cool. Phone number? Uh, sure. Sure, 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 sure. Somebody was saying a couple episodes back that there was supposed to be some trainer on this route that's gonna give us. Whoa, 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 chill, 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 chill. There was some trainer on this route that's supposed to give us uh, thunderstones or something like that if we let him call us. So that was completely accidental. So if he calls us, then hey, that's dope. Hold up. Nothing down here, nothing at all. Did I talk to you? <laughs> Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Come over here, bro. You have a Lugia? What are you doing on this route, bro? What are you doing on this route? I think there's another Pokemon caught up. I don't know why 31 is the level that we're catching up to, but it works. <laughs> you know, whatever works. So I know we have been behind. Oh, route 39. Oh, I was gonna try and duck him real quick. Damn, what the fuck is with? I know this bitch gonna have a roar beam. I already know this whole gonna have a roar beam. Get rid of him, Winston. Winston the pirate making all these legendary Pokemon bounce. It's a one hit Kate. Oh, it's a one hit Kate. Oh, Ramla, come through. Come through, Ramla. We desperately need to patch up this moveset. Desperately, desperately. Desperately, we ain't got nothing we can give you. Cut, surf, flash, rest, milk, drink, spore, hydro pump, sand attack, wing attack, wing attack. Let's double check really quickly. Let's double check. I know for a fact I looked this up before, but I do not remember. So in generation two, Lady Romlet will learn wing attack at level 30, which is why we have not taught it to her yet. 
So, in two levels, she will learn Wing Attack, and her moveset may get a bit better. But anyways, I know we're a day behind on our pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom, and I feel like doing two per episode kind of makes it feel like it's like a homework assignment or something like that, and I'm not trying to do that. So I think we're going to let the one that we missed go, because technically the comment that we included in last night's episode, that was our second one. So, we're caught up. So we are reading our Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom. It's part of the late night vibe here on Late Night Crystal. Trying to uh, get us to be a little introspective. Maybe influence some positive uh, introspective dreams. Uh, but anyways, we're still in chapter one. And tonight's quote is may not call God the same name you call God if they can call God can't read hold on let me restart may not call God the same name you call God if they call God at all I may not dance your dances or speak your language but be a blessing to somebody that's what I think may not call God the same name you call God if they call God at all I may not dance your dances or speak your language, but be a blessing to somebody. That's what I think. Be a blessing to somebody. It doesn't matter if you call the same God God or believe in a God at all. It doesn't matter if they... What was the second line? If they dance or speak your language. Be a blessing to someone today. Just be nice. It costs nothing to be nice. Being nice is free 99. Don't give me no apricorn, a mint berry. Ooh. Being nice is free 99. Maybe Silver needs to take a lesson from Maya Angelou. Maybe Silver needs to watch this shit. <laughs> a mint berry wakes you up from sleep? Ooh, you learn something new every day. Every single freaking day. Hey, check out all these thick ass mill tanks down here. Moo hoo hoo hoo. Moo. I wonder if any of these are shiny moo tanks down here. Moo. Moo. Look how it stops the music for each one. I like how we match mill tank too. Oh, you know how we do. Thursday night vibing with the cows. Thursday night vibing with the cows. Gotta get a little vibe session on in the field. Fuck yeah. Alright, y'all be good. Be safe. Behave. What y'all up to? Our milk even goes out to Kanto. So if our own milk tank won't give us any milk, we're in trouble. My milk tank ain't giving me milk no more. This here farm's got famous milk. Most everyone wants to drink. It'll give me lots of milk, if and I feed it lots of berries, I reckon. Well, I know I got a lot of berries. This is the one cow? This is the one cow you get all your milk from? All the milk comes from this? Moo Moo is sick. She needs lots of berries. Okay, let's see what we can do, Moo Moo. It's Christ week. Here you go. But don't take my, my mint berry. I just got that. I have no more berries. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> I feel so ashamed. <laughs> I feel so ashamed and embarrassed. I don't have any more berries to give you. I'm sorry. Let me go see if I can find some more, okay? Um, What the fuck am I supposed to do against this big ass bitch? Get the fuck out of here. Now I gotta get everyone up to 32. God damn it. You got a berry? There's a cow dying right up the road and you just let your thick ass little Clefairy just suck it down. <laughs> and it's gone. Route 39, Route 38, Route 39. We didn't change routes going down there, did we? Route 38, Route 39. Okay, okay, check it out. What you doing down here? We hiding? Who we hiding from? Shh. Who we hiding from? Hey. 
You came at just the right time. Let's battle. <laughs> I thought she was gonna give me an item or something. Uh, confuse ray and a berry. Cut that shit out. Judy, don't do this. Judy, don't do this. Judy, I uh, thank you, Judy. I was gonna say, Judy, don't do this. I met my meow that night, right here on Route 39. I'm not sure why, but it seems to like it when I train here. It seems to become friendlier by training here than anyone else. We haven't gotten an encounter on Route 39 yet, have we? I don't think we have. I just went back up and checked, but I don't think there's any grass. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again. I think it was just the time spent at the Moo Moo farm. Route 39. Yeah, there's no... Fuck this dude. Oh my god. You're ruining everything, bro. You're literally ruining everything, and now I'm poisoned? Ah. What am I supposed to do? You ruined everything. Alright, we always need space in the bag. Oh, we are used. Oh, we have a poison cure berry. Yeah. I'm gonna give it to Winnie right now. Okay, so our Route 39 encounter is, survey says... Ooh, we catching that bitch. Ooh, we catching that bitch. I don't care if we gotta use every Pokeball we got. We had, look, there's only two pseudo legendary Pokemon in this game. <laughs> two pseudo legendary lines and one of them refused to be captured this one will be captured we're going full team rocket on this dragon air <laughs> i'm descending i'm attacking from above we'll at least expect it out of my hot air balloon excellent work winnie keep it up keep it up it's bullshit it's such bullshit to make sure I don't use oh and then we get on the first pokeball we use I'm gonna say I have to make sure I don't use the master ball but never mind Dragonair it's called the divine Pokemon when its entire body brightens slightly the weather changes oh what do we name this male Dragonite hmm I think I'm going to name him Hmm. I don't know why. Just the first thing that popped in my head. <laughs> if it had been a female Dragonair, I probably would have named it Pearl. But a male Dragonair, I was like, I don't, I don't fucking know what to name this thing. I'm gonna name it. Uh. Derek, Derek the Dragonite. I don't know, it's really, in my opinion, I think it's really funny when you have, like, um, pets, or I guess in this case, Pokemon that have, like, human names, you know, like a pug named Kevin or something like that. So we have a Dragonite named Derek. No big deal. It's just Derek. It's just Derek. So we can get an Olivine City encounter as well. Wow, you have a Pokedex. That is just so awesome. Hey, thanks, bro. Thanks. <gasps> oh. You know, I was gonna say, can we go in this gym right now? You again. There's no need to panic. I don't bother with wimps like you. Speaking of weaklings, the city's gym leader isn't here. Supposedly taking care of a sick Pokemon at the lighthouse. Hmm. Boo-hoo. Just let sick Pokemon go. A Pokemon that can't battle is worthless. Why don't you go train at the lighthouse? Who knows? It may make you a bit less weak. And he pushes us out of the way. I gotta jot down Derek over here. So we don't forget. Got a Dragonair named Derek. Oh, I forgot there's no trainers in this gym. Jasmine, the gym leader, is at the lighthouse. She's been tending to a sick Pokemon. A strong trainer has to be compassionate. Hey y'all. Alright, welcome to my gym. I will now 
spend the rest of the episode right here like this waiting for a challenger. Wish me luck. I can see why she left. <laughs> I can see why she left. You have to come into see my gym. You have to come in and make an appointment. So like a month from now, that's when we're going to have our match. I'll see you on the 17th at 4 p.m. All of mine is on the sea, and if it's on the sea, there are bound to be fish. I fished here for 30 years. Would you like to face the sea and fish? Hell yeah! Ah ha ha ha! We have ourselves a new angler. Thanks, bro. Fish aren't found in the sea alone. They go wherever there is water. Okay, 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 okay. I like it. I kind of like it. Okay, so this is Olivine City. Olivine City encounter. Survey says... We've never good read it before. What can it be? Oh, a bite. Survey says... The hooked Mr. Mime attack. Do you know how creepy that would be? Imagine you're just out fishing and your line gets snagged and you're reeling it in, reeling it in, and all of a sudden, like, this humanoid comes out of the water. Oh. But this is going to be super effective on Mr. Mime. Can you get paralyzed? Thank you. I was going to say, can you get paralyzed right away? But, you know, we were about to walk right into the mart, and we... Bro, what? Can I not... Don't do that again, bro. <laughs> Don't do that again, bro. I can't catch you if you do that. What the fuck? Damn. It uses the mysterious power it has in its fingers to solidify air into an invisible wall. Give a nickname to Mr. Mime. I think I'm going to name this Mr. Mime. Veronica. Off to the PC with you, Veronica. So, again, I don't think Mr. Mime's particularly awful in this generation, so I think that's not a horrible encounter. I think still, all of our encounters in tonight's episode have been kind of fucking bananas. Hi, I'm looking for this Pokemon. If you have a Mankey, would you trade it for my... Hell no. I already got a Ditto. I wouldn't trade a Mankey, and he's rubbing it in. Bastard. Whenever I get in trouble, Daddy always scares me. Along the way to Cyanwood, there are four deserted islands. Bad kids are taking these islands as punishment. What, are they left there? <laughs> I don't understand. The sea is sweet. Yo ho, blow the men down. Hey, what does is, what is taking there as punishment mean? Like we're never going to see them again? Um, So I'm going to deposit mahogany for now because we we've made it to a whole new city. You know, mahogany's not officially on the squad yet. Whoa, 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 what's going on in there? Ha! Your Pokemon sure like, look like lightweights. They don't have the power to move boulders aside. Here, use this and teach them strength. Now we gotta go back to Mount Mortar. On the sea, the only thing you can count on is your own good self. I'm so proud of my buff bod. <laughs> I'm so proud of my buff bod. Whenever I roll into this town, I always visit the Olivine Cafe. Everything on the menu makes me feel stronger. I can't stop eating. Olivine Cafe's menu is chock full of hearty fare for beefy sailors. <laughs> beefy sailors and those with buff bods, make sure you stop at the all new Olivine Cafe. Who we? Guaranteed good time. Guaranteed. Okay, I'm buying some antidotes because we very clearly need them. I'm gonna buy some paralyzed heals. I know we have an awakening. Uh, I don't know if we have any ice heals, but I think we've already been frozen. <laughs> Look at me making up excuses. I know we don't have any more great balls. Oh, we can buy some great balls. Yo, fuck yes. We can't even buy no more uh, Pokeballs anymore. But hold on. Let me look at my Pokemon. We don't need... I don't think we need... Well, I don't know. We might need... I need to sell this slowpoke tail. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. If it seems like I'm all over the place, it's because my brain is all over the plate. I'm trying to organize this bag and sell shit at the same time. It's like, whoa, 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 wow, we. Do we buy hyper potions yet? 
Do we need hyper potions? I'm gonna buy five for in case of an emergency because we about to go up in this tower and I don't know what's gonna go down in there. Can you get encounters in the tower? I don't think so. Whoa, 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 Christine. Who the fuck is Christine? It's Christine, how are you? Professor Oak's Pokemon talk is a popular radio show, right? Did you know that he was going to turn down the show at first? Mary's energy and persistence wore him down. So we have Mary to thank for it. See you later. Don't be distracting me. At all, ever. Hold on, move this up here. And we got super potions, we got hyper potions. We got 12 super potions. I'm gonna buy eight more. Okay. Wrapped. Wrapped. On the next episode of MTV's Wrapped, can we. Oh, fuck yes. Is this still considered Olivine City or is this Olivine Harbor? Olivine? You know what I keep thinking of? Olive Olivania. This is Olive Olivania City. We're in Olivine City. Okay. No new encounters for us. Womp, womp, womp. Damn, this speed up is a bitch. Just zoom straight through that hole. So does this say, battle tower ahead, opening now. Route 40. Hmm, there's a big building up ahead. What is it? I came to Olivine to buy the ship, buy the ship to soak up the sights and soak up the atmosphere. Being in a port, it feels so different from being in a big city. Have you gone to the battle tower? I think a lot of tough trainers have gathered there already, but since you have so many badges, you shouldn't do badly at all. Whoa, that's so creepy to me. Although you can't see it from here, a sign what is across the sea. This is so creepy to me. Maybe a Pokemon can break this. What if the Pokemon breaks you? Are you going to the battle tower? This is a secret, but if you win a whole lot, you can win special gifts. Like what? Like what? I don't know if we're gonna be doing any battle towering, but it doesn't hurt to come over here and uh, chit chat and see what's up, you know? You can only use three Pokemon. Well, if I had to choose from the squad, I would probably choose Sauron. Sauron! Winston the Pirate and it would have to be Ramla because Winnie and Judy share weaknesses with Sauron. But Winnie wouldn't be bad either. Winnie would not be bad. This big ass battle tower. You only got shit over here. Hidden. Nothing. Everything has been found. Huh. Do they not tell you what you can win? Because if there's a chance to win something decent, mayhaps. Battle Tower rules are written here. No. Battle Tower welcomes you. No, I want to see what you can buy. And y'all don't want to show me, so fine. Fuck you. I have a different tower that has my name on it. Thank you very much. So we do need to get an encounter over here, and I think we will surf instead of good rotting. So, I don't know what fucking route we're on, but I know we're on a new route. Survey says, is that a little fire type I see? I spy with my little eye a little fire type that would be a wonderful addition to the team. <laughs> uh, I love it. I'm going to name him Roger. <laughs> I'm kidding. The fire that spouts from its back burns hottest when it is angry. The flaring flames intimidate foes. So what nickname should we give you? I think we're going to name you... Hmm. I think we're going to name you... I feel like, oh, you know what? I've done this one in the past. 
Theo. Short for Theodore. We have Theo. The Cyndaquil waiting in our PC. Dang, we got a lot of options for power just to tonight alone. But my question is, do we add someone now? Get your little paralyzed ass out of the party, bro. What are you doing? Do we add someone now? Or do I wait? Because honestly, Veronica would be a good add. But you see, I'm, I don't want to add them right now because I don't know what their movesets are. Veronica could be a good add. Derek, who am I kidding? Derek would be a great add. I don't think anybody would be mad at Derek either. But then again, a lot of you guys are very, very B-team friendly. And if the mod is deemed too good, we cannot use it. So... Hmm. Does that eliminate these two starters that we got tonight? Is that why Roger got the boot too? <laughs> Poor Roger. Um, Derek or Veronica? I wouldn't be against adding Veronica. I think Mr. Mine is somewhat speedy, and having Psychic type wouldn't be bad. It would be like having a miniature Alakazam. So I think for now, I think we are going to add Veronica to the team. Well, let me check. I was going to say, let me check uh, her moves first. But I think we are going to add Veronica to the squad. Maybe she can be like a miniature Xavier. We shall see. We shall see. We shall see. But what we are going to see right now, really quick, like, can you learn anything worthwhile? Probably not. Can I teach you water gun? Nope. Can I teach you hydro pump? Veronica can learn hydro pump. Sauron can learn hydro pump? What? Whoa, we might have to do that. Might have to teach you Hydro Pump. I think I'm going to teach him Sore. Teach her Spore. Confusion, Meditate, Substitute, Barrier. Oh, Barrier. Oh, God damn, I got Barrier. I'm going to get rid of Meditate. Even though it doesn't Meditate like up your attack or something like that. Something along those lines. Doesn't, or your special attack, something like that. I don't know. Anyways, Princess Jasmine is up here in Jafar's tower, and we need to go and save her now. Now. Knock, knock. Can you get an encounter in the lighthouse? Because I would really love to get an encounter in the lighthouse. I would really love. It would be chef's kiss to the T. You don't want to fight, bro? People train at this lighthouse. It's not easy to climb because of all the trainers. Bitch, we have a speed up button. Do you see how quickly we can climb this tower? You wanna fight, bro? You wanna fight? You sure about that, bro? You sure about that, bro? I'm not walking down to the Pokemon Center. Eh, 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 eh. We don't have any paralyzed heels. You're kidding me, 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 you're kidding me. Don't do me like this. Don't do me like this. Okay. Okay, hey, buddy. Mr. Jelly, with the smooch I'm gone, oh. and now the long-awaited wing attack, get rid of Screech, you don't even have to ask me, bro, you know, I feel like if it's a move, would there ever be a circumstance where you are saving a move, but you have never used it, I mean, I guess in Renegade Platinum, I was saving bulk up on Metacham, oof, look at this Magmar, even him, he's like, oof, too hot, too hot, too hot, too hot, just too hot with it let's move these moves around here whoa he just fire punched me what the fuck whoa 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 judy 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 please please judy please please judy please clean up clean up you know like when you gotta clean up you just take your hand and wipe it across the table and dump everything into the bag she does that except she splits the ground open and the whole table falls through <laughs> table trash and everything else all of it falls through and execute no 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 Ramla I need you to get caught up we need Ramla to get caught up no 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 we're not doing this get him out Ramla's caught up 
I say that, and Winston is 32. Everyone else isn't. So, Judy, you are up next. Veronica. Once we get Judy leveled up, we'll, we'll start switch training Veronica. Maybe I'll do a little bit of grinding in between tonight's episode and tomorrow night's episode. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not play this game here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not play this game here. Chill. Ow, you don't even gotta act like that. Winston definitely needs to be healed up. Thank you. So a lot of people like to come here to train, huh? Huh? Well, I feel like I'm whooping everybody's ass. Ooh, this Persian. This game is not ready for when Judy learns a ground type move. I was gonna say, I felt like this one over here. Ha 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 ha. A dragon fang? I don't know, Veronica. You might not last on the team that long. If we've got all of that now. Oh, I say all of that. We have a dragon fang. A dragon fang. A singular dragon fang. What the fuck is this dude doing? I wanted to battle Jasmine, but she's not up to it now, so how about you? Well, I'm always down. Oh, Tilly, time out, time out, time out, time out. I'm not having fun. I'm not having fun. I'm not having fun. Oh, you know what? I should have sent out. Oh, whoa, 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 do it. Oh, please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Please don't hurt me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mr. Mewtwo. Okay, Winston. Winston, you are the pirate. You are the pirate, and this Mewtwo needs to walk the plank. Now is the time. <clears throat> All right, buddy. All right, Winston. It's okay. So I saw rounds here. It's okay. I don't know how this random chucklehead got a Mewtwo he said I'm looking for Jasmine <laughs> but she doesn't want a battle uh, probably because she knows you got that what the fuck guy walking around with a Mewtwo looking for you Jasmine oh I'm not here I'm not here <laughs> tell him I died I died um Dratini print man oh, see now I have a dragon thing and a little blue mail I want to give uh, our brand new Dragonair. Dang, what do I get rid of out of this bag? <laughs> it cannot be the brick piece. The brick piece is staying. It is permanent. It is not going anywhere. Elixir, you know, everybody says you're supposed to hold your elixirs until the end of the game. But I don't think I'm ever going to end up keeping them that long. A self heal for burn. But we have ice heals, so we don't. We uh, Mill Tank doesn't want them. We're gonna get rid of self hold restore for PP, poison cure berry. Uh, I'll hold on to that one because it could be useful. It could be useful. But some of this stuff I need to drop off in the PC. Some of these items. Why did I even pick that bitch up to begin with? And how come when I toss it, it doesn't pop back up on the floor right there? Whoa, is this like a shortcut up here? Did we really? Hey, knock knock, girl. Looking to whoop that ass. This Pokemon always kept the sea lit at night, but it suddenly got sick. It's gasping for air. I understand that there is a wonderful pharmacy in Cyanwood that's across the sea, and I can't leave Amphi unattended. May I ask you to get some medicine for me, please? All the way across the sea, pa. Palu. It's breathing is terribly labored. All the way across the sea, really? I guess to go all the way over Ooh, I knew there was an item up here. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up, hold up. <sighs> Another elixir. <laughs> I just want another Master Ball, I'm not gonna lie. Like, one is not enough. Because, you know, you might have that panic Master Ball moment where you're like, Oh, fuck, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta use it now. But then you look back and you're like, mm, do I really need to use that then? Honestly, I want to fall back. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's the only way to go up. No, it's not. You can walk around here. I was going to say, I want to go back to where we were and finish out the tower. <laughs> that's what I want to do. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Chill, 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 chill. You know what, Veronica? I think you got this. Hit him up with this confusion. Just for the one time, we outspeed two. Oh, that was not enough. All right, you got to go. 
<laughs> Let's try this instead. No, it was just not enough. It was not enough damage. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. TM43. Survey says that we do not have TM43. And TM43 is in fact mirror move. Okay. Excellent work. Excellent work. But we will jot it down nonetheless. Mirror move. I'm not missing any encounters for tonight's episode, am I? I was thinking about that just now. Like, I don't think so. I think we got everything we needed to. We had a total of one, two, three, four, five, six encounters tonight, but we only missed out on one of them, which sucks, but can I fish with this grabber? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh hell yeah, Judy. Hell yeah, Judy. Hell yeah, Judy. Get that out of here. I was honestly kind of spooked. <laughs> we lost a mod to magnitude last night. I was not trying to have that happen again. Yo, can we just give a special moment of silence? Just a moment to Winston the pirate. Everyone else is trying to catch up to Winston, and Winston just keeps going. He doesn't stop. He just keeps going, keeps leveling up, keeps getting better, bigger, stronger, faster. Well, he needs to land a couple more of those guillotines, but other than that, he's doing great. So, okay, I think we have wiped out the entire tower. Bada bing, bada boom. Realest dudes in the room. How you doing? So, we got that taken care of. Um, and I think right here is a good enough spot as any to wrap up tonight's episode. I know some of you guys are going to say, oh, it's, it's not exactly, not quite an hour. Um, but it's close enough. It's closer to an hour than last night's episode was. Even though last night's episode was pretty close to a goddamn hour. Um, but I do want to teach, honestly, I want to teach strength to both Winnie and Winston. <laughs> to be honest with you, uh, Winston... We're going to get rid of Vice Grip, because why not? I'm pretty sure Strength does more than Vice Grip. <laughs> uh, and Strength is just Stab on you. So, oh, you have Cut, but... Oh, we're going to learn Slash. Uh, no, I might not give you Strength, bro. I want to, though, but he has Cut. <sighs> okay, I'm not going to teach him Strength for now, but that would... No, I really should. It's Stab. <laughs> It's stab. It's really very good. Isn't the move deleter in like Blackthorn City or something like that? Like it's still a ways away. But he learns slash level 39. So I have to get rid of Lick. I don't really want to get rid of Lick. We use it a lot. <laughs> we get paralysis a lot. Um, but I mean, I guess I wouldn't mind. But I would, I would get rid of Scratch now for strength and then get rid of... That's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. Because ignoring strength on Winnie is just stupid. I'm going to get rid of Scratch now and we'll keep using Lick. And by the time we get Slash, we'll put that there. And we'll get rid of Lick for Slash. So, we'll see. So, in the last episode, um, I know you guys mentioned a ton of shit. A ton of shit. You mentioned a ton of different things for me to go back and pick up and go back and do and this and that. And like I kind of mentioned with Homegirl earlier... We got to come back through all of this area, so I think I'm going to do another little ledger, another little checklist like we did in Goldenrod City where we went and explored everything south of Ekerty. So probably on our way either back from Sirenwood or as we're wrapping up here in Olivine, we'll probably snag a lot of that stuff. So if you guys have to comment mentioning something here or there or wherever or whatever, um, I'm definitely going to go back and put them all together. So we'll, we'll take a look at it, we'll take a look at it, we'll take a look at it. But anyways, we need to get to... Did we fish here? I know this is gonna... Ugh, I know I'm taking up so much time. We just gotta go, 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 go. Um, but I want to... See, I can't remember. Oh, they don't show you. They don't show you in this game, do you? You take so many things in Pokemon for granted. It doesn't show you where you caught the Pokemon. But, let me double check real quick. We got a Cyndaquil named Theo. I feel like we did fish for that. 
feel like we did. Um, so, I don't know. I might fuck up this encounter if that's not where the Cyndaquil was from, but... I don't know. You get old and you just can't remember shit anymore. <laughs> I'm getting so old now. Are you going to sign with? How about a quick battle first? Well, yeah. The fuck else you think I'm going? Dummy. Look like you're trying to be Misty. Anyways. Oh, but you know what? I don't know what. Wait, I'm always opening up my map. Did I miss it? Route 40, Route 41. So if I would have fished, that would have counted as a Route 40 encounter. I mean, there's a syndical out here. Okay, so I'm guessing, yes, we got a Route 40. So we need a World Islands and a Route 41 encounter. We need to keep an eye out for both of them. <laughs> um, hold up, hold up, hold up. Sal run. Sal run. Take him out. Hold us down. Come on now. Judy, do your thing. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, so I'm sure a lot of you guys may have noticed that we did not have an episode of Renegade Platinum today. Oh, Route 41. Oh, Route 41. Put a pin in it. Put a pin in it. Put a pin in it. The last episode of the day was talking about wasting Master Balls. Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we? Do we Master Ball? Do we Master Ball? Oh, Veronica. I want to send Veronica out and click Spore. Level 21, does this bitch have sleep talk already? Um. I'm gonna go out to Ramla. If only Ursula was still here. Special defense point way up. I mean, I like, I know it's a Snorlax. But it still spooks me, you know? Is he still confused? I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to click it again. Because if Ramla gets a crit, oh. I don't want to do it. 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 I really want this Snorlax. Okay, 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 okay. We're going to create ball. Do we, do we Master Ball a Snorlax? Is Snorlax Master Ball worthy? You know what I mean? Like... And I mean like in the sense of if we run through all these great balls and all these pokeballs, is Snorlax Master Ball worthy? And late night yellow we got one Master Ball and we used it on Articuno. <laughs> and surprisingly enough we caught Zapdos without a Master Ball. Oh, God damn bitch. Come on. Well he doesn't have rest. I hope he doesn't. I've seen him use Tackle, Amnesia, and Defense Curl. That sounds about right for level 21 Snorlax. <laughs> Never mind. I take it back. Come on, bro. Don't be doing no stupid shit. Don't be attacking Ramla like you know her. Judy, come take these tackles. I don't understand why are Pokemon so difficult to catch in this generation? Moment I say it, but is it just me? Like, is it just me? Or has it seemed like even the Pokemon that we have caught have been pretty difficult to catch? You know what I mean? Like, is it is it just me? Am I the only one that's noticed that? Like, what the fuck? I don't remember it ever being this hard in Gen 2. Alright, we got a Snorlax. That boy is a thousand pounds. This Pokemon's stomach is so strong, even eating moldy or rotten food will not affect it. Ooh, what do we name Snorlax? I think I got it. I think I got it. I think I got his name. What it's meant to be. Ben Hamim. <laughs> or Benny for short. Bill, is my PC full? Hi Nappy, it's me, Bill. Thanks for using my storage system. That last Pokemon you sent filled your box up. 
You'll have to switch boxes if you want to catch more Pokemon. Bye now. Okay, we will get to Cyan Wood City eventually. Like I said, all I want to make sure that we do is get the potion. Because <laughs> now we got to go back. God damn. Marie, Flaffy, and a Kabuto? What an interesting trainer you are. So, Unpin, I'm sure you guys noticed that there wasn't an episode of Renegade Platinum today. Today being Monday. This being Monday night. <laughs> that we are. Playing this game. We're good, right? Okay, box two. Just wanna be sure. I want no more phone calls from Billy. You know how I feel about phone calls. Um, anyways. I was busy doing a whole bunch of silly shit over the weekend. Um, and I don't know why I forgot this, but Sunday night I was sitting there thinking like all the stuff I had to do on Monday. And I was thinking to myself like, oh, I'm good. I can record Renegade Platinum in the morning. First thing in the morning. You know, I like recording Platinum in the morning. It's a nice contrast to late night crystal. We got loud morning Platinum. <laughs> oh, there's just all oh, this Snorlaxes in the water. Duh. I was going to say, there's just Snorlaxes in this water? scary face no get out of here okay so we're at 30 we're gonna try to start switch training veronica and getting her at least some sort of support i feel like playing on set switch training is very difficult like it requires me to be somewhat well i mean i guess not i'm not gonna say very difficult it's just not as easy as playing on uh switch is that what the other mode's called? Regular, regular, normal Pokemon? Uh, because they prompt you to swap every single time, you know what I mean? Like, whether you can or can't, they prompt you to swap every single time, so it reminds you, oh, I need to swap, oh, I need to swap, oh, I need to swap. Um, anyways, can we... Whoa, absorb. Hold on, get your ass out of here. Get your ass out of here, Winnie. Handle this dugong. Jesus, Winnie. I'm not going on something double slap. Why? Don't you know you are a special attacker? Do not learn double slap. Winnie grew to level 32? Ah, oh, damn. See, like, in that sense, I could have swapped out to Veronica uh, as she swapped in her. Whatchamacallit? <laughs> dugong? Or her Sunflora at the end there? But didn't get the chance to. It's a vicious whirlpool. Pokemon be able to pass it. Uh, don't you? You don't get whirlpool until like. Uh, oh, we level twenty six. Chill, 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 chill. Did he just pursue trap me? What? Fuck! I had never seen pursuit Gen two. I mean, like, yeah, I know it's a. Uh, Gen 2 move, but like, I don't know. I just wasn't expecting it just now. What the fuck? Veronica has so little HP. I'm glad she lived that too. Um, can we stop with the magnitudes, please? Like, I'm a little over it. <laughs> I'm a little over having to stress over magnitude. Like, Jesus. Just burn through these potions. Anyways, pin back in it. So I was thinking to myself last night, like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll have plenty of time to record in the morning, this and that. I completely forgot that this morning <laughs> we were getting our roof redone. <laughs> oh, there's sweet coon in this water. Oh, how nice. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to say that with the impression that I'm not happy with Benjamin Benjamin at all. I definitely am, but I mean a sweet coon is a sweet coon, you know. But you know what? I guess at the same time that's kind of good because we have Winston. And as long as we have Winston, probably would not have been afforded many opportunities to utilize said sweet coon. So we'll see. Um anyways, yeah, I completely forgot that we were getting a roof redone um today. I don't know how I, I guess I just like I didn't get the dates mixed up I was just like I knew what the dates were but I was thinking it was a different day does that make sense anyways so yeah 6 a.m. this morning bang 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 no 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 
doom, 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 doom. And it blows my mind too because, you know, like, is it worth? Do I quit the confusion on the poison type? Tail whip. Okay, I'm getting the fuck out of here. <laughs> get the fuck up out of here. Before anything else happens, get me out. Get this Abra out of here. Get me out of here. Uh, so yeah, 6 o'clock. They're banging. And it, it's so weird to me because like you can tell like what a normal hammer sound is like. You know, like bang, 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 bang. This bitch has six Pokemon. Director Mallory. Bite? From an Ammonite? Chill. Um, so yeah, so you can kind of tell um, what a hammer sounds like. But you know, there is some, some point during the day where it sounds like these motherfuckers are just up there picking shit up and just dropping it. Just boom on the roof. Bang! Boom! Doom! Sound like this motherfucker about to come straight through the ceiling next to me, sitting here. What the fuck? So, long story short, uh, long time ago, long time ago, probably about two months ago, um, during monsoon season, which we're kind of sort of um, almost out of, I guess. Maybe we are considered out of it. Um, we had a really bad, like, um, I think it's called... Uh, hotspot or something like that. I can't think of the term now off the top of my head. Uh, but basically it's like a really, really centralized like storm. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, 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 chill. I know I'm swapping a lot, but chill. Um, it's a microburst. That's what it is, not a hotspot. <laughs> Hotspots are what fading is. Um, anyways, it was a microburst and it ripped off part of our roof I was like what the fuck <laughs> we're like of course this happens did I just get pursuit trapped again Veronica grew to level 23 oh chill 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 Sauron come here yeah hold up oh, just, I feel like we have to use bite though and it's a dog <laughs> it's a dog they bite anyways microburst came through Sometime in like June or July or whatever, and just now we got um, the people out here to fix it. Uh, but I got the dates mixed up. I swear to God, if this Sand True knows pursuit. Got the dates mixed up, and they were just out here all fucking morning, just banging, 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 banging. And they took lunch, and I didn't even realize it until they were like halfway done. So I run in here and I sit down and try and like get ready and. Uh, I want to make sure I do everything, good to go. I get like eight minutes into this episode of Platinum and have to stop because bang, 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 doom, 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 <laughs> all over again. I'm like, what the fuck? Are you serious? So I just didn't get a chance to record Platinum today. It was in the cards, but I guess it wasn't in the cards. Um, and I figured if anything, I could just explain during Late Night Crystal, so... I'm sure there'll be a couple people who don't watch Late Night Crystal who will probably be like, what the fuck, Navi? On uh, tomorrow's episode of Platinum, but I missed out. You guys are here getting the scoop, getting the scoop of things. Um, I think, inadvertently, I have kind of, sort of... That wasn't my fault. I shouldn't have done that. That was stupid. Veronica did not deserve that. That was my fault. 100%. You know, Switch training this entire time, I've been like doing this mental check every time a Pokemon comes up, thinking, like, what can it do to Veronica? What can it do to Veronica? I even mentioned how little HP Veronica had. Um, and there were a couple I think I clicked Confusion on just to get a little bit of experience. But, you know, now that I'm thinking out loud, the whole point in Switch training is to switch the Pokemon out. Not to leave him in. I should have seen that coming. I should have known better. Dumb, 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 dumb. Veronica didn't deserve that. Veronica did not deserve that. <sighs> Such a bad trainer. Awful trainer is awful. Awful trainer is awful. Awful trainer is awful. Um, well, we have a gym coming up. So I think whoever we end up replacing Veronica with, I'm going to probably do some grinding and get the entire squad up to a certain level so we'll see but that was just awful that was awful there's no excuse for that i shouldn't have done that winnie's level 34 oh 
I shouldn't have done that at all. Just dumb. Just dumb. Just dumb. <laughs> Just dumb. Just dumb. Is this really all that this route is? I feel like as a kid, this route was huge. Like a massive, big ass fucking route. Yeah, get me out of here. I wanna fight that. The fuck's over here? <gasps> We're in Sinewood City. This is our Sinewood City encounter. Well, that is species. Technically. Okay, we're on Route 41. Sinewood City. What the fuck? Don't tell me all Sinewood City got is... Am I too close to the city? There we go. Don't tell me all Sinewood City has a Zubat. <laughs> okay I can rock with that we have done wonderful things with a drowsy in the past <laughs> oh but I don't want to go out to Ramla because he's gonna click pound because <laughs> he's gonna click pound uh, what do I do? I feel like Veronica would have been perfect. <sighs> what do I do? I feel like anyone that attacks him is going to do a lot of damage. Um, Sauron, can you smog him? Okay, we got a poison. I know we're right next to which we'll call it, but I want to sign with City. I know we're right next to Sinewood City, but I don't want any sneaky shit to happen while we're trying to catch this drowsy. Because, you know, that'll be the spirit. Disaster strikes in twos. Or is it threes? Three. But still, we don't want to, uh... Beckon that in. We don't want to bring those bad vibes in. When it twitches its nose, it can tell when someone is sleeping and what that person is dreaming about. Give a nickname to drowsy. Hmm... What do we name this drowsy? I think we're gonna name him. <laughs> I think we're gonna name him Xavier. As a little miniature shout out to Xavier from Late Night Yellow. Hoorah. Speaking of bad energy, as we are sliding here into port, in Sinewood City. Ah, oh, Sinewood City. A port surrounded by rough seas. You know, that would be one hell of a Pokemon quiz. Like, name the city by their description. A port surrounded by rough seas. Sinewood City. <laughs> okay, but speaking of bad vibes. We are going to pull another quote from our pocket Maya Angelou wisdom guide here. We are still in chapter one, self-empowerment. Um, and tonight's quote is, There is no greater agony than bearing an untold story inside you. There is no greater agony than bearing an untold story inside you. It's like she's reading my mind. It's like she's reading my fucking mind. It's like she's reading my mind. So I had this idea just now before I started recording. Um, I was checking the comments on the last episode. And someone left a comment. I should have had this ready to go. I, every time I have to look for a comment, I always say I should have had this ready to go. Uh, Retro Da Vinci. Da Retro Da Vinci. My bad. <laughs> Um, he left a comment, which I'm sure was just in jest, uh, about, um, like, the framing of the Elite Four and the Pokemon League and how Lance's champion in two regions and what ifs and this and that and whatnot. Um, I'm probably going to put the comment up on the screen, but if you want to see his comment and my full reply, I definitely suggest going back to last episode and checking it out. You can add your thoughts and opinions there as well, or on this video, or whatever. Anyways 
point I'm getting to uh, was in replying to his comment about champions in different regions, I kind of had this weird idea. Like, we were talking about, like, progression in the Pokemon League and, like, how people move up or rank down and, like, what ifs, this and that. And I was thinking about Koga and how Koga became the Pokeseer ahead. How Koga kind of... Oh, whoa, 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 chill. What's, 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 what's you doing? Yo, Nappy, wasn't that you, Suicune, just now? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand, and it races through towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's wonderful. I want to see Suicune up close. I've decided. I'll... I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come now. Come on, Nappy. Let's battle now. Oh my god. I wasn't ready for this. We just lost. I didn't even go to the Pokemon Center. What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with me? But catcher Zoe. Cubone. Be reasonable. Level 30. Oh my god. Actually, no. No, oh my god. We're good. We got this. We got this. Boomerang. Doesn't affect us. Doesn't affect us. Try it again. Try it again. Get your weak ass little Cubone. This is why Suicune refuses to show himself to you. It's every time. It is every single time I lose a Pokemon. The very next fucking battle it shows up. What the fuck? <sighs> Mr. Mind flinched. Get it out of here. Set your light screen up. I won't remember it. It's fine. Sauron, we're not getting confused. We're not letting... Sauron, we're not getting confused. Oh my goodness, thank you. Oh my goodness, thank you. Level 33, Quillback. Oh, okay, wait. I'm not even gonna try it. I'm not even gonna try it. I'm just gonna heal. Okay, wait. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to you. I had to ask myself, like, what level is Ramla? Does Crobat learn Pursuit? <laughs> I had to make sure. I'm sorry. I didn't want anything to happen. I, could, I couldn't lose Veronica and Sauron back to back like that. Come on. You're amazing, Nappy. No wonder Pokemon gravitate to you. I get it now. I'm going to keep searching for Suicune. I'm sure we'll see each other again. See you around. Okay, no more sneak attacks. I was coming up here to check out the house. I was gonna like do a sweep of Cyanwood City. That's probably why I didn't even think about the fucking Pokemon Center, but I don't wanna do that shit again. <laughs> I don't wanna do that shit again. <sighs> Whoa, the Pokemon gym trainers here are macho bullies. <laughs> if I stick around, they might come after me. Here's some advice. The gym leader uses the fighting type, so you should confound him with psychic Pokemon. Wipe out his Pokemon before they can use their physical strength. And those boulders in the middle of the gym? If you don't move them correctly, you won't reach the gym leader. If you get stuck, go outside. Damn, they just tell you to eat. Motherfucker, he is mad at them. Macho bullies? He said the entire strategy had to whoop their ass. <laughs> Oh, okay, Veronica, I'm sorry. I apologize. I didn't really want to do that. I shouldn't have done that, but I did. Um, we will consider our new addition in a moment. But, back before you scene interrupted us, I was thinking about like lines of succession and whatnot in the Pokemon League and Elite Four. And I was thinking about Koga as an example, how Koga, like he has a clan, he has like a house almost, like Game of Thrones. You know, like he moves up to King's Landing or to the King's Court or whatever as taking place of uh, the Elite Four in Gen 2. And then his daughter becomes the new heiress or whatever, Lord or Lady, Lady, she's the Lady of Fuchsia City. <gasps> Janine is the Lady of Fuchsia City, whoa. Could you imagine if every city had their own house? They had their own banner. Oh my god. You want to talk about a rabbit hole? Wow. I see all. I know all. Certainly I know of your Pokemon. 
Um, okay, check out my boy Winston. Hmm, I see you met Winston here. New Bogtown. The time was night. The level was five. Am I good or what? Incidentally, it seems to have grown a little. Winston seems to be becoming more confident. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Um, there were a couple of you guys that were leaving comments in the last episode saying that if you train the Pokemon on the route that it is caught, it will increase its friendship. Something like that. So I'm sure, I think you guys are talking about that lady. Photo Studio, take a snapshot as a keepsake. I don't have my Game Boy Color printer. You, you have magnificent Pokemon with you. How about a photo for a souvenir? Okay, big smile now. Which Pokemon should I photograph? Photograph my boy Winston. Alrighty. Hold still for a bit. I apologize. The pirate. Printer error 2. Check the Game Boy printer manual. Press B to cancel. Oh, no picture. Come again, okay? Damn, I wish I still had one of them little printers. I'd print off the whole fucking Pokedex. <laughs> You came from Olivine? Do you remember the four islands along the way? I heard that a mythical sea creature is hiding in them. Oh yeah? I heard that you can only see it if you have a silver wing. It must have the same scent as the creature. So what, did Lugia come back thinking there's a lady Lugia there? I've heard that the whirlpools around the islands are caused by the sea creature. You might need a special move to get past them. Or you know, it's 2023. Maybe... A boy Lugia, it's waiting on. Chuck, the gym leader, spars with his fighting Pokemon. Do we dip our piggies in the water? Uh, I'm in shock. A guy about your age with piercing eyes and long hair came in. He scared me into giving him my prize Pokemon. I still have one left, but what if he comes back? You look strong. Could you look after my Pokemon for a while? Oh, thank you. Take good care of it, please. Thanks. So, I'm going to ask you right now. Make your guess in the comment section below. What do you think this shuckle is going to be? That's why I didn't add anybody to the team just yet. Because I was like, I know you get a shuckle here. Or it's going to be randomized. So I'll give you a few moments. Go ahead and make your guess. What do you think this shuckle is going to be? And let me know if you're right. <laughs> All right. Survey says Shucky is a diglet. You know, I saw the 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 sprite in the party and i was like you know <laughs> sometimes they use sprites just for groups of pokemon maybe it's not a diglet it is <laughs> but you know at the same time i'm not mad at shucky the diglet uh i'm not mad at shucky the diglet i like the trio um but we have judy so i don't know if shucky the diglet is gonna get much screen time um, at least for right now But we have Shucky the Diglett Level 15 holding a berry um, Shucky, I'm gonna need to snag that from you Scratch, growl, and magnitude I'm gonna need to snatch that from you Because I know a certain sick cow that could use it 500 years of tradition Sinewood City Pharmacy We await your medical queries Hey, knock knock your Pokemon appear to be fine. Is something worrying you? Ah, oh, the lighthouse Pokemon is in trouble. I get it. This ought to do the trick. The secret potion. My secret potion is a tad too strong. I only offer it in an emergency. How, like, what, what about it makes it too strong? I don't understand. You crossed the sea to get here? That must have been hard. It would be much easier if your Pokemon knew how to fly. But you can't use fly without this city's gym badge. If you beat the gym leader here, come see me. I'll have a nice gift for you. Isn't that Chuck's wife? Pokemon gym. His roaring fist do the talking. See, that's another good Pokemon trivia. What are all the gym leader sayings? Do you know all the gym leader sayings? Um, okay, so we got our secret potion. We got a couple new encounters. We unfortunately lost Veronica, who I was actually really looking forward to using. Um, but if we consider adding a new mon to the squad, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna leave it up to you guys. I'm gonna leave it up to you guys again. I feel like I do this every episode, but we record this series every day, so why not? I'm gonna leave it up to you guys. You let me know who you think we should replace or add to 
What is his item? What is he holding? A lure ball. Wow. Um, let me know what you guys or which Pokemon you guys think we should add to the squad. I'm going to go over them really quickly. I'm going to deposit them in the box. So we have Judy, Ramla, Sauron, Winston the Pirate, and Winnie. So in this box we have Shucky the Diglett and Xavier the Drowsy. If we go back to box one, we have Ben Hamin, the Snorlax, Derek the Dragonair, Magnolia the Gyarados, Seven the Onyx, Sinclair the, Va the Vaporean, Penelope the Elicade, Romelina <laughs> the Golbat, Patty the Croconaw, Chartreuse the Blossom, Goldberg the Whooper, Stephanie the McCargo, Nolan the Sunflora, Allison the Jigglypuff, Otto the Ditto, Fiona the Charmander, Kenya the Amistar, Roger the Charmeleon, Madam President the Lickitung, Mahogany the Ivysaur, and Theo the Cyndaquil. So you guys let me know who you think we should add to the squad. And I think just, just, just to say we did, I think we're going to dip our toes in the gym water here real quick just oh my god do i have to do two battles at once okay never mind we're not gonna do that <laughs> we're not gonna do that right now enough chit chat enough chitter chatter oh, never mind not enough chit chat hi nappy good evening it's christine how are you want to battle i have to battle every so often to avoid rusting out i'll be on route 38 see you later all right enough chit chat let's pop up in this gym we were gonna dip our piggies in the water in the last episode, um, but we got a little too spooked because it's a double battle right from the start. Um, but you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. It's not a double battle. It's not a double battle. Swimmer Marilyn. Okay. 35. Okay, I feel like we're right on target for where we need to be. We martial artists fear nothing. I wouldn't fear shit if I had a Ho-Oh -Oh either. What the fuck? Uh, is this Ho-Oh -Oh no Hydro Pump? <laughs> Can I send out Judy? Uh, you know what? Actually, I think... Do we guillotine this Ho-Oh? -Oh? <laughs> I'm gonna click it. <laughs> I will never not love that i would never not love that i would never not love guillotine and some monster ass pokemon on the screen in front of me sorry donna <laughs> hit the gym <laughs> you, you bitch <laughs> hit the gym you bitch oh don't you ever challenge me to a battle again last time i checked our eyes did not link our eyes did not lock whatever Tackle star me, get the fuck out of here. Hop it. Stomp that thing out. Dang, this gym sucks. <laughs> oh, alright, Winston. Let's do this. Let's do this. I just want to point out we did that on the first try. Mm, my raging fist will shatter your Pokemon. Come on, bro. Send out whatever you want to die. Winston's level 40. Whoa, 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 whoa chill i said penelope will show up eventually i don't need you to be showing up now i'm a horn drill too <laughs> oh it's so funny i don't know why it's so funny get this shit out of here bro get this shit out of here is that like low-key like whoa, whoa 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 i'm not risking it chill out chill out let's get xavier his in episode debut i gotta bring it down a little bit i'm what the fuck quick bite i'm way too hyped to record late night crystal tonight we gotta bring it back down a little bit bring it back down a little bit bring it back down a little bit okay let's see what we can do here Knock this total out of the water, but I liked his little prediction with the bite. <laughs> I got shattered. Uh, so do y'all think we're ready? The brick piece says we're ready. Oh, mighty brick piece. <laughs> do you think we are prepared for our upcoming battle? 
I mean, our team kind of slow. I mean, Xavier, I mean, uh, <laughs> wrong Xavier. Ramla and Sauron are really only two speedy ones on the team. I feel so bad for Ramla and Xavier. They don't have anything. Come on, let's go. Wah! So you come this far. Let me tell you I'm tough. My Pokemon will crush stones and shatter bones. Watch this. There, scared now, are you? What? It has nothing to do with Pokemon. That's true. Come on, we shall do battle. Hey, y'all see that Mario movie poster that came out today? I don't know what made me think of it just now. But... Uh, or no, you know what I think it was? I think it was the goofy-ass voice I just did. I was thinking how goofy Jack Black's gonna sound as Bowser. But, I'm not... Like, I like Jack Black, so, like, I'm not mad at Jack Black as Bowser. So, I like, goofy in a sense is not a bad thing. I'm not using it in a negative connotation, but I, it just popped into my head. Are y'all hyped for the Mario movie? Because I'm looking forward to it. I don't think it's going to be awful. I mean, I saw the cast. I don't think it's going to be awful. <laughs> All right, Ranger Kim. Show me what you got. A star you. A star you. I think on our next randomizer, I think I'm going to uncheck like strength or similar strength or something like that. Um, because like I think I included it on there because it felt like it's fair. You know what I mean? Like um, I don't want the first gym leader to have a Mewtwo <laughs> at level five. Mewtwo clicking. Uh, well, we would have trained right on par. We were one level above. Mewtwo clicking confusion against my level 4 Cyndaquil. You know, like, that's just... Well, I'm not going to have a level 4 Cyndaquil at the first gym. But you know what I mean. Like, it's just like, what the fuck? Uh, but I feel like as you go further on into the game, and especially, like, kind of like midpoint in the game like this, it's like, it feels like it can go either way. You know, like, like right now, what is Chuck's Ace normally? A Poliwrath? So this is set to similar strength. Smeargle is similar. Is Smeargle's on par with Poliwrath? Is that like based on stats or? It's just goofy to me. Like, whatever our next randomizer is, I think I'm gonna try it without that, and we'll just have to roll the die and see what ends up happening. Sorry, Ranger Kim. Whoa, I lost. How about that? You're worthy of Storm Badge. Is this Storm's in? Hey, we getting two badges tonight. Storm Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 70 obey, even traded ones. Up to level 70? This is what, badge number... Five? Damn. Who's got level 70s at this point in the game? <laughs> it also lets you your Pokemon use Fly Rear not in battle. Here, take this too. Can you get... No, you can't get the Lugia. I surfed all around the islands. You need Whirlpool. You don't get Whirlpool until Dragon's Den, right? Right? So why would they let you have up to level 70s at this point? Is there... I feel like there's something I'm missing. There's gotta be something I'm missing. TM01? We do not know what TM01 is. I guess our luck has run out with TMs in Late Night Crystal. We just received TM01. Lovely kiss. How lovely. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it, dude. Well, I don't know how to tell you this, but your gym is kind of a joke. Ma'am, you crossed the sea to get here? That must have been hard. It would be much easier if your Pokemon knew how to fly. That's Simon Wood's gym badge. Then you should take this HM. Hey, thanks. Teach fly to your Pokemon. You'll be able to fly instantly to anywhere you have visited. My husband lost to you, so he needs to train harder. That's good, since he was getting a little chubby. <laughs> okay, then. Um, let us go ahead. Lady Ramla, we must ask you to ferry us to and fro. Uh, I'm going to get rid of this. <laughs> I, I, I like having fly 
but I don't like having fly as the only flying type move on a Pokemon. Like, uh, whack, whack. Okay, but anyways, yes, fly us to New Bark Town. Oh wow, we did visit Mahogany Town, didn't we? Wow. Well, we still got that secret potion burning a hole in our pocket, and we need to deliver it quick, fast, and in a hurry. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Get me out of here, bro. Hey, check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Was that clean? Was that clean? Will that medicine cure Amphi? There you go. Um, please don't be offended. Amphi will not take anything from anyone but me. Amphi, how are you feeling? Palu! <laughs> Palulu! Palulu! I'm like, why, why would I type that? Is that what they think Amphros' cry sounds like? Palulu! Oh, I'm so relieved. This is just so wonderful. Thank you so very much. I will return to the gym. Hey, that's my gym now. Where'd she go up here? Palu! Palulu! <laughs> What the fuck? Oh, cause it's a lighthouse. What the? Scared the shit out of me. She she dipped off down here. Is this where I gotta go? And you know, ever since I was a little kid, I always felt like they could have done more with this tower. Like, add more people in it or whatever. But it just I don't know. Like it looks so much more imposing and intimidating than just this. Whatever. Okay. So we did the damn thing. So Chuck's age just now was 39. So I'm guessing that her ace... She only has a three Pokemon too, right? <laughs> Jasmine uses the newly discovered steel type. I don't know very much about it. <laughs> Alright, well, fuck you too. <laughs> Alright, Jasmine. Let's pose for the thumbnail. Oh, I love how symmetrical your gym is too. Like, just look at it. Look at it go. Thank you for your help at the lighthouse. But this is different. Please allow me to introduce myself. I am Jasmine, a gym leader. I use the steel type. Do you know about the steel type? It's a type that was only recently discovered. Um, may I begin? Dang, you know, it is kind of crazy. They put two gyms like back to back right here like this. It would have been cool if they would have had like an event in the middle of the route or uh, whatever the sea route is between Cyanwood and Olivine. Something more, you know, something that stops you and then you would take on Cyanwood and then on the way back, it's still badges back to back. I don't know. That's just weird. Very weird. I know they try not to do that again, but still. Ranger Dudley? Ranger Dudley? So I know she normally has a Magnemite, so Magnemite got swapped out for Bellsprout. Ooh, I like that. Chuck's Ace is the level that Hermon starts at. Um, yes. Come, come. Sweet Scent? What is this meant to do? What is this meant to do to me? My evasion fell? Well, what are you doing? You're gonna hit... Uh, uh... I can't think of a... Grass-type one-hit KO move. <laughs> is there a Grass-type one-hit KO move? I would click out, but every time I click out, the audio cuts out. Get this bell sprout out of here. Um, I'm gonna type in Oko moves. Cause I feel like there's not. But I'm thinking about it, so now I wanna see. One hit knockout move. Fissure, guillotine, horn drill, and sheer cold, that's it? That's it? You're telling me we have three of the four one hit KO moves on our team right now? <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. What? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
wait a minute. Time out, time out, time out. Time out, time out, time out. Yeah, that's what I thought. You ain't fucking with me. So, can Winston the Pirate learn Shirkle? <laughs> He's the only one on our team right now, I think, that can learn it. I mean, unless we get a TM. If we get a TM for Shirkle, then we could. Do we do we horn drill this Zapdos? Um So what is this? Her Steelix? So her Steelix is equivalent to a Zapdos in this game? Oh, oh I didn't know the tech was a Gen 2 move. If you would have just asked me like what generation did the tech come out in, I probably would have said Gen 4. Why do we outspeed the... Is Judy holding the quick claw? Oh! Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Hold on. It was the quick claw. Hold on, so she had two level 39, and then they just throw out a level 46? <laughs> oh, okay. Um... So what's the plan here? I'm gonna go out to Winnie. I think that's our I think that's our play. Aha! Uh -huh -huh. Wow, she has a level 36 Gengar. <clears throat> you know, after all these years, I still do not have a Gengar tattoo. I have a Ghastly tattoo, but if I ever do get a Gengar tattoo, I want it to be this sprite right here. This is his dopest. I mean, later in later games when it's on the Switch and whatnot, of course he's super dope there too. But I'm talking about like an old school Pokemon. Just look at him. That shade of purple is like the perfect purple right there. When I tell you my favorite color is purple, that is the purple I'm talking about. Like, ooh, wee, boy, look at him. Look at his grin and everything. Ah, uh, uh, he's the best. He's the best. They got it, they got it right the first time around. They made the best Pokemon in the first generation. Even now, look at him. They swapped the red and the purple when he's already still dope too. Oh my god. I love this Pokemon. I don't even want to hurt him. If I lose my lock right here, right now, I'd have no issue with it. We'd start late night Emerald tomorrow. <laughs> I'd have no issue with it. Bro, you're just making this easier for me. Winnie. Oh, wow see I complimented him he knew he knew Gengar knew he knew we like this we like this right here we like this you are a better trainer than me in both skill and kindness in accordance with league rules I confer upon you this gym badge I was about to say what the fuck he skipped a whole line. <laughs> skipped a whole word, but it was just me. It's just me. I'm just still so flustered from that Gengar. Mineral badge raises Pokemon's defense. Um, please take this too. TM23? So everybody says we don't know what it is. That teaches Thief. Alright. Uh, for what it's worth, we do have a dark type on our team. I wonder how much damage Thief does. Um, but okay. Still thanks. Still thanks for all of your help. What was that, 23? Tech that may steal a held item. Huh. Huh. Um, okay. Uh, all right, I had fun. Let's move on. <laughs> I had fun. Let's move on. We're done here. Thanks, Olivine. Thanks, Cyanwood. Uh, but I think we're going to uh, you know just get the fuck up out of here. Level 46 Gengar and a Zapdos just out of nowhere. She was not playing games. Anyways, so where to next? Is it Lake of Rage time already? Are we already going to be hitting up? that Gyarados speaking of like equivalent exchange or whatever similar strength equivalent exchange um 
I wonder what Gyarados would be swapped out for. Moo. It's cry is weak. Hell yeah. Now that I forgot I had that berry, I would never. I would never. Damn, how many berries you need? I have no more berries. You know, ate all my fucking berries. But I'm pretty sure the next one will be three, so. I'll come back. Don't you worry, Mr. Moo Tank. I'll come back. I will, I will, I will. Is this round 38? Where's homegirl at on Route 38? Oh, homeboy. I've been waiting. Let's battle now. Hey, just happened to be in the neighborhood. What can I say? Performer Christine. Hey, let me let me show you something. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Rachel. Ah. That's just so popular. Nappy, it's Rachel. Got time to chat? My Ampharos and I are getting more in sync with each other, but you know, I still haven't caught Vile Bloom. It's getting past frustrating. Vile is shut. Oh, maybe she did hear. Heard I was handing out ass whoopings and wanted to hang up real quick. Yeah, change the subject. You brought up that Ampharos. You think I'm scared of that Ampharos? I ain't scared of that Ampharos. Keep talking about it. How are you doing all this shit? Oh, me and my infros. We didn't catch a vile plume just yet. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I gotta get rid of her too. Anyways. <laughs> I need to get rid of her too. Get her out of here. So, I guess, yeah. We just head to Mahogany Town next. I feel like when I played this as a kid, this was much more like, you know, like you forget and then you come back and you're like, oh my god, wow, what the fuck, wow, wow, wow. Should we explore Mount Mortar? Don't you get a Tyrogue in here? Isn't this where you get Tyrogue? So do we need to explore Mount Mortar? What do we need to explore Mount Mortar though? We need Flash, right? Do we need Flash? We need flash for the deeper, darker parts, the innards of Mount Mortar, where the One Ring was forged in flame. Hey, this past week's episode of Rings of Power, crazy, crazy. Um, I've been watching a whole bunch of reviewers on Rings of Power and whatnot, and I gotta say, like, I don't get it. I fucking love the show. <laughs> <laughs> like I understand the issues that people have with the show but just as a show itself I'm fucking in love with it I love it so much this thick ass right you you think I don't see you up here bro I see you and you know I I have this like weird feeling of oh wow I have this weird feeling of two of these I was about to say of like you know like when someone has a in joke or like a group of people have an in joke and then you're on the outside looking in and you're like uh-huh uh-huh I don't get it that's how I feel about House of the Dragon <laughs> everybody is like oozing over this show right now is really just pick up a fucking park ball <laughs> you know uh, I feel that's how I feel with um, House of the Dragon. Everyone's just like in love with the show. And don't get me wrong, I like it. Me and Hector watch it every week. I love Game of Thrones. I'm, I'm watching it, but I just don't understand. People act like it's the greatest show that has come out in forever. And I'm just sitting here like, mm, what's happening? Like, I don't really understand the point of all of this right now. Is he a trainer? Hey, what the fuck are you doing in here, bro? Get guillotine. I mistook you for someone else. Yeah, I could tell. Winston ended your shenanigans real quick. Anyways, I didn't mean to bore you guys with um, House of the Dragon and Rings of Power chat, but for those of you guys that do watch it, let me know what you think. There's only three episodes left in each show until the end of the season. Love it. Um, so yeah, this was kind of like an impromptu Mount Mortar search. I kind of just kept going because it didn't ask us to use Flash yet. <laughs> if I'm being honest, 
Um, I know that we had another way to go up here that I did not follow, right? Because I jumped down this ledge to come whoop that guy's ass. I wish I had repels or something. I probably do have like 98 repels in the bag. But I'm just not using them. Nope, not a single one. Um, but you know what else I've gotten into lately? I have fallen down the archer well. The archer hole. I don't know why. For the longest time I've never watched Archer. I, like, never had any reason not to. And like I knew Jessica Walters was on there. I love Arrest Development. It's one of my favorite shows ever. Um, but I knew she was on there. Um, and I knew that there were... Like I always had interest in that. I don't know. I was just always just watching other shit. Um, and I got into it. And there's 13 fucking seasons. Do you know how good it feels? When you find a new show that you really like and you see that there's 13 <laughs> seasons of it. Oh my god. Oh. Let me tell you. EXK Static. Oh my goodness. I'm going to need you to... Uh... Alright, fine. You landed enough. It's okay. 42. Let's get Winston out of here. Sorry, buddy. You are our pirate numero uno but we gotta let someone else get some experience a polka dot bow can't carry any more items toss that bitch hope it's not worth a million dollars dang but this polka dot bow powers up normal type moves what the fuck okay i'm gonna give this to winnie and i'm gonna give this to lady ramla she is the lady of the reach. So she is mistress of coin. Um, but yes, I've fallen down the archer well and I want to drown in it. <laughs> and what's crazy is there's so many different people that lend voices to the show. Like, whoa. But I think the one thing that really helped me get over this, like, I always had this like um, subconscious like I don't know like I can't shake it like it goes back to Arrested Development too. Um, Joe from Arrested Development played by Will Arnett I think. Oh I would love to use the air across. Um, he voiced Bojack Horseman and for the longest time I just could not get into Bojack Horseman because I always just saw Job in my head. Do we really just clear that bitch out? Is this the middle one? Is there another one? I always just saw Job in my head. Oh, the middle one takes you deeper in. Okay. So I could never like get into Bojack Horseman. Can we take on a gym right now? Oh. The fuck? Fuck. What is it? Three gyms in one episode? Whoa. Anyways, I could never get into Bojack Horseman because of that. Um, but eventually I just started watching Bojack Horseman and it's incredible by the way. I love it. Um Maybe it's about time for a rewatch. It's been a little while. Um, never mind. I can't do that. Down the archer hole right now. Down the archer hole. Um, but maybe it's time. Uh, maybe it's time for a rewatch. Down the archer hole right now. <laughs> My thought processes are getting crossed, so I'm going back and starting over. Um, but. I brought up Bojack Horseman because that idea, like I just pushed through it and I got into it. I really enjoyed it. That's kind of what I did with Archer. And it's really weird because Jessica Walter's character in Archer is kind of almost the exact same as it is in Arrested Development. <laughs> so I love it. She's all over every single episode, in every single episode. It's great. Anyways, I'm going to shut the fuck up about Archer and maybe go watch some Archer. Actually, I think might be watching Dahmer tonight but I don't know we'll see we'll we'll see so I want to start off tonight's episode by going back and checking something that we missed so I mentioned that last night we went and exploratized uh, Mount Mortar but I mean as far as I remember we got everything that we were supposed to like we did everything that we could have access to 
Does that make sense? Like, we went through all the rooms, we went through all the paths that we could go through, and we ended up on the other side of Mount Mortar and went to Mahogany Town, and we skipped this middle section. And I remember mentioning it, too. I was like, you know, there's a there's a middle entrance here that we didn't do, um, and we're going to have to come back and do it sometime because I could swear you needed Flash in Mount Mortar. Um, but Shiny Mutank reminded us that we also missed out on the Suicune encounter <laughs> down here, which we would need to continue the storyline. So, hey, what's poppin'? Because I'm going to be honest with you, I would have 100% forgotten. The pack is fucking full. You know, what happened to giving out good, useful berries? Now we just have yellow apricorns. And you know, I said I was going to do something with this pack. <clears throat> Why? Why do you make it so that this is even an issue? Like, just have unlimited pack space. Unlimited pack space. You know, I was gonna... I really was gonna go in here and see what was popping and what was up. Just take a peek inside, at least until we needed Flash. Which, you know, in all honesty, isn't even really... I mean, it was mean Waterfall, at the very least. Yeah, so we came in through here before. And is this the other side? Did we go out that side? how it's fucking designed I guess we did but I don't really want to I'm not gonna lie I do really want to explore in here we came through here before didn't we the first time we came down this route yeah we came in here before well what the fricky friggle frick frack what the yeah, we did we did yep yeah, we did all of this so the only thing we're missing in Mount Mortar is just waterfall. So we need to get waterfall. <laughs> okay. Um, Cause I was gonna say it's not that I don't want to explore Mount Mortar right now. It's more like I really, really, really do want to explore Mount Mortar right now. But it's not even Flash that I'm worried about. It's fucking waterfall. Anyways, so. <laughs> Yeah, we had to go back and uh, check out the Suicune just now. Um, but our primary goal for tonight is, as Homeboy over here says, Since you came this far, take the time to do some sightseeing. You should head north and check out Lake of Rage right now. You know what, buddy? I think you give good advice. I really, really do. But I need to... Drop some shit off real quick. I'm gonna drop off both Dragon Fangs because we don't need them. <sighs> See, I don't want to get rid of the berries because we could use them, you know what I mean? Metal Powder upgrade, Rage Candy Bar, we'll hold on to Leaf Stone, Miracle Seed. Okay, for now, we're just gonna drop those off. The Brick Piece can never leave. It can't leave. It is what has gotten us this far in the game. Like, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Um, but I do want to sell this Max Revive. Hold on to this, bro. Just for a little bit. I might be back for it. What you selling? I mean, what you, yeah, yeah, yeah what you selling? Pokeballs and potions, bro? Just podiums? That's all you got? I mean, I know that this is like a, like a local, support local buy local businesses type shit, but you only got potions, bro? Do you see my Pokemon? Do you see this HP? We are not sustaining this amount of HP off of just Podeons. But you know, it's interesting. <laughs> the experiment worked like a charm. Magikarp are just worthless, but Gyarados are big money makers. Well, fuck you, dude. Um, I, you know, there was a comment on Oh, wait a minute. Can we headbutt this tree? We can get a Mahogany Town encounter. There was a comment. I went to look on the last episode to see if it was there. Because uh, I could swear that's where I saw it. But maybe it's on the episode before that. I don't know. But I couldn't find it again. But um, somebody was mentioning how um, Game Freak kind of lets you just take whatever path you wanted to once you got to Ecrity. That's why the trainers on the east side of Ecrutique going to Mahogany Town, technically you can access that um, once you get Surf. So they have to be at a level that's appropriate for you to battle against at your fourth gym badge. But you could also choose to go west and do all that shit, which in my opinion I think is normal. Um, 
I'm pretty sure when I was a kid, I remember coming to Mahogany, Mahogany Town first and being like, well, there's nothing I can do here. I can't get into the gym, so what the fuck do I do? You just go back the other way. But, I mean, you had the guards guarding Sabrina's gym or guarding Saffron City in the first game. Why couldn't you have just done the same thing here? You had the fucking slowpoke tail salesman guarding the path to Union Cave. Why couldn't you just do that here? Like, what? Like, it just doesn't make any sense. Um, but long story short, you could, if you went and did that, it would make the game a different pacing, you know what I mean? So that's why Jasmine's ace is 46, but we're getting ready to fight a bunch of level 20s. Because <laughs> technically, you could have come here before the fourth badge. So it's weird, it's wonky, but we're going to head with this street. Fuck! All that tension for nothing. Nope, nothing. Is it forever? Nope, nothing. Well, then I wonder if the battle tower will have anything. How come Pokemon don't live in Mahogany Town? Oh, this motherfucker right here! This little jackass right here won't let me go over here. Hi, you kid. I see you're new in Mahogany Town. Since you're new, you should try a Yummy Rage candy bar. Right now, it could just be yours for $300. No, I'm good, bro. I already bought one from you. you. Ass. But, like, why couldn't they do that? Why make it so that you can come all the way over here initially? This jackass. Only people headed up to Lake of Rage have been through here lately. What does that mean, bro? But, anyways, yes. We didn't get our encounter up here. Did we? We came up here and whoa, 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 I don't know what kind of critical hit you just got, bro, but I'm gonna need you to slow, oh, wow, <laughs> I'm gonna need you to slow your roll, but no, we did not get our encounter up here, I do not believe, so do we get our trainer tips? All Pokemon have pros and cons depending on their types. I'm looking for the Lake of Rage sign. I want to go in here just to fuck with Team Rocket. <laughs> Hold it there, kiddo. The toll is $1,000 to go through. Thank you very much. Oh, I thought they asked to battle you. We're making a bundle. Everyone wants to see what's going on at the Lake of Rage. Do they do it again? If I go back out? Oh, they can program this in the game, but they can't keep us from going to Mahogany Town. <laughs> I don't even want to go through the building, bro. I was more so looking for a battle. But, oh, this is Route 43. Okay, so it's not a Lake of Rage encounter. It's a Route 43 encounter. All right. Survey says... Magmar, the Spitfire Pokemon. It moves more frequently in hot areas. It can heal itself by dipping its wounds into lava. Give a nickname to Magmar. So I know a lot of you guys are probably going to want me to name it Tit Duck, but I have something to tell you. I think the first time I named it Tit Duck, I think it was because I could never come up with a name for it, and I've never really liked the name Tit Duck. Like, I like it, but, you know, I don't love it. You know, like Drax for Titar? That's an incredible name. I love it. But Tit Duck for Magmar, I've never been a huge fan of. Um, for a while there, I had Jeffrey as my Magmar's nickname. Only because, I don't know, for some reason it reminded me of Jeffrey the Giraffe, but I know Jeffrey the Giraffe is spelled with a G. 
I know this sounds like I'm rambling, but anyways. But now I kind of don't want to name it Jeffrey because of Dahmer on Netflix. Um, just because it's popular right now. Um, so, I think my Pokemon Go account is Blaine's Magmar. Which, of course, is after Blaine, the Cinnabar Island gym leader. So I think I'm just going to try something new. And I think we're going to name him Blaine. I can't believe it. I can't believe we got a fucking Magmar. I can't believe we got a fucking Magmar. <sighs> Yo, Sauron, you might be out the door. You might be out the door. You might be out the door. Hey, Sauron, I'm telling you right now, bro. Count your fucking days, dog. The moment you slip up, the moment something happens, just know. Just know, dog. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. I'm feeling devious. I think now is a good time for our nightly pocket Maya Angelou wisdom. We are still in chapter one, self-empowerment. And tonight's quote is, oh wow, wait, I think. Sauron, you listening to this, bro? You listening to this? Let me pull it up so you can hear. Tonight's quote is, do the best you can until you know better. Then when you know better, do better. Sauron. I'm not trying to make this all about you, bro, but do the best you can, but just know there's better. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling too devious. Even my Angelou can't save me right now. But anyways, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, Sarah. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm hoping that these quotes are touching some people out there, at least making you think. I know some nights I have... Uh, they impact me more than others, but I don't know. Like I said, I'm feeling a little too devious right now. Sauron got me on edge. Actually, Sauron even got me on edge. That Magmar, me more got me on edge. Yes. Fuck that app, bro. Oh shh. Gotta bring it back down. It's late night, Crystal. Shh. It's late night, Crystal. Why are you guys yelling? Stop yelling. Yeah, it's a bitter berry. I'll take the bitter berry. Anyways, it's late night yellow, not whisper yellow. No, I can't do this. It messes with my head. I gotta go the right way. <laughs> oh, we could have had another Ursula. Fight me, bro. How? Tell me again. Tell me once more how the horn drill missed. <sighs> wow. I need a nap. All that adrenaline after that magmar. <laughs> oh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But I am really, really happy that we caught a fucking magmar. We still have our Lake of Rage encounter as well. A Carbos. Who's trying to get speedy? Um, I feel like we should give it to Winston. <laughs> so he can skitter across the battlefield uh, naturally i kind of want to give it to sauron but i think i'm gonna give it to ramla actually i want her to be as fast as possible the lady ramla uh her speed is 130 97 yikes 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 yo look at look at look at judy's horn You're so animated. Okay, wait, 130. I'm looking at speeds. I'm pretty sure she's crushing everybody else. Our team is so slow. Oh my god, our team is so slow. All right, let's get up here to the Lake of Rage. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Once I join Team Rocket, maybe, hopefully, maybe, they'll let me through there. 
Maybe they'll let me through there without charging me. There's another magma. I want to catch him too. Oh, he's fucking whole O's in this grass. Oh my god. Imagine. Imagine if we would have caught a whole O. Imagine if we would have caught a whole O. Oh, that would have been wild if that was our first encounter. Ah, oh, we would have gone from Philly Birdo in the last late night series. Wait, bro, you want to fight? I love Pokemon. We would have gone from Filiberto in the last series to fucking Ho-Oh. Ah, oh, bananas. Bananas. Okay, we're at the Lake of Rage. Uh, are you guys excited? Because I'm excited. Did my eyes deceive me? I saw a red Gyarados in the lake, but I thought Gyarados were usually blue. Fishing Guru's house. Hey, let me talk to you. Hold up. Lake Rage is actually a crater made by rampaging Gyarados. The crater filled up with rainwater and the lake was formed. That's the story passed on from my grandpa's great-great-grandpa. It used to be that you could catch lively magic out there, but don't understand what's happening. Bro, can I get a fishing rod? The Gyarados are angry! It's about Ovin! Look at this dude. Lake of Rage, also known as Gyarados Lake. Gyarados Lake? A Pokemon could be in this tree, one ahead, but no, 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 I don't want my Lake of Rage encounter to be that. But it's a good thing I know that now. A Pokemon could be in this tree. I heard this lake was made by rampaging Gyarados. I wonder if there's any connection to their mass outbreak now. Mass outbreak, there's one. What do you mean? There's an item up there. There's an item right there. Friend ball. No, I don't want to hit but nothing. I don't want to hit but nothing. I wish I had a guide of like... I mean, I guess it's just a guide. <laughs> I was going to say, I wish I had a guide. Oh, fuck. We in the water. We in the water, water. And we ain't got no repels. We in the water, water. We way out in the deep now. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh shit! Fuck. We get all the way around here without an encounter. It's another magma. As much as I would love to catch it, I feel like there's still too many Pokemon in that Pokedex we haven't encountered yet. So, but wait, hold, hold the fuck up, hold the fuck up, hold the fuck up, hold the fuck up. Isn't it down here? Because I didn't find that... Ooh, I'm in a slump. Maybe it's the gear I'm using. Let's battle for a change of pace. Yeah, because you see I went the other way instead of going down here. Damn, that's motherfucking level 13s. Oh my goodness. Wow-wee. Wow-wee. God dang. No, 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 no. I don't want to headbutt that shit. Not at all, not at all, not at all. Oh, so we, now we are in the Lake of Rage. See, I just wanted to see about these items up here. That's all. <laughs> you know they got hidden items every fucking where. I mean, I just click on spaces that look obvious. I know I miss a ton because I know you guys comment from time to time saying like, oh, you missed this here. You missed that there. There's also a hidden item over here. So I don't know. Something like this, I feel like could be a hidden item, but maybe not. <laughs> There's an actual item. Who the fuck is this? Wesley? That's the name of my car. <laughs> well, how do you do? Seeing as how it's Wednesday today, I'm Wesley of Wednesday. Pleased to meet you. Please take a souvenir. I remember these dudes. There was one for every day of the week. They were all supposed to be like a family or some shit. Black Belt beefs up the power of fighting moves. It is 100% a coincidence that we decided to do Lake of Rage on a Wednesday and came up here to visit him. Because, like, each member of the family only appeared, like, they're not there the other days of the week. You know what I mean? So it's not like you could be like, oh, are they? Did they tell you to come back on a certain day? I, I think I remember, like, they're not, like, tomorrow night if we were to come back here, he won't be there. I mean, we could probably very well test that. But that's what I remember. So I think it's like just by chance you happen to run into that dude that day, then you get it. But I mean, if you know where they're gonna be, then it's not that hard. 
Fastball, fastball, fastball. How many fucking different Pokeballs we got now? Friend ball, fastball, park ball. Okay. Enough with the mazes. And whose fucking house is this? Is this the Rage Master's house? The Rage Master. The Lake of Rage Master's house? Knock, knock. You have straight far. Here, I have a... Here. Here, I have meditated. Inside me, a new power has been awakened. Let me share my power with your Pokemon. Take this, child. Whoa, 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 whoa. We got... TM10, which we do not have registered yet. TM10 is... Do you see it? It is psychic. Is it really? Is it really? Is it actually fucking psychic? Okay, do 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 do. Okay, so I know a lot of you guys are thinking, "Oh my God, put that on Xavier." But number one, we don't even know if he can. Oh. I was gonna say we don't even know if he can learn it. Everyone can learn it. Sauron learning Psychic would be great because then what is a fighting type? Um, isn't that his only weakness in this game? Well, no, I mean, with his dark typing. I know he's fire, he's weak to rock, water, ground, whatever. Um, isn't TM10 hidden power? Is that why everyone can learn it? But I mean, that's not bad to have. Giddy goddamn. Um, I would teach it to Xavier, but if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure he's going to learn it by level up. Probably sometime soon. I would tab out and go and look for it, but... I'm pretty confident that he learns Psychic soon. <laughs> pretty confident he'll learn Psychic soon. TM39. Another TM. Stun Spore. We didn't have that one either. Huh, damn. Um, speaking of TMs, um, you guys are reminding me that we need to go back to... I have the Game Corner TMs jotted down and the goldenrod city tms jotted down like sacred fire i like how <laughs> the ones that we didn't know you guys are like you know you can just read the description for it like fuck you're right you're 100 percent right <laughs> we could just do that but anyways we'll, i'm sure we'll make it back there for sacred fire sometime soon um i don't remember what sacred fire's original move is tm 25 uh, was it Fire Blast? Is it Fire Blast? Oh. There's Suicune and Ho-Oh on this route. Hot damn. Um, is it Fire Blast? Or t is TM24 Fire Blast and Team 25 is Flamethrower? That's my shot in the dark, I think. <laughs> what it could be. So, we got our... We didn't get our Lake of Rage encounter, actually. Can we actually... We have old rod, good rod. Let's use the good... Now isn't the time to use that? You can't fish while surfing? You can't fish while surfing in this game? What the fuck? Oh! Okay! I'd rather have the other magmar. <laughs> Oh, can I hit him with a squirt bottle? Like, damn, I'd rather have the other Magmar if I'm gonna be honest with you. Bug catching contest ball, fastball for catching fast Pokemon. Hot damn. Oh, he broke free. Guess he wasn't that fast. Um. I wish we had. Winnie, can you control yourself? If I click lick, will you control yourself? Excellent. I learned lit. Good luck with that. Well, can't be entirely mad at it. I feel like Sudowoodo, if there's any generation that he has, we're going to catch him in a friend ball. Because he just looks so friendly, doesn't he? I feel like there's any generation where you could actually successfully utilize him, it'd probably be this one. 
You know, the generation he was introduced in. Is he low kicking me? Bro, I really don't want to use Great Ball on you. Thank you. Appreciate that, dog. Alright, let's jot him down. So we know if we have dupes or not. Wouldn't it be some shit if I had a suit? <laughs> Let me jot this down so I know if there's dupes or not. He's the imitation Pokemon. If a tree branch shakes when there's no wind, it's a Sudowoodo, not a tree. It hides from the rain. Oh. Alright. Well, I like a Sudowoodo gets his own fucking party sprite. <laughs> Oh, I was gonna say, that looks inappropriate. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it now. I think I'm gonna name him. First thing that popped into mind, Windex. <laughs> All right, so we got Windex the Sudowoodo from the Lake of Rage. And now it's time for us to soothe the savage beast. Look at him. Look at this. This is a kaiju fight. Lapras versus Gyarados. Yasha! Yes, ah. Oh, I love it. I love it. The red Gyarados. <laughs> oh, because it's red Gyarados. It doesn't matter what it was going to be randomized to, it will be shiny. But, I'm not mad at Shady Tentacool. But could you imagine? Like, what if it was like a shiny magma or shiny whatever shiny anything i mean anything more than a tentacle but uh, don't get me wrong i'm not mad at a tentacle you know what's fucking wild is earlier today i recorded a couple episodes of renegade platinum and i was talking about tentacruel and it dawned on me like tentacruel is a fucking monster especially in game like i really want to use a tentacruel in a nuzlocke like i said arcanine was on the asterisk like on the list of mods I want to use sometime soon. Tentacruel is one as well. Not that I've never used one before, but I mean, just think about it. Surf, Ice Beam, Sludge Bomb, Giga Drain. <laughs> What's stopping it? Other than an earthquake. What's stopping it? Like, what the fuck? Um, well, we got ourselves a shiny Tentacruel lure ba ball. Whoa, I can't do anything with you. Um, do you think I can click Surf on it with Winston? I think I'm gonna swap to you and click Confuse Ray. Let's let the little shiny bastard hit itself. Go ahead, you do your thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this again. Hurt yourself with confusion again, buddy. Let's go one more time. Tentacruel's confused no more. Just one more time. Hurt yourself with confusion. Okay, chill, 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 chill. Hop in this great ball, bro. Hop in the gray ball. Wow, that's so cool. We got a shiny tentacle. Winston will not allow this on the party. <laughs> Uh, as it floats along on the waves, it uses its toxic feelers to stab anything it touches. Oh, what do we name this shiny tentacle? Tentacle has its own party sprite too, and that looks equally inappropriate. Um, I think I'm gonna name our shiny tentacle. Hmm. Fuck. I had a name and then I thought, well, no, wait, it can be better. And then it didn't get better. And then I lost the name. So I'm just going to go with this. This just popped into my head. <laughs> and I think it fits. So we have Julian. Our oh shit, we got the red scale. Put the red scale in the key pocket. Rachel, Nappy, it's Rachel. Got time to chat? No, bitch, I just saved the world. Would you be my practice partner again sometime? I'll be waiting on Route 34. 
Could you take it a little easier on me next time? Bye, let's chat again. Route 34. This bitch at Route 34. Hey, bro, hold up. I'll be back, bro. Hold up. No, wait. Hold up, bro. It doesn't show me. <laughs> hold up. Just one more. Just one more second. Where the... Oh, it's not on here. Hold up, bro. Hold up. Route 34. Where that? Where is she at? Route 32. Route 33. Route 34. Okay. Here we go. Hold up, Lance. I know you... Shit's going down and shit's super duper important and whatnot, but... Fucking Rachel. I'm gonna let Judy get this. This vile plume? This the vile plume you talking about? Now, don't get me wrong, I'm well aware I cannot utilize this. Never mind. I was gonna make a point about catching this vile plume to rub it in an NPC's face, and then I realized, what the fuck, I'm wasting my own fucking Pokeballs. And this chick don't even care. I've been waiting. I've gotten a bit better at this. Then why'd you ask me to go easy on you? Stomp. Fissure. 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 Judy, what are you doing? Judy, what are you doing? Judy? Did she pay you off? Thank you. God damn, Judy. What is that? What is that, Judy? Judy just ruined a perfect moment. That would have been a perfect moment to just pull up on her and stomp her out. But. Why not? Yeah, man. We really needed it. I remember this is another one of them spots that, like, I found, like, I don't know, like, 80 hours into the game or some shit after I beat the Elite Four 18 times. Whoa. Whoa. What the fuck is going on here? Excuse me? Uh, what is this witch's coven I've walked into? Irene? Yeah, someone found us. See, they wouldn't have found us till post game and just shit on them entirely. I was gonna say, we don't have anything for Quagsire around here. Jen? You can't beat Irene and go unpunished. Why not? It's kind of my thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think we're leaving it up to the guillotine. What can a Wobbuffet do when you one hit KO it? And Judy's level 42. So sorry, Irene, sis. Hold up, I'm glad you gave me a moment to breathe. Because it's Winnie's turn to run havoc. Let's go. You sure you were mean to my little sisters? Or you sure were mean to my little sisters? Fuck your little sisters. Preschooler Bob? Wait, she got a little 36. Hold up. Ramda. I didn't see what he used. <laughs> no, I can't believe I lost. So that's it? You're too strong. I didn't stand a chance. Here, you deserve this. I'm sorry we jumped you. We never expected anyone to find us here. You sure startled us. Sunlight makes your body stronger. Hey, amen to that. Isn't this beach great? It's our secret little getaway. I mean, I guess if you call it a beach like that, it is like a secret little getaway, but... Okay. I mean, I have fun. I could just use the item finder, but whatever. Um, anyways... Uh, it was nice talking to you guys. I wish that this was a spot on the map I could fly to. Oh, we can fly right back to the Lake of Rage. Judy, Irene, and Kate's Beach. Why can't we fly right back to that? Hey, bro, see? Told you I'd be back. Quick, fast, and in a hurry. This lake is full of Gyarados, but nothing else. So the Magikarp are being forced to evolve. Did you come here because of the rumors? You're Nappy. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumors, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, Nappy. I can tell that you're a trainer with considerable skill. If you don't mind, could you help me investigate? You're lucky you're one of the best. Sure. Excellent. It seems that the lake's magic cop are being forced to evolve. Yeah, I don't like him with a British accent. That's more Steven. It's more of a Steven voice. This is Lance. A mysterious radio broadcast coming from Mahogany is the cause. I'll be waiting for you, Nappy. 
He's much more like... And did this motherfucker just... Did I run out of Pokeballs? <laughs> <laughs> and Lance just took off? What the fuck? Well... We can say we wanted to complete Lake of Rage. We also broke up. These motherfuckers are still down here charging us? Alright, bro. It's whatever. Um, but we did complete Lake of Rage in its entirety tonight. I'm very, very happy about that. Um, we went and whooped Swimmer Rachel's ass and invaded Irene, Kate, and... I don't know what the last girl's name was. Invaded their private beach, too, so... So, yeah, I guess we're in the process of trying to get our squad up to 42. You know, so we can level them up evenly. So, Winnie is up next. Whoa, 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 whoa! Juggernaut! Hyper Beam! What took you, Navi? Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. Yeah, get him out the way. Look how goofy he looks. The stairs are right here. Navi, we should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Why? We're going to the same place. Hey, bud, what do you have to say? You found the secret stairway. Oh, yeah? Ugh, that guy's dragon Pokemon are tough. Whoa, but you know what? It's nice to see a champion out here putting in work. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, intruder alert. So, um... Fortununk. We are going to stomp all over these dudes. But you know what? Like I said, that just means we're going to have a nice, chill, late night episode. Surveillance cams are in the statues. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Nice, chill, late night episode. It's kind of like we're doing grinding and progressing in the game at the same time. <laughs> I mean, I'll just click strength and wipe each and every one of these dudes out each time. Why not? But... More importantly, I really want to know what items. There's no items down here? Nothing? I want to know what items are in here. I need to see what this TM is. It's calling me more than anything else. And look at this. I told you. It's like grinding. It's like they just want to come up and just get smacked. Oh, but well, we need to go heal. Do they reset if you come back out? Because we're all out of strength. <laughs> I don't think that's a good thing. <laughs> <sighs> well, I think we should pop that in the PC for now. Just for now. Um, only because we have an issue with item space in the bag. And we have a charcoal. And that's not something that we can give to Xavier either. So, like, what the frick? Why do you want to fight, bro? This was once a ninja hideout. There are traps to confound intruders like you. What trap? Oh, he means the little checkerboard shit. I don't know who they confusing, but they ain't confusing me. So let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. In last night's episode of Late Night Crystal. You may have remembered that on our way to the Lake of Rage, our encounter, first encounter on that route, was a Magmar. A level 15 Magmar, to be specific. And a lot of people were like, oh my god, Nappy, I can't believe you masterballed a Magmar. Just say that sentence out loud. <laughs> Do you really think I wouldn't masterball a Magmar? <laughs> It's late night crystal, okay? Could I have caught that with a great ball? Maybe. But it's late night crystal. Wow. Maybe I want to say I master balled a magmar. You know? I think it's better than saying I master balled a muck. <laughs> I mean, at least I like magmar, goddamn. Well, okay, wait, no, I can't say that either, because then everybody will assume that I don't like Muck, and that is not the case at all. I do like Muck. Muck is actually really dope. He's really cool. He's really great. Um, it's just... Magmar is like top five. Whoa. 
Is it time to bring back top five? <laughs> Has the top five changed? No, wait, stop. Don't get any ideas. Don't get any ideas. The top five series that we started a while back will, will return one day. I will tell you that much. A soft sand. You know, did we already have a soft sand? We did. But we need to wait for whenever the hell Judy's going to decide to learn Earthquake. She's just been sitting here with her horn up her ass. Wait, I want to see this. No, 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 stop, Winnie, stop. Look at that horn. <sighs> yeah. Judy knows what's up. But, I mean, the whole puzzle thing doesn't matter because you can just go down this way and dodge the whole thing, right? Right? It doesn't really matter? Please don't poison me again. I would really appreciate it if you would stop doing that. Because uh, we only have so many antidotes, bro. And I know that you're superiors. But I really want to fight that guy in the front, though. Yeah, this motherfucker right here, bro. Go cool. Take another step. Take another step. I dare you. Dang. Dang. Look at Xavier. <laughs> Xavier's fucking oh. Okay. Hey, like I told you, we are grinding and making progress at the same time. What can I say? But wait, I'm going to put Faith. No doesn't like Lance heal you or something like that wait a minute wait a minute can't you get an encounter here in this little maze thing so this counts as the team rocket hideout and then we get the electrode encounter as well down here because that's a static encounter we get one of them right I just remember at the last second oh yeah that sounds like an onyx did we just get an onyx How you doing, big boy? Kingler, Rhydon, McCargo, Mankey, Chameleon, Wooper, Bellsprout, some floor, Crobat, Golbat, Houndoom, Elegate, Karkanaw, Teddy Ursa. We do have seven the Onyx already. So this is dupes. How the fuck can I not escape from an Onyx? Oh, there's a Pokeball next to the Onyx's name. Oh, whoops. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Get him out of here. And Ekans though? Did, 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 we, did we have we? Kingler, Ryder, Bacargo, Mankey, Tremillion, Wooper, Bellsprouts. <laughs> Is this guy gonna do this every time? Um, Cyndaquil, Snorlax, Drowsy, Diglett, Magmar, Scootaloo. Okay, no, we do not have an Ekans yet. So, we are going to attempt to capturize this Ekans. How? How are you confused for one turn and then confused no more? Um. See, to, see, to me, this is an Ekans. Like, I feel like I should be able. Oh, I can't swap him out. Ramla can't be recalled. I feel like any attack I use is gonna be too strong. I need the Ekans to hurt itself. Hey, yo, and can you chill? out with this whatever you're doing over here to Ramla chill with this Ramla is confused I mean not Ramla Ekans is confused no more excellent excellent work so we snagged ourselves an Ekans we can add Ekans to our uh, late night crystal pokey <laughs> Well, hello there, hidey ho there. It flutters the tip of its tongue to seek out the scent of prey, then swallows the prey whole. Wow. Um, very descriptive for what a snake actually does. I mean, I get it snake backwards, but still. Should I just call this thing snake? <laughs> Instead of Ekin? Do I just call it... Name instead of Ekans. Ekans is his name. Ekans is his nickname. I'm not gonna call it Snake. Uh, oh, it's a lady snake. I mean, it's 2023. 
I'll make her name whatever she wants. I really want to call it Doug, but <laughs> it's a lady, I can Um, what is the equivalent to Doug? Ursula? <laughs> Uh, okay. I don't know where this name came from either, but we're gonna go with Ophelia. I don't know where these names come from. You know, I used to never, I know I've said this before in past uh, Let's Plays on the channel, I used to never, ever, oh, I would have gotten a fucking job. I used to never nickname my Pokemon when I was growing up playing, playing this game, playing any Pokemon game. I would never nickname them. And then the whole Nuzlocke thing, like playing them on YouTube, people are like, yeah, 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 it's a Nuzlocke rule. You have to nickname your Pokemon. So honestly, that's why for the longest time when people would respond positively to like nicknames like Drax and things like that, I just went with it. Cause I was like, okay, that's another Pokemon I ain't gotta come up with a name for at all. We good to go. But I don't know, I kinda like just pulling random ass names like I feel like I really like these names because I feel like nobody on planet earth has ever had Ophelia the Ekans <laughs> are you alright your Pokemon are hurt or tired here give them some of my medi medicine Nappy let's give it our best for Pokemon hey you know what you cleansed their team Let's cleanse ourselves real quick. We have our nightly pocket by Angelou Wisdom here. We are nearing the end of chapter one, self-empowerment. I think we only have a few nights left. But tonight's quote is, nothing can dim the light that shines from within. Nothing can dim the light that shines from within. I like this because it reminds me a lot of uh, a quote from a previous episode if you're always trying to be normal you will never know how amazing you can be nothing can dim the light that shines from within hot damn hot damn you know I, I really wanted to add these I think it's just because it's the self empowerment section but I really wanted to add these to the late night because I feel like it fits the vibe you know um, but some nights they're just deeper than others and I'm like chill my chill what the hell <laughs> that's literally in the name of the series chill just chill but I've seen you guys saying that you enjoy the quotes and whatnot so if you guys are enjoying them and I'm enjoying them then we won't keep doing them I'm coming for you look at you up there chill out there boy Whoa, 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 the door won't open. Ugh. They always be doing this. Always be doing this. You know, I miss Veronica. I miss Veronica because I really miss the option of playing with a Mr. Mime. I feel like I've done that like once in the past before. I don't know. I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. It takes two passwords to get into the boss's quarters. Those passwords are known only to a few rockets. That rocket there very graciously told me so. Nappy, let's get let's go get the passwords. Ugh, the guy in the cave is incredibly tough. Hell yeah, bro. It's a motherfucking OG. L A N C E. Don't you ever forget about it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Somebody at Game Freak had to have known this looks like a rubber chicken. Like, I don't, I'm not even trying to be mean or anything like that, but I mean, literally, it looks like a rubber chicken. What the fuck, Moltres? <sighs> Top five worst sprites? That's probably like number eight. Maybe an honorable mention. I'm sure there's a lot of goofier ones out there, like Venusaur. Venusaur's back sprite from Gen 1. Oh, what were they thinking? What were they thinking? That guy probably got a raise too. Sentry, get him out of here. Bro. What the fuck? How do you have a Moltra just chilling here, dog? Do I know the password? Maybe. But no weakling's going to get it. 
So you're saying if I whoop your ass, you will give me the password. Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. I know you're gonna pull this dude out. Oh, we can't go to the sun. I know you're gonna pull this dude out and click Stone Edge on me. And I'm not trying to have that happen. Look at all these delicious items. They're just sitting around waiting for me to pick them up. Ooh, we another heart ball. Okay, wait, there's a staircase here, and that distracts me. Heal powder. Elaborate. Use more words. Cures all status problems. Bitter. Ew. Ew. I don't want that. I don't want Pokemon to like me. I don't care that Pokemon are hurt by our experiment. Yes, but do you know the password? That's what I want to know. Do you know? Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have to watch Shrek again now. I have to watch Shrek again sometime soon. I want you guys to know we have a new series coming to the channel soon. Um, if you have not been... Damn, both heavy balls? I didn't think I'd find a pair of heavy balls in tonight's episode. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, but yeah, if you hadn't been paying attention to Renegade Platinum, we are nearing the end. So that means that it's time for a new series to arise and take its place. Uh, I mean, I'm not going to tell you what it is. I'm just saying I've been working on it a bit for the past couple days. And, you know, it's really weird. Every time I've ever gone to start a project, it's like it doesn't matter how much preparation I have. It doesn't matter how long I've been working on it or this or that or whatever. Like, the day before is always hectic. <laughs> it is always like I have forgotten one thing or another. There is some aspect of it that... I didn't think about until now um well I shouldn't say every single time there have been times in the past where I was very very prepared for LPs we do not have TM 34 registered yet TM 34 is survey says kinesis oh wow excellent Ex excellent. I mean, right? Excellent, right? Kinesis. I mean, we love Sand Attack, so why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? So what you're telling me is these electrodes are shocking the... No, the electrode are powering the radio signal that is messing with the Magikarp in the Lake of Rage. Why is Silver here? What the fuck? Didn't I tell you that I was going to destroy Team Rocket? Tell me, who was the guy in the cape who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. It's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. I don't have time for the likes of you. He just pushed us. Like, that wasn't like the classic, like, where they push you to the side so they can walk past you. No, he haul, whole ass hauled up and pushed us. What the fuck? Oh, I'm glad they took him out the game. That's too violent. <laughs> Hold on. Did I just see what I think I saw? A twisted spoon? At a time like this, when we need an item for one of our Pokemon, hell yes. Give this Twisted Spoon to Xavier. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Now everyone has an item. What was it? Was it six rings for the Elven Lords? Or six rings for the Dwarven Lords? <laughs> well, everyone got their rings now. <laughs> But we still don't know the password. It needs two passwords to open. Oh. 
Who's got the password? I got wiped out in the last mission by a kid too when we were abducted. I'm pulling on this kid with long red hair and mean looking eyes just crammed me. <laughs> Phrasing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. God damn. So, where was I? Yes, I've been working tires, tirelessly, diligently, day and night, trying to get this new series up and off the ground ready to go. But it will be up very soon. I promise you that much. Yuck, yuck, yuck. The password to the boss's room, uh, I think it's Radicate Tail. I knew one of these gangsters around here had it. So do we need to get both? Or can we just pull up on the thing now? Where's Lance at? And these two passwords to open. Uh, Lance? Okay, so I know I spoke to him. I know I spoke to everybody in this here room. Ain't nobody passed him? No. That's the boss's room up there. That dude ain't talking to nobody. What about you, bro? Radio signal drives Pokemon mad. Nothing but success. I whooped your ass, right? Password to the boss's room is Slowpoke Tail, but it's useless unless you have two passwords. Hey, well, there it is. You know, now that I think back, she did say she would not give it to losers, and I didn't even think to ask her afterwards when we therefore proved to her that we were not a loser. Anyways, like not. <laughs> the door opened. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I got spooked just now when Silver pulled up, thinking I was unprepared. Hey, hello. What? Who are you? This is the office of our leader, Giovanni. Since disbanding Team Rocket three years ago, he has been in training. But we're certain he will be back someday to assume command again. That's why we're standing guard. I won't let anyone disturb this place. Okay, bro. Come on, give me your best shot. You're supposed to be the best motherfucker up in here. Look at this dude, Sailor Robin. Bro. Oh. Give me massive late night yellow vibes. Episode one, late night yellow. But bro, how you know I was gonna have a flying type? Who tipped you off? Who tipped you off? Winston, come on back, my boy. Get rid of this geo dude. Get rid of this geo dude. I really, really wish that we could have gotten um, the whole squad up to 42 tonight. I think maybe we'll get Ladian. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna go out to Romla. Yeah, I was gonna say maybe we'll get Lady Romla leveled up. Hell yeah. Mean look? Uh, no, I don't think so. <laughs> no, I, ju I, just, I just don't think so. I just don't think so. A fortress? Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Oh my goodness, how perfect. Bide? I'm not playing that. I'm not playing that. I've seen this before. I've been here before. This is one of those lessons that you only have to learn one time. <laughs> and never again. I don't care if I would have okoed this fortress with this ember. I don't care. I was not taking any chances. Because you know, <laughs> if that would have happened, I would have gotten the absolute lowest of low rolls. I would have got whatever the reverse of a crit is. It would have done half as much damage. <laughs> and that thing would have clicked by it and wiped out any one member on our squad. Knowing my luck? Absolutely. No, I can't let this affect me. I have to inform the others. Hey, bro, chill. Where are you going, dude? The password is Hail Giovanni. Alright, Mr. Murkrow. Doesn't that guy normally have a Murkrow? Isn't like, uh, isn't this TM that's right here in Sacred Gold? Dark Pulse? Or something like that? Is that what it is in Heart Gold too? Isn't that weird? You just remember weird little tidbits <laughs> here and there? 
shit that you haven't thought about in forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and then you just in your head one day bingo bango there it is Let's see wait oh it's for this door the door's closed the door opened hold it right there oh I thought that was Lance <laughs> We can't have a brat like you on the loose. It's harmful to Team Rocket's pride, you see. However strong you may be, you can't take both of us at the same time. <laughs> Come on. Sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. Dang. Dragon Knight coming through. Hey, don't be so selfish. Spread the fun around. What? You had an accomplice? Where is your sense of honor? As the interim boss in place of Giovanni, I'll show you how wrong it is to meddle with Team Rocket. Ooh. Hey, the other guy is the lucky one. Cause this girl, she about to get waxed. Sailor Fortress? Dang, we didn't swap Ramla out. Fuck. We need to get sold on some training as well, but... Winston, you the only one. You the only one that can save us now. Winston the motherfucking pirate. I just love it. Okay, perfect for Sauron. Okay, remind me to put him first next. He only needs a level and a half. That's it. Do we have a rare candy? <laughs> Get rid of the Eevee. Ugh, you are really strong. If you were to join Team Rocket, you could become an executive. Hey, where do I sign up? Sign me up. But you know what? I guess the only... I guess positive to forgetting Rama's there. She has the Amulet coin. But you notice how much money I didn't get paid for these battles in tonight's episode? What the fuck? This hideout is done for, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. That did it. We defeated all the Rockets here. But I'm concerned about the young guy I battled in the process. Sorry, Nappy. I saw how well you were doing, so I just hung back. Now all there is left to do is to turn off that odd radio signal. Is this the machine that's causing all the problems? I don't see a switch on it. We have no choice. We have to make all the electrode faint. That should stop this machine from transmitting that strange signal. It's no fault of the Pokemon, so it makes me feel guilty. And Nappy, let's split the job. And this is where I say, Lance, wait. He says, yes. You remember how you said there were no more rockets? Yes. And that's when, out of nowhere, Winston scuttles across the floor, claw raises out of the air, and it's like, you know, like the anime angle where it's like, you're right there, like Winston's point of view, like streaking across the room straight towards Lance's face, but it's Lance, so he doesn't, he doesn't falter, he doesn't wince or flinch or anything, he just stands resilient, watching as... Winston the pirate scuttles across the floor and in the last possible moment out of nowhere Dragonite Whatever his fucking cry is like dragon tails Winston's claw To the side and now the battle begins Me on one side remember uh, The brand extension the battle royale they had in like 2008 or whatever it was and it was big show and Randy Orton left and they thought Raw won, and Big Show pulled his shirt off, and it was ECW. That was me, boy, Team Rocket. That's what I pull off my jacket, and it's red with a uh, red R, black with a red R. No, let's be real. It'd be white with a red R. You know what I mean? Have to find out what happens next time. <laughs> Wouldn't that be one hell of a fucking, like, series, though? If you had a... Uh... I should write something like that one day. <laughs> like an event like this in Pokemon that is written with a different outcome. Like what if 
the player did join Team Rocket in that moment and betrayed Lance. And then Lance, let's say, I, I don't want to say Lance dies in this scenario or whatever, but let's say like the player, because you know, we're like the chosen one, you know, like Lance sees the potential in us and shit, right? So like, what if we were just so good that we end up whooping him and his Dragonite's ass? But you know what I mean? Then you could say, well, wait a minute, he's the champion at this point and we are not at on par with the champion, but we're the chosen one, okay? Come on. Come on, come on. This thing called plot armor. Have you ever seen Avatar? Like, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. So, anyways, we whoop his ass real good and escape. Or we could whoop his ass real, real good, and the radio signal could continue to go out. Leave this side to me. I was checking for items, bro. So, should we do one, two, or three? We can only keep one of them. But each one's going to be different though, right? I think I'm gonna go with the middle one. Which one was one, which one was two, and which one was three? We get all these crazy ass water types. But we are we will remain loyal to Winston the Pirate. We will. Oh my god. A Kingdra? A Magmar? I'm just saying, listen to this. Kingdra? I mean, I know, I know I'm counting my chickens before they've hatched. We haven't caught the Kingdra yet. But Kingdra? Magmar? Crobat? Houndoom? Ivysaur? <laughs> uh, we have... Oh, never mind, we don't... Uh, what did I say? We could have the slap right on on there too, and Dragonair. Oh my God! What a team! What a fucking team! And that's all in our PC. <laughs> well, not the Crobat. Romla is here. Um, but we can't, we can't betray Winston. But even then, that's just six Pokemon that I randomly pulled. We still have a Charmeleon. We have a fucking uh, Elekid. We have a Croconaw. An Onyx. Didn't we find a Metal Coat? Did we get one? A uh, Cyndaquil. A Snorlax. A Diglett. Yo, we have so much power in the PC. Yo, I'm writing this down right now because I know that we're catching this hope. Um, I'm gonna confuse Ray. Ah. I wish that we still had somebody that could do something, but we don't. I'm just afraid that a lick from Winnie is gonna be too much. You think it'll be too much? I mean, poison gas with Xavier, but I'm just spooked, I'm spooked, I'm spooked. I don't wanna ruin the encounter. And I feel like as long as you're playing it safe, you can't ruin the encounter, you know what I mean? Okay. How heavy is Kingdra? <laughs> hooked by a rod? Does this count? I mean, technically it's hooked up to something. It's powering a radio broadcast. Fuck. Oh my god, this is why I wanted to... Oh no. Confused no more. Okay. Wow, that kind of sucks though. We definitely need to get some more Pokeballs after this. I know we got money. Like I told you, I've been watching all the money we've been getting over the episode tonight. Just in case I'm forgetting, I can poison it with poison. Oh, we have hypnosis. Holy fuck, 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 shit, fuck. How do you forget? I don't want to play anymore. I don't want to play anymore. And I realized just now, I said Kingdra at the start of that team and ended it with Dragon Hands, two Dragon. But it doesn't matter, we're not getting the Kingdra anyways, thanks to my obsession with the speed up button. I just sped up too fast and clicked Confusion instead of going to Hypnosis, so 
Wow, what a mulligan. Forgetting that I had hypnosis to begin with and then accidentally clicking confusion and bodying one of the best encounters. We're just not meant to have a Kingdra. Renegade Platinum, we had a chance to get a horse, he couldn't catch it. And now we have the chance to get to it. just, I just, I just want to use a Kingdra. I mean, I can't blame anybody but me. That was my fault. Oh, this was a fucking Tyranitar! We have a Kingdra, a Tyranitar? What the fuck is going on? And what's this last one? Is that Chansey? Oh, a Clefable. I wouldn't have minded that. Stupid, stupid nappy. Happy. That odd signal has finally stopped. The lake should be back to normal. You're the hero. Let me thank you on behalf of all the Pokemon. Oh yes, you should take this. I found it here, but I don't have any need for it. HMO6. That's Whirlpool. Teach it to a Pokemon to get across wild water. But keep this in mind. You can use that out of battle only with the badge from Mahogany Gym. Nappy, the journey to becoming the Pokemon Master is long and difficult. Knowing that, will you keep going? I see. No, you're right. If you would give up that easily, you would have never chased that dream in the first place. I look forward to seeing you again. I'm chucking my deuces up. Yeah. Well, god damn. Could have had a fucking Kendra. Fuck that up for sure. Well, I guess we need to get the badge from Mahogany next. And then once we do that, we can visit the World Islands actually and maybe quite possibly go fuck up another encounter. <laughs> I jotted down the charges that we have for tonight. And up first, since we are here now, we are taking on this next gym. Tonight we are definitely 100% snagging a new gym badge. I don't care if it kills us. I don't care if it ends our lock here tonight. We're beating this gym. Damn it. Um, we also have a new Suicune encounter that a lot of you guys have been mentioning. We need to go back and activate. Um, and a few of you guys are mentioning that we need to trade in that red scale for the experience share, which I'm not going to lie would be helpful, especially if we're trying to train like two levels at a time. I mean, I don't know how long it's going to last, but... I'm sure we'll find out after this next gym. Um, and last but not least, I'd like to give a special shout out to my boy, Jamon Vasquez. I hope that's how you pronounce your name. If, if it's Jamon, then, or J Jamon, I, I don't know, but Jamon. <laughs> he said, you still need to get the silver wing to get Lugia and beat the eighth gym. Also nappy, I've said many times, to go get the free Lapras. It's only available on Fridays, which is today. So hopefully you go and do that. <laughs> have no fear, my boy. <laughs> I have seen your many comments and you are right. It is Friday. So we are gonna go and get that Lapras tonight. Okay, don't you stress. Don't you worry. We are gonna go get that Lapras tonight. <laughs> it's like, hey, bruh, take your black ass. I know you see me commenting. Take your black ass on over there and get that goddamn Lapras. <sighs> you gave me a chuckle. You gave me a giggle. Um, I think I said last night we were gonna do this gym with just the potions that we have. So almighty brick piece, guide us, guide us through this gym price is a veteran trainer who has pokemon who's trained pokemon for some 50 years he's said to be good at freezing opponents with ice type moves that means you should melt him with your burning ambition see i like how he tells us and he doesn't tell us but i also like how we have our fire type out ready to go we so we're dipping our Say so we're dipping our piggies into this water here, but I don't think it's working out 
for Sauron to well. Get that Mantine out of here. That Mantine is huge. Why is Mantine so big? For such a meh Pokemon in this generation. What the hell? Whoa, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is not a very fire type friendly gym. The man at the front door fibbed to me. Get this out of here, bro. Actually, I'm going to let Sauron eat this up. Uh, he double kicked. How did you know? How did you know? Um, so, in typical fashion, I'm just going to try and fight all the trainers first. <laughs> and then figure out the puzzle. You know, that, that, that really hasn't changed, that MO. Oh, get this Ariados out of here. Oh! My boy Sauron. He heard my cries in last night's episode. You remember last night I told him, I said, bro, you need to step it up. Well, I wasn't last night, it was the night before. When we Master Ball that Magmar. Hey, you guys remember? Do you remember? Do you remember when we Master Ball that Magmar? Um, <laughs> um, he heard our cries. And now he's ready to step it up. Um, technically, I feel like I should keep Ember. But I'm going to get rid of it for a flamethrower. Why the fuck not? So now all we need is Crunch. And then I think he will have reached his potential. And then I think he's free for... TM experimentation after that. Can I fight you, bro? I know price is secret. What the fuck? Manager? The manager? Ooh. Okay, hold on. I want to put this down here. But you see, I always favor bite because of the chance to flinch. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like that's so much doper. I like the way this looks better. It's like the letter E. Get rid of the seconds. Get rid of this Crobat. Whoa, how are you going to burn me? I mean, how are you going to be burned and then get a crit? Get this lady in out of here. Be gone. Okay, I'll tell you Price's secret. What is it? Dummy, dummy, dummy. The secret behind Price is power. He meditates under a waterfall daily to strengthen his mind and body. That's a gimmick. Chuck already did that. You think I believe that he does that too? Are you fibbing to me? We whooped everyone's ass in there, right? Right? We did that, right? We did that? We did that? We did the damn thing in there just now? Okay. I like how it's... It doesn't matter. His gym doesn't change at all. <laughs> Whether you leave or not. It's like, one person figures out the floor tile combination. That's all you need. He's gonna tell everyone. Uh, okay, so let's work this backwards. So the tile in front of Price. Let's say we go to the guy in the blue. So how do we get... Oh, is that it? Okay, well, before we get all angsty and into this battle, let us have our nightly Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom. We are still in Chapter 1, Self-Empowerment, and tonight's quote is... Hold on. My wish for you <clears throat> is that you continue. Continue to be who and how you are to astonish a mean world with your acts of kindness continue to allow humor to lighten the burden of your tender heart my wish for you is that you continue continue to be who and how you are to astonish a mean world with your acts of kindness continue to allow humor to lighten the burden bur <laughs> burden of your tender heart. The birder. It's like if you said butter with an accent. I think that's so deep. I think that's so important. Like all of these tie into each other back to back to back to back. No matter what, be you. Be who you are. Let your light shine. Because you never know who you might touch. Even if they don't praise the same God that you do. Even if they don't speak the same language that you do. Soldier on. Well, we about to soldier on to our 8th badge. 8th badge? God damn it! To our 7th badge. But even that's still kind of crazy. We had our 7th badge already? What the fuck? But, I'm going to save my game. Because only you can prevent lost save data. 
Pokemon have many experiences in their lives, just like we do. I, too, have seen and suffered much in my life. Since I am your elder, let me show you what I mean. I have been with Pokemon since before you were born. I do not lose easily. I, Price, the Winter Trainer, shall demonstrate my power. The Winter Trainer? You think that intimidates me, bro? You look like you play chess in the park. Which, I'd be down. I really like chess. Let's play. Ranger Thomas sent out Magneton. Yo, put a pin in chess. Put a pin in chess. Don't let me forget about chess. But isn't Magneton a steely wheelie type in this generation? I believe he is. So Price is a level 35 to begin. But what does he end with? <laughs> and execute. Oh, so we just you just gonna hand me I love how all of them spin. <laughs> a level 38. Hmm. But I mean I guess he's just gonna hand us the badge tonight. Since that's all he wanna go with. Help me get to 42. Ranger Thomas sent out. <gasps> if I want to hit 42. <gasps> At least he fought. At least he got a lick in. At least he fought. Oh, Hyper Potion, yes. Revive him. Don't let him die. Don't let him die. That is my boy. Don't let that big boy die. Look at his grin. Oh, no. God damn it. Sauron, didn't I tell you to stop fucking up? Gonna have to end up replacing you with that Magmar soon enough. You keep fucking up like this. <sighs> Well, we had to sacrifice a Gengar to get Sauron to 42. Ah, I am impressed by your prowess. With your strong will, I know you will overcome all life's obstacles. You are worthy of this badge. I wish we would have sent out Lady Romla. She's got the amulet coin, right? That badge will raise the special stats of Pokemon. It also lets your Pokemon use Whirlpool to get across real Whirlpools. And this, this is a gift from me. TM16, hold the phone. Survey says we do not know what it is. Ladies and gentlemen, put your guesses in the comment section below. And be honest. Put your honest guess and let us know where you write. I'll give you a moment. I'll give you a moment. Here we go. We put TM16 in the TM pocket. That TM could be hypnosis. Oh, I mean, oh, wait, that was 16, right? It demonstrates the harshness of winter. Winter puts you to sleep. <laughs> so TM16, he said, hypnosis. Okay, well. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, this is honestly like one of my favorite parts of the late night series so far is putting together like the the Pokemon index of TMs for the game. <laughs> the uh, list of TMs as you we find them out. Like I can't wait to find another TM. I can't wait to find out what it's gonna be so I can fill it in and figure them all out. You know, we should make a stop at Goldenrod. I'm gonna jot that down right here. Goldenrod department store Tonight if we can okay, so we got the gym taken care of so we need mr. Pokemon Suicune and Lapras left but check it out We got seven badges we got seven badges we got seven badges and I'm part of get number eight Ugh. Honestly, uh, I think that is true. I think we could probably take on Claire right now with all level 42s as it is. So, 
honestly, to me, from my position, from where I'm sitting, <laughs> that just means we don't have to grind anymore. We're on par. I was going to say, I swear to God, this is Rachel. Nappy, how are things going? I called because something weird is happening with the radio broadcasts. They were talking about Team Rocket. Nappy, do you know anything about it? Maybe Team Rocket has returned. No, that just can't be true. Sorry to bug you. Take care. Oh, are you trying to hint, 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 hint to go that way? Um, well, time out, time out, time out. First of all, let's go in here. Let us go in here. Let us go in here. Let us go in here. Can we actually go this way? So we could just say, fuck the radio tower. Oh, don't look at me, bro. Fuck the radio tower and just continue on? Is that really how you, how you could do that right now? But... We're not even going to get a Route 44 encounter right now. We're not even going to go over there. We're going to leave that for when we get over there. Lady Rama, we need to rely on your resources once more, madame. And we need to head to Mr. Pokemon. So I believe Violet City will get us there the fastest. Because we have the Red Scale. A Red Scale from a Gyarados. Is this the dude? Huh? What's that? You have mail for me? Oh, this is the sleeping guy with the mail from the... But whatever Pokemon we give him, he takes the Pokemon, right? So, is Amistar... I should have done this before. But is Amistar better than something else that we have? Um, I mean... I think we have a Metal Coat, so I don't want to give up Onyx. I mean, we could give up Diglett. I'm not against using a Doug Trio, but we have better ground type options. That makes sense, so I wouldn't be against that. Honestly, I think that's probably the best bet that we have. <laughs> so we could offer up a Diglett just to get the TM reward. I mean, I just talked about how much I fucking want those TMs. Those goddamn TMs. What am I doing? Where are we? Wait, hold on. This is not what I thought it was. There's a teeny in this grass. No, this is what I thought it was. What the fuck? I was about to say, what the fuck? Where? How? Who? What? Where? Mm hmm? That scale. What's that? A red Gyarados. That's rare. I, I want it. Now, would you care to trade it? I can offer this experience here I got from Professor Oak. Okay. Cool. Dope. I mean, honestly, that doesn't really do much for us right now. I mean, um... I don't mean right now, I mean like in an episode, um, because all of our mods have items, but it's not bad when we're grinding, and, knock on wood, it's not bad in case we lose somebody, we have to add somebody mid-episode. Life is delightful, always, new discoveries to be made. Excellent. So now, next on our list of charges tonight, we actually need to head to... Goldenrod. Ooh, wee, we actually do need to hit the Goldenrod. But first and foremost, I think it's time. I think it's time we head to Azalea Town. It is in fact Friday night. It is in fact Friday night, and it's time. Wait, 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 wait. Since we're in Azalea Town. This is still Azalea Town, right? The, the thing didn't change, right? Route 33, Azalea Town. So we can get an encounter in Azalea Town, right? Nope, nothing. A Pidgeot fell out of the tree. I mean, I could believe it. It makes sense. What if it was in it? But just to double check, really quick, like, because, no, I think it was like a second encounter in a route or something like that was a Pidgeot. But you know what? I am not mad at a Pidgeot by any means. Not at all. I need to get some more Pokeballs. That is something that we really need. Oh, you know what? Okay, and this time, we're not fucking it up. <laughs> We're not fucking it up. We're not gonna hold the, whatchamacallit down. There's nothing I can do to attack this thing. Like, come on. Great ball. Whoa, what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know if that showed up for you guys, but that was kind of wild. Um, I'm gonna...
Is it because it's a park ball, not inside the park? <sighs> okay, so what can we do? I could poison gas it. There's nobody that can attack <laughs> to do anything. I mean, but even poison gas is an attack. It does damage. It doesn't just poison them. <sighs> How heavy is Pidgeot? I'm going to exhaust all efforts at the very least. Well, for what it's worth, Azalean Town Encounter is gone. Um, we're not getting anywhere. Oh, we are about to get a new encounter. Let's say fucking Lapras. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So what is the next? Olivine City is the next upgraded city mart that we have um i don't know if goldenrod's mart increases like if they offer ultra balls or whatever right now because we're further in the game because that's supposed to be like the big ass mart right like hada hada so is this oh we don't get premier balls in this game okay fuck you too all right we got that many um I actually know we do need some more hyper potions we need a little bit more of everything it's not this is not the game where we have um, lava cookies <laughs> let's try to remember it for a second this is not the game where we have lava cookies so we need to actually stock up on a couple of these things I'm just gonna buy five of each for right now I know that in our bag we have different amounts Uh, super repels uh, I might get 10 for now I feel like it's not that big of a deal uh, but the heal powder I'm gonna s it's better does it really matter like are we doing anything with it like with our bitterness and whatnot we're not like running return or anything so does it matter yo look at our fucking collection I'm gonna get some more great balls just because just because because we have Podions to heal and all that shit. Okay. We are refocused. Back on task. <laughs> the Azalea Town Pidgeot distracted me for a brief moment. Okay, so there is a Lapras that spawns in this cave. In the lower levels of this cave. On Fridays only. But you need to surf to it. Now, we have already gotten an encounter in Union Cave, but this, oh, hello. This is considered a static encounter because it's just a Lapras that spawns here. You know what I mean? Oh, I'd love to have a Seedra. I'd love to have a Kingdra. Whoa, 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 what's over here? Yeah, push this shit out the way. Dugon. Ruins of Alf. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Hold on, I'm not ready to go back. Because if I hop down that ledge, we can't get back up here. But I know that takes you to a different room. A different puzzle that you can solve. But we came here for this. Look at Sauron with this flamethrower. He's trying to prove himself. He belongs here on the team. Get this Beedrill out of here. We're at the Ruins of Alf again. Bro, who are you? I was gonna say, do we have faith in Sauron? Whoa, hold up, hold up, hold up. Giggity goddamn. Okay, well, first of all, first thing I'm thinking is I hope that I went the right way in Union Cave. What the fuck? Ruins of Alf. Patterns appeared on the walls. Ho oh. A Pokemon that flew gracefully on rainbow colored wings. Is this a puzzle? Oh, don't do this to me now. I don't have the answer pulled up next to me. How am I supposed to know? We came here to get a Labrys. This is how episodes end up being 40 minutes long. 
Um, okay, this looks like it goes up. It doesn't look like it goes there. It looks like it goes up there somewhere. Maybe? Wait, this is... Stop! This is the eyeball. But I don't know where the eyeball goes. Okay, we have another wing. Okay, I think that goes there, but I don't know if that goes there. Okay, that one goes there. But where's Ho's face? Is this a beak? That's a beak. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How come there's no, like, clear bottom pieces? That looks right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, sure. <laughs> I mean, sure, that looks right. Uh, I mean, this definitely is not right by any means. Uh, you have to take it all the way off. Um, okay, wait. I have a feeling that these are swapped. Boom. Okay, yes, 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 we're doing it. Okay, I have a feeling that this does not go here. But I don't know where... Whoa, okay, that looks right. Okay, fuck this. I feel like I had the feet wrong. <laughs> I feel like I had the feet wrong. Another day, another time. We're looking for a Lapras right now. <laughs> what the fuck? And there's nothing else in this cave, so I went the wrong way to begin with. <sighs> How annoying. Wait, did I fight this dude? Did I sneak past him? Oh, Celebi in the cave. Celebi and Cedra and everything else that I cannot have. Okay, fine. Cool, 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 cool. We went the wrong way. We weren't supposed to go this way to begin with. But I did the damn thing with that puzzle. Is it down here? Who's there? Leave me and my Pokemon alone. A vile plume? Hell yeah. I felt like it was somewhere in that area. I feel like I feel like even more this is the correct area, bro. Why do y'all? Why do everybody want to fight? You got nothing but these shitty Pokemon, and this is all you want to do is fuck with me. Chill out. I'm here looking for a lost and lonely Pokemon that's all by itself, crying, wishing it could be held. Burn him! Oh, come on, don't do this to me now. Don't do this to me now. I need all of these things. Like, I absolutely need all of these things. Actually, I said I was going to drop some of this shit off in the PC. I should have just sold this shit. Like, why? Restores Pokemon HP by 20? Is anybody hurting? No, of course not. Because I'm a fucking Pokemon master and everyone is healed up. A self-restore for PP. Let's use it on... Sauron on his flamethrower. How about that? And you're telling me we don't have a burn heal yet in the bag? We got everything else but a fucking burn heal? We have ice heal, but we don't have burn heal? Come on. Come on. Who do you think I am? And what delicious hidden item is over here? What if it didn't even show you hidden items if you had a full bag? There's nothing over there? Nothing at all? Nothing, nothing, nothing. But I like how I'm... Whoa, bro, I'm not even on the same level as you. Those who have style and those who don't. What kind of person are you? Bro, get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. How dare you accuse me of not having style. Sauron will mow you down with flamethrower. He learned flamethrower and he's ready. Silver powder? Okay, I'm just gonna commit at this point And I'm getting rid of these berries this eon mail i kind of want to get rid of ev print mail but we have so much mail in the pc actually i think we have like two pieces of mail in the pc but 
poison cure berry I'm gonna hold on to because that really means something but mint berry adios bitter berry adios but the other items we need to get rid of but silver powder I'm pretty sure power the bug type moves not that we have any bug types on our team at the moment but wouldn't be bad to have for the future there's so many good Pokemon in here I wonder what our Union Cave encounter actually was and now instead of all of this madness that's here now we ended up with something entirely different but it's probably like <laughs> Winnie or something I think Winnie was our national park encounter but anyways is this uh, Lapras right around the corner here is this is this, is this where we find the Lapras <sighs> looky here it even moves around look at that okay ladies and gentlemen just like we did with the TMs earlier I need you to place your bets in the chat for what you think this Lapras is going to be Sir they says I'll give you just a few more moments Time's up that sounded like a Kakuna. Oh It's an oddish Technically That is species because we caught chartreuse the blossom and oddish evolves into blossom but it's a static encounter and we cannot change what it will be so we either have the option of catching it or simply running from it um i also wonder if we were to run from it now and let's say come back we have 60 fucking great balls i didn't know i bought that many let's say we came back next friday would it be different or would it still always be a lapras and would said lapras still always be randomized into oddish but in the words of Kanye West, we may never know. Because we caught the Saj. During the day, it stays in the cold underground to avoid the sun. It grows by bathing in moonlight. So let's give a nickname to this little Oddish here. I think we're going to name her... Delilah. We've got... Delilah the Odish so we caught our Lapras hot dog hot dog hot dog hot diggity dog and you know with all that shit we went through in our bag we don't have an escape rope we don't know anybody that knows dig nobody knows teleport get us out of here get me out of here right now get me out of here because we have a legendary encounter to make. So, Ramla, Lady Ramla, ferry us once more, my lady. Allow us to heal ourselves because we have a sweet coon encounter to make outside of. The National Park, which I kind of vaguely remember. <clears throat> is he up here or some shit? <gasps> is this like where I go to the left, he goes to the right? Like I go to the right, he goes to the left? Like, <laughs> gonna get you. <laughs> gonna get you, buddy. And where's you seen? He doesn't even show up for this shit? He doesn't even show up? Like he doesn't even give a damn? I thought he was hot on the tail of Suicune, ready to pounce at any moment. We're gonna let this uh, tree here thrive for a bit longer because the last thing on our to-do list tonight is to check out the TMs and the Mart and the Mart itself. Y'all selling Ultra Balls yet? Y'all ever sell Ultra Balls? You still sell potions and Ultra Potions. So I'm going to take the guess that no, you do not sell Ultra Balls until, or is it, does anyone sell Ultra Balls yet? Maybe it's not until the uh, last city or something like that, then they'll update it like across the board or something like that. Fuck that. We don't want any of that shit. Is this the same dude? Do we go through the door twice? <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. 
Nope, wrong man again. Nope, I'm not paying you for that shit. You know exactly what I'm looking for. I'm looking for them TMs. Okay, a move that raises the user's attack. So we have the money, we have the moolah. <clears throat> Let's figure it out. But our fucking back is gonna be full. <sighs> Alright, so TM41. We have it purchased. TM48. On oh, our bag is full. This doesn't go in the same pocket. We don't know TM48 either. TM41. 48. We have 33, which we don't know either. Oh, I didn't even read it. What the fuck? An attack that strikes twice. Double slap? Stiff wing strike the foe. Is it wing attack? Or is it steel wing? Causes confusion and raises attack. That's swagger. We know what that is. TMO8 strikes the target with wings. That's wing attack. So I guess the other one is steel wing? Okay, but we don't have to buy any more. So we just snagged up. TM33, Bone Meringue, an attack that strikes twice. Bone Meringue, an attack that strikes twice. TM38, no, oh, that's game point, wait. TM41, Sharpen. Oh, wow, I can't believe I just paid 3k for that. Sharpen. Uh... And then TM48, Steel Wing. There it is. Uh, and that's all that we have written down for Goldenrod. Well, I mean, I guess that's not terrible. Can we teach Steel Wing to uh, Lady Romla? No. Winnie? Uh, I wouldn't be terrible against rock types, considering that Winnie's a normal type. Steel is physical, too. Judy? Wouldn't really need it on Judy. Wouldn't be bad on Winnie. Um, I don't think we got anything else that's really important. Sidekick? I can teach it to everyone, but like, we talked about that last time. I mean, we have a couple moves that are decent. I'm not gonna lie, we have a couple moves that are okay. But a majority, I don't know, I feel like we started out with heat, like actual fire. And now we're kind of just puttering out. Did we come up here last time? We're just kind of puttering out. Oh, wow. Will you quit bothering me? Puttering out with good TMs is what I was trying to say. <laughs> they have bargain sales here every so often. Pardon? Who says an adult can't get into this? I'm going to go back every day to collect all the dolls. What, 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 what are you talking about? A vending machine for Pokemon dolls? Insert money, then turn the crank, but it's almost empty. Okay, don't tell me to walk. <sighs> I can't use that here. Well, I think this is good enough timing and perfect enough for me because my ass is tired and ready to go to bed. So I think we're going to wrap up tonight's episode here. As Professor Elm called and told us when we beat the Mahogany Gym, that some weird happenings were happening in Goldenrod. It's just so happened, so perfectly planned that we happen to end up here in Goldenrod. Oh, look, that path's blocked off. All these paths are blocked off. And did I mention that we already got, oh, we went too high. We already got potions and Pokeballs and everything else. So I don't know about you, but it sounds like we are strapped and ready to go. Radio tower, let's do it. Skeely Bebop. Ma'am, are you in need of assistance? Hello, I'm sorry, <laughs> but we're not offering any tours today. Dang, dang, dang. No quizzes, nothing? Dang, he's got good eyesight. We've finally taken over the radio tower. Now every, oh, it's supposed to be star screen. Now everyone will get to experience the true terror of Team Rocket. We'll show you how scary we are. Are they star screen and late night crystal? Or is that just Renegade Platinum? I can't remember. Anyways. <laughs> so our goal is to get Sauron up to 45. I mean, I guess the rest of our squad up to 45. But, I mean, maybe. Maybe, just maybe. That'll end up making this a walk in the park. 
Why would they want to take over the radio tower? I don't know, you tell me. Jigglypuff seems kind of chill about it. Buena? Huh? Today's password? Help, of course. Well, okay. Can I call in? Do I get a bribe? Whoa, 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 whoa. Ha ha ha. How boring. It was far too easy to take over this place. Come on, keep me amused. I wonder if they know my actions. They must not have heard. They must not know of my actions in Mahogany Town. When I betrayed Lance and assisted the Team Rocket admins in escape. Who, who, who are you exactly? Exactly, read your Team Rocket newsletter. I know it goes out. I know everyone in Team Rocket gets the newsletter. I know you've heard about me. Don't act like you haven't. Dragonite, you think we're scared of a Dragonite? Dragonite flinched. Dragonite's scared of the Great Lord. The Great Dark Lord, Sauron. Which, by the way, Rings of Power season finale. Uh. This week, am I excited? Yes. <laughs> and I have to say, this past week's episode of Game of Thrones, yet again, is just disappointing. I mean, I'm not going to call it disappointing. I feel bad calling it disappointing. It's not bad. It's just... <sighs> like... Damn, Judy. First battle back. Can't do nothing with that. It's like, have you ever had a series that you started watching, right? And it's 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 all right. You could say maybe my 100 episode <laughs> Sunday movie playthrough or whatever. Or any TV show is fine. Don't want to make this about me. But have you ever had a TV show where like as it progressed oh, that Cubone reminds me where as it progressed you kind of lost interest in it but because of like either I, I don't know outside influence you know people saying oh it's so good it's so good so like you want to watch it or I guess more so the point I'm driving home like you've watched so much of it already that you're you kind of feel committed to finishing it. Also, by the way, praise the almighty Brick Beast, leader of our bag. <laughs> um, I wanted to check out that Cubone reminded me because I thought that we... Where did we... There it is. Boomerang. Can Judith... Judy can't learn boomerang. Damn. A lot of you guys are saying we should check to see if Judy could learn boomerang so she could have something stab. But unfortunately, that won't be happening tonight. To trainers, Pokemon are their beloved partners. It's terrible how Team Rocket is trying to control Pokemon. Anyways, that's the point I was getting at. It kind of sort of feels... Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening? Oh, it flinched. Yo, there's too many water types. This is spooking me. It kind of sort of feels like I'm committed to, like, the season. I'm so excited. I gotta watch it. Yada, yada. But it's just not... Uh, for me, it's just not living up to expectations. Like, I guess... I don't know. I guess I was just expecting more. I just... I, don't know, I, just, I just don't know. I just don't know. Winnie, handle this. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We got plenty of hyper potions, plenty of super potions. Look at our bag. We're just doing wonderful. Challenge me too. Challenge me too, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill, chill. Winnie, perish song. We don't even need three turns to get rid of you. But hold up. Winston, get rid of this Dratini. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Winston, Winston, Winston. Winnie, come back out. Come back out. Come back out. Hit him with that strength. Took me too lightly. What do you mean? You perish song me. <laughs> you clicked perish song on me and you have a Celebi. The Team Rocket boss has locked himself in, but the director can open it. He's up on the fifth floor. <laughs> Bro, man, from up on the fifth floor. Was it was it fourth floor or was it fifth floor? I think it was fifth floor. Anyways, wait, who is this? Who's that over there? It's 
Excuse me. You plan to rescue the director? That won't be possible because I'm going to beat you. All right, Sailor Joey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Again with these water types. Chill. I guess we're getting training well across the board today. Everybody in the squad is getting experience. And you know what? It's good too because Sauron got experience as well. Look at that. Finally, an opponent that Judy doesn't have to swap out on. <laughs> Um, also, that guy's meta power was level 39. <gasps> you, you, you came to rescue me. Is that what you were expecting? Wrong. I am an imposter. I pretended to be the real thing to prepare for our takeover. Do you want to know where we hid the real director? Sure, I'll tell you, but only if you can beat me. So was he like in character the whole time as he was revealing his treachery to me? Sailor Scott. Oh, he's got six Pokemon. Okay, I send the glow. Okay, I see you. Rare Pokemon. Okay. All right. No damage at all. I still see you. I still. We here. We here. We here. We here. Who you got next? Who you got next? Show me who you got. Oh my goodness. Getting flashbacks. PTSD from Renegade Platinum. Um, I don't know what this thing can do to me. Pursuit? Well, it's a good thing I didn't swap. Shit. Frick, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Well, now I might swap. Shit. Um, what the... Can we get this thing out of here? Thank you, Winnie. Damn. Get rid of that, too. Get rid of that, too. Oh, it's level 42? Was that your ace? What is that normally? A Weezen? Oh, no, this is the guy with the Murkrow. Is that a level 43 Murkrow? Don't tell me he's got a level 43 Murkrow. A Geodude? Wow. A rollout Geodude? That was your... your Great master plan. Oh, I was hoping. He missed, so I'm gonna go again. Okay, we're not playing that game. Get him out of here. Get that ferret out of here. I like how Winston outsped the ferret. I know it's just the levels, but still, I just imagine him like skittering around. Just outspeeding this little rodent. Okay, okay, I'll tell you where he is. Yeah, tell me, bitch. We stashed the real director in the underground warehouse. It's at the far end of the underground, but I doubt you'll get that far. Do I have do I have space in my bag for this? <laughs> Maybe, perhaps. Okay, excellent. So I think that's the where the not the real director, but we'll get there. We'll get there once we get the key card. But I think now we have a date with Nurse Jubilee. Indeed, indeed, indeed. I think that's where we're headed. Because we just whooped all this rocket scum behind. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, chill, chill. All y'all need to chill. Ganging up, standing shoulder to shoulder. Like y'all got issues with people walking around the city and shit. I'm telling you. Y'all don't read your newsletter. Gotta read your newsletter. The newsletter will tell you. Don't fuck with him. I'm the only reason y'all even still here, doing what you're doing. See, look, they don't even fuck with me neither. I think someone said there's a hidden item down here somewhere, but I'm not remembering on the top of my head. Like, I just remember the moment I came down here, but I don't know. Maybe I'm mixing it up. Anyways, knock, knock. Open sesame. Oh, we're going down even further. Oh. This part right here, I forgot. Oh no, he was Starscream. Oh. Hold it. I saw you, so I tailed you. I don't need you underfoot while I serve Lord Megatron. Wait a second, you beat me before, didn't you? That was just a fluke. But I'd repay my debts. 
You a Lannister? The Lannister always repays his debts. Silver. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. I like how the hoe comes out like. <laughs> okay, buddy. This is how we're starting this. Um. Should I click Fisher? <laughs> Level 39 ho oh. Wow. I mean, I understand I'm four levels above, but wow, I outsped this ho oh. Wait, is this gonna hurt? I mean, no, I'm a rock type. I was thinking like physical and special. Oh, never mind. Oh, we didn't outspeed. It was a quick clock. Damn. Thank goodness they gave us an animation for that. That was a crit. Whoa. Whoa. And of course we get burned, which makes all this useless. Thank you kindly. Thank you kindly. Let's get you out of here. I just have to say, I hope and pray it doesn't know pursuit. <laughs> um, what is that? Number four or number three? God damn. Um, I know I bought a burn heal just for this occasion. <laughs> I know I bought a burn heal. Okay, so that has to be number five. And yes to the fuck yes, I'm about to heal this damage off. Okay, never mind. Maybe that's number five. Whoa, what the fuck is happening? What the fuck is happening? Can we, wait, can we cure this burn? Cures all status. It's bitter. But I mean, I think that Winston the pirate could take it. Gust, okay, after all of that, we use Gust. I wasn't stressing too much about it because I know once the sacred fires were gone, I'm going to click surf anyways and the burn's not going to matter, but Winston might need you to, okay, <laughs> I was going to say, Winston, I might need you to tag out for this one, buddy, but we're going to let you get that, okay, this polyrath, okay, chill, 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 polyrath, chill, poly, 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 polyrath, chill, Xavier, can you, I didn't see what he used, but to level 42 Polyrath, we are suddenly not over leveled anymore. Ooh, a critical hit. Xavier, I asked him, can you? And he showed up. Yes, he can. Double slap me if you want. Hit him with that confusion, Xavier. Oh, I love it. Another crit. Oh my god, I love it. A twisted spoon acting like a scope lens. Ooh, boy. Ooh, boy. Look at everybody just getting love tonight. Look at everybody just getting... Oh, shh, shh, shh. Gotta bring it down. Gotta bring it down. Gotta bring it down. It's late night crystal. Oh, I forgot he has a fur alligator for a starter. This is the first time I've seen a gator, though, right? Um, What's my health like? I know he's going to have bite or something like that. I don't know what this accuracy is. Am I wasting time by clicking these? Didn't affect. Okay. Uh, that slash did 49 points of damage. I'm gonna click confusion. Oh, don't hurt me. That was a crit. How much damage are we doing? Give me a decent amount. How much damage are we doing? Okay. Okay. I'll take another crit. Okay. 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 Um, but I think I'm gonna go out to Winnie instead. I think he's gonna. Oh my god! I think, I, was say, I think he's gonna keep clicking slash. He went for scary face, so that you can click slash. Oh, I don't think so, buddy. I don't think so, buddy. I don't think so, buddy. That wouldn't even crit. Winnie is a monster. Oh my goodness! Oh, he stole another Pokemon. A Graveler. Whoa, whoa, Graveler. Wow, I would go out to Winston normally and click Surf on this, but... I'm gonna click 
Lick? Should I have healed? Oh. Um. 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 Whoa. Um, okay. I'm going to... Oh my god, this is a horrible position. I'm gonna click-click again. And I'm not really clicking it for damage. Okay, I'm gonna heal... Winnie. Oh, you missed. Excellent. Okay, I'm gonna heal... Winston. Are you joking? When he eats it like a champion. Like the champion she is. Oh my goodness. Yes! I was stressing the whole time. I was stressing, stressing, stressing the whole time. I was like, oh my goodness. I know he's gonna click self-destruct. And then rollout happened and I was like, oh shit. Roll up, I gotta deal with that now too. And he missed, and I was like, alright, perfect. So I healed him up. I mean, I know Winston has great defense. Wait a minute. Is this battle over? Or am I gonna get burn damage? Oh, excellent, thank you. I don't think the burn damage would kill me, but why? Why did I why do I lose? I've assembled the toughest Pokemon. I didn't ease up on the gas. So why do I lose? Damn, bro, now I gotta go back to the Pokemon Center. I don't understand. Is what that Lance guy said true? That I don't treat Megatron, Lord Megatron, properly? Love, trust. Are they really what I lack? Are they keeping me from winning? I, I just don't understand. But it's not going to end here. Not now. Not because of this. <clears throat> not sounding like Starscream anymore. Not like it sounded like him much to begin with. Damn. I won't give up my dream of becoming Lord Megatron's best Pokemon trainer. Alright, bro, let me get the fuck up out of here. Look how you left my team. Look how you fucking left my team. After this sacred firing ho-oh. <laughs> he didn't miss a single sacred fire the whole time. Damn. Did Rachel want to battle? Do we have time to go uh, see Rachel real quick? Could be, maybe, please, possible. No, okay. We've got a, uh, we've got, we've got bigger Team Rocket related fish to fry down here. Instead, we're fucking with Rachel. Rachel's always fucking with us. All right, buddy, let's get it going. I don't care if you're lost. You show up here, you're nothing but a victim. Damn. Oh my God. Why do you have a Lugia? We just fought a ho oh, oh, and now we have a Lugia. Can I get a break? Can I? Can I get a break? That's how you feel. That's how you feel. And a crit. Okay. 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 We are we just gonna keep clicking arrow blast. That's how you feel. We got spammed by sacred fire. And now we getting spammed by arrow blast. So that's how you feel. You know, I just came from the Pokemon Center. Cut this. Tomfoolery out. Open one shutter, another closes, but you can't get where you want. Oh, we have another puzzle. There is a puzzle here, isn't there? Oh, I'm gonna give this to Winston. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I'm gonna give this to Winston because I think. There we go. I was gonna say, I think he's got this one covered. I think he's got this one covered. I think he's got that one covered. Can we just talk about. Confounded by the shutters, are we? I'll let you in on a secret if you can beat me. Can we just talk about how the legend that is... Oh my goodness, this game haunts me. I'm gaining him now. Put the reflect up! I tell everyone the same thing. I will not remember it. Uh, but can we just talk about the legend that is Winston the Pirate as it slowly grows? Alright, a hint. Change the order of switching. That'll change the ways the shutters open and close. 
Okay. It's labeled Switch 3. It's off. Turn it on. You know, like, we are... Oh, it's a little burglar. I'm mad I missed this sprite. Oh. But anyways, <laughs> focus. We are living through history right now. Oh, we have a Charizard and a Gengar? What the fuck? You're so lucky. Whoa. Um, what do I do here? Winnie. <laughs> Look at the little burglar. This <laughs> sprite is so dope. <laughs> but we are living through history right now. You know, as you see all these tremendous feats that Winston the Pirate is accomplishing right in front of your very eyes. He survived Late Night Yellow. He's leading the squad through Late Night Crystal. He just tanked. Absolutely tanked to self-destruct. While being burned and lived to tell the tale. To be honest with you, I have no idea what I'm doing. I know this is supposed to like open up to a certain something or something or other. But we're 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 working on it. That's what I that's that's all we can share at this time. That we are working on it. He called for mercy. Oh, do we actually do it? Masterful and that Magmar isn't such a big deal anymore now, is it? <laughs> I want that item though, because I mean, as we just saw, items are very important. Are you lost? No, you can't be. You don't have a scared look. I'll give you something to be scared about. Um, I want that item. He doesn't learn anything that can hurt you. Yeah, I was gonna say that can hurt Judy, right? It's labeled emergency. It's off. Turn it on. What does that mean? Emergency. I'm guessing I'll be able to come back down there to get that item. I'm just not trying to fuck up this pattern because I got it just now. You know what I mean? <laughs> just for now, but there's an item to go back down and get. Ups critical hit ratio of Chansey. Oh, okay. 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 Uh, need to go visit the PC again. I bet you there's cool guys of hidden items down here. Put them up. Put them up. Put them up. You're not going any further. I don't show mercy to my enemies, not even brats. Chill, bro. I'm not trying to get hit with no magnitudes either. I need you to chill. Blast it. Can we pause for just a moment? We got Sauron up to 45. 43, 43, 43, 44. Look at us go. Look at us fucking go. And a moonstone. Look at us fucking go. So I want to let you guys in on a secret. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I remember you. You got to be good at our hideout. This goof. Oh, he's got a fucking Venusaur. Did he have a Venusaur back then? I don't remember that. Did he have Chartreuse back then? I don't remember that. That was a blast. I'll remember you. Oh, shit. A pearl. Uh, you know, I was kind of sort of like trying to hold on to all these males. But... Like the Eon Mail, but I might have to get rid of it. What does Rage Candy Bar do? Restores Pokemon HP by 20. Here you go, Judy. Rage on. Rage on, homegirl. Rage on. Um. I mean, really, I don't want to get rid of these items. I would rather pop them in the PC, you know? Like, I want to keep that Poison Cure Berry. Do we have... They have eight antidotes. Okay. I'm going to toss this berry. Because I know the moment I pick up this pearl, which I'm going to inevitably sell. So I'm not stressing over it that much. Uh, anyways. How did you get this far? I have a secret to tell you guys. Um, we have a new series starting soon here on the channel. Um, it's not a late night series. If you are following... Along with, what the fuck? Did he just use absorb? If you are following along with Renegade Platinum, you will know that we are imminently approaching. Damn, forty-six. 
Wait, 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 wait. We gotta jot it down. TM46, we do not know yet. Survey says... Slash. Not an awful move to have, but TM46 is slash. Put it up to you. Teach slash to a Pokemon. Winnie Winston saw around Rama. Rama wouldn't be awful with it. Lady Rama attack, special attack. Um, I think somebody said that it doesn't work off of speed in this gen, so I don't know. Maybe we'll see. I'll think about it. Who? Oh, what? You came to rescue me? Thank you. The radio tower. What's happening there? Take it over by Team Rocket. Here, take this card key. Thanks, bro. Use that to open the shutters on third floor. I'm begging you to help. There's no telling what they'll do if they control the transmitter. They may even be able to control Pokemon using a special signal. You're the only one I can call on to save the radio tower and all the Pokemon nationwide. Oh, see, now it feels much bigger. It feels much more important. Like there's something to lose, like Team Rocket. This is the definite last stand of Team Rocket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rah, rah, rah. Anyways, if you are paying attention to... What the fuck? Oh, okay. If you're paying attention to Renegade Platinum, then you'll know that... I don't know how to open this door, though. I'm going to click this one. Nope, not that. Nope, not that. Um, you'll know that Renegade Platinum is about to wrap up. We're going to be taking on the Elite Four this week. Um, what the fuck? So we have a new series that's about to begin. <laughs> I know this is very sporadic, but I'm trying to figure this out. So we have a new series that's about to begin, and I'm not going to tell you exactly what it is. But let me just say, I've already given you a hint. So, you can figure dig it out for yourself from there. Consider it a uh, late night crystal exclusive. Because I know you guys are the, the troopers of the troopers. <laughs> the super troopers, some might say. <laughs> um, I thought... I'm so confused and I hate this puzzle. The Pokemon of the world are in trouble and you have me in here fucking with this shit. Instead of just giving me the item. How come every door I press closes that one? Every single button affects that one. I need to open that door beneath it. That opens this over here. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Oh, I couldn't see that. Mystic water. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. What are you holding? Pink bow. <laughs> okay, okay. You know, Winston the Pirate, he's not really a, a, a water type per se. You know, he is and he isn't. He's a, a water type in the sense that he likes the water. And that's, about, that's about as far as you get with that. Whoa, too far, too far, too far. Speed up in these older games is bananas. B A N A N A S. Look at this, just zooming all over the place. And it's not like I even hold it that long either. I just barely just tap it at him across the room. Uh, did he say third floor? <laughs> Here we are. Hey, buddy. Why did the shutter open? Did you have something to do with this? Sailor Daniel. Oh my goodness. Damn, Judy just didn't even flinch. Winston and Judy taking counter no not here taking back-to-back self-destruct god damn it's not fair it's not fair so I like having a bulky team oh I've been wanting to get up in here stop I'm known as the team rocket fortress you're not taking another step whoa is this a is this an admin whoa 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 whoa, whoa. nice Jay chill and Judy's level 45 the fortress came down. Um, hold up, hold up, hold up. We're gonna swap you with Winston and use this last super potion to free up a little bit more space in our bag. What you doing over here? Don't 
I think Pokemon are cute. I think my Pokemon are cute after they beat yours. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. Can I guillotine the frog? I mean, the toad? It's in his name. Get him out of here. We got self-destructs and guillotines in one episode. If Winston the Pirate is not the most badass Pokemon you have ever laid eyes on, hold on, time out. Judy, come back. If Winston the Pirate is not the most badass Pokemon you have ever laid eyes on, if Judy the Ride Eyes are the most badass Pokemon you ever laid eyes on, both of them taking back to back self destructs and dishing out Okos right afterwards. Come on now. It's just not fair. Does Miltank get self destruct too? <laughs> A Snubble, that's all you rocking with? Oh, homeboy was stronger. How you doing today, ma'am? Why? Why do I have to suffer through this? Meowth, help me. Meowth, meowth. <laughs> that was a pretty good merry voice. Wow. <laughs> myself on the back for that one. Excuse me. No hidden items here? Remember me from the hideout in Mahogany Town? I lost them, but I won't this time. Oh, this is another admin. I gotta take note of... The Whoa, don't be getting crits on me. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 I don't like that range. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Judes. Judy, Judy, Judy. Thank you. Um, I don't like this either. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Xavier? Oh, I forgot. Whoa, yeah. whoa wait a minute. I don't like that try attack. Oh my goodness. I'm frozen, I'm burned. Try to text normal, right? And now I'm parallel. Are you being serious? Um, is this a joke? Where are the cameras? It's a level 42 Porygon. And now I'm burned. Fuck. We didn't buy anything for that either. Um, okay. Let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think. I'm gonna heal Winston. And we're gonna go out to Winston. Recover all you want. Defense curl all you want. He try attacked, and Winston the pirate didn't get caught by it. Look at Winston leading the pack. God damn. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. And you know why I don't like this. I'm not playing any games. I would go out to Sauron, but I don't like this. That's why I don't like this. Winston, Winston, Winston. Wow. Wow. I wonder if he would have lived that from full. Um, I just wonder. Wow. I should have swapped. I should have swapped. Why didn't I swap? And now here we are. I never even thought about this day coming. I just never, never crossed my mind. Never thought it would ever be possible. This can't be happening. I fought hard, but I still lost. Wow. Now I just have this image in my head because of what she said. You know, I won't lose this time. You know, like, anime with me for a moment. You know, like, we're just going back. I have to go back. I have to go back. We made it all the way here, and I have to go back. You know, like, we were battling our way up the tower, and everyone's taking hit after hit after hit, and now this evil Team Rocket member vows to get revenge, and she's, like, right there around the corner, right around, uh, right stops just right before our goal. Freeze, burn, paralysis, and then explosion. 
Winston held up his big claw. The moment we saw that fortress light up, I'm going the wrong way. The moment we saw that fortress light up, Winston quickly scuttled us behind his massive claw. And he took the hit for us. And when the light faded, all we saw was just the blackened husk. <laughs> that was Winston, the motherfucking pirate. Don't you ever forget his name. Don't you ever forget his name. Dang. I can't believe I went all the way back there and didn't swap a Pokemon out or anything. Winston, my boy, I'm so terribly sorry. Oh, you managed to get this far. You must be quite the trainer. We intend to take over this radio station and announce our comeback. That should bring our boss, Giovanni, back from his solo training. We are going to regain our former glory. I won't allow you to interfere with our plans. Oh my goodness. It still hasn't set in for me yet. Fucking Machamp? You leave with a fucking Machamp? Vital throw. I'm gonna click fly. Look at how serious his sprite is. He knows cross chop, Jesus. Look at how serious this Machamp Sprite is. He's level 43 too. Whoa. Whoa. Damn, he just lived that stab super effective. I mean, that's not going to do shit to me. Ooh, big spooky cross chop. Get him out of here. <laughs> okay, whatever. A Kingdra. Ooh. This is perfect Winston territory. Oh, we got a crit wing attack. A water gun. Get that Kingdra out of here. Another crit wing attack. Lady Ramla is stepping up. She saw... Oh, 46. She saw Winston fall. And she knew she had to step up in the fight. Um, this is kind of nerve-wracking, though. Not gonna lie. Rapid spin. Bite. Okay, get him out of here. <laughs> no, forgive me, Giovanni. Okay. How could this be? Our dreams have come to naught. I wasn't up to the task after all. Like Giovanni did before me, I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. Oh, just like that. Boom, pow. Skip that. Thank you, Nappy. Thank you. Your courageous actions have saved Pokemon nationwide. I know it's not much, but please take this. A clear bell. There used to be a tower right here in Goldenrod City, but it was old and creaky, so we replaced it with our radio tower. We dug up that veil during construction. I heard that all sorts of Pokemon lived in Goldenrod in the past. Perhaps that veil has some connection to the Tin Tower in Ecrotique City. Ah, that reminds me. I overheard Team Rocket whispering. Apparently something is going on at the Tin Tower. I have no idea what is happening, but you might look into it. Okay, I better get to my office. The Tin Tower. Isn't this normally a Master Ball? A Metal Coat. Or am I, am I getting this mixed up with something else? A Metal Coat? We already have one of those. Silver Powder, Pink Bow. Okay, I'm gonna give this back to Winston just to free up the space so we can pick up the Metal Coat. <laughs> okay, well. Hey, Mary. Oh, you're my little savior. Will you take this as my thanks? Oh my god, another fucking pink bow. Um, I guess we don't need it right now. <laughs> she wouldn't give me another pink bow. Well, we have certainly cleared out um, Team Rocket as much as it pained me from the radio tower. I'm interested in the tin tower thing. I wanna see what that's about. So we might head up there next. And by next, I mean in tomorrow night's episode. However, before we fully wrap for tonight's episode, we must <sighs> wait, 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 wait. Hold on. <laughs> deposit that, deposit that, deposit. Fuck it. Deposit all of this. Deposit that. 
deposit that, deposit that, deposit that. Okay, once we get full heals, we'll fix all that shit up. Wait, I need to withdraw the pearl, though. Okay, Winston. The pirate. Thank you so much for all of your guidance, leadership, Okos, making the uh, scoundrels and heathens that stood against us walk the plank. But now it's time for you to rest in Davy Jones's locker. <sighs> Makes me sad. So, we have options now. Obviously, a water type is an obvious replacement for Winston the Pirate. So, we have... Whooper, Goldberg the Whooper. Uh, we already have a ground type though. We have Patty the Croconaw. Um, we have Magnolia the Gyarados, but we already have a flying type. And we have Julian our shiny tentacle, but we already have a poison type in Ramla. So we also have the option for, I don't know, maybe a grass type? I don't know, we have options. We have options. I'm just gonna go the long way and show everybody the options. Benjamin the Snorlax, Derek the Dragonair, Magnolia the Gyarados, Seven the Onyx, who by the way, we just got a metal coat, so Seven the Steelix, Sinclair the Vaporean, Penelope, the Elekid, Ramalina, the Golbat, Patty the Croconaw, Chartreuse the Blossom, Goldberg the Whooper, Stephanie the Mercargo, Nolan the Sunflora, Allison the Jigglypuff, Otto the Ditto, Fiona the Charmander, Kenya the Amstar, Roger the Charmeleon, Madam the Lickitung, Mahogany the Ivysaur, Theo the Cyndaquil, and that's just box one. We got six more in box two. And survey says Delilah the Oddish, Ophelia the Ekans, Julian our shiny tentacle, Windex our Sudowoodo, Blaine our Magmar, and Shucky our Diglett. So we have options. Let me know what you guys think. Who should we add? What should we do? I think I'm going to try and get everyone on the squad up to at the very minimum 45. Anyways, yes, we have Julian our shiny tentacle here because in the last episode we unfortunately lost our starter all the way from late night yellow that makes it sound like he was our starter on late night yellow he wasn't our starter on late night yellow but he was from late night yellow winston the pirate which looking back on it all i can say is in the moment i think i was really feeling it we were killing mon after mon after mon and i just kind of didn't even look at his hp like i remember mentioning like oh i thought his hp was higher than that because, you know, he did just take a self-destruct. Kingler has great defense. You know, I thought for sure he's going to take the hit. We'll be good to go. But he didn't. I should have looked at um, his health a bit more. And I should have swapped out to Judy. In all honesty. I should have swapped out to Judy. But Winston did what he could. He did what he could. He did what he could. Wouldn't that be some crazy shit, though? Like, main character dies in the show. <laughs> Or something like that. Uh, it wasn't meant to be that way. And I actually meant to swap Sauron and Ramla. Let's get Lady Ramla up to... Here we go. Yes. Because we're still trying to get the squad up. Level them up together. So Julian is sitting here chilling. Hold up. Let me check really quickly. I forgot we have another Master Ball. What the fuck? Oh, we could automatically teach you serve right now, buddy. Hop up here. Oh, but Bubble Beam, though. Oh, Bubble Beam is the shit. Um, <clears throat> so you might be wondering, Dappy, what the fuck? Now you have two poison types. You know, I was thinking about who to put on the squad. And ultimately, I was weighing a bunch of different options. But ultimately, I just thought to myself, ooh, psychic. 
Ultimately, I just thought to myself, like, I've been saying that I want to use a tentacle. Tentacle is on my list. I want to use it. We'll make it work. We'll find a way to make it work. Let's just hope Claire, Claire's Kingdry isn't randomized into a Alakazam, because then we might have some issues. Um, but not even. We have fucking Sauron, and Focus Blast is not a thing. <laughs> At least not yet, so <laughs> we don't have to worry about that. So Sauron's a pretty safe bet to swap out to. But anyways, we need to... What am I doing? What is this? Renegade Platinum? Get me the fuck out of here. Fly me. Take me up here to Mahogany Town. Because, as I mentioned... Nappy? It's Rachel. Got time to chat? My clo... And I are getting more in sync with each other. We battled a wild vile plume and managed to drop it in a close match. We're getting into the groove. Bye. Let's chat again. <sighs> Rachel. Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. I just walked on this route. And first dude pops up. I'm gonna win for sure. Okay, this is what we're doing. This is what we're doing. This is why you think you're winning for sure. How do I kill this thing for sure? Judy? Surefire way to get out of Wapafit. Yo, that's crazy. I might have to, uh... Are you joking with me? <laughs> okay, hold on. I did not know Belly Drum went all the way back to Gen 2. Whoa. But Belly Drum Snorlax, chill the fuck out. I already got absolutely demolished by one Snorlax. I don't need to be demolished by another one. I don't have that many potions in this game. Come on now. <laughs> what is with Snorlax is terrorizing me? Next time, I'm gonna put Snorlax on the list too. Next time we get a Snorlax, we're using it. I don't care about typing, I don't care about none of that shit. We're slapping that Snorlax on the squad. Give me that shit too. Okay, so we can get a new encounter on this route. Mm -hmm. Isn't there like a grass patch? I fish until I can't anymore. I also battle until I drop. It's my relationship with my Pokemon. Isn't there like a grass patch across the water or something like that? Can I walk up to it or do I have to surf? Whoa, confusion gold duck chill. Um, hold on. Let's go and see. Or we could headbutt. <laughs> we could headbutt these trees for an encounter. That could be a possibility. But if there's... I feel like I never get that. I feel like there definitely is a grass patch on that route right there. On that route? On this route. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, time out, time out, time out. Get that out of here. Get that out of here. Holy speed up button, Batman. Whoa. Well, I did say I chose Julian because I wanted a tentacruel. Or I wanted to use a tentacruel. Lo and behold, tentacruel immediately. It's a shiny too. That's so fucking dope. It's so fucking dope. It's a shiny. But you know, this 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 usage of tentacruel has a little bit of an asterisk next to it because it can't learn all those moves that it can learn later you know I feel like is sludge bomb even a move in this game right now does it learn sludge do we even have acid surfing acid woo woo here we come uh, uh, talking about getting his hands on rare pokemon and you pull up with this what Winnie can you See, this is when we are really missing Winston. Because Winston would have bodied this Articuno. Not that Winnie couldn't. Not that Winnie couldn't. But you know what I mean. Like, having that reliable to swap out to. Did the game just give us a poison bar? Because we have two poison types on the squad. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, but I cannot get distracted. Hold on. Okay, but I cannot get distracted. We still must get our encounter. And Romlet is level 45. Okay, it's Xavier time. 
So we've got, oh, never mind, hold on, wait, time out, time out. I just got interrupted again, hold on. Preschooler Joe, get this Porygon out of here. Get this Cloister out of here. Get all this shit out of here, bro. Yes, it is laying right there. Okay, we're gonna make a break for it. Ah, oh, it's over here. Ah, oh, we made it. Ah, oh, we made it. No way! That's crazy. That's crazy. What are the odds? So technically, we could call species on this uh, because we did have a Kingler before and we could re-encounter here, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna catch this Krabby right now. Krabby the River Crab. If it is unable to find food, it will absorb nutrients by swallowing a mouthful of sand. <laughs> you gonna eat that sand? <laughs> but this is a lady crab. So what should we name our lady crab? Do we just still say fuck it and name <laughs> Wednesday? Uh, I think we are. <laughs> I, I really feel like this is a second chance we've been given. Look at Winston. I love it. But I also want to see. Oh, we could have had Xavier. Could have had a Dunsbars. Well, that would have been dupes. That would have been species. Uh, I wouldn't have minded a Natu just because I don't think I've ever used a Natu <laughs> in an LP. But what are the odds? God damn. There's Jigglypuff in these here waters. But wait, I gotta jot this down really quick before I forget. The TMs I'm all about, but the uh, Pokemon, I be skipping sometimes. So hold on, we got a, <laughs> a Krabby named Winston. What are the odds? Like, what are the actual odds? <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay. Still, I think we're going to go with our... I don't know. Do we keep Julian on the team? I think I'm going to leave that up to you guys. <laughs> do we swap Winston, our new Krabby, onto the squad? Or do we rock out with Julian the Shiny Tentacle? Tentacruel. I'm sorry. I apologize. But wait, just because I'm curious... There's even crabs in the trees! <laughs> crabs in the trees, oh god. Let's go, bro. If you know about the legendary bird, you ain't got no legendary birds. Get out of here, bro, get out of here. Get this Dodrio out of here, too! Look at that. I don't know. I'm gonna leave it up to you guys, but I think that we should give Julian a chance. And if he works out, then Winston will just be chilling, you know? Or you guys can just be like, fuck that. Put Winston back on the team. Fuck that shiny little bitch. I don't want him on the team anyway. <laughs> God damn, I can't get over this fucking ledge. <laughs> Let me in this bitch. I don't want a new encounter. But you know what? I think that the chill tunes, pun intended, of Ice Path are a perfect backdrop. Uh, we forgot our Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom in the last episode. Um, but we are still powering through self-empowerment, which is chapter one. And tonight's quote is, develop enough courage so that you can stand up for yourself and then stand up for somebody else. Develop enough courage so that you can stand up for yourself and then stand up for somebody else. Ooh, wait. You know, a while back, I was thinking about doing a... I don't want to... I, I guess you would call it a charity stream. I don't know, that, that name has such... Uh... Oh, this is our first encounter. Whoa. Hold on. 
Wait. Hold on. Wait. Have we caught a Pikachu? We have Elekid. Uh, we do have a Snorlax. I was sitting there talking, but I want to use Snorlax on the team. I don't care anything about Tycoon. We have a Snorlax. But we don't have a Pichu. So, we are going to catch this little bitch right here. Get in the ball, ho. It is unskilled at storing electric power. Any kind of shock causes it to discharge energy spontaneously. Hmm. Let's name this Pichu... It's hiccup, but spell only using the letters in Pichu. <laughs> His little burst of electricity are like little hiccups. He hiccups and just sparks come flying out. Oh well, Wobbuffet would have been interesting. I would have been down to use that Wobbuffet if anything happened to Xavier. <laughs> Let's just see how this goes. No, no, actually, I take that back. I don't want to use a Wobbuffet. I don't want to use a Wobbuffet. Um, anyways. <clears throat> Um, I wanted to mention to you guys, did I just do this, like, ding, bang, boom? The fuck? I wanted to mention to you guys, I haven't actually mentioned it in a video or anything yet. Um, is that waterfall? Did we get waterfall just now? Oh, damn, waterfall. Hell yeah. Uh, if we had a, I mean, we had to surf. Just if we had a physical water type attacking Pokemon but that's not a thing it doesn't matter water is special <laughs> uh, but I wanted to mention to you guys because I mentioned it a while back on late night yellow and like late night crystal whatnot but we do have merch available now if you haven't checked it out if you haven't seen it in the description of our upload since episode one of our new egg lock did I miss the entrance for this no it's got to be a hole you come out of I'm gonna put a little mental pin in that right there. Um, but yes, it is in the description of every video since the egg lock went up. Um, I think. I need to double check that. <laughs> um, but it is shopnappy.com. It's got a whole bunch of different stuff on there. Um, but the idea behind it is. Oh, I have to go all the way around, don't I? No, I don't. Ah, damn, the boulder fell through. Um, but the idea behind it is kind of like we'll have different color schemes going up. It's it's not like merchandise that we've done in the past where it was like a Teespring campaign and you had to like get it now, this and that, yada, yada, yada. Um, it's more like um, this stuff will always be there, always be available. So if you can't get it now or don't want to get it now and change your mind later or whatever, you know, to be there, but <laughs> I say that, but that's only certain things. <laughs> um, so like the first, the purple and green that we've been sporting this whole time, um, that'll be available always. But like the one that's like the cracked egg lock one with the cracked egg lock colors, like that one's only going to be available while we're doing the cracked egg lock, you know? So that's like, a uh, you had to be there kind of sticker, like either you were either you were at the lock bro or you weren't either you were totes cracked or you weren't bro i almost pushed this boulder too far um and then i also have a halloween one on there right now too so um but that's just for halloween that was just fun whatever i really only originally planned the two um but who can't who, who doesn't love a nice purple sticker you know what i mean who doesn't love a nice purple sticker um, so those two will be limit, like have a limited run available. Um, wait, I gotta think about this. Those two will have a limited run, um, but the purple and green will be there. Um, probably in the next month or so, there should be another one up there. Um, but you know what I think is super funny is my mom she says she's like the puzzle queen like I love doing puzzles but she calls herself the puzzle queen and this and that 
um, and to, it, to give her credit she does do a lot of really difficult puzzles but I know y'all saw those puzzles on that shop nappy if you haven't seen the puzzles on shop nappy you need to go fucking check them out I want to get her one of those for Christmas and be like all right <laughs> now do this puzzle <laughs> Here's this puzzle with my face all over it. I know you're gonna love it. <laughs> ah, at least we're finding items that don't take up any more space in our bag. Is there one down here? You hiding anything down here? Huh? 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 Just tell me. Just tell me. I would have loved to use an Amphros. Okay, I don't remember where I went. I think I went this way. Um, but yes, if you haven't checked it out yet, at the very least, check it out. Um, shopnappy.com. Peep it, 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 peep it. Um, and I did have a, um, actually I did have a couple people mention on the website, um, the stickers are 5x5, five by, five, by the way. If you click on the size guide thing, it'll tell you the size of them. But I just wanted to mention it, because I had a couple people asking me. I don't want people to get confused or anything, you know. Um, but anyways, we did still never get to that item in the cave back there. BT dubs in the cave back there in this cave. We still never got that one item back there. Um, and I feel like we're not getting any closer to it. So like, what the fuck? Where are you hiding this shit at, bruh? Frig off, exit. Wait, was that a level 42? Whoa, what the fuck did I just do? Oh, I just went straight down to that? So wait, if I go this way, it would take me to that item. I love how Ice Path has no trainers on it. Not a single one. Whoa. What the fuck? <sighs> you know what's messing with my head? It's not even this puzzle. It's the fact that I still haven't gotten that item back at the <laughs> uh, uh, the other place yet. The other room in, in this cave. What the fuck? Fuck off. What the fuck is with this puzzle? Am I crazy? So wait, if we go like this, I want to see what's up here. Okay, I get it. <laughs> okay, I get it. I think it's from here. I think I might be over one too far. No, never mind. There we go. TM10. Okay. It was worth the one iota of brain power to get a duplicate of Psychic. Who we? Yes, it was worth it. Absolutely. fucking -lutely. It'd be cool if you could just let me get back on the thing at that point. But, you know, you weren't being ass. Make me go all the way back around. Bet you I probably could have gotten on to it. <laughs> If I hadn't gone that way and zoomed back up here, but okay, get me the fuck out of here. I like Ice Path, I do, I do, I do, ooh, but it's time for me to get the fuck up out of here. Oh, there's two different pathways. One takes me to an item and the other takes me to a staircase. Where does the staircase take me? Oh, to the item that I've been wanting. And it's a rare candy, ain't that about a bitch? Ain't that about a bitch? Okay, he just leveled up. I'm gonna give you this rare candy, bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, chill, chill. Go back to the item. Boom. There you go, Julian. Welcome to the squad, bro. And I'm pretty sure this is the way out. So hold on. I want this item. Um. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> I was just thinking that it would be difficult or something. An HP up. You know, I wouldn't be mad at another 
Master Ball sometime soon. It raises the base HP. I don't fucking know whose HP to raise. Xavier, here, you have it, bro. Restore health. Okay. 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 Did we just clear out Ice Path? Did we get Waterfall in Ice Path? Did we get a new encounter in Ice Path? Did we get Soft Sand? in Ice Path, which I mean, Judy, we just need you to learn Earthquake. Once you learn Earthquake, I'll slap that soft sand on there. We get rid of that Quick Claw. And look at this, Blackthorn City. Wow, you came through the Ice Path? You must be a real hot shot trainer. I did indeed. Blackthorn City, a quiet mountain retreat. Running up at all these people's houses. Star you is cute, but I don't have it. Do you have a star you? Want to trade it for my whooper? No, don't insult me. Aru, voices in my head. Now I'm listening to my radio. <laughs> what is the point in putting him in the game? Deep inside, far off Indigo Plateau is the Pokemon League. I hear that the best trainers gather there from around the country. Far off? There was this move I just had to teach my Pokemon, so I got the move deleter to make it forget an HM move. But I mean, technically the Pokemon League's not that far off from Blackthorn City. It should just be like on the other side of these mountains over here, or maybe higher up in the mountains. But still, like what the fuck? Not that far, bro. Um, Almighty oh, Brick Piece, I forgot to include you in the team recap. I'm sorry. All right, we're good. We don't need the Mart. We don't need the Mart for nothing. This leads us to route 45. You the move deleter, bruh. We don't really need any moves deleted at the moment. I think we kind of good, but thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. If you can hop over to Renegade Platinum, that'd be a big help. Big, big, big help. A Pokemon holding a Miracle Barrier will cure itself of any status problem. Are you going to make your Pokemon forget some moves? Is that all anybody talks about? I feel like there's many more important things going on in Blackthorn City than just the move deleter. A clan of trainers who can freely command dragons live right here in Blackthorn. As a result, there are many legends about dragons in this town. Is this a dragon? You can get a dragon in your house. What do you mean legends about dragons? Myths about dragons. That is a dragon. Plain as day. What if she just didn't see him? He's tucked under the table. Dragon Masters all come from the city of Blackthorn. Oh, oh. Oh, we can get a Blackthorn encounter? Claire, our gym leader, is waiting for you. However, it would be impossible for a run of the milk trainer to win. Oh, I remember. She gets all upsetty and runs into the dragon's den. Mmm. Mmm. So, I'm going to get a Blackthorn City encounter here. Well, let's see what we got. Survey says... <laughs> Yo, this is like the old school WarioWare game where you could talk into it. <laughs> This controller must be hearing me. This game must know things. It must. Get in the gray ball. What are you doing? It appeared to be caught. Fall asleep. I literally cannot do anything to attack you. You have to get in this ball. You like you 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 have to get in this ball or this is gonna be a waste of an encounter. Thank you, bro. Once it begins to meditate at sunrise, the entire day will pass before it will move again. Wow. So, I mean, what I said about the Wobbuffet earlier, I wouldn't be against now. If anything happens to Xavier, I would not be against using an Azatu. Kind of want to asterisk that as well. I feel like that's like a. You never see anyone use a Zatu. I feel like I used it once. When I was a kid, playing through some game, but I don't remember what game it was. But it wasn't as memorable as that grappler. Let me tell you what. Um, so we have a lady Zatu here. I think I'm going to call her Nina. Nina, take your ass to the PZ. 
Take your ass to the PC. Dragon's Den ahead. No, only chosen trainers may train here. Please leave. I will fuck you too. Well, I don't think we're going to be diving into a gym battle tonight. Should we dip our piggies in? Should we dip our piggies into the gym and see what's happening? Yo, champ in the making. It's been a long journey, but we're almost done. Count on me. Claire uses the mythical and sacred dragon type Pokemon. You can't damage them very easily, but you know, they're supposed to be weak against ice type moves. Alright, bro. I'm gonna st st stick my piggies in this lava. Show me what level you are, bro. Preschooler Alex. You got a level 44 Doug Trio. Ooh, wow. Um, Rama, come here. We're not losing anyone else to magnitudes. Ooh, a Steelix. Wow, 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 wow. A Steelix. Uh, what do we do against this Steelix? Wow, 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 wow. What do we do against this Steelix? I'm gonna confuse Ray it. Didn't affect the Steelix. He clicked slam. Oh, I don't like this. And we missed because of the fucking Xan attack. Um. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I really, really, really wish I really, really wish that you would stop clicking slam. Like, what the fuck? Okay. Xavier. Oh, what the fuck? Oh my goodness. Yeah, we should not do a gym battle tonight. Doesn't affect the enemy Steelix. Why can't I put him to sleep? Thank you. <laughs> Um, he hasn't used a. There we go. <laughs> I was gonna say he hasn't used a ground type move yet. All I've seen him use is sandstorm and slam. Jesus. Get rid of this Flareon. Get it out of here. Get it out of here. I'm a dog person. Um, okay, so level 44. He had 44. Um, I think for the next episode, I'm gonna get. Definitely, we're gonna get Julian leveled up. And I kind of want to take on Claire with a team of 45s. I'm not going to lie. But I feel like she's going to have like a 52 or something like that. So I think I'm going to grind. I'm going to say this. I'm going to start the next episode with a team of 46s. Whatever grinding we get in the episode, like in the gym here, whatever, that, that'll just be a part of it. But I'm going to, no. Because I don't like that either. That's really underleveled. But, like, I don't want to get leveled up and then just stomp all over her gym. Um. 48. Team of 48s. 248s. 246s. 256s. 250s. 250s. 248s. 246s. 250s. 249s. 248s. I don't know. But, anyways, we'll figure it out. Let me know what you guys think. Should Winston rejoin the squad? Should we keep Julian on the squad? And what levels do you think we should train to? This is the squad moving forward in tonight's episode. Um, I have faith. <laughs> For the most part, I have faith that we will do well. Um, I think so. Uh, as much as I know Xavier is first here, I really kind of want Sauron to get some experience next. I don't really know why I did 46 for Sauron. I guess I was thinking maybe he's like well-rounded enough. I mean, I know he's kind of frail and whatnot, but he's kind of speedy. You know, for his level, I think he can still hold up a, a fight on his own without having to worry about too much. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So I'm just going to make a big old guess that we're never gonna get behind these boulders so they need to be dumped and dropped in here ASA Ooh, I'm kind of excited this is so nostalgic you know I just have like little flashes moments in time and memory 
where it's like I remember where I was doing this all these years ago and holy freak let's uh oh you went for the rain bro you went for the rain let's chill with that real quick bite I need you to chill with that I wish I had sled bomb or something damn that's all you had I'm gonna say I wish I had sludge bomb or something anything other than just acid um, let's double check here. Let's double check here. Let's double check here. Um, I'm gonna teach you Whirlpool. Maybe I shouldn't teach you anything just yet. <laughs> I'm gonna have to teach you Whirlpool. Fuck. Um, Hydro Pump Thieves Hand Attack, Hypnosis Water Gun. We have two Psychic TMs. Oh my god, what fucking level does Hypno? Oh my god. I have to look it up. What level does Hypno learn Psychic? Uh, no wait, I'm doing this wrong. I have to know right now because if, if for whatever reason, my information is incorrect, <laughs> then I would just teach him to him now. You know what I mean? I hate, 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 hate how they do this. My website is different on mobile. Don't do that to me. Just load it up like normal. Just load it up like normal. You don't have the same stuff available when you do that. And then you end up wasting extra time in my fucking YouTube videos when I want to look shit up. Come on now, why are you like that? There we go. So in Generation 2, he learns Psychic at level 49. So, as much as I want him to have Psychic, I don't think I'm going to teach you Psychic just yet, bro. When you're going to learn it in three levels. Um, so, uh, what, what the, what the, what the fuck, what the fuck is happening here? Okay, so I'm gonna push that one into there. So, this boulder needs to be pushed up to here. So, to this one, we need to move. Right? I'm not gonna speed up on this one. <laughs> We're not gonna speed up on this one. Just take it on up there. There you go. Cha-cha-cha. Perfect. Just like that. Alright, bro. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Come here. Send out this Pokemon. Oh, bro, bro, chill, chill, chill. Now, I know you ain't got no Earthquake. So, go ahead and get up out of here. You think this Surf will kill this right on? <laughs> Do you think? Do you think this Surf will kill this right on? Yo, whoa, it's kind of crazy. We don't have anything on our team for water types. Dark Fire, Psychic. Poison flying, normal, rock ground, water poison. Julian would be the best thing, but uh... damn. Um. Well, yep. That's about it. I'm gonna put that barrier up. Oh my goodness, we're getting critical hits. Wait, time out. Hold up. Wait a minute. Take a moment, my watch says. Just take a moment with this slash. Take a moment. My speed sharply fell, bro. Chill. Can I put up double barriers? Holy fuck. Water types are what now really screws our team over and now we encounter over 48 blastos and a 46 for alligator those are the only two water starters in this game <laughs> claire's gonna have a fucking <laughs> she's gonna have a swampert before everyone else like, what the fuck how the hell she get that are we already at claire whoa 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 hey shout the fuck out to sauron finally being able to go first jesus christ oh 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 not a glare this yet. Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. I know what you're about to do. Whoa, that high jump kick was a critical hit. Jimmy Cricket, yeah, keep going and crash. That's all the damage that he did to himself with that kick. So I'm telling you, we don't have anything for water types. This is a problem. This is a problem. This is this is a problem. This is a problem. This is this is the problem. This is the problem. This is a problem. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Okay, so I'm only spamming hyper potions like this because I don't really want to leave the gym and have to come back and redo all this shit all over again. You know, we made it here. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey, how you doing? How you doing, Claire? All right, I'm going to save my game because only you 
can prevent loss of data. So, oh shit, no wait, I wanted to, I wanted to save state too before I start talking to her shit. I am Claire, the world's best dragon master. I can hold my own against even the Pokemon League's Elite Four. Do you still want to take me on? Fine, let's do it. As a gym leader, I will use my full power against any opponent. See, she can hold her own against the Pokemon League's Elite Four, but you know she didn't say champion. Means Lance stays whooping that ass, Ranger Thomas. But that's okay. I still love you. She's still one of my favorites. I don't mind her. So she has four Pokemon. And she leads with a level 48 C King. Wow, 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 wow. Should have gone to 50 all the way across the board. Didn't really mean to lead with Sauron as well. Um, also, just want to mention again how I said that water types really kind of screw us over. Uh, and you know, no matter how long it goes, that's the one piece of Pokemon fact I will never forget. Waterfall's a Gen 1 move, and Sea King gets it, gets it by level up. Don't ask me why. They took it from a level up move to a uh, HM, I guess, just out of necessity. You know, we want to add something new to the game, and... Well, what if we had people go up Waterfall? We already have a move named Waterfall! Well, let's act like it didn't ever happen. <laughs> Can you not flail on me? Damn. I'm sitting here whooping your ass and that's what you decide to do? Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do me like that either. Come on, come on, come on. Alright, Ranger Thomas. Send out that right you. Look at this thick ass mouse. Whoever's kitchen he's living in, he is eating good. Hoo 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 hoo. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do this. 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 Let me see. Can I just replace Hypno in this text with Right on? Right on. We learned. Oh my god. We don't learn Earthquake until level 60 fucking 5. We have another 15 levels before we learn Earthquake. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. I mean, I can't be mad. Earthquake is a great, 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 phenomenal move. I can't be upset with it. Okay, sure. Make us wait that long. Uh, Flareon, level 52 Flareon. Is this your ace? Is this your ace? Is it your ace, buddy? Is it your ace? I think I'm going to stomp you, too. Oh, you're spooking me. Judy, I know you can take this. I know you can take this. You might not have the best special defense in the world, but I know you can eat up that flames. Oh, that was a critical hit. All right. Oh, and we're burned. Oh my god, Judy with the critical hit. Fuck it up, Judy, fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up, Judy, fuck it up, fuck it up. Um, I'm with Almighty Brick Piece watching over us, there is no way. No way, no way, no way. You know, I just got rid of a fucking burn was it a burn bear or an ice bear? I can't remember. But we need to start buying full heals. God damn it. I'm saving that soft sand for you too, Judy. Um. Well, okay, this is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to say, I know you're just going to keep spamming flamethrower. So, Julian, come on out. Let this Flareon do its thing with its little flamethrower. Let, let it do a little thing. Let it, let, let, let it do its little thing. Let it do its little, 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 little thing. Man. Go ahead, do your little thing. Larry, do your little thing. Click flamethrower. I mean, I know. I like flamethrower. I like clicking flamethrower. Whoa. Can we just point out how that Flareon lived a surf? From Julian's? God damn. Damn. But would it have lived a surf? <laughs> from Winston that is the question and I'm not taking any more risks I think even if he were to have exploded or whatever then we still would have definitely lived light screen set up your light screen set up your light screen my fissure is never gonna land but I'm still gonna click it okay enough with the burn get this thing out of here Electrode flinched. Did I get that quick claw? Was that that quick claw that I just saw? Damn, Judy. Even burned. Judy is not playing no fucking games. She is like a lunch lady ready to go. You gonna eat what she gonna serve. 
and that's all you gonna have whether you like it or not I lost I don't believe it there must be some mistake uh, that was about it. I should have sent that lady Ramla. Did wasn't that lady Ramla in that match? Did we get the I'm in the coin bonus? I won't admit this. I may have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I know. You should take the Dragon User Challenge. Behind this gym is a place called Dragon's Dim. There is a small shrine at its center. Go there. If you can prove that you've lost your lazy ideals, I will recognize you as a trainer worthy of a gym badge. Didn't even make any sense. All right. Just pout. <laughs> That's fine. That doesn't make any sense. How am I a trainer who has lazy idea? I just whooped your ass. Like, in entirety. And you want me to go back here and take on another challenge? I wonder if they did that because her ace is so low in the first game. <laughs> uh, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Um. Okay, <laughs> dragons and it is. So we did get a encounter here in Blackthorn City in last night's episode, but now Jackass number 101 here is moved out of the way. If Claire allows it, her grandfather, our master will also. You may enter. That was probably like the loudest thing I've said all night. Wow, we gotta tone it down. What the fuck? You, how dare you enter uninvited? I was not uninvited. It's not that I wasn't invited. I was told to come here. So what do you mean? Uninvited. Yo, don't go for no stupid shit. Oh my god, you went for the stupid shit. Okay. Judy. Judy, come help. Judy, come help. I wonder if that Dom fan knows Earthquake. <laughs> yikes, 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 yikes. Okay, it's kind of weird because now I feel under-leveled in this entire gym. Isn't there a rival battle in here? Flower mail. Oh, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah, that flower mail. Isn't there a rival battle in here or something like that? I feel like there is. You shouldn't be in here. Get this vile plume out of here. Got plenty of experience whooping vile plume ass from Rachel. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. I meant to flame. Why did I flame Thor? Fuck. But you know what? I meant to do this when we first walked in. But we need a, another entry from our Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom book. We've been going through Chapter 1 Self-Empowerment um, every night here on Late Night Crystal. And we are nearing the end of Chapter 1 Self-Empowerment. Um, but tonight's quote is, I believe probably the most important single thing beyond discipline is any artistic work Whoa, I read that entirely wrong. I believe probably the most important single thing beyond discipline in any artistic work is to dare. I believe probably the most important single thing beyond discipline in any artistic work is to dare. And I think that that's so true. Because if you aren't being daring, if you aren't pushing the boundaries, then... I don't think that you are really, I don't know. I don't want to say you're not being artistic because you could, you know, just in the word itself. Wait, is that like light ball for Pikachu? <laughs> um, you know, you could be artistic without being revolutionary. Did they both have fucking parasex? You know what I mean? So it's not like I'm sitting here saying like, oh, you can't be artistic or whatever, but I'm just saying, um, it resonates with me because you know we just launched our cracked egg lock which for us that's brand new that's daring here on the channel but i do want to thank you guys for all the support i know a lot of you guys that keep up and support late night crystal are also excited and have sent in eggs for the cracked egg lock and my goodness what a fucking name that series has pokemon blaze black 2 redux cracked egg lock with nappy <laughs> jesus christ all right, who wants to learn Whirlpool so we can get through here? I get our goddamn gym badge. Julian, step up, be my guest. I'm gonna have to get rid of Bubble Beam as much as I am a part of the Bubble Beam gang. Bro, 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 bro. Yes, use Whirlpool, damn it. So now, 
we can go get Lugia. Right? I thought there was a rival battle here. No? Did they change that? Is that only in like uh, remakes or whatever? Another charcoal. Wow. Um, but yes, be daring in all creative things that you do. The um, other end of that coin that I wanted to mention. Isn't that weird? Interrupting myself. Isn't the dragon fang normally here in Dragon's Den? Is it normally there as well? And is this our first encounter? I didn't encounter anything yet, did I? Oh, I encountered this fucking wiggly tuff just a moment ago and I ran from it. Fuck. Wait a minute, 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 wait a minute. Just to double check. Kingler, Rhydon, right Macargo, Mankey, Jermillion, Whooper, Bellsprouts, and Flora, Crobat, Goldbat, Houndoom, Elicate, Crookin' Out, uh, Teddy Ursa, Onyx, Ivysaur, Gyarados, Dragonair, Mr. Mime, Syndicate, Snorlax, Drowsy, Diglett, Magmar, Suwoodle, Tentacle, Ekans, Oddish, Krabby, Zatu. Don't have a Jigglypuff or a Wigglytuff, so we just blew our fucking encounter. It's crazy. Talking about the Egglock, I did the fucking, blew the first encounter in that too. Jesus Christ. Are those supposed to be Charizards and Dragonites on the wall back there? Because the the two on the side, like the one in the middle obviously looks like a Charizard, but that could, the, the two next to it could either be a Dragonite or it kind of looks like a Mewtwo as well. Anyway, Dragon's Den, Dragonite. Hmm, good to see you here. No need to explain why you came. Claire sent you here, didn't she? That girl is a handful. I am sorry, but I must test you. Not to worry, you are to answer only a few questions. Ready, what are Pokemon to you? Friend. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battles? Um. Raising? Strat strategy? Oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to battle? Um. What is the right answer here? Well, not weakened person, tough person. Oh, I understand. What is most important for raising Pokemon? Love. Oh, I understand. Strong Pokemon. Weak Pokemon, which is more important? Both, bro. Hmm, I see. You cut deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. Nappy, don't lose that belief. I will see, it will see you through at the Pokemon League. Come on, player. So, how did it go? I guess there's no point in asking. You did fail. <gasps> what? You passed? That can't be. You're lying. Even I haven't been approved. Dang, girl, it's okay. Correct. This child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and confer the rising badge. Or must I inform Lance of this? Yeah, she's scared of Lance. I, I, I understand. Here, this is the rising badge. Hurry up, take it. Thank you, girl. Rising Badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon Pokemon will recognize you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Kra, reflect upon what it is that you lack and this child has. Damn. Shit. You ain't gotta be rude. Thanks, bro. Can we chill next to each other just for a moment? Mm. Hands behind our back. Um, but unpin, the thing I was gonna mention um, about the Maya Angelou quote is um, not only the point I made earlier, but I was going to mention the aspect of creativity in and of itself. You know, when you are uh, any artistic work, you know, you're creating art, creativity and art in and of itself is not just limited to just the traditional aspects of what you expect. You know, I feel like I'm a very incredibly creative person. And, you know, super duper tiny little um, behind the scenes for the Top 5 series. A couple years ago, I was working on Top 5 Psychic. Um, I think I mentioned that at the time. And, you know, I still have so many, um, so much footage from that for Top 5 Psychic that I'm sure I could use again. Uh, but anyways, I spoke with this lady who read my chakras and she said that my 
creative cores like all like I, I can't remember ex exactly the um yo fun fact she actually gave me this fucking pen the one that you see me using with the light on it Ooh, she gave me this shit i was like whoa that's the dopest pen ever like do you want me to pay you for this like <laughs> she's like no 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 just keep it um but she was saying that my the creative cores or something is just overflowing creativity and in all honesty i feel it like to me creating youtube content it allows me to be creative does that mean that that's the only thing that i could ever do in life that would allow me to express my creativity no but i'm also a gamer and this allows me to do both so i think i've had a lot of really good crazy creative ideas over the years and I'm even more excited to see what's to come. I mean, just look at this. We just started uploading again and we have brand new late night series. Like, what the fuck? I just wanted to play Pokemon Yellow. <laughs> I'm sorry about this. Here, take this as my apology. TM24, do we know, do we know, do we know? I'm not looking at it, I'm not looking at it, I'm not looking at it. TM24 is, we don't know, we don't know. That contains substitute, well. Well, well, we have the TM for substitute now. Aren't you guys happy and glad TM for substitute? Well, if you don't want it, you don't have to take it. What's the matter? Aren't you going to the Pokemon League? Do you know how to get there? From here, go to Newbark Town, then surf east of Pokemon League. The route there is very tough. Don't you dare lose at the Pokemon League. If you do, I'll feel even worse about having lost to you. Give it everything you've got. Will do, Claire. Thank you. Hey, bro. Mm, good to see you here. Your arrival is most fortunate. I have something for you. Take this Dratini as proof that I have recognized your worth. Yeah, bitch. I was going to say, I thought I remember that homeboy gave up a Dratini. Wasn't there a rival battle down here? Or is that only in Heart Gold, Soul Silver? That's only in the remakes? Is that only in the remakes? That might only be in the remakes. Okay, well, we got to come back up in this bitch. We got to bring our ass back in here. Um, because I want that Dratini. Whoa, 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 whoa! Professor Rachel, I have something here for you. Could you swing by my lab? See you later. Is this where he gives you the Master Ball? Do you normally get the Master Ball from Elm now? Or does he give you the... Oh no, that's that can't be until later. Oh, I don't know. I think this is where he gives you the Master Ball. Because now can't you go and catch Lugia? Or, no, 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 somebody left a comment, um, and, uh, they were saying that Lugia's post-game, you have to get the silver wing from some guy in Pewter City, or something like that. Okay, I'm gonna deposit Julian just for a quick, nope, 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 we're going to withdraw Julian. <laughs> we're gonna deposit Sauron really quickly, can't deposit Julian, he's how we get there. So, okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Chill, chill, chill. Um, but yeah, so we can't do that. Um, I don't know if it's Ho-Oh. Can we do Ho-Oh now? Um, I don't know entirely the story of Sweet Queen off the top of my head. Um, I think a majority of whatever we have to do next. Um, I know that before I had a little miniature list jotted down. Dragon Shrine. So this is like the Dragon Pit in Game of Thrones in here, basically. <laughs> Wait, is there anything up here? I feel like I explored every single other side of the cave but up here. It just goes up to where the item was. Damn, that sucks. Man, there's like no dragon's den. This is a wiggly tuff with the occasional scyther's den. <laughs> I say that now it's nothing but scyther. Holy shit. Um, but anyways, the only um, go back list that I've had so far. Um, oh, never mind. I got rid of it. I guess the uh, go back stuff wasn't important. I remember the the Omastar piece of mail, um, but I feel like there's got to be a few more things that I'm missing out on. So if you guys know for a fact, if you've been following along, and it's like, yeah, you could do this now, or you should go do this now. Now is the, this is the episode. Leave it in the description below because next episode I pretty much want to make it to the Pokemon League because I know that. There are no trainers in the Gen 2 Victory Road. You just fight the rival at the end. Um, so I want to be able to knock out all those type, all those loose ends, hop, skip, jump over to Kanto. 
and <laughs> make our way to the Pokemon League because this is episode 18. So that would mean episode, yeah, one more, episode 18 is going up on the 18th. Wow. Uh, well, it might be the 19th for some of you guys watching, but uh, it's not the 19th till you wake up, bitch. Um, but anyways, yeah, that means episode 20 will be our hour of power. We can do the Pokemon League. So, bada bing, bada boom. Mm, good to see you here. Your arrival is most fortunate. Can you give a nickname to the Persian that you received? So, normally it's a Dratini. This time we got a Persian. What are we going to name this here, Persian? You know, I'm not mad about it. Actually not. Um, I kind of wish that we would have gotten the... Persian in Late Night Yellow, because that would have been a lot better. But I'm going to name this... Persian Vivian. <laughs> I'm gonna name this Persian Vivian. Bada bing, bada boom. Dragon Pokemon are symbolic of our clan. You have shown that you can be entrusted with one. Okay. So, as long as my memory serves me correctly, which as of late, it has somewhat decided to, you know, just choose which days it wants to work. Um, but I'm pretty sure that we have one more encounter that we could make right now, at the very least. And it's on the route south of Blackthorn City. Professor Elm wants us to go to Newbark Town. Everybody wants us to go to Newbark Town. I figure at the very least we can head to Newbark Town. But first, let's check out Vivian, our level 15 Persian. With Scratch, Growl, and Bite. <laughs> okay. I mean, uh, I'm not going to lie. I kind of would have preferred a... Uh... Oh, my body's all fucked up now. I kind of would have preferred a Dratini. But you know what? We have a Dragonair in the PC. So, who's crying? Beggars can't be choosers. Alright. We got our situation handled. We got it taken care of. Hold on, let me go to this mart here. Wait, I need to sell this pearl too. We got so much shit going on. Damn, look at all this money. I'm gonna buy some full heels. <laughs> Cause you know we need that. And I'm gonna buy some hyper potions. Cause you know we always need that. I'm gonna buy some ultra balls. Because you never know what we might encounter right now. Bada bing, bada boom. I just spent so much fucking money. Why did I just spend so much money? Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going to deposit. I'm holding on to that soft sand. Flower mail, light ball, charcoal, dragon fang. Uh, antidote, paralyze heal. Antidote, paralyze heal, awakening. Ice heal. Cures all status problems. Bitter. Put that in there too. Why not? Energy root. Put that in there too. Why not? We got plenty of full heals. We got plenty of everything we need. And at the end of the day, we are guided by the brick piece. The almighty brick piece. Okay. Anyways. Uh, we got our eighth badge, you guys. Hot damn. Hot fucking damn. Isn't this the... Uh move to lead ourselves oh might come back there get you to get rid of that whirlpool um i was gonna say do we need whirlpool anymore but yes we do need whirlpool to get to lugia if i mean we'll see what ends up happening but route 45 is next and i do not think we got an encounter here before this is dark cave no okay no all right fuck that place all right route 45 will you give us a grand encounter survey says it's a butterfree now, if I'm not mistaken, didn't I say Butterfree when I went over all these Pokemon? Oh my god, there's no Butterfree. There's no Butterfree. Oh my god, there's no Butterfree. Bellsprout, that's probably what I was thinking of. Well, looks like we're about to catch a Butterfree. God damn. Come on, Power in the PC. I know that's where you're trying to be. Come on, power in the PC. I know that's where you're trying to be. Okay, look at that. <laughs> I'm just going to name this thing uh, PC. Why not? But I want it to be like one name, PC, you know? 
<laughs> um, so I kind of okay pearl just sold a pearl gonna sell that pearl too. I kind of dislike this route. I'm not gonna say I hate it because I hate such a strong word. But look at Biker Bob here. Biker Bob, what are you doing out here, buddy? What are you doing out here? Get that out of here. Because in order to do everything and experience, oh, I wish I would have got that jinx. In order to do everything and see everything, like I want to battle that guy, but I, you're telling me I gotta go back up there. Ugh. I want to battle this guy, but you're telling me I gotta go back up there. Okay, Lady Ramla, escort us. We're gonna do it because this guy is just chilling here, and we can get past him. We can get past him. And then I'm going to continue down because these two paths connect, obviously. These two paths connect where we just were. Then I can, I guess, clear out this side for the most part. And then I have to go back to Blackthorn and go battle that guy. Oh, did we just find leftovers? Holy shit. Who do we give leftovers to? I would love to give them to Judy, but Judy just... Do we give it to Xavier? Once he learns Psychic, I'm going to give him the leftovers and he will not die. He will not die ever 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 and can we just point out we have made a b team again i would say probably lady ramla is the only one here that's not traditionally b team and i mean i don't know i guess in competitive everything is a bit different a lot of them have different roles to play but i more so meant for like just in you know i'm not playing with this shit Get this fortress out of here. Uh-uh. I just meant more so in like Nuzlocke and playing through games. You know, you don't always see people choose this Pokemon or that Pokemon. Oh my god, they split the path again. I need to battle that guy up there though. Ooh, a piece of candy. There's a guy down here. What the fuck? Okay, so we're going to take the left path to go right all the way down. Oh, this guy don't even want to fight? Oh, he does. What the? What the? I just walked right past this dude. What the shit? Oh, hello, Mr. Moltres. How you doing? How you doing? We can't land that fissure because it's a flying type? That's all right. That's all right. Oh, my God. There's so many people over here. Fucking battle. Why is this plaid? path split like this i mean i guess i get it like you're coming down the mountain but still it's like what the fuck get that sneasel out of here i just honestly want to make sure i don't miss any items more so than anything else but we definitely need to make at least one more oh route 46 is this a new encounter oh it's not here god damn it Route 45, Route 46. It is a different route. Let's start Cave 2. What the fuck? We might need to get Flash and go up in that bitch. No, oh, this route is huge. What the fuck? This is Route 45 again, but it ends down there. Okay. Oh, lots of exploring to do. This is like tripping me out a little bit. What the fuck? Route 46, are there any, I mean, not any trainers, are there any grass patches on this route? Let me talk to you, are there any grass patches on this route? Get your level 21's out of here. Surf mail, thanks for it. Oh, oh, oh. Grass patch. Okay, it's a level three. You can't evolve either, fuck. Um, okay. Can I move these things around? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna move this down here because I feel like at any moment now, I'm going to accidentally click. <laughs> and the last time I clicked on a Master Ball, it was most definitely not on accident. I can tell you that much. Um. Okay, just scared me for a moment. Thought we already had a Togepi. But now we have a Togedi, the happiness Pokemon. Although it does not flap its wings very much, it can stay up in the air as it tags along after its trainer. I'm gonna name this Togedic. I'm gonna name it. 
Hmm. Wendy. Wendy. Which is kind of weird because normally I name my um, golems Wendy. And they kind of have a golem in Pokemon Go named Wendy or some shit. But look at this. Okay. We made it all the way down. It's a lot farther than I thought it was to be fair. But we're going to make one more pass just to be safe, just to be sure. I think I already fucked it up. We were supposed to go to the left, weren't we? Or did we already fight that guy? I think we were supposed to go to the left. But then I said, yeah, we were supposed to go left and then to the right. All the way down. Well, we got one more buddy to fight then. We gotta go back up there and fight him one more time. They're just assholes splitting this path like this. I bet you there's some item over there. But I mean, we did just say we gotta go back, so... Hold up, hold the phone. Hold up. Um, you know, we have a fucking rare candy. I could've just got a psychic on him already. Oh, this is where we were at with the homeboy. Okay, okay, okay. We're doing great, we're doing great. We're doing excellent work. Oh, look at this little fishing spot down here. Oh, that's so nice. What's down here? What y'all got down here? Show me, tell me. I guess it's fishing only. Okay, well, Route 46, Dark Cave, how you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Um, I'm gonna be honest with you, I wanna go fight that guy. <laughs> just because I can. I really wanna go fight that guy. Look at this just free chip experience. We're just trading. Let's just. I'm just training, bro. You don't want to let me train? You got one more battle with our names on it? You, you won't let me train? You, won't, you don't want to let me train? Okay, no speed up. Because speed up is what made me miss it the first time. Or the last time. Which means we could have made it through here. Um, But, you know, I really... Actually, I really do kind of want to put Flash on and go into Dark Cave. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I got one more confusion just for you. Oh, come on, bro. Level 49, we're right here. Can I get one Pokemon, please? Oh, fuck. Excellent. Excellent work. You know, I really did not want to have a 45-minute episode tonight. I was actually thinking about cutting a little bit short, but I was like, no, maybe I shouldn't. Hypnosis, Confusion, Headbutt, Poison Gat. I mean, Psychic only has 10 HP, though. I mean, 10 PP. Confusion has 50. I mean, <sighs> 20 or 30 or something like that. Um, I almost never click poison gas, but I really do like having the option. Hypnosis I've been using a lot. I'm just gonna get rid of confusion. Fuck it. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Check it out. Tauros is gone. Get him out of here. Completely in entirety. But I think with that, we have gotten our encounters. We have gotten our eighth badge. We cleared Dragon's Den. We got that static encounter as well so as i mentioned earlier please 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 let me know if there's anything that you know that we have not done or we have missed out on didn't go back and get let me know in the comment section below oh, it seems like chartreuse was just yesterday god damn rachel nappy it's rachel got time to chat would you be my practice partner again sometime i'll be waiting on route 34 could you take it a little easier on me next time bye let's chat again Rachel, 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 Rachel. Okay, so anyways, we need to Spelunk in Dark Cave, and I don't know if I really want to go through this entrance, or should we go through the one down at the start? I feel like, no, I feel like it's made like a mountain, like it goes down, so I feel like we should go in here, and we'll encounter those other entrances. Um, but anyways, this is why Hiccup is here. So hit that flash, Hiccup. Hit that flash. I want to see what we got in here. I want to see what we got in here. It has been so long since I have ever taken the time out to even think about Dark Cave. <laughs> I don't think I've explored Dark Cave ever in a playthrough or a Nuzlocke here on the channel. Oh, and I guess I should, because goddamn, they have wild Lugias in this bitch. Um, 
Mount Mortar had a ton of wild encounters. I think Mount Mortar had um, Lugia, Ho-Oh, Tyranitar, Dragonite. It had like everything. I was like, what the fuck? Our Mount Mortar encounter was like a wheel or something. <laughs> it wasn't, but it wasn't that good. Like, Jesus, what? Um, speaking of spelunking, I have fallen into this like... Actually, yes, I want to search. Yeah, there's land over here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. One thing at a time. Um, is this what I think it is? I keep getting interrupted by this haunting cave. TM26, we do not know what it is. Could this be the missing TM for Julian the Tentacruel? Survey says... And by the way, in the last episode, Ellen gave us a Master Ball too. In the last episode, in the lost episode, <laughs> whatever. Um, TM26 is Amnesia. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Who's coding this? <laughs> Whose decision was it? Randomize the fucking TMs. Anyway, speaking of spelunking, I have fallen... Um, down a interesting hole <laughs> no pun intended um i don't know uh, around the time that i started uploading again i started really getting into like video essays on youtube um and i don't know it's just kind of grown from like one topic to another like related video to related video um and one of the video essays uh, which i mean i guess you could use that term who the fuck is that dude I guess you could use that term to describe a lot of different things, but I mean like more, much more formal video essays. Like you can tell, like they have chapters and like you can tell it's written like an essay. You know I mean? But um, anyways, one of the related videos on one of them was about like caving incidents and accidents and whatnot. And I'm just gonna tell you right now, I would never ever in my life. Who the fuck is this dude? Whoa. Is he a gambler? I mean, a burglar? You startled me there. I had my <laughs> black glasses on, so I didn't notice you at all. What am I doing here? Hey, don't you worry about it. I'll give you a pair of black glasses, so forget you saw me, okay? Oh, are you fucking kidding me? What the fuck? Ah, back is full. <sighs> Who told you to be full? Smoke ball? Who told you I needed to smoke ball? Nugget, surf mail, focus band, experience share, I need to sell all this shit. Poison cure berry, we have full heals. Oh, and I know you saw that. I forgot to tell you guys what I found inside the mountain. <laughs> You'll never believe what I found inside the mountain. Mount Mortar, I mean. A gorgeous box. A gorgeous box. The brick piece has brought us a gorgeous box. Open it and see what's inside. I don't know what's inside. Does it use? Is that how you open it? Do I open it? Do I open the gorgeous box? Anyways, never ever ever, never would I ever 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 go actually like cave exploring or spelunking or any of that shit i have homework for you guys go look up um the sand cave story the nutty putty story i watched one about these people that were like i don't know like scientists or something and they went black glasses power up the power duck that moves <laughs> they went scuba because, you know, of course, there's underwater caves, too. So they had people talking about these underwater caves. And there's all different stories in different parts of the world. But this one, it was these scientists doing this research on underwater caves in icebergs. <laughs> I mean, it sounds pretty badass, but it's not something that I would ever want to be around, ever. If I can find that video... Um, I will link that but my homework is I'm gonna link all three of those videos in the comment 
in the comments in the description and I want you guys to check them out um, and if you've ever done any sort of caving or anything like that like what the fuck let me know what your experience is let me know what your what the, what the thrill of it is you know like what what uh, I don't know I don't know I, I'm not gonna say that I'm claustrophobic Ooh, where are we? Where are we? Where are we? I'm not gonna say that I'm claustrophobic, but I am. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Can you rock smash in this fucking cave? You've already asked me for flash, and now you want me to use fucking rock smash? <sighs> oh. Oh, but you know, we knew they had Zapdos. Never mind. Level two. Um, but yes, let me know. Uh, what's your thoughts and experience on it is uh, I'm not gonna say I'm claustrophobic because I, 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 I've never been like officially diagnosed as that but um, is this the original cavern like the one by uh, Violet City but I definitely do get anxiety in tight spaces and tiny tiny spaces not like to the point that I'm like I would have an anxiety attack or anything like that but who knows if I was in a situation like that like caving because, you know, these people, they go through, like, openings that, like, you have to... Some of the openings are so small that you have to exhale to squeeze through into the next cavern. And I'm like... Uh... No. <laughs> this paralyzed heal, you gotta go. We go for you. Like, just no like there's just no like i'm sorry i just can't like i just can't i can't do that is this violet city route 31 dark cave i believe it is all right excuse me we're not done we gotta go dive back in but yeah i i, I just can't i just could not do something like that <laughs> i mean i like listening to stories about it i like reading about it um, but that in and of itself, I just can't. So yeah, check out those videos. I mean, if you don't want to, then you know, if I can have to, but um, who are we gonna get that can learn Rock Smash? Do we have anyone that knows Rock Smash? I guess we're about to find out. We didn't even have Rock Smash? Where the fuck do you get Rock Smash? How do we not get Rock Smash? you get rock smash hold on <laughs> you know that's one of those things that's like I don't know I guess you just never think about it oh it's a TM huh So, I think we've actually talked to that guy that gives out Rock Smash because we have TM08, <laughs> which is Rock Smash. So, unless we have, we have Lovely Kiss, Swagger, Wing Attack, Psychic, Water Gun, Hypnosis, Giga Drain, Sand Attack, Thief, Substitute, Sacrifice, Fire, Amnesia, Hydro Pump, Flame Wheel, Boomerang. Kinesis, Fissure, Stun Spore, Confusion, Sharpen, Mirror Move, Spore, Milk Drink, Slash, Steel Wing, and Rest. Are the only TMs that we've discovered so far. So, to finish exploring, to finish spelunking Dark Cave, I mean, I don't really know what's on the other side there. It looks like it's a pretty decent size room. Um, but what if that's a... Uh... Oh, we can't. Oh, we have to go out the other way. Um, what if that's just a... Uh... What if that's just like uh, the other entrance that we saw down here? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold up, wait a minute. You're not pulling a fast one on me, buddy. I'm not letting it happen. You're not pulling a fast one on me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Pardon me. I don't want to speed up in this part because I know I'm going to speed past the part that I want to go to. But I know there's a dark cave entrance over here. Haha, uh -huh. isn't there another one down here or something? 
So does this lead to fuck more rock smash? What the fuck is back here? <laughs> Why should that be the TM for rock smash? Um, okay, so we can't get in through that side. There's not another entrance down here? Are you sure? Are you sure? I thought there was. No, there isn't. Oh. Okay then, well shit. Um, does Professor Elm have a computer in his lab I can use? Because I think if my math is correct, get me the fuck out of here. If my math is correct, I think the last thing we have to do is uh, saddle up and ride on up to Victory Road. Um, bro, for real? Oh, you ain't got no fucking PC, bro. Is this a PC? Observations of Pokemon Evolution. It says on the screen. Bro, you waste my time, bro. Now I gotta hop on the back of my... Crobat. Actually, I bet you that's not how it happens at all. <laughs> not with a Crobat. Surf, Waterfall, Whirlpool. Really hope we don't need Whirlpool. Wait. Y'all gotta go. Y'all gotta go. Because we need to welcome the B Squad V2 back onto the team. B Squad V2. Look at this goddamn Hypno. Who's using a Hypno? Nobody. You forgot that Pokemon even existed. Okay. So let me, just for the sake of, you know, wanting to be sure, let me take a generous. Oh, we need to go to the fucking Pokemon. It's a good thing I checked that out. Let me be sure there's nothing else that we need to. Why would we need to teach Psychic to... We don't. We don't. We don't. We don't. We don't. We don't. We absolutely don't. Boomerang for... I need something for... Oh, I really don't have that either. Fuck. I know I'm just rambling at this point, but I was thinking about Julian. I don't think we have anything that we can teach him. <laughs> but before we go into Victory Road, or before we head that way, we're going to clear out some of this nonsense in our bag. I don't know how we end up in this position all the time. Oh, I know how. It's because I click on everything. <laughs> or I try to. Max Revive? Come on. Whoever randomized this game didn't get the message. They don't realize what we're trying to do here. Get rid of this pearl. That can go as well. Okay. The brick piece? You can look, but don't touch. You can look, but don't touch. Does the PC have a limited amount of space? I'm gonna keep them leftover because you never know. I gotta hold on to that soft sand as well. Okay, 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 okay. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm liking how the. Hold on, let's put this up here real quick so we can uh, make sure to utilize it. Look at that, look at that. Let's put this ether up here as well. And you know what else? Swap them too. <laughs> okay, now we're good to go. Now we're ready to go. We can leave this land and get the frick up out of here. Route 29, whoa, whoa. Just tripped me out for a second. I thought that we were in New Bark Town and I turned left and started walking. I was like, what the fuck? Did we get a New Bark Town? Right, I mean. <laughs> Do we ever get a New Bark Town encounter? Do we fish? Did we ever get a New Bark Town encounter? Okay, you know, we're learning as we go. I guess I have to jot down where we got it from. Well, no, because in the next game, well, no, I guess it would still be good to have it, so. Um, but, I mean, on the off chance that we did not have this already, I have no issue with throwing a Master Ball at this. I mean, we have two. Gonna be honest with you. Hooked by a rod for lower-leveled Pokemon. You think I'm gonna catch this Mew with a level ball? 
Only thing I'm worried about is if it knows metronome. Damn, that was an ugly fucking Pokeball too. Cut that bitch in a level ball. What's the odds? We catch Mew in late night yellow and late night crystal. So what I'm gonna say is this. If we do have a new Bark Town encounter, then oh well. Mew's just not gonna get used. If we don't, then that's dope as shit. We have a Mew. <laughs> Why the fuck not? It's the new species Pokemon because it can learn any move. Some people begin research to see if it is the ancestor of all Pokemon. Um, I don't remember what we named Mewtwo or Mewtwo Mew in Late Night Yellow, but uh, this is gonna be my best guess, <laughs> and I hope it fits. Boom. So we have a Mew, and we didn't even use a Master Ball, which I'm actually kind of happy about because if that Mew does in fact end up being illegal, I would not want it to have wasted a Master Ball on it. And look at this, Route 27 encounter. Are you being for serious with me? Oh, bro. Hey, do you know what you just did? You're taking your first step into Kanto. Check your Poke Gear map and see. You know, it's so funny. <laughs> because people <laughs> have been asking since the beginning of the series. Nap, are you going to do Kanto? Are you going to do Kanto? Or are you just going to do Johto and end it after that? Which I'm guessing you're asking because we just did Late Night Yellow. But this is Late Night Crystal. And this is a part of Crystal. So of course we're gonna do this as well. And plus, this is gonna take half the time to play through. <laughs> so we're gonna knock this out in no time because I don't think the trainers get any harder than the Elite Four, the gym leaders do. Um, and on top of that, not only is this a part of Crystal, but you can't really say that you beat Crystal until you beat Red. So, yeah, we're gonna go fight Red. <laughs> Anyways, this is our first step into Kanto, and it's also our first night with the start of a new chapter in our Pocket Maya Angelou Wisdom book here. This chapter is called Love. So chapter one was self-empowerment, and now we have moved on to love, and our first quote, whoa, 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 whoa. If we lose love and self-respect for each other, this is how we finally die. If we lose love and self-respect for each other, this is how we finally die. Unless you're an NPC in this Pokemon game. Because then things are going to go quite badly for you. Um, but that's interesting because a lot of those video essays... Um, uh, touch on a lot of different drama moments um, between different issues um, the link between Kanto and Johto um, different issues like drama related issues in regards to like the topic at hand like you know like like I said it's a video essay so it's not just like okay here's the thing let's talk about the problem you know it talks about um, like oh, black hair and something else I'm going to toss out later so like in a proper video essay you'll have like the topic and then you'll have like all facets of that topic and all of the things that cause those facets of that topic and what's right and wrong or the issues and here and there and whatnot so um I don't remember the original point I was trying to make <laughs> like this sometimes it's late night crystal we just chilling vibing that's one thing i've definitely noticed as i've gotten older i'm tossing all this shit right now is my memory is just gone i'm gonna forget who i am by the time i'm <sighs> no Whoa, wow it's a huge waterfall oh wait a minute wait a minute Whirlpool. 
that you ain't couldn't learn. No, oh, I know there's gonna be so many comments from you guys saying, <laughs> what do you mean? Yes, he can learn it. What do you mean? Yes, he can learn it. And then this thing that can learn it. Is this my first encounter in this route? Is this actually my first encounter in this route? Because if it is, we have a crocodile. So it's species. Yeah, because all we caught was a Mew. I don't know. I think we encountered a Don fan too. I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know. I wasn't paying attention to that. This whole whirlpool shit got me fucked up. That's so annoying, Julian. Oh my god. I wonder if there's anybody. Yo, Tentacruel. Why can it not learn Waterfall? Make it make sense. How come you can't, like. Pound and transform. I was worried about metronome. Like, how come you can't just, like, skitter up the waterfall with your tentacles? Like, come on, bro. What the fuck? Alright, Magnolia, you're back on the squad. Well, not officially, but just for the moment, because we gotta scale this waterfall. Um, look, take us back here. God damn, what a waste of time. What a waste of time, what a waste of effort, what a waste of energy. I think I encountered that Don fan down there. Whoa, oh my god, Tojo Falls? Are you serious? Did I just barge in here just a moment ago and surf around and encounter a bunch of Pokemon and run from them? Maybe I shouldn't go to where are you off to with Pokemon? Pokemon League? Are your Pokemon loyal enough for you to win? Let me see. Are your Pokemon trust you very much? It's nice to see a good trainer here. Gift for your journey. TM37 happens to be Double Slap. It's for advanced trainers only. Use it if you dare. Good luck. Don't tell me it actually is. What the fuck did she just give us? 37. I was looking at 27, like, I don't have no fucking TM27, what the fuck? Oh my god, oh, I thought that was a PC, fuck. And homegirl over here. Oh, Tyranitar, I was really hoping that you would still have a Bulbasaur. Oh, what the fuck do I do to a Tyranitar? I lost my water type. Can I horn drill him? Thank you, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Can I horn drill him? Just need to stop him out. I liked your other team better, girly. I really did. Okay, I want to number one stop missing encounters. <laughs> Route 27. Tojo Falls. Route 27. So this is a new encounter. Yes. Right now. Oh, uh, okay, Don Fan again. Is it Route 27 on the other map too? <laughs> okay, that's gonna be the last one I run from. <laughs> I promise you this. I promise you this. I'm not giving up any more encounters. <laughs> I mean, it's okay. We have a lot. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot of power in the PC. So it's okay. We're not missing out on all that much. I think the few encounters that we have encountered we're not gonna miss out on that by any means um but i want to oh we need fucking whirlpool oh magnolia is fucking here never mind fuck yes i was gonna say i want to see what's back here 
Yo, I'm down to wipe all of these trainers. Sauron just needs the training. TM48 is Steel Wing. We got that one already. God damn. Isn't this a rare candy? Isn't that item like a rare candy or something? In regular crystal. Um, but anyways, I was gonna say earlier, it's I'm missing points, I'm forgetting shit. Uh not remembering waterfall versus whirlpool. It might be time for bed. Giggity goddamn, maybe I shouldn't take on uh, our rival. But who am I kidding? I really fucking want to. <laughs> this guy has a Blastoise, a Meganium, and then a Jinx. Why am I psychicking this Jinx? Maybe I shouldn't take on our rival tonight. Oh, Brick Piece, what shall we do? Oh, mighty Brick Piece, guide us. What shall we do it? In this time of need. But excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Pardon me, pardon me, pardon me. Route 26. What's up, bro? I'm feeling great today. I feel like I could even boot the League Champ. Probably why I embraced itself. Get the fuck out of here. Sauron is racking up experience. Look, Pokemon after Pokemon falling at his feet. Alright, Sauron, do the damn thing. Shit. Wait, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ooh, secret, secret. But why, though? Why, though? But why? It's just an alternate route? Wait, we don't have a Route 27 encounter. Okay, Route 27. Route 27, Route 27. Whatever it is, I'm catching it. Route 27. Wait a minute. Actually, I believe that is species because... We have a Persian named Vivian already. Who? Wow. I'm not catching that. I know I said I was, but I'm not catching that. I would love to use a jump off. I want to put jump off on my list as well. That's an asterisk, come on. Um, Pokemon Go got me in love with that Pokemon. Jump off is so fucking good. Like, it's just not fair sometimes. So, Meowth was our first encounter in this route. And now Raikou is our next encounter in this route. Um, I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna fucking do it. I'm just gonna fucking do it. Why would I not fucking do it? Like, what, what do you want me to do? <laughs> Look at them stars. You think it doesn't fit him? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Got a Mew and a Raikou in tonight's episode. Are you not entertained? <laughs> This rough Pokemon stores energy inside its body, then sweeps across the land, shooting off electricity. I think we will give a nickname to Raikou. I'm gonna name him... Reginald. We have Rochester and Reginald. He was sent to Bill's PC. I mean, I guess uh, we couldn't get a Lugia or a ho -Oh or a Tyranitar or a Dragonite like in the mother <laughs> area. So, I mean, at least we have a... Uh, look at that. Plenty of Raikou over here in this bush. But I know there was another path up there. Look at all this grass. Oh, look at the Mil Tank. I want to add Mil Tank to that list as well. Ariados, not so much. Not so much. Hello? There's something written here. Read it. To my brothers and sisters, we take pride in serving Pokemon trainers. When trainers talk to you, give them something useful. Love, Monica. Keep reading. Monday, Monica, Route 40. Tuesday, Tuscany, Route 29. Wednesday, Wesley, Lake of Rage. Thursday, Arthur, Route 36. Friday, Farida, Route 32. Saturday, Santos, Blackthorn City. Sunday, sunny Route 37. So wait, Monday, Route 40. So today is Monday. Where the fuck is Route 40 at? Can I, I, I can't swap. Oh, you're not going to show me places I haven't been yet? What the fuck? Well, I guess we're not getting to meet Monica tonight. 
because <laughs> I don't know where the fuck Route 40 is. This is a rest house. Your Pokemon look a little tired. You should rest them a while. There, your Pokemon are looking good. Keep at it. Um, I really just want access to a PC. Like, whoa, whoa, chill, bro, chill. Look at this Machamp. What a powerful ass fucking spray. Jiminy Cricket. Seismic Toss. Throw a whole globe at me. Get this Venusaur out of here. Grow all you want. <sighs> Don't believe this. She gave us 4,000 Pokebucks. That's because of Lady Ramla. Lady of the Reach. She got that Amulet coin. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What's up, bro? I don't give a fuck about this Raikou. I just caught one of them. Oh, chill. Chill, 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 chill. Chill with all that noise, bro. Chill. Chill with all that noise, bro. Whoa, whoa, chill. Yes, I am gonna go straight back here and heal again. <laughs> Act like I won't. Act like I won't. So, I know some of you guys have been watching House of the Dragon right along with me. I know you guys saw the season finale this past week or yesterday. What the fuck is the point? Murkrow? Am I on a new route? I don't think so. Uh, it was a pretty good finale. I'll say that much. It was alright. I don't think the show is necessarily living up to my own expectations, but I mean, that's subjective, so it's whatever. Um, but I mean, it's not like I'm by any means gonna stop watching. <laughs> You know, when season two kicks up, I'm going to be excited to watch it. Um, but regardless, it was pretty good. Um, Vagar freaking eating that little ass dragon. Oh, my Lord. <sighs> Giggity God damn. But still, it was great. I liked it. I liked it. I liked it. Let me know what you guys think. If you liked it or not. <laughs> Get him out of here. I have no choice but the Oko because we don't have Julian. You know, we need Julian here to do the damn thing. Can I even fly up here? A normal box? Open it and see what's inside. So now we have a brick. The brick piece has brought us a gorgeous box and a normal box. I feel like the gorgeous box is Ur. And the normal box is oh, I can't remember what his name is the two aliens from Aqua Teen Aqua Teen Hunger Force number one in the hood G um eight badges of Johto please go right on through thank you for not listing each of them out this time but I can't even we have to go through this without Julian what? but our first encounter is a slugma did we already catch a Slugma? Or a Macargo? I don't know if we did. Yeah, we did catch a Macargo, Stephanie. So sorry, buddy. Now joining this PC box. <laughs> but a Mantine? I don't think we caught one of those. I don't think we caught one of those, and I wouldn't mind catching it. Ooh, another one I want to add to the list. Got an asterisk. I think this is like six now that I said I want an asterisk. It swims along freely, eating things that swim into its mouth. Its whole body is very coarse. Sounds like my Pokedex description. <laughs> um, I'm going to name this thing Nelly. Because that's the first thing that popped into mind. It's not necessarily named after the rapper, just the name Nelly is the first thing that popped into mind. Um, okay, we got an upgrade. Let me, let me upgrade you. Um, I wouldn't mind it a horsey as well. But you know, I'm really not too blown away, or not blown away, but I'm really not too interested in everything here. Yo, is this really the same Victory Road? They just removed the boulder that was here I wonder who made the executive decision to get rid of everything oh it's only been a little while get rid of it all take that shit out of there 
but so does this mean that we have to fight our rival without our primary water type Pokemon? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'm still gonna win. <laughs> don't get me wrong, you know? I, 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 but what I'm saying is, don't, don't get me wrong, I don't think it's gonna be that big of an issue. I mean, I know he's gonna have a Feraligator. Oh, Skull Blends, that's good. That's very, very good. I mean, I, it is the same victory row. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I mean, I may have had that realization in the past, but I'm having it now, and it's blowing my mind. It's changed a bit. We're spelunking again. We're still spelunking. But it's so weird to me. Did they ever give like an official reasoning? This was that big room where the trainers were in the middle of it. Oh, I shouldn't have jumped down here like that. Oh no, never mind. It was good. Another fucking scope lens? Jesus. I'm not trying to be critical here, but you could swap up your item selection a little bit. Uh, but yeah, I don't know if I ever made that realization before about Victory Row, but I'm I'm having it now, so 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 be proud. Be proud. Be be very proud of me. What the fuck is this? Hold on, I'm gonna save my game right here. Only you can prevent lost save data. I'm saving my game. Oh, this is where the I feel like we just got TM28 though. We didn't. Whoa. TM28? Are you Rock Smash? Drill Pet. Okay. Um, not the worst. Not the worst. Could I teach it to Ramla? Winnie can learn it. Judy can learn it. Judy wouldn't really do much with it though. Another normal box. Yo, this is not normal by any means. We have two normal boxes and a gorgeous box. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what the actual fuck? Um, so, okay. Anyways, fuck it. I don't know why. I knew he was in Victory Road. What the fuck? We have to fight him without. Well, I guess we have an hour of chill tonight, and we'll have an hour of chill tomorrow night. Haven't seen you guys in a few nights, so fuck it. Why not? Why not? Hold it. Are you going to take the Pokemon League challenge? Don't make me laugh. You're so much weaker than I am. I'm not like I was before. Now I have the best and strongest Pokemon with me. I'm invincible. Maybe I challenge you. Bring it on, Silver, bro. I don't even need the tentacle, dude. Don't even need it. Don't even need it. Silver, you got a whole squad of six. Oh my god, he's got a Gengar. But he has a Gengar normally, right? Oh, I'm not even healed all the way. What's going on here? Can we get a flinch? Oh. Lady Ramla. Lady Ramla. Lady of the Reach, Lady Rom, look. Lady of the Reach, I love it. A pilot swine, chill, 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 chill. Kicking it on the ones and twos. Um, who has the better defense? Ninety-six, ninety. Okay, Winnie, you're up to bat. Oh, he was missed. Oh wow. Missed. Shut up, shut up. Missed. Wow. Oh my goodness. How mystical. Takedown. What are you teaching this thing? What are you teaching this thing? You know, it would have been dope if they had Silver come back in Gen 4. I know, very weird, but I'm only thinking in terms of mammal form. <laughs> Imagine if he traveled to. Sinnoh to evolve his squad. Didn't he have a Sneasel? 
and a Murk. I mean, and uh, yeah, and a Murkrow. I don't remember his entire original team. No, you did not. At this point in the battle, you did not just sit here. Get the fuck out of here, pedal dance. Get out of here. Blossom has plagued us since the start of this series. Espeon. Woo, 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 woo. I'm just going to click strength again. Side beam. Winnie. Hell yeah, Winnie. Blow this Espeon back. Hell yeah, Winnie. Why does this team not seem very randomized? Is it just me? Maybe it is. Maybe I don't know what his original team is. Also, our HP is very, very low. Okay, we're lucky this isn't later generations where Gramble could bust out some crazy fighting type move. For Ralligator, oh boy. Oh boy. What am, what, am, whatever am I to do? Actually, this is my only real option here, is Winnie. Fuck did he hit me with? Don't be critting me, bitch. Slash, don't you don't you dare. Don't you ever. Hold this strength. Bro, for real, don't you ever be doing that ever again. I don't really appreciate how this gator outspeeds me. It's a polka dot bow wearing bear. Polka dot bow wearing bear in our first level 51. I couldn't win. I gave it everything I had. What you possess and what I lack. I'm beginning to understand what that Dragon Master said to me. I haven't given up on becoming the greatest trainer. I'm going to find out why I can't win and become stronger. When I do, I will challenge you and I'll beat you down with all my power. Hm. You keep at it until then. Hey, that was the dollar store star screen for tonight, you guys. <laughs> But we have made it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Indigo Plateau, the ultimate goal for trainers. We have made it. Um, but we did go ahead and get the squad leveled up. And here I am slipping again. I don't know why I ever even plan to include shit uh, if I don't get it ready. Um, I want to give a quick shout out. Um, I asked you guys in the last episode last night's episode what you think we should train up to for the elite four um just want to give a quick shout out to my boy uh bassam pal um he suggested 57 57 58 58 59 59 so uh i suggested 60 58 55 or something like that 60 58 56 something like that Some, somewhere around there but I don't know I like I like that one I like the way that sounds I think it's pretty even pretty fair for us to go through so I chose two Pokemon to be level 56 up first we have Lady Ramla our Crobat at level 56 holding the amulet coin rack and wing attack bite fly and confuse Hooray. up next we have Winnie our Ursa ring at level 56 uh, sporting that polka dot bow rack and strength slash cut and lick Oof. Look at that attack stat. Oh my goodness. Up next, at level 57, we have Julian, our shiny tentacruel. I love how balanced uh, his stats are. I just, I just love seeing all the numbers, all the numbers on the screen. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, but he's holding the Mystic Water Rock and Surf Acid Barrier and Hydro Pump. You learn Hydro Pump by level up. Um, don't really have a TM to fill up that spot, so let's hope and pray. That somewhere in Kanto, we find a TM for him. Bingo, bingo. Um, but it's Hydro Pump for now. It's Late Night Crystal. Why the fuck not? Hydro Pump's animation is dope as shit. Um, up next, we have Xavier. Our level 57 Hypno. Look at that special defense. Um, he's holding a Twisted Spoon, rocking Psychic Headbutt, Poison Gas, and Hypnosis. He tried to learn Psych Up, and I was like, bruh. Nah. Not right now. Nah. Nah, nah. I'm trying to avoid coughing my brains out. Up next, at level 58, we have Sauron. 
our Hound Doom. I decided to take him level 58 because he has honestly proved himself through this LP. You know, I was really down to keep uh, Roger our Charmeleon. Um, but I don't know. Maybe next time we'll end up with a Charizard. I feel like we just get so close and the Charizard just get ripped away from us. Not that I'm like a Charizard advocate, but I'm not like anti charizard either but you know i don't know i just feel like it's it's like a carrot dangling in front of us and we're just so close to it but anyways sauron has done great we love him we love him we love him we love him special attack is off the charts um i decided to raise him up to one of our level 58s because he's quick and he hits hard and if even if he has a glass cannon all we need to do is click flamethrower and as long as you aren't a swampert you're dying to his flamethrower. He's holding a charcoal. He's holding a charcoal. <laughs> but he is holding a charcoal rock and flamethrower crunch psychic and faint attack. And you guessed it. Last but not least, at level 58, we have Judy the Ride On. Uh, she's holding her quick claw, rock and stomp, horn attack, horn drill, and fissure. Um, I was sitting here thinking, damn, well, 58, <laughs> isn't it like 65 or something like that until she gets earthquake? Like, God damn i guess somewhere in the back of my mind this entire time i just assumed that once we got to this point in the game we'd have earthquake but damn we still ain't there yet <laughs> judy come on what's going on here um but yes i decided to take ramla and winnie to 56 because i feel like winnie is bulky enough to take a hit and hit back strong enough um ramla i feel like her speed is going to be most beneficial i'm pretty sure that she's still the fastest one in the party 182 she's 100 points of speed faster than winnie jesus 144 97 141 85 so um not that I don't want her to hit harder or anything like that, but I'm just saying, like, her best stat is speed, so I feel like she doesn't need to be the highest because she will still be the fastest. You see, you see, you see, you see I'm picking up what I'm putting down. Um, Julian, I feel like it's never a bad thing to count out your water type. Water type's the most abundant, they're always there. And name a time that you played through Pokemon when your water type was not there for you. Name it name it <laughs> you know i mean i know sometimes playing a nuzzle like shit happens but most of the time my water type is always my most dependable on the squad so i figured if i had to have someone in the middle let's drop julian off right there xavier i wanted to have up here because i really wanted to have a decent special wall um xavier's offensive capabilities aren't the world's wildest but it's okay i would rather have bulk even if i need somebody to send out there and just heal up or whatever you know xavier is there to do the damn thing sauron like i said he's really impressed the shit out of me i want somebody fast i want somebody to hit hard that's sauron and judy kind of the same reason as xavier you know we could have swapped judy and xavier in this place i just wanted somebody that was defensive that could take hits bada bang bada boom so i'm gonna shut the fuck up now and go play some pokemon so Let's go do it. <laughs> it's an hour of chill. It's an hour of chill. What, what, what even is an hour of chill when our main series on the channel is an hour long episode every single day? <sighs> What's up, bro? <laughs> Welcome to the Pokemon League, Nappy. Allow me to introduce myself. <laughs> I'm Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic Pokemon powerful. At last, and at last, I've been accepted into the Elite Four. This is where he, like, pushes his glasses up and it goes, Sheen! Speaking of Sheen, uh, is this ice? Is this supposed to be, like, the same room Lorelei was in? Is that why it's icy? Right? It makes sense, right? Did I just answer my own question? So I was gonna say, are these supposed to be like mirrors? Because he's a psychic type? Like, or is this just so hot and fresh? You know, like Lorelai just left 36 hours ago, 48 hours ago. They ain't got time to change the room yet. But uh, come on, it's still all icy. They just, they just cut the AC off. Now it's melting. I can only keep getting better. Losing is not an option. 
Who are we leading with? Rama. Ooh, we boy. Technician Pansy wants to battle. Alright, Technician Pansy. Send out that Azumarill. Look at how thick this Pokemon is. Oh my god. Why is it so wide? <laughs> you know what, Azumarill? It's 2023. You live your best life. Just don't come near me with no ice type moves. Or rock type moves either. I'm not a fan of those either. Okay, so check it. You're locked into rollout, right? Right? You're locked into rollout when you use rollout. So, as long as we don't miss the Don fan in the room, we should just be able to stomp the shit out of this Zoom <laughs> Hey, the dumb fan is still wreaking havoc. That's fine with me. That's fine with me. That's fine with Judy, too. Judy, do your thing. Do your thing, Judy. Do your thing, girl. Do your thing. Look at that. Judy's so strong, she takes out water types. Come on. Technician Pansy going to send out a marijuana. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who told you to do all that? Romla, come on back out, girl. Watch this marijuana go for a boomerang. And do nothing. Uh, can I click bite on you? <laughs> <laughs> How did you end up in the Elite Four, bruh? With a rage Marowak. Who did you spook? I don't know. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill, 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 chill. Okay, th actually, you know what? That don't do shit to us. We don't care about that. Hurt yourself with confusion. Oh, I meant to open up the gorgeous box and the normal box. Praise the brick piece. I'm sorry. It's like how Arya had the like uh, her list. I meant to get four stores too. Fuck. Yo, hurt yourself one more game. <laughs> I'll take it, bro. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Can I just take the moment to say? Isn't it wild that we're at the D4 right now? Like, I feel like... Like, we just did Renegade Platinum. And, like, I know that Platinum's a longer game than first and second gen. But, like, we just did Renegade Platinum, right? And we did Late Night Yellow, did the Elite Four, and dove right into Late Night Crystal. And we just finished the Elite Four of Renegade Platinum, and now here we are at the fucking Elite Four again. These motherfuckers can't get enough of us. Holy shit. Yo, that's crazy in Gen 1. Raichu has nothing against a Rhydon. A Doug Tree? Yo, what the fuck is up with this? Every time I be sending something out, I be killing something that you have, and then you send out some random ass Pokemon. Uh, does Doug Trio get Stone Edge? <laughs> hey, ain't nobody falling for this stupid shit again, bro. I'm flying up out of here. Show me what you got. Sand Attack? That wouldn't hit me either. That still would fail. Is that why that Marowak clicked Rage? <laughs> Sand Attack does hit me. Oh, my accuracy. Slash. Get out of here. Rama still outspeed you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, my God. Why does this keep happening to me? <laughs> it's always this fucking Pokemon. Yeah. Miss that shit. Hold this strength. Winnie, you got this. If there's any Pokemon on our team that can leverage a Snorlax, it's definitely Winnie. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't be clicking on rollout. Don't do it. Don't you be doing it. I'm not interested. Hey, can we get a round of applause for Winnie? That Snorlax is level 55. Um, we're actually like right on par, smack dab, perfect. Technician Pansy, out of my way. I I can't believe it. 11 grand. Shout out to the Lady of the Reach. Shout out to the Lady of the Reach. 
Even though I was defeated, I will change my course. I will continue battling until I stand above all trainers. Now, Navi, move on and experience the true ferocity of the Elite Four. Hush. Hush. Should we open the gorgeous box? No, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait until we have our Elite Four Championship and this will be our prize. The normal box and the gorgeous box. You know, I meant to get fucking full restores. <sighs> Mighty brick piece, how I fail you. Um, okay, so let's see here. Let's see here, let's see here, let's see here, let's see here. We have leftovers and two scope lenses. I feel like we're not utilizing our items properly. We have scope lenses. Should we put a scope lens on Sauron? Um, should we put a scope lens on Sauron and give up his charcoal? Um, we really don't have any little means to heal, so I'm not gonna waste any podions right now, but I mean I feel like we could Spare it like it wouldn't hurt us um, Hold up. Do we got any? Uh... No, okay Fuck it. Why not? Do I do this? Do I heal 17 points of damage on Winnie with a hyper potion? Oops, I did. Oops, I did it Oops, I did. Whoa, holy fuck. It's popping, bro. Look kind of familiar. I am Goga of the Elite Four. I live in shadows of Ninja. My ink jacket style will confound and destroy you. Confusion, sleep, and poison. Prepare to be the victim of my sinister technique. Pokemon is not merely about brute force. You shall see soon enough. Watching my whole squad of legendary Pokemon. Alright, Technician Sonya. Instead of Elite Four, they're technicians. I'm not mad at that terminology. Fuck. But he's a steel type in this generation, which means he gets what? What's the, the flash cannon? Is flash cannon a thing in this generation? Um, what can I do to this here steel type? I can. Is it Sauron? I think we're always gonna lead with, uh. You know, affect the Dark Lord with fucking Thunder Waves. Get the fuck out of here. Um. I think we're always gonna lead with Ramla. She's got the Ramla coin. Why the fuck not? Why the fuck not? Why the fuck will we not? Get this Magneton out of here, bro. How do they promote you? Eradicate? Eradicate? They promoted you with Eradicate? Did you fill that out on your application? I know they had to ask, like, name, date of birth, height, weight, eye color, social security, and then they had to, at some point, look at that, put a scope lens on Sauron? No, we don't. They had to ask you, like, hey, what six Pokemon would you be utilizing? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, get that guy. Bring him in. Hey, Sauron, the Dark Lord. He is here. So 57 is the highest I've seen Koga with. Oh my good. Is this what the computer feels like in Renegade Platinum? <laughs> This is what the computer feels like in Blaze Black 2. Oh, this is just no way. There's no way. No, this must this must not be what the computer feels like, because this guy's not nuzlocking. <laughs> he would not have sent out a butterfree against fucking Houndoom. Oh wow, now I know what it feels like to be the computer. God damn. Sauron, two crits in a row, Sauron. God damn, a mischievous? Oh my goodness. I think just from this one battle alone, I think Kogan needs to be removed. <laughs> I, at this point, I should take his place. <laughs> Whether I'm champion or not, he should most definitely be removed. If you are an Elite Four member and you can get your whole team wiped with one Pokemon, <laughs> oh, you have proven your worth. I gotta calm down. We're being too loud. Late night, late night crystal. I subjected you to everything I could muster, but my efforts failed. I must hone my skills. Go on to the next room and put your abilities to test. I think this is the part of the video 
up where we should take a brief moment and read from our pocket Maya Angelou wisdom. We just started chapter two yesterday and our second quote of chapter two, love, is love recognizes no barriers. It jumps hurdles, leaps fences, penetrates walls to arrive at its destination full of hope. Love recognizes no barriers. It jumps hurdles, leaps fences, penetrates walls to arrive at its destination full of hope. You know, that reminds me of a saying that I have always said in life um, in regards to the people around you. If somebody wants to do something, they will do it. If you are committed to somebody or if you are friends with somebody or this or that or whatever and you express to them that you are lacking something or you need something or uh, some change needs to occur um, and they aren't willing to meet you there, then that tells you a lot just in that one moment. Um, but they could turn around and go in do this or that or the other or whatever but the point I'm making is if somebody truly loves you for who you are for what you bring to the table for what you bring to the relationship you know to whatever degree that this format applies people will move mountains to do the things they need to do look at crackheads (laughs) they will get shit done because they want that next fix you know I know that's a goofy comparison but that's the idea that she's conveying you know somebody really wants to do something in life they will do it they will get it done you will see what their priorities are but remember the same applies to you you know uh, the other people in your life the other people in your relationship are seeking the same thing so it's it's an interesting like I was going to say the word dimension, but that's the wrong word to go about it. Um, It's an interesting perspective. What the fuck? Why can't I think of the most simple word? Interesting perspective to think about because, you know, always put yourself in someone else's shoes. Before you snap, before you go off or whatever, just, just ask yourself, like, was this from a place of malice? Did this person that loves me intentionally do this or that or whatever? But this is, this is, it's too broad of a statement, you know, to really like speak about it. I feel like it's a, it's a broad statement that applies to individual situations and then you go from there, but you get the overall point I'm trying to make, you know, let me, right? Damn you, my Angelo, getting too deep. Well, we said we needed to chill it out, so chilled it out. Anyways, our next person to get their ass handed to him. I am brutal of the Elite Four. Brother. I always train to the extreme because I believe in our potential. That's how we become strong. Can you withstand our power, brother? Hmm. I see no fear in you. You look determined. Perfect for battle. Ready, brother. You will bow down to our overwhelming power. <laughs> Come on, bro. Let's get it on. Let's get it on tonight. Technician Stacy wants to battle. All right, Stacy. Ooh. The Gyarados. We're starting at level 55 now. Okay, okay, okay. Um, a spooky, spooky Gyarados. What do we do against the spooky Gyarados? I think we're going to. Uh. set up a barrier (laughs) I wish I had sludge bomb Um, I think we're gonna go out to I know he gets bite I'm gonna go out to Uh, I don't really know what to do here hold on hold on hold on Fuck it, I'm just gonna go with my gut. Rain dance? Make it rain, ho. 
Make it rain all you motherfucker want. Check out this barrier. Now, I don't know about you, but most of the time when motherfuckers do this shit, I forget about it. But, Hydro Bomb? In the rain? It's not very effective, bro. Here, watch. Check it. I'll do it, too. Ooh, I did more than you. <laughs> mm. Twister, so he has Hydro Pump, Rain Dance, Twister, and I'm hoping Bite. Oh, I need Sludge Bomb so badly. Oh my god, Hydro Pump did more. <laughs> oh my goodness, is this enough to kill? not bite yo i literally tapped the speed up button for not even a fraction of a second and we missed one of the best moves in the game crazy get rid of this dude come on julian you got this what is the irony of julian our shiny tentacruel taking out a gyarados a normal gyarados when we got the shiny julian the tentacruel i'm a shiny gyarados fortress yo we're not doing this. I've learned my lesson. I've learned my lesson. Trust me. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm not messing with it. I'm not touching it. Look. Is he going to hit me back? With Bide? I landed the horn drill finally. Is he gonna like live and then click bide and hit me back with double the damage? He's <laughs> gonna kill two of my Pokemon. <laughs> Open up my bags and Winnie is gone. Oh no. Who you got next? The Sea King? Oh no. Don't waterfall me. See, this is what I was talking about when I said you always gotta rely on your water types. Because now look, here comes this jackass. Um. I know he gets. Oh, I don't want to say it. I'm not going to say it out loud. Fuck yeah. Talk your shit, Julian. Shit. You hear that? <laughs> Letting everybody know. Look at me. I'm here. Look at me. I wish. Uh, is Sheer Cold a thing in Gen 2? I feel like it's definitely a thing in Gen 3. But is it a thing in Gen 2? Um, reason that I ask is because can Julian learn it? <laughs> That's all I really want to know. Can we add more one hit KO moves to our squad? Please and thank you. Not very effective, goddamn. Julian racked them points. Go ahead. You got two more Pokemon? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's a low blow. 56, but 57 was the highest we saw, right? Sauron, can you handle this, bro? <laughs> what do I mean, can you handle this? Whoa, 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 I forgot about them spikes, too. I thought that was last battle. Whoa. Yo, we're not... Oh, I forgot the fucking... Polar stores. Who needs evasion? When you can burn everything to the ground. Go right ahead. Click the buttons that you want. Make fun of my lost victory bells. It's not my fault. Level 60. Yo, this magma. Yo, we might need to get a Magma on the team. I mean, Sauron, you're doing excellent things. You're doing excellent things. Yo, I don't like this. Okay, Confuse Ray. Chill, 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 chill. Okay. So you click your Confuse Ray all you want. Oh, sunny day. That's gonna be a problem. Come to your senses, Julian. And absorb this Fire Blast like the nothing that it is. Hydro Pump him in the sun. Show him the power you were born with, my child. Whew. 
only reason you live that you know, I'm not doing this get this shit out of here bro look at look what you're doing look at what you're doing look at what you're doing look at what you're doing imagine if I hadn't done that why did I click hydro mom <laughs> doesn't matter Jillian's got this I was gonna say imagine if I hadn't healed went for the hydro pump missed and then he fire blasted me and I lost a shiny tentacle to fire blasting magmar in the sun. Yikes. Anyways. Three Elite Four members down. Can we get a finger snap for the team here, please? Why? How could we lose, brother? Yo, Ramla is making us a very rich Pokemon trainer. Having lost, I have no right to say anything. Go face your next challenge. Okay. Cool with that. Keep that mouth shut. Cool with that, bro. Go ahead. Okay, so Ramla, Lady of the Reach. Oh, I forgot about Karen. I am Karen of the Elite Four. Your nappy, how amusing. I love dark type Pokemon. I find their wild, tough image to be so appealing, and they're so strong. Think you can take them? Just try to entertain me. Let's go. Technician Pansy. To me. I'm gonna click confuse ray on this large fella here. Okay, 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 okay. I won't forget about the dime pad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing your thing. Hurt yourself with confusion and flinch. Get him out of here. Who's next? <laughs> I wasn't gonna sit there and let that Snorlax do anything. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, I know we still have three to go, but oh, 59 for alligator. So far, she has a Snorlax and a for alligator. Am I loving her team? Yes, absolutely. Hey, we just did the whole Hydro Pump thing. I ain't scared of it. Why are you screeching? So you can click slash. Watch me Hydro Pump, you bitch. Oh, I called him on it. What do I do here? I'm gonna take the slash on Winnie. Scary face. I thought he was gonna go for an hydro pump. We got an ether and elixir. Is it enough? Oh my goodness! Come on! No, oh, now he hydro pumps a witty. A witty, 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 witty. Winnie, you got this, Winnie. Winnie, you got this. Fuck yes, Winnie. Fuck yes, Winnie. Never had any doubt. In motherfucking Winnie the Ursa Ring took that hydro pump to the face and she came back up wrung out her polka dot bow I was like let's go bitch tackle that get it to the ground snatched his mouth open and shoved that boulder right inside now Mac Mar yo she's got the best elite 14 best elite 14 I've ever seen in my life hands down um Xavier I'm gonna need you to hold this one down is this his debut in the Elite Four? Yo, Xavier. Perfect. 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 Everyone. Whoa, 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 whoa. That flame cover did a lot of damage. All right, now check this out. Check this out. No, all your shit's failing, bitch. Check this out. You want to click that flamethrower? I'm going to click this psychic. How you feel about that? Whoa, 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 whoa. We still did more, bro. We still did more. No, 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 no reason for that. I think they should make that the default Confuse Ray animation in every Pokemon game from here on out. Imagine if you were playing Legends Arceus and the screen went like, inverted and the Confuse Ray went across the screen. <laughs> Just imagine. <laughs> Just for a moment. Yo, I'm not a fan of this. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. I'm not a fan of this. Sunlight got bright and we're going to start clicking... Fire Blast and Flamethrower. Oh my goodness. Okay, chill. Wait, time out. Siren, it's gotta be you, bro. Yo, I'm... Stop! 
I do the confuse ring here. Accuracy fell. Guess what, bitch? Bang time never misses. Came through the smoke. Came through the smoke. Oh, come on. Sauron. You were born in the fire. Excellent work. Keep it up. Keep it the fuck up. Get the, get the magma out of here. She's got two mons left. She has the best Elite Four team I've ever seen. Azumarill. Oh, I was 61. Fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, our team is not prepared for this at all. Ramla, you might have to carry for a moment. Oh my goodness. Ramla, I need you to take a hit. Oh my god, he doesn't go for anything crazy. Okay, wait, wait, wait. He's locked in. Oh my god, he's locked in. Okay, I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. We still have horn attack. I have to pay attention. And we don't necessarily want him to flinch either. I would rather take the rollout. Rain stop. Fuck yeah. I can't believe we outspeed this Azumarill either. <laughs> Judy, go ahead. Shit. I see you. The oh my god. Technician Max. Or oh, Technician Pansy use a Max Potion. Oh my god. Wait. Does it tell you when it's no longer locked into rollout? Never tells you when they're no longer locked into rollout. <sighs> Judy. I feel like our wall has fallen and I'm so very sad that it was Judy <sighs> I fucking love right on oh my god should have thought about that the moment I saw the max potion I should have thought about that <sighs> Julian Get us out of here, bro. Is he a fairy type in this game? Stop fucking rolling out. What is every Pokemon in this game? And she has an Entei. Okay, well, Azumarill's not the worst Pokemon. You know, I shit talk that Azumarill. <laughs> I was talking about how good the rest of her team is. And I was like, Azumarill, mm, well, she already had for Alligator. She already had Water type, which is honestly my only grievance with it. But that Azumarill just. Take it to heart. Take it to heart. But I would still say she probably still does have the best Elite Four team I've seen so far. That makes me so sad. Judy's passing makes me so sad. And then you use Stomp. Judy's signature fucking move. She never even got to Earthquake. Fuck you, pansy. Well, aren't you good? I like that in a trainer. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with their favorites. I like your style. You don't understand what's important. Go on, the champion is waiting. <laughs> oh, my break peace.
how could you let this happen almighty brick piece judy is gone yo her team is kind of rocked in that battle okay 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 we're back up and running i want to check out judy i'm sorry i'm gonna take this from you just for now let me see excuse me let me see what you got plenty of flamethrowers for this you're good you're good we need you taken care of you're good you're good okay so it's just julian ah okay here 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 since you need surfs and hydro pumps well all right ladies and gentlemen it is time oh don't tell me this is some automatic shit all right it is time i'm going to save my game because only you can prevent lost save data Judy, 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 Judy. My save state as well. Oh, that hurts my heart. That hurts my heart so much. I've been waiting for you, Nephi. I knew that you with your skills would eventually reach me here. There is no need for words now or music. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer and as the Pokemon League champion, I, Lance, the Dragon Master, accept your challenge. He's selling DVDs, bro. Look at this cape. Designer Bob. <laughs> it's not a knockoff. Look. <laughs> All right, Designer Bob. Oh, this is how we doing it? Is this like some weird like Black Mirror plot twist where he's got my entire team identical? Let's see who's Crobat's faster. You know, I feel like whenever I zone out, this is the song that plays in my head, just like this. What? <laughs> it just plays like that in my head. Check it out. His crowbar's not touching me. I know your crowbar don't know fly. Don't get it by level up. Hurt yourself. <laughs> get this crowbar out of here. Get this crowbar out of here. Get it out. Be gone. Be gone. Hurt yourself again. Just once. Mean look. Where the fuck am I supposed to go, bro? If I ain't swapped out by now, I ain't never swapping out. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Hurt yourself again. Yo, how did you become champion? How? You might be champion, but Lady Ramla is Lady of the Reach, and she will take the doubloons from your pocket. Give them to her. Designer Bob with the mischievous. Hey, don't be doing no level 61. Don't be doing the shit I think you're gonna be doing. You know, I'm looking out for the destiny bond here. I'm looking out for it. It hasn't happened in a long, 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 long time, but Oh fuck, I forgot she knows side beat Rob. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold strong, hold strong, hold strong, Rob. Yes, fuck yes. Okay, we're not playing with this shit. I'm gonna fuck with Lady Ramla. You're gonna end up bringing out the Dark Lord. And this mischievous won't know what hit it. You better hope and pray that you break. I was gonna say, you better hope and pray. Too bad you trapped the wrong one. You got a little excited from that side beam. You thought that was gonna be it. You thought that was gonna be it. I don't think so. Lady Ramla does not go anywhere without the Hound. <laughs> oh, I gotta calm down. Lady Ramla and Sauron, the Hound over here. Okay, designer Bob, who you got next? I'm a champ. Yo, I already know what's gonna happen. Lady Ramla, I need you to take this hit. Actually, no, Julian, you could take it. Julian resists as well. 
I can set up a barrier too. Yeah, I knew you was gonna go for that cross job, bitch. Check this out. Check this out. Check it out. I'm not gonna remember it's there. So I know you won't stress about it being there. But hold this hydro pump, bro. I, I gotta say, for a champion's team, he's got a pretty good fucking squad. I will say that much. He really does. Oh, chill with the cross chops, bro. I don't know if you know this, but Tentacruel Julian over here is a boy. Whoa, 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 I guess the fucking berry doesn't matter if that's the case. Fuck, yo, I'm not risking this shit. This is a fucking shiny tentacle. How many times on this channel do you see us use legal shiny Pokemon? <laughs> it almost never fucking happens. We never do it in those likes. I'm not losing this bitch now. Get the fuck out of here. That would be the time that I would miss the hydro pump. I miss the fucking hydro pump. He would get land the cross chop and it would kill. Nah. Not happening. Not happening. <sighs> Who you got left, bruh? Three more Pokemon, damn. A lady in. I take back everything I said about his team. Take it all back right now. Check this out. Isn't Lady in like specially defensive though? Isn't that, like the only decent stat it has? Yeah. He ate that pretty good. And watch this double edge do nothing. <laughs> Get out of here, bro. Get out of here. I take back everything I said about Lance's team. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Oh, bro, there's no way. He had two of our own Pokemon. What do I do against an Ursaring? Judy has left us. Oh, Judy. I wish I can go out to Winnie, but um, who's got the better defense? Y'all tell me. Wanna wait? Shitting me. <laughs> I'm gonna click Hydro Pump. I mean, I know I'm gonna outspeed this thing, but what is it gonna do? Hit me with Slash? It's gonna hit me hard. I, I don't expect to kill this Earthstring with this Hydro Pump. Oh my god. Just fucking Hyper Beam me, bro. <laughs> hey, actually, I think this barrier is saving us. Does the barrier ever go down? Is it permanent? If it said it went down, I missed it. But if it's permanent, then that first ring never stood a chance, bro. I told you I was going to forget about the barrier. <laughs> His last Pokemon? Oh my god. Did he have two Mischievous on his team? Is that because he has two Dragonites? <laughs> his little 65 Mischievous? And I'm all out of Hydro Pulse? What the fuck am I supposed to do? Well, Sauron. It's time. It's level 65, Mischievous. Lock us in. Can't escape now. I ain't trying to go nowhere else. This is his highest level Pokemon versus our highest level Pokemon. I wonder what will happen next. Yeah. I can't be similar strength. Maybe I didn't check that shit. How the fuck is Dragonite swapped out for a Mischievous? Or, yeah, Mischievous. Designer Bob. <laughs> Fucking knockoff champion over here. <laughs> it's over. <laughs> but it's an odd feeling. I'm not angry that I lost. In fact, I feel happy. Happy that I witnessed the rise of a great new champion. Damn. Whew. You have become truly powerful, Nappy. Your Pokemon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokemon. <laughs> oh my god, like, oh no, like, it's all over. Professor Oak, if you weren't so old, ugly, and slow. <laughs> oh, Nappy. It's been a long while. You certainly look more impressive. Your conquest of the league is just fantastic. Your dedication, trust, and love for your Pokemon have made this happen. Your Pokemon were outstanding too, because they believed in you as a trainer. They persevered. 
Congratulations, Nappy. Oh, oh my god, like, let's get this inter- let's interview the brand new champion. Oh, this is getting to be a bit too noisy. Nappy, could you come with me? Oh my god, like, oh, wait, we haven't done the interview. Dang, it has been a while since, you know, I mean, I know we saw him at the start of this game, but I feel like we saw him at the start of Blade Night Yellow. <laughs> and now he's here in a second region to see his cool with all of me. <laughs> I feel like Professor Oak should come back at the Hall of Fame ceremony for every single game. <laughs> I remember you. It's been a long time since I last came here. This is where we honor the League Champions for all eternity. The courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Here today, tonight, we witness the rise of a new League Champion. A trainer who feels compassion for and trust toward all Pokemon. A trainer who succeeded through the perseverance and determination. The new League Champion who has all the makings of greatness. Nappy, allow me to register you and your partners as champions. Hey, what can I say? Rest in pieces. Rest in peace, Judy. Check out Lady Ramla, Lady of the Reach. Winnie, our Ursaring. Ooh, look at her go. She's like, yeah. Tell me how good I am. I know. I know. Everyone doubted Julian. But Julian, our tentacle, actually did a lot in the Pokemon League. Look at Xavier, our Hypno, coming through. Eating them hits like he ought to do. And, you know, you gotta say, you gotta give it up for, like, honestly, the real MVP of the uh, Pokemon League here. Sauron. <sighs> Memorial. Judy are right on. All my fault. So upset about that. So, so upset about that. 234 Pokemon seen. 49 Pokemon owned. 24 million playtime hours. You need to fill up the Pokedex. Catch different kinds of Pokemon. I'm fucking Nuzlocke in here, bro. Can't do that shit. Well. I'd like to give a special shout out to the Pokemon Crystal version staff. <laughs> Um, anyways, we have made it through the Pokemon League. Fuck yeah, we did it. Hot damn. I really did not want to lose any Pokemon in that, but... I mean, what was that, like the third, fourth time we were counting up rollouts? And I don't know, I just... I guess the Max Potion threw me off, but the moment I saw the Max Potion, I should have known, like... Ugh, rollout's not done, I didn't kill it in time, whatever, but... Rest in peace, Judy. Rest in peace, Judy. I still think we did a, a great job smacking up that Pokemon League. And can we please get a round of applause for Sauron and Julian both back to back? You know, like they imagine them back to back, like Houndoom chilling, Tentacruel with his uh, Julian with his tentacles. <laughs> um, but hats off to them. Um, the rest of the squad did their thing to Winnie, Ramla cashing in that bank, Ramla whooping that other imposter crowbat, uh, and Xavier holding it down. <sighs> like I said in the last episode, yes, we are going to continue on to Kanto. Um, a lot of people ask, uh, are you, you going to continue after you beat the Pokemon League? Like, I get it. You know, I guess the credits are playing, so technically you beat the game. Um, but in my opinion, you didn't beat the game until you beat Red. So, frick yes, we're going to continue on. Um, so tomorrow night, I will be here <laughs> with you guys ready to continue on. But I do want to thank you guys so, so much for your support throughout not just Late Night Yellow, um, but Late Night Crystal as well. Maybe I should have said that backwards. Just through the Late Night series, just in general so far. Um, shout the fuck out to you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. But I think for right now, we're going to go ahead and wrap up here for tonight. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed tonight's hour of chill and of course if you'd like to show your support of the prime and the nappy nation make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated now rachel yes i've got time to chat is my, are my pokemon still tough the toughest matter of fact i just beat the pokemon league 
every day? A what? A what? A ditto? <sighs> you beat it though, right? Oh, hell yeah. Alright, girl. Call me later. Gotta build those relationships. Make sure she knows that we care. Okay? When your vile plume needs help, I will be there. Oh! Look at the bottom of the burning. I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> Let's get a quick team recap. Up first, we have Lady Ramla, our crowbat. Lady of the Reach uh, at level 57, holding the amulet coin, rock and wing attack, bite, fly, and confuse ray. Up next, we have Winnie, our earth spring at level 56, rock and heart polka dot bow with strength slash cut and lick. Up next, we have Julian, our shiny tentacruel at level 58, holding the mystic water, rock and surf, acid barrier, and hydro pump. Then we have Xavier, our Hypno at level 57, holding the Twisted Spoon, rocking the Psychic, Headbutt, Poison Gas, and Hypnosis. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe this is our last, but not least, Sauron, the Houndoom, level 59, holding the Charcoal, Rock and Flamethrower, Crunch, Psychic, and Faint Attack. I love how you can tell. <laughs> At this point in the series, if a Pokemon is itemless, they are soon to be headed for a box. <laughs> um, I mean, I guess... We are just so popular tonight. I'm gonna turn my phone off. Hello, Nappy. I have something here for you. Could you swing by my lab? See you later. Bro, hold up. I ain't even spoke to my mom. Hold up. Mama, how you been? We ain't seen you in 20 episodes. Hi, welcome home. You're trying very hard, I see. I've kept your room tidy. Or is this about your money? No, 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 no. Do you want to switch to daylight? No, 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 no. I live in Arizona. Just do what you can. You know what? While we're here with Mom, and before I forget, let's get our nightly Pocket Maya Angelou wisdom quote. We uh, just started chapter two, which is based on love. Um, yes, we just started chapter two, <laughs> which is love. Um, and tonight's quote is, whatever you want to do, if you want to be great at it, you have to love it and be able to make sacrifices for it. Whatever you want to do, if you want to be great at it, you have to love it and be able to make sacrifices for it. It's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. I can relate to that so so much harder than I, I could even imagine. Like, you know how many opportunities and different things I've had and had to pass up over the years? just because of YouTube. That's such a neatly packaged way. <laughs> Anyways, but I mean, it's true. If you really want to be successful at something, you have to, um, you have to love it to death. Um, this reminds me of, I don't know if I ever mentioned this on the channel before, I'm sure a lot of you guys that work out or go to the gym or whatever, uh, maybe, I'm not even going to make assumptions, maybe you may have heard of them for whatever reason, but there's this, um, um, I don't want to call them the wrong thing, <laughs> bodybuilder, <laughs> fitness influencer by the name of C.T. Fletcher, and he has a documentary about himself called My Magnificent Obsession. And, you know, long story short, his magnificent obsession is going to the gym. It's working out, you know, and <clears throat> that it's basically like another way uh, to say that, you know, like if you want to be 
successful at something, if you want to be the best, if you want to this and that and whatnot, you have to give it 800,000%. And when you don't, and when you slip up, you know, it's it's like you reap what you sow. You know, we could just keep going into circles with this, you know, so. Uh, is this the window that Silver was looking into? <laughs> I mean, I know it was on this side of the building, but you know, these Pokemon buildings are like friggin' tents in Harry Potter. It's just a tent, and then you go inside, and it's a whole fucking hall. Anyways, bro. Navi, there you are. I called because I have something for you. See, it's an SS ticket. Now you can catch Pokemon in Kento. Fuck yeah. The ship departs from Olivine City, but you knew that already, Nappy. After all, you traveled all over with your Pokemon. Give my regards to Professor Oak and Kento. Hey, I'm out this bitch. I'm out this bitch. Actually, what we need to do... Hold on, hold on. We have... Hold on, hold on. We can't go to fucking Kanto yet. We still have business to take care of. Okay. 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 No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> I only had the one for you. <laughs> I only had the one for you. Chill out now. Chill out now. Um, okay, so we need to... I didn't even think about this at the end of last episode. By what Pokemon we should add to the squad. Um, I would prefer ground type. I don't know which ground type we might have. We're still currently rocking two poison types. Um... Hmm. We are. We have a very large. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Let me see here. Let me see here, just to be sure. Could we rock out with a Steelix? Maybe. Do we ha even have a metal coat? I'm pretty sure we do. Somewhere. Hmm. I know you were expecting us to be on that boat halfway over to Kanto by now. I know you were. I just know you were. Um, uh, so we don't have any immediate ground type other than that Steelix or that Onyx that jumps out at me. Um, I mean can't don't need another duplicate typing with flying we already have a normal type water i mean electric would be bad but it's uh i know that whooper is sitting right there too but let me check here let me check here let me check here nothing screams at me in that first box whoa whoa oh fuck <laughs> Um, I mean, shit, we could have motherfucking Raikou to the squad. No, our ground type weakness would be insane. Holy shit. Half our squad would be demolished by Earthquake, and the other half would not take it very well. It'd be Rama or nothing. Um. Oh, wisdom. Yo, do we really not have any ground type? Did we do it? Dang! That's really all we got. What the fuck? Oh my god. What the fuck, bro? What the fuck? Oh, wow. Okay, well, let me think. 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 Just let me think. Shh, shh, shh. Let me think. Okay, I just came to a conclusion. Check it. The answer is not in this box. I have to go back to the first one. 
We need to go back to the first one. Damn, this music's so fucking loud. I can't even think. Um, yeah, so here's, here's, here's the conclusion that I've come to. I think that we are just going to have to wing it. No pun intended. Didn't know Romelina was going to be there. Uh, and see what we can get away with until we can maybe snag a few more encounters. Um, but I also want to check and see... Metal powder. Metal code. Are we doing it? Are we gonna run a Steelix? Steelix coming to late night crystal? Are we doing it? Seven? Any objections? Going once? Going twice? Okay. Gonna have a Steelix on the squad. Um, yo, but check it. Here's the thing. I don't fucking know how this works in this game. Like, when I give it to him? Does he need to learn anything? <laughs> I don't know what, he, what Onyx gets by level up and what Steelix gets by level up. But I know I turned off trade and impossible evolutions. I mean, I guess if worst comes to worst, we can just... Put a Steelix in our game. It wouldn't be that difficult. I hope that's not ruining anyone's immersion. <laughs> Look, if I told you Santa Claus isn't real. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. 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 It's late night yellow. We don't tend to worry about things like that. But okay. I think that's what we're gonna go with. Uh, we're gonna give him the experience share for now, just so he can get leveled up a little bit. Cause in all honesty, I think we're gonna smack up all of these trainers on this ship. I know we already got an encounter here, but <clears throat> welcome to the first ship, SS Aqua. Will you be boarding today? May I see your SS ticket? I called this thing the SS Anne earlier. Yikes. We're departing soon. Please get on board. Ooh, wait a minute, turn it back up. Whoa! Excuse me, I was in a hurry. My granddaughter is missing. She's just a wee girl. If you see her, please let me know. Come on, yo. Pokemon Company. Pokemon Company. Game Freak. Whatever. You. Dweebs. Someone gave you just a little bit too much funk. Uh, a little bit too much groove. That's what I mean. A little bit too much groove for your own good. Nobody gave you permission to be doing all that. Fucking soundtrack. Come on now. Just let it go. I won't be over here in this trash can. Ah. Wait a minute. Oh, it really conveys the fast part of the SS Fast Ship Aqua. What's the name of this ship? Fast Ship SS Aqua? I feel like I'm going a mile a minute. Like in my brain, it's like fucking light years are just going by or something. This is my cabin? I thought it was on the other side. Okay, well, everybody, hey, check. <laughs> Bitch, this ship got Wi-Fi. <laughs> it has a Ethernet connection. Can I upload videos from here? <laughs> What's good, YouTube? Now we're going to YouTube here. Back again once again. 
and tonight people tonight we are here for episode number 21.1 of late night crystal late night crystal is a pokemon crystal randomized nose like here on the channel um currently we are here on the fast ship ss aqua as you can tell by the music we are zooming from one continent to the other here in the Pokemon world and now this thick ass fire breather wanna fight. Level 36, really? Weightlifter Mike? Yo, Lady Ramla? I think we're just gonna work on getting everyone to level 60. Yeah, check this dude out though. One of these days for Halloween when I'm built like that, that's who I'm gonna be. When I'm built like that, that's who I'm gonna be. Who we? Hey, bro. You let people on here in onesies? You let people on here in their onesies, bro? That's not sanitary. You know he hasn't won. He hasn't watched that in forever. Hey, kid, wanna battle with me? Get your Venus or the fuck out of here, bro. I am the champion. Don't. I don't want anyone to ever stop me again. Ever. Don't ever, no, no one can ever stop me on the street and be like, hey, do you want to battle? No, you must go. <laughs> you must go and take on the Elite Four. I should have just gone and healed in my room. But you have to fight the Elite Four. Oh, this is the dude? Okay, hold up, bro. I'll be back. And then and only then can you fight me. This is the only way through here? Oh, down in the bowels of the ship. Hey kid, could I get you a look for my buddy? He's goofing off somewhere with that lazy bum. I wanna go find him, but I'm on duty right now. Um. Okay. Um. Where's Buddy? Knock knock, excuse me. Buddy? You seen a pirate around here somewhere? No? How about you? Knock knock, is this you? Yeah, I'm a sailor, all right. I wasn't goofing off. This cabin was vacant, so I just took a quick nap. I'll forget it, let's battle. He was in here doing drugs. I know you were. Look at you. You look like... Game can't let me have anything. Is that a good omen? Or is that a bad omen? Is that a... Oh my god, or a dun dun dun? Um, I don't want to go for Earthquake, because it's going to hurt. Hurtquake. Rage. Ugh, I forgot. Get this out of here. Now take your ass back downstairs. We trying to get to Kanto. Can't get to Kanto with you up here. Being a sailor, I have to do physical labor. It's exhausting. Take your ass back down there. And I'm gonna go take a nap real quick. Just hold up. All fresh and refreshed and restored. All right, get me out of here. You got your, your, your BFF, bro? Thanks, kid. I chewed him out good so he'll quit slacking off. A little girl. I mean, I've seen her go by here. This is like the exact same story of Bioshock. Like, scene by scene. I'm seasick. Oh, but you got time to battle? That's why your Yama got wrecked. See, you don't care about your Pokemon. That's what's wrong with you. What if it wasn't so much that Gary didn't care about his Pokemon? What if he cared about them too much? No one ever looked at it like that, did they? Gary cried when his Raticate died. Get the fuck out of here. Go throw up somewhere else. Let me dig through this trash can. <laughs> Do you know what you're throwing up on in here? There could be a master ball in there and you're just vomiting all over it. Jackass. Excuse me. <laughs> I was gonna say, how about you? What are you up to? You wanna fight? I miss the mighty, mighty ground type.
that we could so easily call upon any time there was some electric type shenanigans going on. You know what I mean. You know, you know, you know exactly what I mean. You know what I mean. When it comes to those electric types, you know the type of uh, Pokemon that deal with electric types. You know what I mean. Those, those electric types. Those, those type of Pokemon. Judy was there, ready to go. Hey, I'm so bored. What about? I feel just so bored. She's staring at the wall. <laughs> She literally staring at the wall. Look at her. Uh, go back. Do what you were doing before. Wait a minute. You think I'm not gonna notice that there isn't a hidden item down here? Hmm. Hmm. Is this the end of our adventure? Yo, can I heal? Can I get some of this coffee? Can I check out this trash can? Hey, you know your grandpappy looking for you? Captain, play with me please. I'm bored. I want to play more. Hey, you should go talk to the chick out there. Hi, will you play with me? <gasps> Grandpa's worried about me. I have to go. I have to go find Grandpa. Grandpa, here I am. I was playing with the captain in the sky. Nappy, was it? I heard you entertain my granddaughter. I want to thank you for that. I know, I'd like you to have this. This game is mocking me. The game is fucking mocking me. The game is fucking mocking me. The first battle we do, Steelix. This motherfucker gives us a metal coat. Are you serious? Fast ship SS Aqua has arrived in Vermilion City. It's like I just took my <laughs> It's like I took my phone out of maritime mode. What the fuck? Nappy. It's Rachel. <laughs> Got time to chat? Uh-huh. Yeah, sure. What's up, Rachel? Yeah, 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 yeah. Just like you asked 24 minutes ago, Rachel. Yeah. My Pokémon are still tough. Still Pokémon champion. Just doing a little bit of traveling. How about you? What are you up to? Every day. No way. I train every night. I mean, I try to train uh, my entire team every night. I actually have this new Pokemon I just added on to the squad as well. <coughs> Name Seven. Hopefully, I'm going to get him into a big, strong Steelix one day that's going to really bulk up our team. But I don't know. Either way. <laughs> Why? What's up? Really? You haven't caught that bio plume yet? Oh, I can understand. Oh, oh. Uh all right okay yeah I yeah, no no it's good I gotta go too all right yeah call me call me whenever call me whenever you know never busy I love these late night chats with uh swimmer Rachel <laughs> she's just great she's just just the best she's just the best um but you thought I wasn't gonna go talk to this captain look at her oh, I'm so bored I'm so bored Bored beyond belief. Oh my god, so boring. Hey, bro. What's in that trash can? Oh, thanks for coming along. Keeping that little girl amused was exhausting. Nothing? You don't give me nothing? I just got a fucking metal coat? I took the metal coat out of the PC. And now you gave me another metal coat? Ugh, me, right now. Bored. So is this supposed to be, like, glass? Like, on the floor or something? I don't understand. What is this blue patch? On the floor or wall? I'm mean, gonna guess it's the floor. Were you supposed to be able to see through there or some shit? Well, either way, let me off this shit. Fast ship SS Aqua has arrived in Vermilion City. Yeah, 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 yeah. I heard the announcement. Who were? Wait, let me check my map. Oh, fuck, let me check my map. So we are technically in Vermilion City. I'm not gonna count it just yet. Do we get our encounter here? Or do we wait till we actually get to Vermilion City? Like, like up here, you know what I mean? What are you doing here? Fast ship sails on Wednesdays 
and Sundays every week. <laughs> so, I can only use the ship every Wednesday and Sunday, but they have the train, right? Between Saffron and Goldenrod. Um, and can't you fly to the Indigo Plateau? And then fly to the other side? There not there some flying shortcut that you can use? Lady Ramla, show me your secrets. Indigo Plateau. Oh, I can't fucking see shit. Never, never the, never the fuck mind. <laughs> I'm gonna surf over here and we're gonna get our Vermilion City encounter. Ooh, I'm so excited. Are you guys so excited? Are you guys excited? If you guys are hype right now and like to show your support as proud members of the Navi Nation, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Turn on notifications. Um, in all seriousness, I do believe this is a do. Um, and yeah, we have the Pokeball. But you know, sometimes I just gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta see it. I gotta see it, y'all. I gotta see it. We got a pseudo named Windex. So get the fuck off my screen, bro. Eat, eat. Who's next? No, 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 no. Get, get him out of here. No, we're not catching. What is with all the poison types on this late night series? There's some part of me, maybe the drowsy Ekans. We have so many poison types. What the fuck? Whoa. No, this is a new encounter for us, so we are going to catch the shit out of it. Watch, watch. We got ourselves a grimy boy. I think that's what I'm gonna call him too. <laughs> when two of the, when two of these Pokemon's bodies are combined together, new poisons are created. I'm gonna, will it fit? Skill trainers gather in Kanto. Gym leaders are especially strong. They won't be easy to defeat. Look at this boy right here. Oh, I imagine just walk up to him, stare, stare at him like this. Like, oh, look at this. Oh, look at him. Snorlax is snoring peacefully. <laughs> oh, the air smells different here. I'm on the road to Vermilion City. Look at that. I want to get one more encounter because that Grimer doesn't necessarily fulfill our need. There are eight gems in Kanto. That big building in Vermilion is Vermilion's Pokemon gym. Ho 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 ho. Whoa. Pokemon fan club. Well, right, you know, I'm a, I'm a fan. I'm a fan. I like fairy. Oh, okay, never mind. I love the way Clefairy waggles its finger when it's trying to use metronome. It's so adorable. I'm the chairman of the Pokemon fan club. I've phrased over 150 Pokemon. I'm very fussy when it comes to Pokemon. Did you visit just to hear about my Pokemon? Sure. Good. Then listen up. So my favorite. Oh, Rapidash. Oh, it's cute. Oh, it's lovely. Smart. Unbearably. Plus, oh, it's amazing. Oh, you think so? Oh, too much. Wild, beautiful, kindly. I love it. Oh, I'll get when sleeping. Oh, I'm cuddly. Oh, and spectacular. Ravishing. Simply divine. Oops. Look at the time. I've kept you too long. Thanks for hearing me out. I want you to have this. Oh, <laughs> 
It's a rare candy that makes Pokemon stronger. I prefer making my Pokemon stronger by battling, so you can have it. I mean, how else are you supposed to read that text? Like, he's not thinking about it. He's not like, hmm, how would I describe my Rapidash? He's like gushing over his Rapidash, like, oh, oh God, it's so beautiful and smart. And... Oh, brick piece. Oh, brick piece. All right, so show me where, ah, uh, the bag's not split. Show me where, who were using this rare Kondai on this Gumai Kondai? Um, is Sauron? I'm just gonna use it on Sauron. I don't give a fuck. Sauron, you deserve it. After last episode, you most definitely deserve it. Get yourself leveled up. Is this a Poke Doll too? Oh, that's a bay leaf. Look at my darling bay leaf. The leaf on its head is so cute. Our chairman is very vocal when it comes to Pokemon. Okay, you do you. You do you. You do you. Do you know about the magnet train? That's what I was just talking about. The fuck? I want to go to Saffron to see the magnet train. There's some big freaking magnet train supporters in this house. Don't go in there. <laughs> the Vermilion Port is Canto Seaside Getaway. Luxury liners from around the world dock here. I've heard of two. Two. And one's a fast ship. My Pokemon is preparing the land for construction, but I have no money to start the project. Go, 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 go. My chop is growling while stomping the ground flat. All right. You do you, bro. You do you. I'm not going to stop you. Hey, can I get the ultra rod? I am the fishing dude. The elder of the fishing bros. Have you met the fishing guru at the Lake of Rage? He dreams about seeing the world's greatest Magikarp. If you don't mind, could you show him any Magikarp you catch? Who knows, you may get the Magikarp of his dreams. I already got a Gyarados, bro. Magikarp don't matter to me. So heal my squad up. I just gotta say, you know, this whole episode 7 has been unproblematic the entire time. Gotta say, it's been, been great teammate so far. Great, 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 great. All right, Route 6, look at this. Yeah, let me get on this action right here, bro. What y'all talking about? Meeting of the minds here. Oh, I wish I could stand between them. But okay. Route 6 encounter. Oh, that's definitely a duplicate. We've already got a Sinclair in the PC. How dare you try to hoodwink and bamboozle us. Do we, though? King of Red Island, Macargo, Mankey, Charmeleon, Wooper, Bell Sprouts, and Flora, Crobat, Gobat, Houndoom, Elekid, Croconaw, Winnie, Onyx, Winnie, Teddy Ursa, Onyx, Ivysaur, Gyarados, Dragonair, Mr. Worm, Cyndaquil, Snorlax, Drowsy, Diglett, Magmar, Sudowoodle, Tentacle, Ekans, Oddish, Grandi, Zatu, Persian, Butterfree, Tuxer, Weedle, Magmar, Mew, Raikou, Bandai, Grimer, we don't have a bully flag, so you're gonna get in this ball. Check it out, bro. You're gonna get in this lore ball. Fuck. How dare you put me to sleep? Get in this goddamn Ultra Ball. You are a level 15 Poliwag. Are you being serious? The swirl on its belly is its insides showing through the skin. It looks clear after it eats. Okay, little Poliwag. See, that wasn't that difficult. Should we give a nickname to this Poliwag? It's a Lady Poliwag, so I'm gonna call her Oh fucking no. How about that? Okay. Are you happy, Pokemon Crystal? You put me on the fucking spot. Whoa. Hi Nappy, it's me, Bill. Thanks for using my store. Oh, motherfucker, the box is full. Okay. Fine, I'll go back. I'll go back and I'll change the goddamn box. The box is full now. We got 40 Pokemon in the goddamn box. Holding this shit up. Change the box. Oh wait, what the fuck? Is it because I withdrew from this one? 
Oh, because I withdrew seven and then I caught the, the uh... Okay, makes sense. Anyways. Polywag acquired. Grimer acquired. Everybody give it up for Grammy Boy and Mercedes getting added to the squad. We have officially made it to Kanto, ladies and gentlemen. I believe that our adventure will pick up next time. We're not cutting anything as we head into this here gym. This here gym. <laughs> In the next episode. Or you know what? Fuck that. You know, I thought to myself, Seven isn't leveled up yet. We don't have a rock type. Fuck that. Bro. Yo, champ in the making. You lucked out this time. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. He's set traps all over the gym. But huh, the traps aren't active right now. You'll have no problem getting to Lieutenant Surge. Fuck yes, bro. Take me to Lieutenant Surge. Get this Lugia out of here, bro. That's all y'all got in here is Lugias. That's it? Yo, I'm definitely not playing this game. I have no... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bro, no way. No way. <sighs> you know... We're not taking on surge right now. <laughs> I told myself when I swapped to him, like, I know he's gonna use explosion, but what are the odds on the very first turn? You know, it's always I sit it in and I attack the fortress three or four times, and then finally it uses explosion. But no, no, no. That time it clicked it first. Oh my god, I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Missed all you want, Julian's in. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not a fan, not a fan. How'd I know you was gonna do that? Not a fan. Get it out of here. Rage? You don't need me have any room in your heart for rage. You don't need that. Oh my god. Can we please stop blowing up? What am I supposed to do? Oh my god. Don't do this. Please don't do this. Yes. Fuck yes. This is awful, this is awful, this is awful, this is awful. Um, it's not even like these Pokemon are hard to beat. They are just... Oh my goodness. Was that his last rollout? I think he has one more. How have you not gotten paralyzed? I gotta go to bed. <laughs> I gotta go to bed. Whose idea was this? I gotta go to bed now. Whose idea was this? Don't tell me there's gonna be a third battle. Oh, I thought that guy was gonna... I'm going to bed. I'm not doing this. <laughs> Can you believe that that just happened? Can you believe that that golem broke through four turns of paralysis? Winnie, I'm so terribly sorry. I'm so, so unbelievably sorry, Winnie. That hurts my heart so badly. I 
I should have just ended the episode. I should have just ended the episode. I shouldn't have gone into the gym. I was sitting there thinking, you know, we kind of got here really quickly and everything. You know, I was really just planning on doing the boat tonight. And then that. But, you know, in all honesty, I do have a mon in mind that I would like to add to the squad in Winnie's place. It has been on my asterisk, asterisk list for a while now. I think we are most definitely adding Benny to the squad. Hell to the fuck yeah. Benny getting added to the squad. Peep it, peep it, peep it. Peep my boy, Benjamin. Oh, I miss Winnie. Whose idea was it to go into that gym? Who? 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 Tackle amnesia and defense, girl. Guess we got some grinding to do. But we've got a much bulkier team now. Between Xavier, Seven, and Benjamin. You can't say we're not taking hits. Sauron, Julian, and Ramla. Oof, I just wish we had like a dragon type or... Um, I don't know. I don't know. I gotta figure things out. I gotta figure things out, but I'm pretty sure we got some leftovers with your name on it, my boy. You'll probably actually get that experience share when I do some grinding, but <sighs> should have never gone in that gym. Well, I'm taking my black ass to bed. A lot of you guys were saying, "Hey, we're in Kanto. It's time for a brand new team." Are y'all crazy? <laughs> We done did all this work. We done crafted this team, this incredible B team here. They just carried us through the Pokemon League. And your answer is get rid of them? Oh no. We still have one of our boons active from our first late night series. I think I'm going to go with the term boon. Remember we used our boon to bring Winston from late night yellow to late night crystal? So if we happen to do a late night series again we'll have that boon so we'll get to choose one of our team members at the end of the game not someone that's in the pc one of our team members at the end of the game and i don't know we'll come up with another one towards the end of the series and both of those will carry over you know they'll stack as we go anyways let's not talk about that let's talk about now so ben Hamin is on the team i think that we should be good for now to see where we can go um have no fear we still have so much power in the pc like it's ridiculous the amount of power in the pc that we have but before i forget for a fourth time i know we haven't started yet how far are we into this six minutes and i haven't started yet oh my god what's wrong with me bro just shut up um let's see here where is it at? where is it at? where is it at? learn set by level up let's see here gen 2 survey says Steelix gets crunch at level 49 and guess what that's it no earthquake not even a steel type move by level up wow wow we wow we wow we wow we okay um you know another thing that i meant to do at the pokemon league that we never did was we didn't open up our boxes the gorgeous box i'm gonna open it uh do we send that to mom? Send the trophy home. All right, normal box, survey says. Trophy. Normal box? All right. Just trophies. So whenever the next time we make it home, <laughs> I guess we'll get some goddamn trophies. Shit. Okay. Let's focus here tonight. We came in this gym. Ugh. We came in this gym. And got absolutely mollywopped in the last episode and here tonight that cannot happen again xavier don't do it don't do it bro don't do it we fought apparently two of these three gym leaders and got absolutely fucking wrecked like i, don't, I didn't even understand what was happening i was just like whoa 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 slow the fuck down slow the fuck down and you know hindsight is 2020 <laughs> you guys watching this shit back Excuse me, swimmer Rachel. Nappy? Uh-huh. It's Rachel. Got time to chat? Mm. 
I mean, you caught me right before I was about to go into this gym battle, but I mean, I got a couple seconds. What's up? Would you be my practice partner again sometime? I'll be waiting on Route 34. Uh, you know, I would love to. Could you take it a little easier on me next time? Uh, you know, I would love to, Rachel, 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 <laughs> swimmer, Rachel. But you see, the thing is, I'm kind of traveling right now. I'm in a different country. And, you know, as much as I really like sparring with you and whatnot, I can't just drop what I'm doing and change countries to come battle you. So, I don't know. Call me when you got some more free time. Let's chat. Maybe we can arrange something sometime soon, okay? Um, so, yeah, like I was telling Rachel just now, Swimmer Rachel, we're about to go up in here and take on this gym leader. This here gym leader. And snag our next badge. Wouldn't it be super fucking cool, you guys, if we were to get two badges in tonight's episode? Wouldn't it just be so fucking cool? I was up there grinding, and you just go to Saffron City. Can we just legit just badge it in any order we want? <laughs> like, just fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. All right, Lieutenant Sergi Wurgi, I'm going to save my game. Because as you guys know, only you can prevent lost save data. Happy Halloween, by the way. I know, for some of you guys, when you see this, it won't even be Halloween anymore, but I'm recording this at 11.07 p.m. on October 31st, so happy fucking Halloween. Hey, you little tyke. I have to hand it to you. It may not be very smart to challenge me, but it takes guts. When it comes to electric Pokemon, I'm number one. I never lost on the battlefield. I'll zap you just like I did my enemies in war. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. Buddy, buddy, boy. Ranger Antoinette. Ooh, Ranger Antoinette got five Pokemon. Hold up. And what levels are we working with? 57? Oh. We're not even, like, overleveled. <laughs> you know, I did this grinding for this episode, and I told myself, like, oh, wow, 60. I don't know why, but in Pokemon, 60 feels like, like, that's, that's like the beginning of, like, I don't know. I don't want to call it high level play. That sounds goofy. But, you know, like, it's no more fucking around. No more making mistakes. 56? And now you have this 52? But anyways, you know, at that point, everything is pretty much more or less fully evolved. You know, except for your high dragons here and there. But pretty much everything is fully evolved. Everybody's, no one's using Tail Whip or Growl anymore. People are clicking Blizzard, Thunder, and Fire Blast. So I looked at my team and I was like, damn, level 60? What the fuck? Are you for real with this? Um, but shit, never mind. Parasite got me thinking doubly. And I love how this uh, Benjamin in his debut, by the way, can we get a round of applause for Benjamin in his debut? Whooping this whole team? He's got another A-palm? Bro. Are these Pikachus for Lieutenant Surge normally? What the fuck is going on? Big Benny over here, wiping this squad out. Holy shit. Level 60, there's his ace. Ooh, 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 ooh. do we do it? Hit me with your best shot, bro. Hit me with that Flareon. Hit me with that Flareon, bro. Whoa, 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 whoa. Flamethrower actually did. A little bit of work. Do you love Benny or do you love Benny? Big motherfucking Benny in the house. Big Benny in the house. Big Benny in the house. Ah, you are strong. Okay, kid, you get the Thunder Badge. Hey, thanks. Yeah, play that shit back. Thunder Badge increases Pokemon speed. Consider it proof that you defeated me. You wear it proudly here. Okay, before we leave here, since this was such a place of strife for us last episode and strife Lieutenant Surge just now, I think it is time for us to pull another quote from our pocket Maya Angelou wisdom that's been chilling with us here. We are still in chapter two, love. And our quote tonight is In the flush of love's light, we dare be brave, and suddenly we see that love costs all we are and will ever be. 
yet it is only love which sets us free. In the flush of love's light, we dare be brave, and suddenly we see that love costs all we are and will ever be, yet it is only love which sets us free. Wow. Wow, hold on a moment. Let me, let me uh, marinate, let that drip all over my, my, my thinking brain. Um, I think that's really true, actually. Hold on, I'm very fucking curious about what's down here. <laughs> I think that's very true, actually. You know, I think the way I interpret that is if you love something or love someone um, and you really want to convey that and to give it your all, then I think that it needs to be all you are. I think you, I mean, you could simplify that and break it down into much more simpler terms. Like if you want to be successful at something in life, then you have to give it all, give it your all. Um, but I think that the most important aspect of that was the first line where love it said something along the lines of like love inspires you to be brave um, In the flush of love's light we dare be brave um, And I think that's something to speak on as well, you know in the sense of um, You may not ever When when do we get the fucking radio card do we have to we have to go to saffron next right to get the train so we can go back maybe we could whoop uh some of rachel's ass anyways what if we surprise her oh my god you need to be so surprised um anyways 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 actually hold on the road is closed until the problem at the power plant is solved i got so many things to do now shit um but yeah i think it's it's in order to take that first step to i don't know chase that person or chase that dream you know whatever your love is however you interpret it you know i think it does take a lot of courage it does take a lot of bravery to take those first couple steps so something wrong with the power oh, we do the power plant first never mind sorry rachel um but anyways yeah because of that i think that you know you really need to embrace that love of whatever it is and that is what will inspire you to take those steps it, it may it inspires you to be brave anyways i got it you wanted this a hey, team 29 do we have it though do, 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 do we have it though team 29 we do not have rock slide Ooh we boy can we possibly teach that to a giant oh he's not a rock type i was gonna say it's a rock or giant steel rock ground snake would they would he even be the best one to give that to considering tm29 let me see what you've got here rock slide ben hamin ben hamin can learn it damn so wait tm29 is psychic so you're telling me that snow Eyes can learn psychic it's kind of wild Fucks up with Silk Company nowadays. Welcome, this is Silk Company's head office building. Wouldn't it be some crazy shit if I can go up in here and get all the items I missed from Late Night Yellow? <laughs> Have this neat little souvenir. Bro, I just put one of those in the fucking PC. I don't need another one. This is a randomizer, bro. I wish his item would have been random. <laughs> that would have helped at least. Shit. Okay. Appreciate it, bro, but it's getting deposited. We don't need it. We just don't need it. And uh, you like how I was carrying around all that shit, all those boxes, taking up even more space. Can we go this way? Oh, fuck yeah. Route 7? No, I don't want to get Route 7 in County yet. Wait, 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 wait. I'm focused. I'm focused. This is how I end up forgetting things, and I have to go back in later episodes. <laughs> because I end up getting sidetracked with new encounters and shit going into the alley for the first time makes me sort of anxious get the fuck out of the alley bro get the fuck out of the alley my daughter likes to mimic people her mimicry has earned her the nickname copycat around here oh yeah she's so self-centered she only has a few friends damn that's rude this is a rare pokemon huh it's only a doll Hi, do you like Pokemon? Uh, no, I just asked you. Huh? You're strange. 
Hmm, quit mimicking, but that's my favorite hobby. Oh, okay. Is this only a doll too? Who's the fairest of them all? I thought you had to like uh, get her a Poke Doll or some shit, and that would restart the magnet train or something like that. Am I going crazy? Is that how it is? Magnet train station. Oh, but we can't use the train. Super modern rail liner that runs on electricity. Super fucking modern. Okay, you guys. All of you guys that are living in the fucking past. What are you doing? Using coal burning trains? <laughs> Peasants. Get with the time. Magnet trains way with the fucking future. This is the gatehouse, right? <gasps> Get a new encounter there too. And that takes us to. PowerPoint. <laughs> Gotta go that way. And this is, um. Lavender Town over here. Saffron City is such a weird place on the map. Like, what the fuck, bro? What the fuck? For, like, the fact that you get there so much later? What the fuck? Alright, fuck it. We're going up in this bitch, eh, bro? Hello, Karate King, the fighting dojo's master, is in a cave in Johto for training. Yeah, I know, bro. Can I take this? Oh. So there's nothing in here? We can't get anything else? Are we really about to, to, to do a fucking two gym episode? Yo, champ of the making. A trainer as skilled as you doesn't need to be told how to deal with psychic type Pokemon, right? I expect great things from you. Good luck. Ha, ah, damn, let's fucking get it. Let's fucking get it. Benjamin carrying us all the way through. So it is Halloween, you guys. Um, I actually didn't have any Halloween plans tonight. Hector and I were going to carve up more pumpkins. We've already carved up two pumpkins, and oh my god, it was it was great, but they ended up awful. <laughs> um, but that's pretty much uh we did we carved up pumpkins. We went to this um, cornfield maze um, this year, and then oh, I need to use a paralyzed heal on Ben Hami. Oh no, he good. Yeah, check this fucking fortress out. So we carved pumpkins. We had a couple friends over. It was super dope. We did a little bit of grilling and whatnot. Made it into a whole event. It was really fun. It was a lot of fun. I had a lot of time. A lot of uh, fun doing it. My pumpkin said boo. <laughs> it was carved and it said boo and everyone's like oh wow you got the hardest one I'm like what the fuck do you mean it's just three letters damn we got your fastest bitch okay Sabrina shit um but yeah I was like it's just three letters what the fuck you mean I got the hardest one um yeah I had the hardest one but it was dope the sad <laughs> what ended up happening was my pumpkin, both of our pumpkins actually ended up getting mold inside of them like four days later and I had to go. But we had two more pumpkins we were thinking about carving tonight. We didn't end up carving them. Uh, we had a pretty dope party that we went to this this uh, past weekend and our theme uh, for the party was villains. So Hector dressed up as Voldemort and I went as Hades from Disney and it was so fucking dope. It was so dope. I had such a good time. Anyways. I knew you were coming. Three years ago, I had a vision of your arrival. You're after my badge. I don't enjoy battling, but it's my duty as a leader to confer badges on anyone who has proven him or herself worthy. Since you wish it, I will show you my psychic powers. Hey, two badges in one episode. Hey, can we sneak over to Celadon and get a third? <laughs> two badges in one episode. I ain't mad about it. I ain't mad about it. Let's fucking get it. But you know, I don't think that we're going to be going to... Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. I don't think we're going to go to Power Plant next. I think we should go to Celadon and then Fuchsia. Snag half the badges. And then when we go to... No, that's the whole southern side. No, it's not. We're missing Cinnabar. We could do Cinnabar next. And then surf straight up to Pallet. And then from Pallet to... Viridian, Viridian Pewter to whatchamacallit. I'm gonna belly jump against this home. Um, Celadon. 
and we're gonna do the fucking power plant last. <laughs> All right, Benjamin. Do 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 do. Hey, let's maximize that goddamn attack. We trying to end lives with this body slam. I only got five left. Girl, it's late. Time to get to sleep. Ben Hameen. Oh my god, I fucking love that we're using the Snorlax. I want to use the Snorlax in our next five LPs or Nuzlocks, whichever come first. Do you only have three Pokemon? Oh my god. Look at this. Didn't I tell you they always do this shit? Every time you lose a Mon, they put it right back in your face immediately. I don't want to see this anymore. Don't thrash me. Don't thrash me. Don't. Yo, 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 chill. I clicked Hyper Beam. Yo, chill. I clicked Hyper Beam. I'm gonna have to recharge. Yo, I have a fucking A bomb. I have a fucking A bomb. A sunflower. Ooh. 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 This bitch is crazy. <laughs> Set out of level 62 sub floor and clicked solar beam. No way! Yo, I love to see it. She's like hyper beam me, you bitch. Watch this. Okay. Sauron, cook her up. Cook this sun floor up. I swear to god, if it has a uh Focus Sash, Focus Sash, Mirror Coat, Sun Flora, Sabrina, you really are reading the future. I will believe it at that moment. <laughs> Oh, God. All right, Ranger Scott. Hand it over. Summer Rachel's waiting on me. Your power. It far exceeds what I foresaw. Maybe it isn't possible to fully predict what the future holds. Okay, you win. You earned yourself a marsh match. Dope. Thanks for that. Marsh badge draws out your subliminal powers. Although I fail to accurately predict your power, this much I know to be true. You will become a celebrated and beloved champion. Hey, thanks. So we did it. We out, right? This takes us out, right? Yeah, fuck yeah. Okay. Peep it, peep it, peep it, peep it, peep it. Look at our badges. How do we see the uh, other badges? Do we not? Okay, what? Well. Look at the badges on the layout. Oh my god, look at this looking so nice. We got another one. Wow. Wow, 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 we, wow, we. Or you know what I think we could do next? Oh, there's gonna be another Snorlax. Fuck, no, we should just go to the, we should just go to the power plant. We should. <laughs> Stop trying to do everything all different which ways. We should just go to the fucking power plant and get it situated so that then we can take the magnet train back whenever we need to. But we are on Route 5, and I don't know about you guys, but Route 5 has grace. Our first encounter on Route 5 is... A Clefable! Oh my goodness! Fuck yes! What do you mean didn't affect Clefable? Clefables don't sleep? <laughs> is that what you mean? Bro, how did you wake up instantly? How does it not affect you 16 times in a row and then you wake up instantly? Get in the ball. Yo, what? Now I'm asleep? What the fuck is happening? Yo. Yo. Thank you. <laughs> I've clicked hypnosis about 87 times. Yo, this is ridiculous. It's a level 15 fucking Clefable. A ball from Moonstone Evolvers. Let's do it. Oh my lord. Fucking stop. Oh, that did nothing. Yo, we have used so many Ultra Balls. I just don't understand. 
Like, I literally cannot do anything else. The only other option I have is to Master Ball it. I can't attack it any other way. You know what I'm gonna do? Can't fucking swap because of blind. Come, because of blind. Because of blind. Come the fuck on. This is. Release from bind. Okay. Rama. Click confuse right. Now well, hurt yourself. Please. Hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. You know, I thought to myself, like, okay, we're just gonna have a nice little quick encounter. Hot little hop skip over to Celadon City, wrap up the episode. But no, this Clefable wanted to do this instead. What? It, it, is Clefable legendary? And I just didn't find out? What was that? Like 40 fucking Pokeballs? I don't even want to use this thing. I don't even want to use this thing. Honestly, I don't. I take that back. I fucking love Clefable, but fuck this one. It's like to live in a quiet, remote mountains. This type of area is a strong version of being seen. Fuck this Clefable. What am I going to name this thing? I'm going to name it... Lola. Okay. Bill, I got you, bro. We'll fix that shit up quick, fast, and in a hurry. God damn it. I know that was the fucking daycare, and I was like, oh yeah, they got a fucking PC box. But you know who else has a PC box? The actual fucking PC. Um, okay, so let's check Lola out real quick. Same double set, metronome, moonlight, like we didn't know that. Uh, let's change let's change this box three and fill that one up we're gonna give seven the chance to shine he's gonna do the goddamn thing I'm just gonna say hey with the addition of Ben Hamin and seven our team just drastically got bulkier like very very drastically got bulkier and am I mad about it no so let us explore cerulean city and see what we can get into. My husband lives happily with Pokemon. He got through trades. No, y'all have no. He just says I'm so happy and spins in circles. Okay. Didn't a uh, lady used to live here that would give out bubble sores? What happened to her? So we need to get a Cerulean City encounter. We need to get a. Let's check it right now. Let's check it right now. Cerulean City Route 24, Route 25. A Route 9, a Rock Tunnel, a Power Plant Encounter, and a Route 4 Encounter. So that we can like kind of curl that off at Mount Moon. Oh, whoa, the bike shop is locked down? The bike shop has moved to Golden Round City in Johto. Damn, fuck all you unfit Cantoians. Who don't ever want to ride your bike to work? You don't want to ride your bike from place to place? Look at you making all these shortcuts in your city. What's wrong with you? You know what? Hold up. We're talking about encounters. Can't we get a Cerulean City encounter right here? No, let's go in the middle. Let's go in the middle right here. Wait, can I surf? Is it fishing only in this bitch? Okay, fine. You forced my hand. Check it out. Wait, we don't have the super rod yet because we haven't been to what's his face south of Lavender Town. Oh, we're fooling ourselves. Now isn't the time to use that? What do you mean? I thought you could get an encounter in here. Not even a nibble. Misty, did you stop stocking this bitch? Do you have to have a super rod to get a cerulean gym encounter? Are the only mons that show up in the cerulean gym super rod mons? 
Alright, look, Misty, I'm pissed. Where the fuck you at? I wanna fight. I wanna fight, ho. She's not in the gym? I thought if we couldn't get an encounter, we could at least get a gym badge, but Cerulean City wants to be stingy with everything! Okay. We'll get a Route 4 encounter instead. How about that, boo boo? So, up first for tonight. <sighs> Yo, I cannot escape this Pokemon. <laughs> Oh my god, today's episode of fucking, uh... The Cracked Egglock. We don't have a Clefairy or a Clefable yet? We do! We caught a Clefable named Alola! Look at that Pokeball next to that. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. We want new... Oh, never mind, I'd rather have the Clefable. Oh my god. You sure we ain't got one of these? Kingler, Rhydon, Macargo, Mankey, Tremillion, Wooper, Bellsprout, Sunflower, Crowback, Goback, Houndoom, Elicate, Krokona, Teddy Ursa, Onyx, Ivysaur, Gyarados, Dragonair, Mr. Mime, Cyndaquil, Snorlax, Strowsy, Diglett, Magmar, Sudowoodle, Tentacruel, Ekans, Onyx, Krabby, Zatu, Persian, Butterfree, Tugatag, Weedle, Magmar, Mew, Raikou, Mantime, Grimer, Polyway, Clef Fable, and now I guess, Ammonite. Almighty Brick Piece. How could you have done this to us? Yo, I don't understand how this thing doesn't get caught on the first try. Like, it, like, it, hold on, time out, time out, time out. Like, I honestly. And just like the crack deck lock, are we killing counters over here too? Ooh, we boy. Ooh we boy, yes we do. <laughs> oh well, I was gonna click hypnosis. I promise, I promise you, I was going to click hypnosis there. But you know, we was just speeding through that motherfucker like it wasn't nothing. <sighs> are, are you mad? Are you mad about a nominate? Cause I'm not mad about a nominate. If there was one encounter that I'm okay- Whoa, we've been held up by robbers before. Wow, that wound's still fresh. You guys, uh... Fixed this wall real nice. I can't even tell Team Rocket broke in. You gotta tell my business, bitch, dog. You need to download the update, though. There's a whole other fucking region you can go look at. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, 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 yeah. You're not worried about the Ammonite. I'm not worried about the Ammonite. Let's not worry about the Ammonite. Let's worry about our next encounter. Yo, they just, it's like they just decided, hey, we're going to make our town livable. <laughs> hey, y'all. Uh, he's talking about Mewtwo. My item finder is responding. Bro, don't freak me out like that. I will go through every single spot on here because you know I didn't catch enough Pokemon to get a goddamn item finder because I'm doing a Nuzlocke so you gonna be a real pal and show me where this motherfucker's at or am I gonna put everyone's eardrums out as I spam this controller on late night crystal huh yo if I go through this whole fucking thing and I don't find anything I am going to surmise that my controller is most definitely fucked up and busted. Now, don't get me wrong. I've known it for a long time. This is the same controller <laughs> that I had before uh, our hiatus when we had issues. But you can't say I didn't try a new controller, Renegade Platinum. I tried that fucking seven kill streak controller. Yo, his item finder is busted. It's bugging. I tried that seven kill streak controller and it did not work out well. So I'm supposed to buy a third controller? Come on. How many of you guys have three controllers in your house? <laughs> All right, Route 24 and count. Whoa, I didn't even touch the speed up button. What the fuck's up with this game? Route 24 and counting. I promise to not kill it this time. A Kodabora. Last time I checked, we do not have a Kodabora. And the last time I checked was just a few moments ago when I did the whole goddamn pokey rap of our PC. So I'm gonna jot down Kodabora. 
because I don't know about you, but I'm gonna catch this bitch. I fully plan to. Oh, please don't have teleport. That's two encounters that we just uh, <laughs> lost out on. <laughs> Don't you worry, we got ourselves a green apricorn. Haven't been back to Azalea Town in 20 episodes, but who knows? Who knows? Maybe we'll get that green apricorn over to Kurt and then come back <laughs> and check on it. Yo, what I don't understand is why did they code the game like this? You know what I mean? Like this. I mean, I guess the the whole idea of gym leaders having stronger Pokemon based on like where you start out, you know, I guess that came later. And I guess ultimately, oh, chill, 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 Ben, Ben, I mean, help us out, Ayutame. I guess that whole notion. Oh my God, hold up, who's taking? It's supposed to be you. Oh no, I healed the wrong person. Oh no. <sighs> I don't think I've had a another lock death that made me feel more defeated than this one right here I was just talking about this goddamn controller and the button sticking and it's <sighs> I keep losing Pokemon to Golem <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why is this Pokemon the bane of my existence? I love you. <laughs> like I fought to use a golem on the team. What the fuck? I did go to heal him. Honestly, I probably could have I <sighs> I think I opened the menu to swap to Ben Hamin and then I closed the menu and went to heal. And then when I opened the menu through the healing selection it was already on Ben Hamin so I clicked up on the controller but this whole fucking controller just sticks so it didn't move and I healed Ben Hamin because that's where the arrow started and unfortunately seven passed away I was so happy to have all this buff on the team too and now look what the fuck happened and to add insult to injury we got a crit not that I honestly think it matters but why 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 is it even necessary? Why? <sighs> Seven, bro. That was not right. That was not right. I don't care what you say, that was not right. He did not deserve that. Xavier, bro, we haven't seen you in a while. Get your long nose ass up here. Do we get an encounter on this route? No. We're on route 25? Yes. Okay. I want to see a fucking Steelix right now. Give me a fucking Steelix. We already got a little Grammy boy. That was two episodes ago. Get the fuck out of here. We don't want you. We want a Steelix. Or something with equal defense. I already told you. You're not welcome here, bro. We've already got a poison type on the squad. We already have a Grimer in the PC. Surprisingly enough, as much as I would love this encounter, it's actually species. We have a crocodile named Patty in the PC. So let's uh, run this one again real quick. Check it. It's species. It's dupes. I don't give a fuck 
I don't give a fuck. 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 And if you know, if you know, then you already know what I'm gonna name this Onyx. If you know, then you already know what I'm gonna name this Onyx. Are you ready? Are you ready? Because if you don't know, you about to know. We just lost seven. And now we just gained eight. What are the fucking odds? What are the fucking odds that would happen? We could have a slow bro. We had a totodile. We had a... Oh fuck! We had a totodile. We had a what was the, what was the first one of those species? We had a couple grimers, and yeah, we had a grimers. We had totodiles. The slowbro would have been a new encounter, but what are the fucking odds? There's onyx in this grass. Pineco. That's wild. I love it. I love it. I love it. If it's meant to be, it'll be. Anyways, enough of music I don't listen to. Let us, ugh, look at this doofus, get him out of here. Of course he flinched. How dare, how dare you try and emulate my team? Get out of here. I, you know, I'm, I'm on such a high at the moment. You can send out as many legendary Pokemon as you like. Do we have anyone that knows? Oh, we got a nugget. Thanks, bro. Bro, I'll whoop you too. I will gladly whoop you as well. You can have three. Three Butterfree. They're all getting whooped by Xavier. Do we have anyone else cut? Fuck, are you serious? Are we really gonna teach someone cut right now? To get this item? Wow, this battle is so intense. It's just so dope. Whoa, 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 wowie, wowie. This battle, it's got me at the edge of my seat. Like, sometimes I don't even know what to do. These battles are so intense. Whoa, 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 whoa. I almost lost all six of my Pokemon. Wow, 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 battle, so intense battle, battle, yo, you know what's crazy, this brand new miracle seed just popped up in my bag, whoa, do you guys know where it came from, I don't know where it came from, Wow, this place is so nice and weed free. Let's move on with our journey. Oh, we could have got a water encounter up here. How come this isn't considered like Bill's Cape or something like that? Why is this not a separate area? You know, like I feel like it definitely should be. Do we even need to come up here for any reason? Mm -hmm. You know Bill, he's my grandson. He's in Jojo. He does something with PC, so I'm house sitting. My grandson Bill told me about a Pokemon that has a long tongue. If you have that Pokemon, may I see it, please? Is it time for Madam President to make her triumphant return? I think it is. I think it is time for Madam President to make her triumphant return. And then we are most definitely, indubitably, slapping eight on the squad. We are going, oh no, we have to change boxes. Oh. My poor number seven. My poor number seven. He didn't deserve to go this way. We're gonna deposit him off. Farewell, buddy. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. We're gonna get 
your reincarnated form ate right out of the PC. <laughs> And without even any hesitation, we are giving this right to you, my boy. Yes, we are. He's after the squad, and I honestly don't think there's any better. What's the word I'm looking for? Poetic justice? There we go. I don't think there's any better poetic justice than that. The fact that he has now returned to our squad. <laughs> Can you be upset? Can you blame him? I couldn't. Um, I'm gonna get rid of one quick claw. Um, okay, we're good with that. We're good with that. Um, but what we're, we're not good with, we need a couple more hybrid potions. Um, okay, so check it. Do we need to go to the power plant next? Because Missy is still not in her gym. And to be honest, I'm getting a little concerned. Just a little bit. 118,000, we don't have that many encounters left. <laughs> you know, all you sell is super potions? <laughs> Excuse me? All you sell is super potions? Okay, look, if anyone dies, it's this lady's fault or this man or their fault in cerulean city it is their fault for us <laughs> losing a pokemon i'm gonna make it known right now if it happens next it's their fault do we really need cut please don't tell me we need cut you moved all this shit out of the way over here in cerulean city please tell me you moved this pathetic ass cut bush Why, yo? Fucking why? Yo, please tell me 8 can learn it. Because you're still... We can move it off of you, you know? <sighs> why you like this, bro? There's a Pokemon Center over there, right? Okay. Okay. In a regular Nuzlocke, you know, you may not bend the rules like this, but you know, here in Late Night Crystal, it's a little bit more of a laid back, chilled out vibe. Uh, I hate to get rid of eight because he's gonna miss out on so much training. Oh my goodness. Okay, the very least, I should withdraw a Pokemon that can learn cut. I will say that much. I was gonna pull seven out of the PC again, but Winston, can Winston learn cut? Yes, he can. Okay. Winston is still going to help us from the grave. Winston the pirate himself has come back to cut all of the ropes on our opponent's ships. Look at that. Cut. Gone. Just like that. Could any other Pokemon cut like that? I don't think so. Okay, we're on Route 9. Route 9, Rock Tunnel, Route 10, Power Plant, Lavender Town. Lavender radio to oh they changed it Okay, um, I Think route 10 after rock tunnel and not when it turns, but we'll see where we're at So route 9 we can get an encounter on rock tunnel We can get an encounter on and power plant we can get an encounter on most definitely Listen here girl, I'm down to battle Xavier don't give a rat's ass he whooping everybody he whooping everybody pull up show up let us know what you do get us out of here I don't care if it's a dark type he don't care if it's a dark type out of here we have had plenty of mock battles versus swimmer Rachel anything you can throw at us does not matter <laughs> I didn't think I'd ever have to say this but <laughs> I think I'm gonna call dupes on this Mew <laughs> I think I'm gonna call dupes on this Mew. And I think I'm gonna go to the other grass patch as well. I mean, we have a Mew chilling in the PC that we're not even using. Oh my God. Yo, okay, hold on, time out. It has happened too many times now across too many series. 
every single time we lose a Pokemon, the same Pokemon shows up minutes later. What the fuck? Like, for real, what the fuck? See, I was comfortable sending out Julian there because I know Steelix does not get Earthquake by level up. <laughs> I know he's a whoa danger man. <laughs> I know Steelix does not get earthquake by level up. We have nothing to worry about. Yo, fuck that Alakazam up. Hey, hold up. Let us get this protein. Uh, we have a special, physical, special, physical, special. I guess eight would be physical. I'm gonna give it to my boy Benhamin here. Benhamin, he deserves it. That's a growing boy. That's a growing boy. You know, he's upwards of a thousand pounds. <laughs> or should we get our encounter here in this patch? No, I distinctly remember getting our encounter there before. I know so many times I fucking forget to get our encounter or I neglect to get our encounter at the next patch of grass. So I'm gonna hold out this time. Very much so intentionally to get our encounter over here. Girl, listen. I don't care what you got with this Blastoise. I don't care what you got with this Giraffery. I'm the fucking champion. Like, who, uh, who do you think you're battling? Who, whom, whomst, whomst do you think you're battling? All right, our encounter is Okay, we can go with that. Put him to sleep. So a lot of you guys were saying that we should use poison gas to lower them down and hope that it catches them before they die. So let's test that theory right now. Let's test it out. I'm not saying it won't work, but apparently poison gas does less poison damage than toxic does. I mean, I can't put him to sleep, so we just have to wait at this point, you know? All right, I'm not gonna wait any longer. Ultra Ball, go. Check it out. I guess the poison gas does work. Shout the fuck out to y'all. So we caught a Slow King here. And I don't know why, but the numbers, Mason. <laughs> what do they mean, the numbers, Mason? Um, I'm gonna call him nine. The numbers, Mason. What do they mean? And I just want to say that we are at the point now where on my little notepad where I'm taking notes, which I know is messy as shit because half the time I'm writing this down while not looking at it. You know, I'm still commentating or like looking at the camera. But we almost have a full fucking page of encounters in this game. We have one spot left and the back side of this is our TM. So what the fuck? I still have late night crystal TMs and encounters. I mean, late night yellow TMs and encounters jotted down. Wow, we, wow, we. Okay, so Route 10 starts up here. So technically, when we're surfing to, I'm just gonna get this rock tunnel encounter real quick. When we're surfing to the power plant, we could get a Route 10 encounter. Uh, no Pokemon living here now. A uh, Zatu. If I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure we have one of those in the PC. Nina, cut it out. Get back in the box. <sighs> I don't think I need to redo the whole encounter list to know that Wobbuffet is a new encounter. Well, I mean, I guess if there was ever a game to use Wobbuffet in, it would be this one right less Pokemon that can whoop his ass less moves to get around his annoyances uh, I was about to say less chances to use him holy shit he is the patient Pokemon in order to conceal its black tail it lives in a dark cave and only moves about at night that's fucking dope that we found him in a cave though so I'm gonna name him Wow, he's got little Gengars. A little Sprite. I'm gonna name him Doctor. Doctor Wobbuffet in the building. Um, we may or may not go through Dark Tunnel. 
I, I actually don't think we actually even need to or have to um, but maybe just for shits and giggles because it's late night crystal why not um, eight my boy I need you back on the squad we're getting ready to do important shit come on back over here buddy come here come here come here come here come here come here okay so I wouldn't mind getting a route 10 encounter on the south side of rock tunnel um, but if we happen to encounter something here, what am I supposed to do about it? That's a Route 10 encounter. Ah, we're two squares away. And we definitely don't have that yet. <laughs> we definitely don't have that yet. Okay, Almighty Brickpea showing us the way. Fuck yes! Okay, I don't know what I'm gonna do about this fucking list now. We're out of slots. Um, what is this? Oh, I need this. Oh, I need this. Get this out of here. Alright, we have... Late Night Crystal Mons 2. And our first edition... To the list is a mighty mighty Heracross. With its Herculean powers, it can easily throw around an object that is a hundred times its own weight. Okay, so I think I'm gonna name him just one word because I name my Hundo Machamp in Pokemon Go Almighty because of Bobby Lashley, obviously. Um, but Heracross will be mighty. Hey, he might have a spot on the squad. Bill? Hi, Nappy. It's me, Bill. Thanks for using my storage system. That last Pokemon you sent filled your box up. You'll have to switch boxes if you want to catch more Pokemon. Okay, fine. You're lucky there's a Pokemon Center right here. Could we fly to it? <laughs> could we have flown to this Pokemon Center? I feel like we definitely could. But you know what, Bill? I got you, buddy. At the very least, you called me. The very least you called me. Okay, I had to double check. So that means we have 40 powerful Pokemon in the PC right now? Waiting? Hey, I gotta put Heracross on that list as well. Asterisk for Heracross. I know I've used a Heracross in a Nuzlocke before, but I just, it's been so long. It's been so long. So off the top of my head, I know I said Snorlax, Arcanine, and now Heracross. I feel like there might have been one more Pokemon on that list that I might have mentioned, but I don't know. But we got to use Ben Hamin. Um, knock on wood. It's only been two episodes now, so here's to hoping we get to continue it, but we'll see. A thief broke into the power plant. What is the world coming to? Oh my god, it's all coming back to me now. Yes, I'm pretty sure we do have to go through Rock Tunnel. This power plant has been abandoned in the past. We had to back up and run in to provide power to the magnet train. I was hoping to get an encounter in here, dude. Someone made off with a part that's essential for the generator. Without it, the new generator's useless. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Vaporeon? You want to trade it for my Tangela? You don't want to trade? Pretty sure we do have a Vaporeon, but I don't want to trade. And number two, I completely forgot about the fucking Lickitung. Hold on, I gotta do the lick of tongue before we wrap here. Hold up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut the fuck up. We got a fucking lick of tongue. Sad and furious. We got a lick of tongue to, to, to show off here. I'm proud of that motherfucker. What do you mean? Yeah, look at me in here. This is what my office looks like. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Late Night Crystal. Oh, oh, I'm ready to blast someone. Who would dare ruin my generators? I spent so much time on it. If I catch him, he's going to get a taste of my zap cannon. And they don't give you any sort of clue or any sort of hint or any sort of reference. But isn't the guy in, like, Lavender or some shit? Isn't he at the the Lavender radio tower? Or is... I just got word from Cerulean. It appears that a shady character has been loitering around. Never mind. I remember it all now. Could I ask for your cooperation? Oh, that's it? You just asked for it? Okay, guys at the gym, throws in the pool. I'm thinking of Drayano Hack, where 
there's an event at the Lavender Tower radio station, right? Right, 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 right. I'm, I'm, I'm remembering that correctly, right? Right, 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 right. This motherfucker. Oops, I'm so sorry. You not hurt, okay? I'm very busy. No time for talking with you. Not good for me if seen by somebody. Oh no, you see me already. I make big mistake. Hey, you, forget you see me, okay? You see here, know nothing, okay? Bye, kid, nothing. Bye bye, a go go. Bye bye, a go go. Bye bye, a go go. Ain't that about a bitch? Well, wait, do you just have to. I thought, is it in the water? Where the fuck is it at? Didn't he hide it in the wall? Okay. 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 Okay, 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 okay. 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 Lady Ramla, if you would not mind. Can we fly over here? Fuck. <laughs> Guess what? You can't fly. There's no fucking way people made a video game and expected you to do this. What the fuck? Come on. Yo, I have to change PC boxes to do this. <laughs> I have to change PC boxes to do this. Yo, what the fuck? I think the number one thing that Pokemon did to improve overall gameplay and experience it was to get rid of HMs because don't get me wrong like I get it I understand it it's an added difficulty for the player to overcome but you shouldn't make something that's so permanent cost so much because the idea of having a high price to obtain something would mean that it would then therefore need to be worth it and I don't know about you but defog rock climb whirlpool aside from most of the time advancing in the story it is almost never worth it um, strength until they changed it or strength on any Pokemon that's not a normal Pokemon really unless you're running surf or waterfall none of the HMs are really worth it Oh, yeah, that's the missing part from my beloved generator. You found it? Waha, thanks. Here, take this TM as a reward. Thanks, bro. That TM07 is Bone Club. Which, uh, didn't we teach to... No, we taught Bone Meringue. TM07 is now Bone Club. We taught Bone Meringue to Benjamin, but now we have Bone Club. It's a powerful technique. All right, thanks, bro. Thanks. You know what? Before we leave this power plant that's buzzing with good vibration, I think we should do our nightly Pocket Maya Angelou wisdom quote. We are in the middle of chapter two, which is love, and tonight's quote is, Everything of value takes work, particularly relationships. Everything of value takes work, particularly relationships. Ain't that about a bitch. That's one thing I've definitely learned um, from seeing Hector. And I'm not trying to rag on him or dog on him or anything like that. You know, he's awesome. He's incredible. He's amazing. He's loving my life. Oh my God. But I will tell you, it definitely does take work. You know, it's just <sighs> wrong example to use. I don't want to get into all that in a YouTube video, but I love Hector. He's the best. But can we take on Misty? 
Where is this whore at? Anyways. <laughs> yeah! I sense a sinister shadow hovering over you. Take this to ward it off. Thanks. Appreciate it. Didn't this used to be a daycare? Uh, no, wait, wait, that, that's it? Wait, would you just give me another item to take up my bag space? So, <clears throat> in the last episode, you guys, we rescued the power plant. <laughs> I was going to say, I'm trying to lead to taking on Misty because that's what I really want to do in tonight's episode. Um, but first things first, we need to get our sixth and final team member on the squad. Um, we needed Winston, the Krabby V2, because he or she has cut. But in actuality, we need to change our box. No, don't do that. And grab the eight, the eighth, <laughs> the eighth member of our squad, eight the Onyx, who's level ten, but he's only experience here. Rock and tackle screech and bind. Everyone else gets a team recap. Eight is on the team. He gets a team recap. Come on now. Um, but anyways, yes. So after we restored order to the power plant, apparently now we have a lot of different things that we need to accomplish now. Um, tonight we are cock blocking 101. We are about to go up here, all the way up here, and interrupt Misty on her date, which she should be available now. I, I don't, I don't, I don't really understand why she wouldn't be available at this point like we've we've done all the necessary things and in all honesty you know this kind of like tripped me out a little bit because i really went into this i really went into this thinking like oh yeah canto's whatever we just do whatever in whatever order completely forgot there's all these little storyline events but <sighs> oh Why'd you have to show up and bug us now? Do you know what they call people like you? Pests. You heard me right. Pest. Hmm. Oh, those badges you have. Are they Johto Gym badges? If you have eight, you must be good. Okay, then. Come to Cerulean Gym. I'll be happy to take you on. I'm Misty, the gym leader in Cerulean. Mm -hmm. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. Alright, so... We were heading towards Saffron in the last episode, and that's why we started off there at the former daycare center. Um, but I guess we can go to Saffron next. I mean, I know we need to go back to Vermilion to get the Poke Doll and whatnot, but still. Oh, magically, all of her gym trainers show up. You know what? While we're sitting here in the middle of her gym, in front of all of her shitty ass trainers, I think it's a perfect time for our pocket Maya Angelou wisdom quote of the night we are in chapter 2 which is love and tonight's quote is the most called upon prerequisite of a friend is an accessible ear the most called upon prerequisite of a friend is an accessible ear and let me tell you that is the mother fucking truth in my life for a lot of the time, I have been every person I've known. I've been their rock. And when you're everyone else's rock, it's very rare that you find someone who is your rock. But I will say, I think that is a number one. This motherfucker roared us out. A number one attribute of a good friend. Ah. Oh. You roared us out into the wrong motherfucker, dog. Let me tell you, bro. You clicking Lear? Did Misty fill you in in who we are? I don't think she did. I don't think she did. She didn't tell you we have eight badges from the Johto League, did she? She didn't tell you that. She didn't tell you that we're coming here for blood. She didn't tell you that. She didn't tell you that your psychic type Pokemon mean nothing to my psychic type Pokemon. Okay, hold on. I can't touch this Pokemon. <laughs> hold on. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. You know, it actually kind of boggles me a little bit. Why would they make Kanto... You know, like, especially considering that this is supposed to be post-Pokemon League. I, I mean... 
I don't know. I, I feel like we're we're looking at this as like hindsight is twenty twenty. Because, you know, like, we've always had the theory of, like, they scale their Pokemon to whoever's taking them on, and then Origins or whatever it was confirmed it. So now you use this, like, idea all these years later, and you apply it to a game that came out 20 years ago when this game actually was supposed to be the last one. So I'm sure they weren't thinking about any of that shit then, but still, either way, this is still 30% boosted. So what does that mean that these gym trainers are normally... Are they really that weak? <laughs> is that if if that's the case, I would say that is my number one issue with Generation Two. I love Generation Two. Do not get me wrong. Just because I point out one thing doesn't mean that I dislike the entire generation. If anything, I pointed out out of love. You know, this is something that I wish was better because then it would be an almost or I should say closer to a flawless Pokemon game. But. Anyways, I'm going to save my game right here because only you can prevent lost save data. I was expecting you, you pest. You may have a lot of Johto gym badges, but you'd better not take me too lightly. My water type Pokemon are tough. Oh my god, I didn't even go and heal. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm missing a Hyper Beam. <laughs> On Ben Hamid, I'm missing a Hyper Beam. You leave with a shuckle? Of all things that you could choose to train? Oh wow, her gym trainers are nothing compared to her. What the fuck? Okay, so what is, what is this gonna look like on this shuckle? I know shuckle's a bug type, but like, what is this gonna look like on this shuckle right here? Okay, okay. I'm gonna tell you right now, I ain't clicking nothing on you, bruh. Nothing. Go to sleep. <laughs> Does Bide still work when he's asleep? It had better not. Sleep better cancel out Bide. Uh, I don't see a prompt for it, but I also would not be surprised if it just all of a sudden said Bide released energy. But won't happen. Because I'm pretty sure that was the third turn, but homeboy is dead and gone. All right, Miss Two, you got next. <clears throat> I mean, Ranger Tia. I'm telling you, I know we encountered Steelix in last night's episode, but every single time we lose a Pokemon, they rub it in your face right afterwards. Why? Well, I know that we can securely go into Julian here because I know that Steelix does not get a ground type move by level up. Oh, unless you count Sandstorm. All right, unless you count Sandstorm, which technically ups his special defense, right? Julian, 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 I'm telling you, this happens every single time, too. I gas them up at the start of the episode, and then everything goes fucking south from there. Julian, land this hydro pump, please, and thank you. Look at them pretty green jelly ores on the top of your dome. Please land that shit, please, and thank you. Excellent. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it when a plan comes together. Eight. Eight has grown nine levels since this episode has started. Is he growing fast as shit or what? That's that's our growing boy right there. Level 57. Porygon 2. Okay. Chill, 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 chill. Ben Hameen? Show him what you're working with. Show him what you're working with. Show him why we call you Big Benny. Show him why they call you Big Benny. Big old Benny. Show him why they call you Big Benny. Is that canon, bro? This is what we're doing? We're pulling out the big guns? You clicking Zap Cannon on my Big Benny boy? Oh, my Big Benny boy? Oh, who does this guy think he is? Who does this guy think he is? I mean, honestly, watch me send it a fucking Machamp. <laughs> please, please, Ranger Tia, don't send out a Machamp. Okay, we can handle a Gramble. Oh, level 61. Okay, never mind. I take back everything I said about this gym. Her trainers are all pushovers, but at least she has one Pokemon that's like on par with where we're at right now. Takedown? 
Whoa, 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 what the fuck? You hench ass fucking gramble. What the fuck? Why'd he hit so fucking hard? God damn. Well, Benjamin, I guess until eight grows up, you are our defensive wall. <laughs> Shit. Uh, we ain't got no full restores? I need to go back to the Pokemon League, bro. I can't believe I bought 30 fucking hyper potions. Bro, stop clicking takedown. You do way too much fucking damage. Look at this. How much HP does Ben Hamin have? I mean, I know he's more specially defensive, but bro, we ain't got no one else to go out to, bro, to take a takedown like that. Like, check it. Check it. 96 defense? Oh, wait a minute. 85 defense? Ain't no fucking way. I know Crobat is fat as hell, but ain't no fucking way. So you tell me right now, I'm gonna swap out to this Crobat and it's gonna take this takedown better than Benjamin does. Hey, I'm no mathematician. That's why I record myself playing video games. I'm no mathematician, okay? <laughs> okay, I just want to make that very clear here. Uh, Ramla, by the way, I need you to... Never mind, you good. <laughs> I was expecting another, like, crit takedown, but never mind, you good. She clicked rage. You really are good. I'll admit that you are skilled. Here you go, it's Cascade Badge. Hey, we get snuck that little amulet coin in there as well. Don't mind if I do. Are there many strong trainers in Johto? Like you, I mean. I'm going to travel one day so I can battle some skilled trainers. <sighs> I'd do all that to get her to come back to this gym. Just for her to fuck around with Big Benny. Okay. Whatever. Speaking of Misty, um, Hector and I were watching... Um, Wait a minute. <laughs> we were watching Pokemon <laughs> Pokemon the movie Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. Pokemon Blaze Black 2 Redux Cracked Egglock. <laughs> we were watching Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. And I gotta say, after all these years, I've never seen it before, but after all these years of like watching that story and those scenes in like old school like gen 1 animation it was really nice to see it with updated graphics now i know some of the voice acting didn't really match their lips or whatever but it's whatever they don't really bother me you know yo i love how you can see the top of the gym for me and it's so dope but you know it don't really bother me it's whatever you know i don't expect it to be some incredible piece of media or whatever i don't even you get the point I'm making. Wait, we need to go to Vermilion to get the doll? Okay. We need to go to Lavender Town to go to the Radio Tower as well. And we have encounters over there too we need to get. But, what if I want to get a fucking gym badge? Where do we go next for that? Celadon? Can we go to Celadon? Okay, we're going to save Lavender. No, because we need uh, the radio card from Lavender to get the Snorlax is out of the way, but technically we don't even need that to go to where we need to. Snorlax is to... Can we go through? Oh wait, we do need it. Because Diglett's Cave is fucking gone. I was about to say, we could just go through Pewter, but wait, couldn't we... I have to investigate Celadon. Can't we go through Celadon to go down to Koga? I mean, to go down to Janine? I mean, to go down to Fuchsia City, and then couldn't we surf, and then go north through Pallet to Pewter, and still get all the badges without ever visiting Lavender Town? It's a plot. It's a scheme. It's a railway that goes to Goldenrod and Johto. Do we have to talk to the girl first? Oh wait, this is the wrong fucking house. What am I doing? <laughs> Oh, right. It's a Clefairy Poke Doll. Can I have this, bro? I love Clefairy, but I could never catch one, so I'm making do with the Poke Doll that I found. 
I thought Homegirl was looking for it. Hello, Nappy. Did you come to see about my Pokemon again? No. Oh, I have more tales to tell. Do we really have to talk to her first? Okay, before I leave, I'm gonna double check. Ugh. Are you for shizzle? Are you for real about this? Anyways, we watched Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution. It was fucking dope. That's all I gotta say about that. <laughs> nah, but it was it was really fucking dope to see a lot of the animation and whatnot. Um, especially all the Pokemon. Anytime they show like Pokemon compared to humans, compared to like any real life like object, inanimate object or whatever, like a building for example, like it just blows my mind. Like oh my god, like I wish this was fucking real. All right, chick. Hi, I heard that you lost your favorite Poke doll. If I find it, you'll give me a rail pass? I'll go find it for you. You think you lost it when you went to Vermilion City? Pardon? I shouldn't decide what you do, but I'm really worried. What if someone finds it? Okay, so now we're gonna go back and do everything that we just did again. Imagine if we could just rewind like back, boom, Vermilion City. But it don't work like that. First off, Fuck you, Wild Typhlosion. I already got an encounter here, and it wasn't you. So, fuck you, Wild Typhlosion. I know there's Zapdos in that grass, too. I do remember that, too. Fuck you, Wild Zapdos. Actually, I take that back. Proud memory team instinct. I can never say fuck Zapdos. But you know what? Speaking of Zapdos... <sighs> um... Oh, I see now. The girl who lost this boogie doll is sad. Okay, could you take this boogie doll back to that poor old girl? I'll be friend a real Clefairy of my own one day, no worries. Thanks. Um, but speaking of Zapdos, so I never played the, what, Crown Tundra DLC in Sword and Shield. Maybe we'll bring that back one day. <laughs> Finish the Sword and Shield playthrough. <laughs> I mean, hey, Skyrim's been going for eight years now. I said I was gonna finish that, and who knows? That might be back soon. Um, but anyways, <laughs> erase that off the whiteboard. Um, I was wondering, like, what the fuck is Galarian Zapdos' Pokedex description? You know, I've been thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about it. So today I finally looked it up, and I am disappointed. Like, first of all, Galarian Zapdos is dope as fuck. Yay, that's my Clefairy, Pokedoll. See the tear where the tear where the right leg was sewn on? That's proof. Okay, here's the Magnet Train Pass, like I promised. Yo. The one time we have a magnet train pass, Rachel doesn't want to battle. That's the pass for the magnet train. The rail company man gave me that when they tore down our old house for the station. Wow. Christine, I'm not coming, I'm not crossing international borders for you. What? I'm good, what do you want? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. Don't ever call me again. This line is for Summer Rachel and Summer Rachel only. <laughs> Performer Christine, didn't we give her our number for a Firestone? Did she ever give us that? Get her out of here. Get her out of here. Bill, you're lucky you're still here. Get out. I love how they incorporate a delete function. <laughs> Like, I mean, I guess they just didn't have enough memory to include all the trainers that you could call. So I guess you have to decide who to ask and who not to ask. Uh, but still, like, why would you not just let the character keep all of the people they speak to? <laughs> Gotta get rid of her. Bye. We'll soon depart for Goldenrod. Are you coming on board? May I see your real class, please? Okay, right this way. Please. I don't know why we're doing this. What? Wait, I just say we have so many things that we need to do here in Kanto, but look at look at us fucking go. We fucking went. We fucking went. Boo 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 doo doo doo. -doo. We fucking went. Here we are in Goldenrod. Are you loving it? Are you loving it? Doesn't the air smell more Johto-y out here? Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Excuse me, sir. I would like to come back now. Um, okay, so we need to get the radio card. 
We can't escape it. I'm not gonna try and go all crazy about it or anything like that. Right. We got a rock tunnel encounter, right? Yeah, we did. I remember that. Fuck, I didn't even want to fight you. Kanto Pokemon Federation? Fuck out of here at your level 38? Do you, like, who? Uh, I guess this is why eight badges is so impressive because what the fuck? What are y'all doing? What do y'all do all day, like, every day with your time? Like, if your Pokemon, like, you have an, a Blastoise and, and an Articuno? Bro, what are you doing here? Bro, catch four of any other Pokemon. Literally four of any other Pokemon. And you can take on the Elite Four. You'll be great. I promise you. Oh, this is the, uh... The Route House. Not the Route House. The Tunnel. It's locked. It's fucking locked. Um, so... Fuck it. We're training to 63. Um, let's get... Who, who, who have we not seen in a while? Ramla? Lady Ramla? Is it time? I think it's time. What is Ben Hamil? Oh, no, you got a ways to go, buddy. Lady Ramla, we have not seen you in a while. You did just save us from that battle. But we have not seen you in a while. Do we need fucking cut to get an... Oh, whoa, chill. Chill, chill, chill. Do we need cut to get an encounter on this route? Because that would be how they say whack as fuck i would have to go to the pokemon center and in all honesty where the fuck is the nearest pokemon center ramla please and thank you i'm asking you nicely here please and fucking thank you don't do nothing crazy oh my god i'm so tired of this pokemon at this point i honestly am like uh I, what do I what, boomerang here hold this just for this is why we have it for occasions just like this hit him again hit him again get him out of here before you can fucking explode and wipe somebody out we're not interested I don't want any apricorns coins either bro <laughs> I don't want any of that shit keep it the fuck away from me okay hold the phone Oh, I have to change boxes. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, eight, chill. Chill, 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 chill. But you know what? This will work because whoever we catch will go into box two in the place of Winston. And then we can put Winston in box three. Right? Okay. So. Let's see what we get here on this here route. Survey says, do we want dupes? Don't think we want dupes. Do we have a Meryl or an Azumarill? I'm going to say, I don't think, wait, this is late night yelling. What the fuck? <laughs> Looking at all the wrong mods. Um, I don't think we have an Azumarill and I don't think we have a Meryl either. But something tells me we may have a male. We just have so many encounters. I said a couple episodes ago, I wonder which game has the most encounters. Well, it most definitely is this one. Okay, so I don't think we have this yet. So I'm going to confuse it and begin praying to the brick piece. Oh, mighty brick piece. Oh, mighty, mighty brick piece. The bubble-like pattern on its stomach helps it camouflage itself when it's in the water. Check it out. Give a nickname to Azumarill. I think I will give the nickname of... I don't know why. It just popped in my head. Azumarill looks like a Sandra. What can I say? Like, Azumarill is definitely like a Florida woman. You know what I mean? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Get me out of here. 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 We need to change the box to box three, like I was saying. Ha ha. And then we're going to deposit Winston. 
and we're gonna withdraw eight. And look at that, we got a brand new box with a cut on right at the door. Um, so we got our encounter on Route 10, right? Yes, because it takes us up there. So hold off on that for now. Let's just get our fucking radio card. Let's stop with all this extra bullshit. Let's get our goddamn radio card. You got a PC in here? Welcome. Free free to look around anywhere on this floor. Really? Just this floor? Ah, so you're the nappy who solved the power plant's problem. Thanks to you, I never lost my job. I tell you, you're a real lifesaver. Please take this as my thanks. EXPN card. With that thing, you can tune into the radio programs here in Kanto. So I can wake up the Snorlax? For real, for real? Hey there. I'm the super music director. I'm responsible for these gorgeous melodies that go out over the air. Don't be square. Could be music off the air. Check these boots out. Real patent leather. I mean, <laughs> real ostrich. Three payments. When you try to make a reference, then you fuck up a reference. <laughs> Sorry, but you can only tour the ground floor. Ever since Johto's radio tower was taken over by a criminal gang, we have decided to step up our security so we're not like those lowly, foul, air having Johtoians. Mm. I don't know about y'all, but I could fucking never. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry to bother you. I'm sorry to bother you. I apologize. Welcome. Hmm, you appear to be raising your Pokemon in a kind and loving manner. Pokemon lovers come here to pay their respects to departed Pokemon. Please offer condolences for the souls of the departed Pokemon. I'm sure that would make them happy. The Pokemon that live with me, I love them like my grandchildren. Their chamber's only Mr. Fuji Man. Oh, oh really no. Oh, really no. So, aside from the EXPN card, which I guess lets us... A name writer? Bro, chill. <laughs> I already fixed CyberZen. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. But I want to test it real quick. I want to test it and, 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 and... Y'all only sell super potions. Bro, what the fuck? Y'all only sell super potions. Well, let me see here. DJ Lily, skip. DJ Fern. So chill out to Pokemon Lullaby. Is that what wakes him up? Never mind. We found it. Anyways, let's get a move on. Let's get a move on. Actually, let's pause for a moment. <clears throat> I put this here because I wanted to make sure I didn't forget tonight. We have our nightly Maya Angelou wisdom. We are in chapter two. which is love and our quote for tonight is yet it is only love which sets us free it's pretty simple yet it is only love which sets us free and the first thing that comes to mind it's a sad memory shadow bomb or umbreon after all these years, do you remember? <laughs> Is this a Earth, Wind, and Fire fan? Whoa, chill, 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 chill. But after all these years, finally all I had to do was be hit with a sh 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 shadow bomb. And then, now look at me. I'm so sad he's gone. Oh, spoilers. Spoilers, 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 spoilers. You do remember. A what, bro? What? What? Um, so we need to get a new encounter on this route. I know I am laser focused on this Snorlax right now, but we need to get another encounter on this route. And I think we're just going to fish? Because I don't think there's any grass routes. Wait, 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 wait. Here, take my pokey gear. Um, we have route 
13. Okay, so it's after the bend. <clears throat> and then Route 14 down here. But I don't think we're going down south today. Does anyone want to take a guess at which gym we're going for today? <laughs> oh, damn. Just got a goddamn Pokemon. Take your guess in the comment section below. And uh, if you happen to be right, congratulations. But if not, do one of those little edit things and say like, Oh, damn. Shucks. Down on my luck tonight. <laughs> Um, I don't think, for some reason I'm thinking that we have a lady in, but I don't think we have a lady in. I'm not going to do the whole pokey rap right now, but I don't think we have a lady in. I don't think so. So... I think we got to catch this here lady in. How you doing there, buddy? How you doing there? It'd be crazy if I clicked fly on you. Uh, you think you live in that? You think you're living Lady Ramla's a fly from Lady Ramla? I don't think you're living a fly from Lady Ramla. Yeah, hurt yourself in confusion. Almighty break peace. Allow this ultra ball to land. It says in Maglock. I don't know. I'm so excited over Lady Bo. <laughs> it is timid and clusters together with others. The fluid secreted by its feet indicates its location. The fluid secreted by its feet indicate its location. I'm confused. Does that mean like if I look and see the fluid secreted by its feet, like, oh, I know it's around here? Or is it like... <laughs> I don't know. A little too deep for me right now. Um, so, oh, it's not a ma'am. It's a mister. I was going to call it Miss Lady. Um, I'm going to call it Mr. Sir. <laughs> Instead of Miss Lady, it's Mr. Sir. Um, isn't there a little sneaky? Nope, 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 nope. A little sneaky, sneaky. A little sneaky, sneaky something over here. Okay, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I want to make sure that we don't miss out on any Earth, Wind, and Fire fans over here. Get him out of here. Lady Ramla. Look at Lady Ramla. Wow, 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 wow. And she's getting us just absolute insane amount of money. I feel so content fishing while listening to some tunes on my radio. Oh yeah, bro? Is this what you fished up? This, this is what you... Whoa, whoa, chill, 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 chill. Ben Hameen? My boy Big Benny? Recovering off all that damage. Get him out of here. Yo. Yo. My stupid radio distracted me. Yo, hold on. Hold on. I mean, I guess Snow Ice could get Earthquake. I was about to say, Snow Ice with a ground type move. God damn, bro. What the fuck? <clears throat> okay, so I would love to continue going down this route. Oh, wait. Hold up, bro. Hold up, hold up. I've been looking for you, bro. I've been looking for you, dog. I'm the fishing guru's younger brother. <laughs> it's not old as shit. I can see that you are like fishing. There's no doubt in my mind at all. So I know I'm right. Yeah. Yes, yes, just as I thought. Whoa. Here, fishing fan, take this. It's a super rod. Yo, I forgot that this... This is the bum-ass controller that I'd be using, and it's, like, sticky and shit. Well, it's not sticky. <laughs> Phrasing. <laughs> Time out. It's not sticky. It's sticks so like you know when I'm like oh my god I didn't mean to push that button it sticks but I forgot that it also <laughs> lights up <laughs> I pushed the button on accident oh we leaving it on oh hell yeah we leaving it on light me up give me that super rod try your hand at fishing wherever there's water remember you can catch different Pokemon using different rods 
Yeah, we know. We've done a randomizer before. Do we keep going? But, 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 but. Uh, the explorer in me wants to ignore the mission and go explore, do all the side questing. <sighs> all the encounters. But alas, I shall not. We have a quest at hand. And we know what our target is. I said it at the start of the episode, we're hunting Snorlax. That's what's on the menu tonight. And no one, I mean no one, not even artist fucking Sonya is stopping us. Mm -mm, out of the way, ho. Can't be mad at it. Can't be mad at it. I buy him. Wait, is this an encounter? Route 11, right? We've never been over here because this the Snorlax is blocking it, right? Um, now, do not lie to me, List, and tell me that we have not caught a Spearow. Do not lie to me, List. I said I wasn't going to do the Poker app, but I will. Kingler, Rhydon, Macargo, Mankey, Charmeleon, Wooper, Bellsprout, Sephora, Crobat, Golbat, Houndoom, Elicated, Crocodile, Teddy Ursa, Onyx, Ivysaur, Gyarados, Dragonair, Mr. Mime, Cyndaquil, Snorlax, Jersey, Diglett, Magma, Sudowoodo, Tentacle, Atkins, Oddish, Krabby, Zatu, Persian, Butterfree. Oh, why is this actually? <laughs> Togetic, Weedle, Magmar, Mew, Raikou, Mantine, Grimer, Poliwag, Cluffable, Clefable, Onyx, Slowking, Wobbuffet, Heracross, Azumarill, and Ladybug. I don't know about you, but I didn't hear any fucking Spearow. Uh, and you know, it kind of is like the Poke Rap too, because <laughs> every episode we add some more. Come back next time to add on to the Poke Rap. And at the end of the week, add them all up. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, that's actually kind of fucking wild. Yo. The evolution of the Poke Rap. Oh, the late night crystal pokey rap. <laughs> Are you ready? Ah, <sighs> okay, get in the goddamn ball so I can add you to the lyrics. Thanks, bro. Thanks. Appreciate it. To protect its territory, it flies around ceaselessly making high pitched cries. How is that any different from any of us? <laughs> Um, what am I going to name this thing? <clears throat> we have a Spiro, and I'm going to name it. Uh, is that not how you spell that? <laughs> I spelled it a little too literally, god damn. <laughs> and then I looked at it and I was like, wait a minute, that spells Moana. <laughs> I wanted to call her Mona. <laughs> oh god. What is the English language? Get all of this- whoa, he roared me out, get the fuck out of here, bro. Wait, 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 did he run me out? Hold up, wait. <laughs> I know I sped through it, but he roared me out, right? He didn't. No, because it would have asked me. It would have asked me who to send in next. It wouldn't have just automatically sent someone else in. Anyways, I'm not trying to steal eight thunder here. Can we give it up? Can we give it up? Big boy, big boy, big boy. Check you out, dog. Let's check you out. Let's check you out. Tackle streets, bind, rock throw. What a move set. Move set of a champion. Come on. Defense is 136 at level 30. 
higher than this Hypno at 63, higher than a Snorlax at 62, higher than a Houndoom, higher than a Tanacruel. Here's a real question, 130? Wait, what was he? 136? We're gonna be great. We're gonna be great. <laughs> I mean, I'm coaching you. I'm, I'm, I'm his trainer. Let's go. Back on the fight. Let's go. Actually, no. Back on the bench. Hold on to this experience here. Don't move. <laughs> Don't move till you're level 65. <laughs> All right, get up. Ooh. Ooh. Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta add Quillfish to the list. <clears throat> the <laughs> I want to use in an upcoming Nuzlocke list. Quillfish, Arcanine. We had Snorlax, but now we got a Snorlax. So who? I think there was one other person. I don't think it was just Snorlax. Is that it? Ain't no other trainers on this route. What happened to the the old gamblers that were out here doing their thing or whatever with the their get up or whatever they had on oh no our path is blocked look what we found here a nice plump Snorlax ripe for the awakening oh this tomb oh. Cha. love it the Poke Gear was placed near the sleeping Snorlax. Snorlax woke up. What is that? What is that? Oh my god. No, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me, don't show me. Oh my god, why do I hear that all the time? Okay, I don't think this is correct. I don't think this is correct, but I'm gonna guess. Jinx Executor, oh my god. Well, I th I'm close. <laughs> In the Pokédex. <laughs> it sounded... A lot like, yo, I was about to click wing attack. I was this close to clicking wing attack. Like, my thumb was on the A button. I was going to do it. I was going to do it. Um, I don't know. Now I'm questioning what does Jinx sound like? Does it sound anything like Executor <laughs> at all? But, I mean, I'm not upset with Executor. I was going to ask you guys, like, to make a guess. What do you think this Executor is going to be? Uh, I mean, this Executor is going to be. What do you think this Snorlax is going to be? Um... I don't know, I wasn't expect expecting Executor, I was kind of just expecting a Snorlax. <laughs> but hey, in Late Night Yellow, wasn't our Snorlax a Mew? Is that spoilers? <laughs> it may or may not be spoilers, because I might be misremembering that. But... I already spoiled that in this Let's Play, when we caught the Mew in this one. Spoilers, double spoilers, yo. If you have not been keeping up, I mean, it's episode 25. Pfft, I can't, I'm not worried about spoilers for shit. You, how are you gonna pick up on a, a series on episode 25? Worry about spoilers, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Yo, can you take a psychic executor? And not die? Excellent, okay, but, see, here's the thing. I don't wanna do that again. <laughs> Because that'll be the time that Xavier wants to prove him. Are you? Are you for real, bro? Are you for real? You're asleep? <laughs> Whoa, that egg bomb was pretty serious. Put him to sleep. Put him to sleep, bro. Thank you. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Oh, I don't want to waste a turn swapping. I don't know if I'm going to catch him like this, though. Why do I ever doubt myself? Why do I ever doubt myself? Why do I ever, ever doubt myself? I said, it's gonna have Ice Beam. Don't leave it in. Shouldn't leave it in. Left it in. But it would've lived. 
got critted. Anyways, Executor has been added to the Pokerap. The late night crystal Pokerap. Jot his name down here. Oh god, thank you. <laughs> I was gonna say, how the fuck do you spell Executor? <clears throat> Living in a good environment makes it grow lots of heads. <laughs> a head that drops off becomes an execute. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, well, uh, that's kind of power. I have a name that just manifested in my head. Let me jot this down. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. We have Benedict, my boy. Oh, we have another Big Benny. <laughs> Big Benny, the executor. So we have not been able to get a Diglett's Cave encounter because of Benny. A bunch of Diglett popped out of the ground. That was shocking. Because of Benny over here that we just caught. So in, more spoilers, in Late Night Yellow, Dickless K was fucking on and popping. So I'm hoping that we can get some on and popping shit in here tonight. And oh my goodness, I'm pretty sure I don't even need to go through the whole bell sprout. We already have an Ursula. I'm gonna have to ask you to relocate yourself away from me. So, we already have a bell sprout, so that is species. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. I'm sorry, dog. I'm sorry. I'm, I know. I know. I know. I'm, I'm a, I'm a bell sprout magnet. I'm a weeping bell magnet. I love victory bell. You know, it's, 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 it's a mutual feeling. But come on, we gotta see what else is out there. Ho ho ho! Wowie wowie! Wowie wowie! But we have a dragon air, right? We have a dragon here in the PC already. Do we run from a second Dratini? Or a second Dragonite? And see what else is in the cave? I mean, it could be something that's worse. It could be something that's better. What's better than a Dratini? Uh, a Larvitar? I would be down for that. Oh, that brings back some nightmares of the National Park. Ah. Hmm. So I'm thinking about the possibilities of everything that we could get, but we're not thinking about the other option that's right in front of our faces. We catch this Dratini and we go hardcore Lance, add both the Dratini and the Dragonair to the team. And then we rock out with Steelix, Snorlax, Houndoom, and Crobat. We'd be unbeatable. There's probably like one Pokemon that sweeps all of them that I'm not thinking of. <laughs> but if we had a oh, pretty big weakness to ice, Ben Hameen and Sauron, yo, that would be a pretty thick team though. You have to bring a lot of power. Yo, I almost clicked wing attack again. You have to bring a lot of power to stop that team. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see here. Let's see here. Let's see here. You know who would stop that team? Fucking like Mega Lucario. <laughs> oh, but you know what? I'm talking about in this game right here right now okay lucario let alone mega lucario doesn't even exist i still get affected by rap when dratini's asleep that doesn't even stop the attack are you being serious this dratini is fucking me up yo how are you awake how are you awake bro hold up hold up hold up Yo, Mr. Dratini, we still have a gym badge to get. And I, I want you to know... Just that's all I had to tell him. He's like, oh, you about gym badges? Let me hop in this Pokeball. Come on, come on, come on. I mean, I'm not mad about it. We have a new Dratini. 
we have I'm just saying the option the possibility is there to go all lance in this bitch it sheds many layers of skin as it grows larger during this process it is protected by a rapid waterfall hmm so our dragoner's name was Derek so this Dratini is going to be named Donald so that you know just just on the off chance that we decide to go all Lance and you know, we just go full Lance uh, we'll have Derek and Donald <laughs> we'll have Derek and Donald on the squad together so we are route two in it <laughs> Oh shit, we don't have anybody in those cut. How the fuck are we supposed to get out of here? Yeah, let's take the fucking lure ball. Out of everything they changed in this game, y'all didn't remove this fucking cut bush. What? I really don't want to teach nobody cut. Hi, wow. I'm so glad to see you. You're the first visitor I've had in a long time. I'm super happy. Let me give you a little present. Oh, thanks, bro. Appreciate that. That's a nugget. I can't give you any nuggets of wisdom. Something I'll have to do. Thanks, bro. That's a nugget. Appreciate it, bro. This tree can be cut. <sighs> bro, clean up your yard. You got all these trees over here. Are we really gonna have to teach somebody cut? Oh boy, 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 oh boy. Eight can learn cut. Well, to be fair, when we had seven, even his moveset wasn't even finished yet. So we could always delete a ties if we need to, but like. I'm never gonna click Screech. At this point in the game, once we get him leveled up, I'm never gonna click Screech, so. Eight, this is how you're gonna carry your weight real quick. <laughs> so we can get a route two encounter as well. Man, why are you bothering me? Why are you bothering me? Why are you bothering me? Why are you bother why are you bothering me? Why are you bothering me? Ow chow 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 chow. Why are you bothering me? Don't be bothering me like this. A route two encounter. And a new addition to the Pokedex. Pokedex? Poke rap. <gasps> Don't tell me if we have one of these. <clears throat> don't you dare don't you dare I have been hunting that was the one on the list Kingdra I want to use a Kingdra and an LP you know I'm already gonna write this down Cedra I do not believe we have captured a Cedra yet so I'm gonna jot that bitch down a level 3 Cedra yo I should not have to do anything hooked for on a rod are you hooked on a rod nope guess not Yo, level 3 Seedra, thank you. The male raises the young. If it is approached, it uses its toxic spikes to fend off the intruder. Hmm, we have a Lady Seedra. I think I'm going to name her... I hope I spelled that right. <laughs> I'm gonna name her Priscilla. Oh, right on time. God damn, Rachel. Right at the 30 minute mark too. How you doing, girl? How you doing? What's up? Do I have time to chat, Rachel? I always have time to chat with you, girl. <gasps> me? You want me to be your practice partner? Are you for real? Route 34? Oh, but Rachel, 
yo, you're never gonna believe this, girl. Check it out. I became champion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know it's crazy. I know, I know, I know. Uh, I don't know. You know, I would have told you sooner. I would have told you sooner. But, uh, you know, you just uh, never shut the fuck up when we talk. So, I never got the chance to tell you. But, like, I, yo, I'm, I was, I, I became, I am, whatever, champion. And I'm kind of, like, doing some traveling at the moment. So, Route 34? Could you maybe meet me uh, in Goldenrod or in Saffron? Or, I mean, you're on Route 34. I'm on Route 2. Could you take it a little easier on me next time? Uh, I don't think she heard what I said. I don't think she fully grasped what I was trying to tell her. Um, but we do have a uh, Citra now, which I'm very happy about. Um, so have you guessed which gym we'll be taking on tonight, ladies and gentlemen? If you guessed the Pewter City Gym, You would be correct. We're going to be taking on and whooping Brock's ass in just a few moments after a word from our sponsors. <laughs> All right, kids, are you ready? <laughs> uh, so do we need to beat Brock to continue on the next route? Because wait, 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 wait. My handy pokey gear says uh, Route 3 is next. And we need a Mount Moon encounter. We got a Route 4 encounter, I know that. So we need Route 3 and Mount Moon. And don't think I didn't notice, Viridian Forest. Oh, they changed it. Route 1 is down there now. I thought it was Route 2 on either side of the forest in, in Gen 1. Ooh. Ooh. Wowee, wowee. Ah, uh, okay. Well, I think we should be good to take on Brock right now. I don't think we need to... I went to Johto to train. You remind me so much of what I was like as a young man. Here, I want you to have this item I found in Johto. Rachel, we might be back sooner than you think. Actually, uh, don't hold me to that. <laughs> Oh, I was gonna leave it at that. <laughs> don't hold me to that. We may or may not. I don't know. I don't know. We're uh, we 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 did our Snorlax hunting. We're about to get our gym badge getting, but our overall goal is to. They closed down the museum. Damn. Damn. Yo, that's wild. Peter City is a dead town. The only that means the only tourism that Peter City has is the gym. Wow, so you have no interest in Pokemon training at all? Nothing for you to do here. Keep it moving. What's up, bro? Yo, champ in the making. You're really rocking. Are you battling the gym leaders of Kano? They're strong and dedicated people, just like Johto's gym leaders. All right, bro. All right. I'm with it. I'm with the cause. Um, I was gonna say this is a rock type gym. Nope. 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 It's gonna be a randomized gym. So I think that we should, Lady Ramla, let's swap you out. Let's let's let Julian do the damn thing. Come on. Come on. Come on. Out of the way. Out of the way. Why? Why? Why are we talking to you? You got one Pokemon, bro. Whoa. We got Alakazam. Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up, Sauron, never mind. Set the reflect up, bro. Set the fucking reflect up. Look, I don't mean nothing, dog. I'm not here for you. I'm here to take on Brock, bro. Here to take on Brock. Sailor Daniel, yeah, you're not winning these battles, bro. You're not winning these battles. Um. Okay, so still a good idea to have Julian up front? I'm going to say so. Hey, Brock, pose for the thumbnail, bro. Cheese. Wow, it's not often that we get a challenger from Johto. I'm Brock, the pewter gym leader. I'm an expert on rock-type Pokemon. My Pokemon are impervious to most physical attacks. You'll have a hard time inflicting any damage. Come on. You know what's crazy? Didn't save my game. Didn't save my game. 
I'm just hoping the power doesn't go out. Or else we have to play through all of that again. Alright, Ranger Bob. Show me what's in them five Pokeballs. Bro, is this his actual team? <laughs> Good, damn, yeah, I love it. That fucking sparkle, it's like he's unsheathing the sword. Check it out, bro. Hold this Hydro Pump, Omastar. We click Hydro Pump and Hyper Beam on Late Night Crystal. And pray they don't miss. Mmm, get him out of here. Get him out of here. Ooh, look at our boy, hey, Hercules, 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 Hercules. A Butterfree. A Butterfree. I just pumped that thing too, Julian. Get him out of here. Sound like fucking Ricky. <laughs> I just pumped that thing too, Julian. Come on, get it out of here. A critical hit. Yo, Julian, Julian, Julian. Julian, I know it's been a little while. I know it's been a little while since we've had you out here on screen, Julian. But come on. Come on, Julian. Come on. I love it. I love it. Bring us home, Julian. But, you know, I don't think a hydro pump's killing this thing. I really don't. But I'm going to click it anyways. I'm going to click it anyways. Is this his ace? 57? Ooh. Set up the fucking reflect. Set it up. Set it up. Set it up. Set it up. Do we care about reflect over here? No. We do not. Probably should have surfed him and saved a hydro pump. How many Pokemon you got left, bro? Two? Oh, and I got one more. Okay. So, wowee wowee, that's what happened to the Mewtwo at the end of the first movie. Alright, Brock. <laughs> I see y'all made a deal of some sorts. <laughs> what the fuck? But what is Mewtwo's level up Mew, Mew set? <laughs> what is Mewtwo's level up move set anyways? Like, yeah, I'm guessing it would have Psychic right now. It has Mist. Uh... I imagine that's more of a TM machine. Get this Mewtwo the fuck out of here, bro. Don't you ever bring a Mewtwo. Give me that Mewtwo. <laughs> Give me the goddamn Mewtwo. Slap that on my team. If we were to catch a Mewtwo, I'm sorry, Xavier. I would catch the Mewtwo and name it Xavier. <laughs> oh, a Crobat? Oh, don't make me do it. You really gonna make me do it? I'm gonna cook this bat up for dinner tonight. Yes, indeedy. Damn. Bats are so fat. Crowbat is crazy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get that out of here. Get that out of here. Ah, oh, I want to eat to get one more level. Damn. Thank you, Ranger Bob. Your Pokemon's powerful attacks overcame my rock-hard defense. You're stronger than I expected. Go ahead, take this badge. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. Nappy, thanks. I enjoy battling you, even though I am a bit upset. That Boulder badge will make your Pokemon even more powerful. Thanks, bro. That's what, like the anime, like, shing, go across my glasses. All right. So that is badge number four. We're halfway through Kanto now. Oh, my God. 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 Okay. So we have cleared out Pewter City. And I think that here is where we're going to go ahead and wrap up tonight's episode. In the next episode i think we need to i know we gotta go to mount moon and we gotta go through viridian forest hmm the mount moon viridian forest mount moon viridian forest uh, i guess we gotta do both i gotta get encounters in both i guess we gotta go through both gotta get encounters in both but i'll probably go through 
Mount Moon, then just fly back to Peter City and then go straight down through Viridian Forest. And then smack up Blue along the way to smacking up Blaine. And then we'll go through Seafoam Islands to Fuchsia City where we can smack up Janine. And then snag those encounters. And then we're going to go up the cycling road fucking backwards. <laughs> I want Erica to watch us ascend the mountain next to her gym. Because you know her gym overlooks that cycling road hill. I want her to see us coming for that eighth and final gym badge. Erica, come out and play. I think our overall mission is to get the squad up to 65-ish. I guess that's what our goal is going to be, I guess, by the end of our badge run here in Kanto. That's what I'm going to hope for. Whoa, I didn't even touch the speed up button. Like, I just grabbed the controller and it just went wild. Okay, then. Okay, you, you just, you just... You do whatever it is you need to do. You you got it. You got it, girl. You got it. Anyways, so I mentioned that we're going to do a little uh, adventuring, but oh, this bitch only has fucking super podions. We're going to do a little bit of adventuring, but we need to do a little bit of spelunking first. Um, and that's going to involve a new encounter on this route as well. <laughs> if I do say so myself. Isn't this where you get Deoxys? Or is that not yet? Has he not arrived on the uh, Pokemon Earth yet? What, what Earth is this? Is this like Universe 147, 167, 163 or something like that? Like, uh, I don't understand what to expect here. Um... <laughs> comic book references aside uh, I did see Black Adam this past weekend and I gotta say I am what's the word I'm looking for here yo shout the fuck out to him look at this bitch right here I love him this fucking trainer class uh, Black Adam I gotta say I am expectedly okay with it <laughs> I know I was I fe it felt like I was building something more but I couldn't think of the name or think of what I wanted to say I didn't want to use the word mediocrity I feel like that's a little rude thanks gloom wait I didn't even check we didn't even bust out the fucking pokey rep to see if we had a gloom we have a fucking blossom oh, uh. <sighs> chartreuse after all the trouble chartreuse gave us well, we have a gloom now, so we have a gloom. <laughs> the smell from its drool-like syrup and the pollen on its petals is so bad, it may make opponents faint. What are we naming this gloom? I think I'm gonna name this gloom. And that's a conversation for another time as well. We have to finish our thoughts on Black Adam first. <laughs> Um, okay, not mad at that. What? Oh, Could have had another ride on. Oh, I would have absolutely caught it. I would have absolutely caught the ride on. No hesitation at all. <laughs> um, anyways, yeah, Black Adam was just okay. I think, um, when it comes to celebrities like The Rock or Beyonce, you know, like, I'm not trying to, like, undercut their acting abilities or anything like that, but I feel like once you achieve like that level of stardom you know like everybody knows the rock everybody knows beyonce you know it would be and i'm not trying to make comparison i mean i guess maybe i am but um i was gonna say that'd be like michael jackson they closed down the pokemon center it'd be like michael jackson appearing in a film today you know i know he was in the Wiz and whatnot but still you know, he's not going to play any other character here forever and always going to see Michael Jackson. So it's like, even when Beyonce's in movies, I don't see her as just as Beyonce. I mean, as the character she's playing, like, that's Beyonce. Like, come on. So it's kind of the same thing with The Rock. Like, I, you could have just, they could have just skipped out with all the lore and everything else, which was great. Don't get me wrong. But you could have just straight up told me that was The Rock. If you told me The Rock can shoot electricity out of his hands, I mean... <laughs> the most electrifying man in sports entertainment i believe it i can't wait to see oh i don't want to spoil anything hold on mm. i would give it like a 
three out of five. It was good, slow in some parts, but am I mad? No. Am I looking forward to the next thing? Sure. So, either way. <sighs> Still waiting on that Storm movie. <laughs> What's poppin', bro? I thought you were at the end of Mount Moon. It's been a while, Nebby. Oh my god, my fucking... <sighs> the cable for the cord hit my leg and I thought it was like Ivy's nose or something. It just gave me a heart attack. Since I lost to you, I thought about what I was lacking with my Pokemon. And we came up with an answer. Nebby, now we'll show you. Oh, buddy. Buddy boy. I've never had a rival that I wanted more for. You know, I just wanted him to go on to do great things, great wonderful things, but his dad is just such an ass. And instead, in a different universe, he becomes Cyrus. I love that theory and I'm sticking to it, okay? <laughs> ah. Poor Silver. But get this Stantler out of here, bro. It's very Johto of you. We're out here representing Johto in Kanto. It's very Johto of you, bro. I see you. I see you. A Blissey? Even more Johto of you. Even more Johto of you. But I don't think it's going to be enough. Julian, hit him with a high throw pump. I mean, I know Julian's from Kanto, but technically we caught him in Johto. He was running amok in Johto. So, damn, that Blissey just ate that shit. I was trying to give... <laughs> I was trying to give Julian a little bit of um, airtime there, but I guess we uh, got to swap out the Big Bunny here. Greedy Glutton's event did just start, and shiny Snorlax and shiny Lunch Legs. Ooh, ooh, wee, oh, wee, oh, wee. And Guzzlord two. I did one Guzzlord raid so far, and. I didn't catch it. I think it was like a 88% or something like that. It wasn't a hundo or anything, but if you're not playing Pokemon Go and you want to keep up with Pokemon Go, check out our Instagram, link in the description. If you do play Pokemon Go and you're not following us on Instagram, what are you doing? What are you doing? Come on, catch up, catch up, catch up. Um, okay, hold on, chill, Mr. Over here, what are you doing? What, 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 what are we doing against you? What are we doing against you? It's the only thing I don't like about having water poison types right here. I know I've talked about this before, but what are you doing? 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 I think I'm going to click body slam on him. It's like, what is this dumb thing gonna do to Big Benny? What is he gonna do to Big Benny? Other than a bunch of nothing. Damn, Benny? Damn. Oh, Benny? Benny, you ain't have to do him like that, Benny. You ain't have to do him like that, Benny. He ain't even do enough damage. That leftovers ate that up. God damn, Benny. Wow. Wow, we. Wow, we. <laughs> Yo, bro, what can you send out that makes Big Benny stressed? I know you saw it. I clicked it. I know you saw it. I clicked it. I love it how the whole screen shakes. Everything goes wild. I swear to God, this motherfucker's not that I'm a champ right now. I'm gonna be livid. It will be the end of the episode. We will not get to the adventure. We will not get to the badges. <laughs> Sandstorm? Nah, 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 bro. Nah, nah, nah. We ain't dealing with that. Espeon. Okay. Good. Thank you. Again, Joto representing. I see you, big dog. I see you. Ooh. Ooh. You did learn something new. He's not here to play. You, do, you, you hit, hit, hit your little recharge, Big Benny. I know that was a was a a tough hit. Took a lot out of you. Hit your little recharge, Benny. Yo, know, I love it. I love it. I love it. I want to start likes on my team in every Nuzlocke from here on out. We'll never lose. We'll never lose unless we go up against all my champs. But <laughs> what are the odds? What are the odds that would happen? All right, come on. I know you got a Gator. This is where Silver's supposed to slide on the screen and say, we're not finished yet. Um, is Benny the answer here? I think Benny is the answer here. Either Benny or we go out to join and spam acid. <laughs> um, but level 59, bro, that's what you're working with? 
I mean, we ain't too far off. I'll give you that much. I'm like a... <coughs> Excuse me. Ooh, wait! I cannot wait to get my Calliope sticker and add to my canteen. Mm. And then I'm gonna like dip it into, I don't know, some sealant or some shit. I'll have to Google it. Um, but anyways, my bad. <laughs> yes, I want a Snorlax on every Nuzlocke from here on out. I know we have the Cracked Egg Lock going right now, and I know that my love for Snorlax has just recently blossomed. Well, to be fair, I've always loved Snorlax, but he just outspent this fucking Veraligator. I mean, <laughs> my bad. I know he's paralyzed, but still. Can we get a, a round of applause for Big Benny here? God damn. Anyways, I hope a Snorlax pops up in our Cracked Egg Lock. Sorry, Silver. Sorry, buddy. It just had, just had to be... I thought I raised my Pokemon to be the best they could be, but it still wasn't enough. Should have got Lady Ronlin there. <sighs> you won fair and square. I admit it, but this isn't the end. I'm going to be the greatest Pokemon trainer ever because these guys are behind me. Listen, Neppy, one of these days I'm going to prove how good I am by beating you. But that never happens, bro. Like, isn't that the end? for him. Damn, bro, we didn't even take no damage. Lady Ramla wasn't even in the battle. She don't know what damage. The fuck? <laughs> I mean, I know I just healed Benny, but damn. Wait, this is our Mount Moon encounter. Okay, and we're gonna check. I'll do the whole goddamn... Oh, right, I ain't gotta check for that. <laughs> I ain't gotta check for that. Wow, we A level 6 Articuno. Wow. Yo, is that wild or is that wild? Is that wild or is that wild? <clears throat> I mean, like, what are the odds? Oh, you bastard. Hey, you know what? We catching this Articuno. I'm putting him to sleep. I gotta lower his health. I don't want to poison gas him though. <laughs> Caught him and he wasn't even asleep. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Bro. There's only one name. There's only one name for my boy. Oh. He backpacked us through all of late night yellow. Legendary bird Pokemon, as it flies through the sky, it cools the air, causing snow to fall. Wow. Honestly, if Winston had been the absolute savage he was, I think Filiberto probably would have won the boon to be carried over. Was it two L's? I think it was. But our boy Filiberto, oh my god, what are the fuck are the odds? I know I say what are the odds, but whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, this isn't touch screen. How the hell did that happen? Um, <clears throat> I know I say what are the odds, but I mean, it's like, it's only two generations of Pokemon, and I'm getting basically two generations worth of encounters, so <laughs> I guess the odds are pretty okay. Where does this take me? Oh, Mount Moon Square, don't litter. Don't litter. Huh. Um, okay. Let me, do we, it's, it's this. Is this actually a separate encounter area? Because I know my map is just gonna say Mount Moon, but the sign says Mount Moon Square, so it's late night crystal. I'm gonna fucking go with it. Mount Moon fucking square. Whoa, 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 chill, chill, chill. I really don't want to teach somebody Rock Smash right now. I really don't want to see. Oh, we don't have fucking Rock Smash because the TMs are randomized. Do we? We don't even fucking have it. We can never Rock Smash anything. Okay, well, fuck us. <laughs> um, okay, whatever. I, I don't know why I thought there was a patch of grass there or something. Maybe that's in the remakes. Maybe I'm just imagining it. 
Um, but no encounter there. I did see the Clefairy, I mean, um, the other door over there, but I have to go see what's over here. This is Route 4. Get the fuck out of here. Don't be fucking with me. I'm not done with my moon. Let me be. Let me be. I'm not done with my. Ooh. We would have had three Dragonites. Yo, I would have totally taken on the Elite Four with a team of three Dragonites. 100,000 million percent. <laughs> uh, it's been a little while, okay? It's been a little while. It's been a little while. <clears throat> um, speaking of, it's been a little while. Um, before recording Late Night Crystal tonight. Sound like someone's car just blew up. What the fuck? Um, before recording Late Night Crystal tonight. Um, I sat down and recorded a series for Nappy the Great. Um, you know, I mentioned at the start of the episode, Nappy the Great. Um, and the new series grounded over there you should go check out. But tomorrow we have a series that has not had an episode in four years. I'm not gonna tell you what it is. I don't wanna spoil it. <laughs> but tomorrow, it'll be up. <laughs> I just can't help it. I just can't help it. I always like to spoil. Get out of here, get out of here. Okay, anyways, we got our spelunking done for tonight's episode. It's time for us to do a bit of adventuring thanks for the berry it's time for us to do a bit of adventuring because we have other encounters to get and if you guessed that we were going to head south through Brutian Forest you'd be correct I feel like I said all of this at the end of last night's episode but anyways <clears throat> yes we're gonna head through Viridian Forest here damn smoke ball is it no longer a forest? Damn, Poggy Doll. What happened? Where'd Celebi go? <laughs> a pu poison, a pison, pison cure berry? Tis all? Wow. No, oh, no, 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 no. What are the odds that I meet a. For 10 HP, we're gonna toss this. Poke Doll, we're gonna toss this. What are the odds that I meet two Clefairy, they dance for me, and I find a Moonstone all in one night? Hmm? What are the mods looking like? Wow, hurts my heart. I know we already got a Route 4 encounter. Oh, wait, no, wait. Is that one that swapped? Route 2, we're on Route 2. Oh, not Route 4. It's popping, bro. You still out here? I had no idea that you were out here. Professor Oak's lab is nearby in Pallet Town. Oh. <laughs> bro, I thought you was gonna slap me a little something, something. Oof. People still leaving items around down here? I'll take a soda pop. Any day of the week. Uh, okay, we need to get a Route 2 encounter. So, survey says, something tells me we just caught a Cedra named Priscilla. Rachel, what? No, I don't have time to chat, actually. I, I've been spelunking. I'm tired. I expected to go through a forest. It's gone. And now I still have a badge to get. What? Uh-huh. What? Uh, uh, uh. You haven't caught a vile plume. I have a blossom and caught another gloom on accident. How you st you still haven't caught this goddamn thing yet? I don't think we have an apom. Don't think we have an apom. Get in the ball, you little apom. Don't make me swap out and put you to sleep. <laughs> Get in the ball, you apom. Dirty little monkey. It uses its tail to hang on to tree branches. It uses its momentum to swing from one branch to another. 
What are we nicknaming this Apalm? I think I'm gonna name him Ugo. We have little Ugo. We have so many Pokemon on the PC. It's crazy. It's crazy. Yo, people thought that Crack Deadlock was gonna be a cakewalk and we were gonna walk through that and it was not gonna be good because it wasn't gonna be challenging. We have lost more Pokemon in that ep in that Nuzlocke than in this one. We have so many Pokemon on the PC. We're on box number three. Yo, you still got hidden names over here? No? No? My boy's still chilling down here too? Can we get another encounter? Route 22? Now wouldn't it be some shit if Gary shows up right here? <laughs> I mean, I know he's gym leader and all, but still, wouldn't it be some shit? Let's get a surfing encounter here, because why not? About to say, maybe we can't. Yes! Whoa, no! Yes, absolutely. I said it earlier. <laughs> Yo, I, I'm telling you guys, there are times when I'm speeding up, and yes, I know I'm speeding up, and I make mistakes and whatnot, but then there are moments like that where, like, I'm literally just holding the controller. Like, I wasn't even trying to do anything crazy. I was doing the right thing. I was going out to Xavier. I was going to put him to sleep. <sighs> but just my finger resting on the button is enough to make the game just go hyperspeed. I wish you could, like, change it. Like, look at this. Look at the water. Just throwing encounters away. Just tossing them out the window. You can't say we don't have diversity when it comes to encounters. You really cannot. We got a dupes. We got a brand new one. Which is a pretty good one if I do say so myself. A legendary Pokemon and... We fucked up one. I got one of each tonight so far. So here's to uh, continuing on here. Um, I think that we are going to trainer house club for top trainer battles. Chill out, chill out. I remember doing that as a kid, like just going in that trainer house over and over and over again. Cause can't you um, like refight the trainers? I mean the trainer in there. I mean. That's where they have the other starters. <laughs> I'm sitting here thinking about two different things at once. Um, yeah, let's stock up. That should be good for the rest of the game. <laughs> Can we sell this pearl too? Thank you. Hey, if you put the amulet coin on one Pokemon and never take it off, you will be a rich person by the end of this game. Who fucking we? God damn. Okay, trainer house, I'm gonna need you to ch 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 chill out because <clears throat> we have our sights set on something much larger. We have a bigger fish to fry. Knock, knock. Oh, I'm glad you got rid of all those pesky fucking trainers. Oh, my boy's not here. I just remembered. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no, he did not. No, he did not. Check this out. Check what we do here. The speed up button has been working against us this entire time. Watch it work for us now. I just want to point out we did not get an encounter right there just now. You saw that? Didn't happen. We don't have an encounter on this route yet. Oh boy, don't have an encounter yet. <laughs> yeah, do we actually have? Fuck, we don't. 
We don't have any repels. <sighs> Route 21. Do duo. I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. He just try attack burned me. Oh shit, I just realized he's level 39. Hold on. I'm just spamming Ultra Balls. I should have bought more of those. Whoa, finger off the speed up. Finger off the speed up button. Go ahead, go on to sleep. Go ahead, take your little ass to sleep. There you go. It lives on a grassy plain where it can see a long way. If it sees an enemy, it runs away at 60 miles per hour. You know what? I would name you James Paul, but you're a lady. And I know it's 2023, but let's name you Blanking on like four letter names now. I don't know why. Um, all right, whatever. <laughs> hey, we got a gym leader to go find. I completely forgot this dude was on vacation down here, farting around with his finger in his ass. Forgot all about this. Come on out of here, bro. Cinnabar Island. Hey, look here, chump. Who am I? Well, it's plain to see that you're a trainer. My name's Blue. I was once the champion, although it was only for a short time. The meddling red did me in. Anyway, what do you want? You want to challenge me or something? I hate to say it. <clears throat> but I'm not in the mood for a battle now. Take a good look around you. A volcano erupts, and just like that, a whole town disappears. We can go on winning and losing in Pokemon, but if nature so much as twitches, we can lose in a second. That's the way it is. But anyway, I'm still a trainer. If I see a strong opponent, it makes me want to battle. If you want to battle me, come to the Viridian Gym. I'll take you on then. So I bet you guys thought that we'd be taking on blue tonight. So I bet you guys thought that we'd be taking on blue tonight, right? This is our Cinnabar Island encounter. Ah, it's fucking level 35. A sun current? Are you sure we don't have a sun flora? We do have a sunflower named Nolan. That motherfucker was in the running to be in the party and he just didn't quite make it. A Parasect? Do we have a Paras? I don't believe we do. Don't believe we do? All right. I gotta listen to what the Pokey Rap says and the Pokey Rap says we ain't got But you know what we definitely ain't got is Ultra Balls. We need to get some more of them. All right, our Cinnabar Island encounter is a parasite. Oh. When nothing's left to extract from the bug, the mushrooms on its back leave spores on the bug's egg. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna name you. Wilma, Wilma the Parasect, I hope you enjoy your time in the PC, you can chill there indefinitely, oh wait, 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 um, but yes, I bet you guys thought that we were taking on Blue tonight, we are not taking on Blue tonight, our first encounter here in the water is a Magneton, and Last I checked, we do not have a Magneton. Yo, this is getting kind of spooky. 
we are getting new encounter after new encounter after new encounter. I was gonna say, you think this man is not a level sidekick? Level 30? I'm only 33 levels higher than him. You think he'll live this psychic? Wait, that motherfucker just woke up immediately? Xavier. 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 Thank you. We gotta get some more Pokeballs. When many Magneton gather together, the resulting magnetic storm disrupts radio waves. We gotta get some more Ultra Balls. God damn. Okay, Mr. Magneton. I think I'm gonna give you a very fitting name. I hope that in time, you end up learning to levitate. You visit the icy north of your region and learn how to <laughs> use ice beam as well. And I know you will be great. You'll do excellent things. So we don't have any Pokeballs, so I'm a little hesitant to get our oh, little squirt, little squirt. I'm a little hesitant to get oh, bitch, you don't want it. Fuck out of here. I'm a little hesitant to get our Seafoam Islands encounter, but like I said, we're not here for that right now. We are here. Yo, know, are we? I was about to say, are we swimming through a, a pod of squirtles? We are here for our, or for a gym badge, I should say. My boy, saddens me to see you here, dog. Look at that. Speed up. What the fuck? Sad's me to see you here, bro. All by your lonesome. But I'm gonna save my game. Because only you can prevent loss of data. And it's time for us to claim another Kanto gym badge. Wah! My gym in Cinnabar burned down! My fire-breathing Pokemon and I are homeless because of the volcano! Wah! But I'm back in business as a gym leader here in this cave. If you can beat me, I'll give you a badge. Ha! You better have been here. Bro, all his machines, all the quizzes, everything gone. Ranger Cammy, I feel for you, bro. I feel for you. A magneton? Did you catch this outside? <laughs> How about that? Oh boy. Okay, so how do we handle this? Benny? Benny? Big Benny? Level 59 Magneton? Bro, I gotta tell you about this place called Sinnoh. They got a place in Sinnoh called Mount Cornet where you can take this Magneton and let me tell you, you're gonna lose your mind. Are you sitting down? Are you ready for this, Blaine? It evolves. Ah, gets even better. Or, bro, just, hey, next time I see you, I'll bring you a EV light. <laughs> just learn what those are. Oh, Benny. Shout the fuck out to Benny. God damn. A nine tails? Yo, for real. Shout the fuck out to Benny. Benny is just doing the damn thing. Confuse him if you want. Benny doesn't get confused. Ben Hamin doesn't get confused. Come on now. Get this out of here. All right, Benny, you get one. Everybody gets one. But Benny, Benny doesn't get confused. See? <laughs> he just got the memo. He thought about it for a second and was like, wait a minute. No, I'm still supposed to attack. He got it. He got it. Don't worry. Don't worry. Big Benny, my boy. Ugh, I fucking love it. I fucking love it. A Snorlax. I fucking love it. Oh. A Feraligator. Oh, boy. Both of y'all got big old gators. Level 65 Feraligator. Hey, you think we're oko on him? He just hydro pumped us. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. 
That might have been a blessing in disguise. <laughs> that may have been a blessing in disguise. Oh, wow. What does Scary Face do? It was just a... The fuck? Does it lower defense or does it lower speed? I think it lowers your speed. Um, we're not gonna do this. 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 He doesn't learn Ice Fang in this one, right? It's the remakes he gets Ice Fang. Lady Ramla. That is a strong ass for Relegator. That's his second Hydro Pump. Um, I know I keep switching and switching and switching. I went to Lady Ramla out of default. I was just thinking to myself like, She's bulky, you know? 181. But I know he's gonna have crunch too. Damn. I don't know if I wanna take a crunch with Xavier, a hydro pump, and a crunch. You know what? What, what the fuck am I doing? Safeguard, faded, um. Acid? Didn't do anything. Slash. Oh my god. Yo, chill, chill, chill. It doesn't matter what we do. He's just a monster. This fucking for alligator. Okay. Hydro. Okay. My speed, though. Okay, that's what I thought. I got a little spooked earlier because I was sitting there thinking defense. But it's special. So what? It, but he wants to click slash. Or he just wants to hydro pump the shit out of me. Alright. Whatever floats your boat, buddy. Whatever floats your boat, buddy. But Big Benny is eating it. Big Benny is eating it. Mm-mm-mm. But we did it. But we did it. I didn't want to speed it up. I want to give it for alligator to have his moment. I think it's the highest level opponent we have faced so far is level 65. Awesome. I've burnt out. You've earned Volcano Badge. And I cleaned 13 grand. Mm, mm, mm. I did lose this time, but I'm going to win the next time. When I reveal my Cinnabon Gym, we'll have to have a rematch. Hey, I'm down, bro. Who the fuck is this? Yo. Huh? It's over already? Sorry, sorry. Cinnabar Jim was gone, so I didn't know where to find you. But hey, you're plenty strong, even without my advice. I knew you'd win. So, uh, yes, <clears throat> we have a new badge to snag tonight, and I believe we will make our way there today. Um, I'm sure a couple of you guys are probably wondering what was up with today's episode of the Crack Dead Clock. And boy, do I have a tale to tell. One that you shan't believe, but oh, trust me, it is truer than true and it has left me livid for most of the day yo champ in the making how's it going looks like you're on a roll the gym leader is a guy who battled the champion three years ago he's no pushover give it everything you got is it smart to be battling the eighth gym leader before we've taken on the fourth and sixth fifth gym leader <laughs> I think we got it. I don't know about you guys. I think we got it. I know we just started, but you know what? I'm going to save my game because only you can prevent lost save data. Who we boy. Okay. Put a pin in the crack deck lock for now. A pin in the crack deck lock for now. I'm telling you, if you're watching this series years after it went up, you're going to have to watch the crack deck lock like with it. Just go to the uploads tab and scroll down until you find the episode you're on and leave that tab open. <laughs> <laughs> and go from episode to episode to episode because then you'll get the full story of everything you know what I mean anyways put a pin in it because we need to focus here I'm going to say that aside from Lance no not even Lance so far um, this is probably going to be our toughest battle yet do I think that we are prepared maybe um, all I can say is let's hope he doesn't have a Mewtwo 
Um, I think I'm gonna start with. I guess Julian works. Let's fuck it up. Yo, finally got here, huh? I wasn't in the mood at Cinnabar, but now I'm ready to battle you. You're telling me you conquered all the gyms in Johto? <laughs> Johto's gyms must be pretty pathetic then. Hey, don't worry about it. I'll know if you're good or not by battling you right now. Ready, Johto champ? I don't like the way he speaks to me. Look here. I ain't no Ash Ketchum. Ooh, -hoo -hoo, Ranger Marshall. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. Oh shit, does this scissor have flash fire? <coughs> what have we gotten ourselves into? <laughs> Yo, I'm setting up the barrier. I'm setting up the barrier. Set up the barrier right now. Set it up right Oh, bro, don't do this. Don't do this. I should have clicked Hydro Pump, you whore. Um, are you kidding me? One double team and we're already missing attacks. Are you being serious right now? Hold on. Do we still have, um, I don't want to switch just yet. Do we still have faint attack? We do. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So worst comes to worst. Um, but I mean like what can this scissor do to me? Don't I resist both his stabs? So far all he's revealed is... I mean, if eight had been leveled up, oh, that'd be great right now. We still outspeed him, though. Yo, Blue is not playing. He said, you got all the gym badges in Johto? Okay, check out this Johto Pokemon. Bro, three double teams, who are you, me? Quit clicking it. Hey, Julian knew. Julian knew. Just like when Charizard came out and he saw Mewtwo, he was like, whoa, hold on a second. Slash. Hey, shout out to the baby girl. 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 Baby girl. Baby girl. Baby girl. Okay, well that's one down. All right then. <laughs> can I do against a Dragonite? Um, we have Big Benny. Oh boy, I wish I had a level 60 Steelix. Um, let me think. Let me just, let me just, just, hold on, hold on, hold on. B team's coming through. B team's coming through. Um, I kind of sort of want to pay attention to when this, whatchamacallit, is up the barrier. Uh, I'm just gonna throw this out there just as a hypothetical because I don't know what the odds of it happening are but I'm just gonna throw this out there if we get a belly drum off on Ben Hamin, I think we might be okay for the rest of the match belly drum has your HP it doesn't have your defense right and then that makes up with something else I don't know um anyways I don't want to stay in and click Surf, but I do want to put up another barrier. Because um, I know he's going to resist this. There's no point in me clicking Acid. Isn't it like base 20? Like, why don't you know Sludge Bomb, bro? <laughs> Come on. Um, I want to set up another barrier, but... You can't... It'll just say, like... Is barrier permanent? Is it permanent on Julian? Or does it last for... You know, this is the type of shit that, like, at any other time, I would know. But right now, in the moment, I'm like, uh, what the fuck? Um, I'm gonna... I just don't want to give him a, a turn, but... Oh my god, does Dragonite get Slash? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Because this changes my thoughts. Hold on. Hold on. Barrier increases the user defense by two stages. Okay, so it's not, even though it's a wall that comes up, it's not an actual. Um, so it's a plus two to your defense. Okay, so that's 
not how I thought it worked at all. I was taking it way too literally. Um, okay. Let me think here. Let me think here just for a moment. Um, so he used agility. Um, I think I'm gonna click barrier again. I mean, what is, what is this Dragonite gonna... I don't know, I don't know what the fucking Dragonite's Gen 2 moveset looks like by level up. I know it's gonna have outrage. <laughs> That's why I wanted to click barrier again. Okay, so we're at... Yes, I'm gonna heal. Hey, bro, outrage all you want. You about to get loopy. You about to get a loop. Yo, I don't trust that though, to be honest. Like, if I click barrier again and he breaks. Oh, he got full three turns. Never mind. Look at me being foolish. Assuming he would confuse himself. This must be one of Lance's Dragonites. And look at that. I literally couldn't even finish the fucking sentence. I couldn't even finish the fucking sentence and the crit happens. Come on, bro. This camera is all types of funky off. One of these days, we'll get it right, no matter the project we're doing. Um, okay, hurt yourself in confusion. That's what I needed. Are you joking? <laughs> what a well-trained Dragonite. Oh. This must be one of Lance's Dragonites. One of his routines came from this pack right here holy fuck why 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 y'all let me do this why y'all let me come in here and fight blue like this <laughs> yo does this dragonite ever get confused i need one turn bro i mean okay that works too i, I wasn't i wasn't gonna do nothing to you dog are you joking with me it breaks through confusion again Okay, so we should be at plus six now, right? I can't remember my typings. <laughs> Okay, <clears throat> then I'm gonna go out to Benny. I know all that barrier and was for nothing, but he takes it a lot better. Okay. Yes, we just learned something. <laughs> or relearned something, I should say. Why are you gonna start attacking me physically now? Stop it. Cut it out. Big Benny was the answer from the start. I should have known it. Dang, Benny, that's not enough, Benny, that's a bet. Benny, that's not enough, dog. Benny, Benny, I gotta talk to you real quick, bro. That's not enough, dog. Big Benny, my boy, that's not enough. 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 Hey, I'm just saying, a Steelix would be phenomenal right now. Um, I wanna click it. So I did... Okay, let's, let's, are you joking with me? Actually, this might be good. Because I could heal now. Yo, what if we get the paralysis? Whoa. That was a big difference in damage from last turn, Benny. Are you hearing me? Are you listening? Yo, so, okay, so check it. 278. 198 and then we recover 17 278 to 198 okay we should be good I'm gonna do it <laughs> yo I swear to god I swear to gosh darn gosh dang baby Jesus above it's not half your HP total, right? It's half your remaining HP, right? Oh, I can't do it because I'm below half. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Wait, I pulled the trigger with that too soon. 
Yeah, I pulled the trigger with that too soon. I was waiting for him to get confused. <clears throat> so he needs to get confused on the next turn because obviously he's gonna outspeed me. Okay. Now we got. <laughs> Yo, I swear on everything. <laughs> I didn't do the math. Benny, yo, this Dragonite. Is this the first time? Is this the first time that it has happened? I'm gonna click it. Are you kidding me? Yo, okay, the belly drum went off. I thought he got a super crit. <laughs> okay, wait, chill, 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 chill. Okay, we're good now. <laughs> Okay, I swear on everything. Yo, hurt yourself in confusion. Please give me this one. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Thank you. We needed this. We needed this. We needed this. How do I make so many mistakes in a row? Yo, his team is bananas. Like, it's actually fucking wild. His team. Rain dance. Hey, set it up. Drop top in the rain. Set it up. <sighs> Am I play Is this late night crystal or is this an episode of Renegade Platinum? What the fuck? <sighs> okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I will take it. What is that number three? Blue has the most insane team that we have fought so far. What the fuck? His team is bananas. Scizor, Dragonite, Blastoise, Weezing. Yo, this dude is the greatest gym leader that has ever lived. Ever. Oh, he's clearing stat changes? He is the greatest gym leader ever! Yo! That was a crit. Yo, I kinda want this Weezing to stay in because I'm pretty sure I can belly drum on him again. Even if he... Well, oh my god. No. There's gonna be one thing that will stop us from belly drumming. I don't want to say it. <laughs> I'm thinking it, but I don't want to say it. Oh, okay, 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 perfect. Good, 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 good. He's gonna click it again. I know he's gonna click it again because I'm gonna heal right now. You little whore, bro. You little whore. Smoke screen? No, we're not doing this, bro. We're not doing this, bro. We're not doing this, bro. I thought it, but I didn't say it. I thought it, but I didn't say it. I thought it, but I didn't say it. But Benny's got it. I know Benny's got it. I know Big Benny's got it. I know Big Benny's got it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's bananas. It is only when it matters. It is only when it matters. <sighs> it was a crit explosion, too. If only I had a Steelix. If only I had a Steelix. Hey, we're level 40. Oh, you want to learn Slam, bro? Come on. Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of a uh, Tackle. <laughs> So he still has two more Pokemon, right? What the fuck are we supposed to do? I'm so upset about Benny. I'm so sad about Benny. I'm so fucking sad about Benny. You don't even understand how sad I am about Benny. I have had a roller coaster of a day so far. From the lividity, is that a word? From the lividness that happened earlier to I don't know if you guys know this or not, but God of War Ragnarok is out. We're not going to sleep tonight. We're playing God of War tonight. It will be on Nappy the Great in the morning when you wake up. Link is in the description. And then we come and do this. And now, my child, Ben Hamid. 
Um, okay, so I don't know who he's sending out next. Um, <laughs> let's go out to Lady Ramla. I can only imagine. Oh, don't say a psychic type. Don't say a psychic type. We haven't bought a psychic type yet. Please don't say a psychic type. Blissey. Okay. Does Blissey get explosion? <laughs> Um, but you know what I'm actually gonna do? I wanna heal Julian. Let's see special defense rules. Cool. I'm gonna click fly. I should have clicked confuse ray. Defense curl. Oh, that's not good. Blissey's defense went way up. Yeah, get that Blissey nice and confused. Get that Blissey nice and confused. Hey, click quit clicking defense curl and full restore. Blissey's hit with recoil. Oh, Blissey's attack missed. Double edging Blissey. <laughs> I was like, what is this little bit of chip damage that I see going on here? What is this? Okay, little Blissey. I think this is, what, the first time? In the LP that we've clicked fly in a gym battle? Ah. <sighs> But you know what? When we need her, we can always count on her. Ah, oh, didn't mean to kill. Get this blissy out of here. Get this blissy out of here. I bet you Blue is probably raging right now, saying, Oh my god, I lost my blissy to a crit. <laughs> Alright, his last Pokemon is an Aridos. Oh, thank the lord. Okay. So the Blissey I don't necessarily think is a horrible addition to the team. Moves that could have been better, obviously. Oh my god, it's got Psychic. I hope this kills. Oh my god, it's got Psychic. I hope this kills. I can't look. Can't look. I mean, it's an area dose, right? It's not stab, right? And Lady Rumla is super thick, right? I don't know what I. It, I have to click A for it to faint. But she didn't faint. Yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. I want to click fly again, but. Yeah, fuck out of here with all that noise. Fuck out of here with all that noise. I want to click fly again, but what if I miss? Then it clicks fucking Psychic and Lady Ramla is gone along with Ben Hameen? I don't think so. <sighs> but was that necessary? What? How the heck did I lose to you? <sighs> Alright, here, take this. It's Earth Badge. Ben, I mean. All right, I was wrong. You're the real deal. You are a good trainer, but I'm going to beat you someday. Don't you forget it. <sighs> My poor Ben Hameen. My poor Ben Hameen. God damn, bro. <sighs> well, I think that we have to lay another one of our proud, proud members of the B team. To rest. We have to. Whoa, 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 We have to do the unsightly task of changing the box. Ah, oh, we have to deliver yet another. Makes me so sad. Look at our troopers that we've lost so far. Makes me so sad. Um, okay, so this leaves a lot of things open for us to do now. So I'm going to check out what we have here. Let me think for just one moment. We have Water Poison, Flying Poison, <laughs> Fire Dark, Psychic, Steel Ground. That doesn't have Earthquake. Okay. So, I am thinking... What about if we add... 
a hair across. Hmm, pretty big weakness to psychic then. All it takes is one random Mewtwo to fuck us up. What if we add a uh, Dragonair? <laughs> uh, I mean, we have a pretty big weakness to ice. Half the team be weak to ice then, too. What the fuck? Um, what if we add a... Raikou? We have options. We have so many options. Um, but I don't know if we have a whole lot of really great options, though. That's the thing. I know we still have the Elekid chilling. We have a Magneton chilling. We have two Dragonairs chilling. Um, could add a Grass type? I mean, I would, I would only add to our Ice Weakness. We could just, no, we don't need to do that. Never mind. <laughs> I was going to say, we could just slap on a Mew. We got one of them. But we don't really need a Psyche type. We have Xavier. Um, I only say Heracross because it's two typings we don't have. But ultimately, check this out. Check this out. The next thing that we're going to do is get some more encounters. <laughs> So we never got our encounter on this route in last night's episode. Um, and we didn't go past Seafoam Islands either. So, but wait, 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 we only have two Ultra Balls. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, where do they sell Ultra Balls at in this here city? Is that wrong? I feel like that's the most advanced <laughs> city in the Kanto region we have encountered so far. Did I go? Yes. Yeah, so did I go the right way? Bro, y'all sell Ultra Balls? Frick yeah, bro. Frick yeah. I'm not going to get that many right now, bro, but I'll get that. All right. Let's get back to where we need to go. Route one. All right. All right. Route one. All right. All right. You want to fight? Don't do me like that. I know she had a... God, what's with the psychic type? So I'm gonna say, I know she's got psychic on there too. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. I'm here to catch Pokemon. Not battle lasses. A snubble. Um, I feel like I... I know I just went through the list. I know we haven't caught a snubble yet, but I feel like... We have a Gramble? Why do I feel like I just saw Gramble written down? Am I seeing things? Did we just fight a Gramble recently? Like I have his Gen 2 sprite in my head and everything. Weird. Weird. Whoa. I hope this isn't dupes. <laughs> I hope this isn't dupes. So, anyways, let us unpin from the topic earlier today of why there wasn't a Cracked Egglock episode of today. And I know that there are gonna be some people that are gonna come to this video and start watching the video with the notion of like finding out what happened. And <laughs> I don't talk about it until 28 minutes in the video. <laughs> it's like when they put the milk in the back of the store. They put the milk in the back of the grocery store so you have to walk past everything else to go get to it. Same reason electronics is in the back. Well. That might be more so it's harder to steal, but anyways. In truth, it is a cowardly Pokemon. It growls eagerly in order to hide its fear from its opponent. Oh, I think I'm gonna name it Fady. My little Fady baby girl. She is nothing but growling <laughs> to hide her fear from her opponent. That sounds exactly like Sadie to me. So technically, isn't this a, wouldn't this count as a Pallet Town encounter right here? Can we relive Red's first steps, his first moments? Nope, okay, well, 
Well, can we uh, stop off and say good day to Oki Boy? Ah, oh, now it's good of you to come all this way to Kanto. What do you think of the trainers out here? Pretty tough, huh? Oh, you're collecting Kanto gym badges. I imagine that it's hard, but the experience is sure to help you. Come see me when you get them all. I'll have a gift for you. Keep trying hard, Nappy. How's your Pokédex coming? Let's see. Current Pokémon completion level, 242 Pokémon seen, 69 Pokémon owned. <laughs> to evolve, some Pokémon grow. Others use the effects of stones. If you're in the area, I hope you come visit again. Was, did, we, did we get the little noise? Damn it. Did we get the little noise because he just gifted us knowledge? He just dropped wisdom on us? Like, what the fuck? Um, okay. Pallet time encounter. Survey says... Oh, wow. A nine tails. I don't think we got a pallet time encounter. And I don't think we got... No, we definitely did get the route beneath of... Because we were surfing. We had to have. Um, but I don't think we have a Vulpix or a Ninetales. Because I would have remembered naming it Sashimi. So, <clears throat> I'm feeling oh so confident here. Then I'm just going to go ahead and jot this name down already. But, you know, the thing that is troublesome here... Oh, look at Sadie in the party. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I can't. Are you joking, bro? Are you joking? Almighty Brick Piece, help us. All you gotta do is ask the Brick Piece, and it answers. All you gotta do is ask the Brick Piece, and it answers. God damn. It is said to live a thousand years, and each of his tails is loaded with supernatural powers. Oh, from Late Night Yellow, we have Sasha. Oh. If our next encounter is an Eevee, I will lose my shit. <laughs> Route 21, and Route 21 continued, because I remember we got an encounter, it was the Seedra, it was right down here. Okay. So, homeboy chilling right there. You just need to wait, bro. I'll definitely come back here and whoop your ass, buddy. Don't you, uh, stress over it. It's like I whooped their ass in the last episode. Anyways, um, 28 minutes, 32 minutes in. More like it. Hit it again. <laughs> yes. <laughs> sure, Rachel. What'd you pick up today? Huh? Huh? <sighs> Okay, Route 34. She wants to battle. She's asked us twice to battle now. Now she's offering incentives. She's trying to get us to come over there. She's got another leaf stone for us. Rachel, we needed that 20 episodes ago. <laughs> and to be fair, we used it. Oh, come on. Thank you. So I can't take any more exploding Pokemon tonight, please. We used it 20 episodes ago, but... Unpin. Cracked egg lock. So, this morning I woke up nice and early. I sat down and recorded an episode of first game of the day. This is Route 19, new encounter as well. Um, recorded a new episode of first game of the day. Then I did my grinding. Look at this big ass goofy boy. I did my grinding in Crack Deadlock. I sat down, I recorded it. Uh, by the time I had finished recording, <clears throat> I was editing and everything and then I look over and I go to click upload, page is unresponsive. So, of course, I <laughs> look at my Ethernet and there's no internet connection. So, internet's been a little spotty here and there, you know. I understand. It's not perfect all the time. Excuse me. Or at least I've never lived in a place where they've offered internet that is perfect all the time. Um, so, you know, it's whatever. You know, if it's acting up, I don't mind resetting the router and waiting 10 minutes or so for it to come back up it's not that big of a deal so i gave it its time i let it sit i let it do its thing and like an hour later it still hadn't come back up so i reset it again wait another 10 minutes doesn't come back up hey i like this meganium it already knows what i'm gonna forget oh, come on. get this meganium thank you thank you thank you 
So to make a long motherfucking story short, <laughs> um, I had to end up calling my internet provider. You know, I called them two or three times today. First time I called them, these motherfuckers said, "Uh, we're experiencing an outage in your area, and a service technician will not be able to." help you due to the outage in your area <laughs> like what what the fuck what the phone call basically just said hey shut the fuck up and don't call back that's basically what it said to me hey i just remember we had a poison cure bear they just told me to shut the fuck up and don't call back <laughs> you you gonna wait till we turn that shit back on so unfortunately it was not back on until like 7 30 tonight and that's already too late on most of the world most people wouldn't even count it as an episode for today but i think it's the first episode we have missed since we started the crack tag vlog i think no i think we missed episode two <laughs> anyways since then <laughs> we've been killing it but i feel bad because it's like i had it it was done it was ready and i just have no internet all fucking day so but it's back now i'm looking at it right now and i'm recording it right now and i'm very happy it's back because we're playing god of war after this meganium the herb pokemon anyone who stands beside it becomes refreshed just as if they were relaxing in a sunny forest um i'm gonna nickname this meganium in honor of our following comrade not ben hamin but Benny. I know a lot of you guys want me to name it Randall, but it's a memorial meganium. <laughs> it's a memorial meganium to a fallen soldier. And wh who better fits the B team than meganium? Actually, I'm sure a lot of you guys would say meganium is more like the F team, but work with what we got. We don't control the encounters. Come on now. But we have made it here to Fuchsia City. <laughs> we should be good to go right so anyways that's what our squad is looking like tonight i think i want to get a little bit of exploratizing done and look around fuchsia city here a little bit um i want to get some encounters i believe we have encounters on both sides of fuchsia city that we can get but we're i don't think we're gonna go over here just yet I battled this guy on accident when I was grinding. <laughs> I don't want anybody to be like, hey, how come you didn't fight that guy? I was speeding, like, trying to get around this giant fucking landmass that the Pokemon Center is centered on. And I just zoomed over there and got caught. So I was like, okay, whatever. Whatever. But I think we can get a Fuchsia City encounter right here in this little pond. I was thinking about it before we started tonight's episode. I was like, damn. We're going to get so many encounters, but how are they going to get a Fuchsia City one? And just now, I walked past that pond. I was like, fuck yeah. My grandpa was a Safari Zone warden. At least he was. He decided to go on a vacation and took off overseas all by himself. He quit running Safari Zone just like that. Does he ever pop up again? I feel like I remember running into him somewhere. Like in a later game, but I don't remember. Anyways. Anyways, your boy is tired. <laughs> Today has been a very long day, and this is the last thing on my very long to-do list. The past 48 hours have been uh, just like a, 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 the trial of a YouTuber. Like, <laughs> if, any, if something could have gone wrong, it absolutely did go wrong. Nothing here, you know, with all the stuff uh that i'm doing at the moment you know nappy the great up and running again and not even a nibble um and then god of war came out and that was just a humongous like again if something could go wrong it could i wanted to have three episodes of god of war up on nappy the great today only got one are you joking with me right now Anyways, I'm not going to put a pin in that conversation. I'm going to set it to the side and just be like, we're done. Tomorrow's a new day. But, are you serious? We just added a Dragonite to the squad. 
Are we really gonna do three Dragonites? Are we? I I want to catch a third Dragonite. I'm gonna be honest with you. I really would like to catch a third Dragonite. Hold up, Xavier, come out here. Put him to sleep. Um, and he's a dragon. But our team, our squad is just so good. I don't think there's anything that we can do. I don't think I'm gonna catch this Dragonite either, which is a straight up Ultra Ball, and he's at full HP. All right, so we're gonna try it. We're gonna see what happens when we poison the encounter. <laughs> We're gonna see what happens when we poison the encounter. I'm gonna hope that we can catch this dragon. Okay. Shit. We have Derek, Dolan, and now we need. Did I say Dolan? Donald. <laughs> I mean, it's the same thing. Uh, we have a third Dragonite. I cannot believe it. Well, technically, we have a Dratini in the PC. Because Derek started as a Dragonair. We have Derek, Donald, and... Let's go with... No, I don't want to do that. Derek, Donald, and... Derek, Donald, and Darnell. We're in 2023. Mixed family. Blended family. Of Dragonites. Check that out. Check that out. God damn. We got another fucking Dragonite encounter. Hold on. Before we go through that um, route house and get our encounters over there, I want to check this fucking place out. Bro, this place building's empty? Yo, you need the mayor of Driftville City to come in here and reorganize your town's budget get this place up and running again god damn mr safari zone may uh may chance you have an encounter for me mr safari zone maybe that'd be uh mighty nice of you damn we could have got an encounter over here too i didn't even know this little pond was up here isn't that just so cute oh my god yeah, we know all about Code's daughter. We're gonna go in there. Oh. Dang. Warzone got shut the fuck down. That's crazy. I know there's a hidden item up here somewhere, but ain't nobody got time for that. That's crazy. They shut the whole fucking Safari Zone down. The warden just said, hey, I'm done with this shit. Goodbye. Good night. I'm out of here. Okay, so we need a Route 15 encounter. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe we need a Route 15 as well as a Route 14 and a Route 13 encounter? Wow, we Do we have a ways to go? I'm just going to keep walking and see. Oh, <laughs> oh all right. Oh, all right. We have a fucking Ho-Oh. Get this thing out of here. Oh my god, the level 47. Uh, after fighting blue, I'm just ready for anything. Can we get an encounter, please? Please and thank you. <laughs> Can I throw a Pokeball at her? <laughs> What's popping, Swimmer Rachel? Uh, I mean, I'm trying to get an encounter, but sure, let's chat. Oh, oh are you? For real? What's popping? Really? You ain't got that vile plume yet? Hey, I understand. I'm out here trying to get encounters too. Uh, Alright, bye. Talk to you later, Rachel. I'll chat with you later. Why are we not allowed to get any encounters? Hello, excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. As much as I would like to smack all of you up, this is what I'm here for right now. I got a badge to get. Unless y'all got gym badges. I don't think, uh, wait, we already have a little cargo? It's been captured. I'm not even gonna go through the list. It says we caught it, so. <sighs> I believe the game. We caught it. Is this all that's over here? Is no cargoes? Oh, well, I know we got a some Flora, too. Are we gonna have to get a dudes?
We caught a Seedra though. We did catch a Seedra already, but I'm gonna I'm gonna rock with it. Fuck it. Fuck it. We have three Dragonites. Why can't we have three Kingdras? Wouldn't that work, right? Oh, a, a good fairy type would fuck us up. But I was gonna say if I had three Dragonites and three Seedras. Dragon types would be a threat, but we have dragon types. Ice types would be no issue. We have three kingdoms. And then fairy types would just have a blast. Stuff. When they're in a safe location, they can be seen playfully tangling their tails together. All right, little horsey. What are we naming this horsey? I think we're going to name it Bob. Because there's something that just tells me that this horsey is never going to evolve. So I like the name Bob. <laughs> For a little tiny horse, he just that's that's my boy Bob. Alright, Route 14. Oh bro, who are you looking at like that? Looking at it all crazy and shit. Damn. Motherfucker's spinning his head around. Okay, so do we think that eight can handle this? Look at that. Eight's in episode debut. Eight's in episode debut. Okay, hold on though, eight. I'm gonna need you to swap. Swap it up, swap it up. You don't wanna battle? Snorlax is cute, but I don't have it. Do you have a Snorl? Fuck off, no, I don't wanna trade with you, you bitch. No, I don't wanna trade with you. That's actually fucked up, why would she do that? Doesn't she know? Doesn't she watch this series? <laughs> Okay, bro, you're a level 26 Quagsire. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna try it again. We're gonna try it again. Hit him with the poison gas. Ultra ball him up. Bam. Damn, y'all might have been onto some with that poison gas shit. Look at the snag and all these encounters. I'm gonna put poison gas on every Pokemon I get from here on out. We ain't never fucking up encounters ever again. I like how I just named that horsey Bob, and now I get a Pokemon that looks like a Bob. I don't name him that. Its body is always slimy. It often bangs its head on the river bottom as it swims, but it seems not to care. <laughs> what an odd fucking Pokedex description. Um, I'm gonna name this Quagsire. There you go. Angela, welcome to the squad. Welcome aboard. We got plenty of room for you. Check this out. Hey, yo, fuck all of y'all. We are here for encounters, and that's about it. Isn't there an item over here? Wait, did the route just change? The route just changed, right? Route 14? Route 13. All right, buddy. I know you want to fight. I know you want to get down, and that's quite alright with me. I'll headbutt this T-Tar to death, bro. Can you believe that? I just <laughs> headbutted the T-Tar to death with a fucking Hypno. But, yes, of course, I know. I know, I know, I know. I was a higher level, but still. Excuse me, get the oh, fuck off. Oh, oh, I'm not going to do it again, though. <laughs> Once was enough. Fuck out of here, bro. We are here for one thing. And it's not anything that you got for us, man. Oh, damn. Oh, wait. Right here. What's popping, bro? What do we got in here? Damn, right away. They're ready to go. Hey, whatever. I love it. I love it. Yes. Yes. I'm so glad to have it. I put it to sleep. Okay, <laughs> that was my last two raw. All right, I'm gonna jot this down because I'm so confident in the poison gas technique. I'm so beyond confident in the poison gas technique. Oh wow, Leech Seed's gonna make this <laughs> difficult. <laughs> Even in the fiercest wind, it can control its fluff to make its way to any place in the world it wants. Wow. What are you naming this jump love? Oh, I gotta add. Oh, never mind. Jump love's already on the list. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Oh, I have the chance now to use it too. I'm gonna name this jump love. Um, 
you know what? This might be a little cliche, but we're gonna go with it. We have Lily the Jump Fluff. You might spell Lily differently, but that's how I spell Lily, damn it. Okay, so we got our encounters all up and down here, which I know we're nearing the... Oh, I'm about to say I can't fly to Fusion City, what the fuck? Which I know we're nearing the end of the game and the odds of our squad changing probably aren't that high, but at the same time, it's okay. You never know what could happen. Um, last episode was a perfect example and just having options is never a bad thing. But, the only option we have now is to snag this damn gym badge. Yo, champ in the making. Whoops, take a look, good look around you. The trainers all look like the leader Janine. Which of them is the real Janine? Oh, is it you? Fooled you? Damn, how could you? How could you, bitch? How could you, bitch? Yo, Sauron, I think we need Sauron to be uh, up in the front in the next episode. I feel like he's been like a... Not even like just recently, like a good while. Kind of just been chilling, playing support in the party. I think it's time that Sauron... It's all up in the action. Xavier, let's get Sauron up here. We're gonna let him rock out this episode and if I remember the next one too, but <laughs> are you the Janine? Did she say she was the real Janine? I don't think she's the real Janine. She can't be the real Janine. Yo, is this Derek's in episode debut? Is it? Let's click outrage. Let's click outrage. Fuck it, why not? Get him out of here. After Blue's Dragonite? Yo. All I'm saying is, Derek, you better have been taking notes, bro. <sighs> we got the real Janine. I'm Janine, the gym leader. No, I'm not gotcha. I really thought <laughs> for a moment there, I really thought that we actually had Janine, <laughs> but I guess not. Never mind. Never mind. Are you Janine? Is there another one up here? Bro, do we really fight every single trainer in the gym except for Janine? Cool. I'm sorry to disappoint you. I'm only joking. I'm the real deal. Janine of Fuchsia Gym, that's me. Well, let's get it. Come on. I'm a Pokemon trainer and you're a gym leader and you got something I want, Ranger Stacy. Is that gym? <laughs> it is every time without failure. Every time without failure, we end up encountering the Pokemon that we just lost. All right, Derek. This is your on the job training where you are now going to be expected to whoop your replacement. <laughs> or not whoop your replacement. You are the replacement. <laughs> Dang, that's not like ate that shit up too. Whoa, 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 whoa. Almighty oh, brick piece. What is going on here? Hey, let his ass go to sleep. Whip out this full heal. Bro, he has snore? You being for real? Is this a Dreyano game? <laughs> what the fuck? An Electrode. Can we bone club this thing? Hey, roll out all you want, bro. Check that out. Who the thunk it? Fucking bone club Dragonite. Fucking bone club Dragonite. Who would have thunk it? Not I. <laughs> Who else you got? Oh no. Oh wait, abilities aren't a thing, I can swap out. Hold the fuck up. Xavier. Xavier, do I hypnosis it or do I poison gas it and we... Oh, he's got a fucking safeguard, he did just use that. Yo, I need that safeguard to go down. Who the fuck do you think you are, bro? You think you are a ho-oh or something? 
Bro, I don't understand how I miss, and then all of a sudden, he just gets to put it back up. He's not affected. I feel like I'm being played. I feel like I'm being played. Yo, I have 40 PP of this. Thank you. <laughs> I'm not sitting here and attacking you. It's not happening. And then check this out. Check what I'm going to do next. I'm going to spam Hypnosis. Destiny Bond? It has what? Destiny Bond, Mirror Coat, Safeguard, and probably Counter. Bro, it's not happening. And you know, I don't think Destiny Bond works like this. But I'm going to swap out just in case. Just in case. I don't believe Destiny Bond works like that. Look at that. Super Potion was perfect. All right, Janine. How very sneaky and ninja-like of you. Oh, mighty brick piece. Oh, mighty, mighty brick piece. Um, can I just... Oh, wait. I didn't do what you were calling yet. Is anyone missing any HP? I don't know if it did. Here, I'm gonna go out to Sauron next. I don't know if it used Destiny Bond just now or not. I was about to click freaking Link Attack on it. That would have rocked my world. Counter, get the fuck out of here, bro. Destiny Bond's only one turn, right? It just used counter. Fuck out of here, bro. That's low, Janine. How you gonna use a Wobbuffet in the gym battle? That's low. You know we doing a Nuzlocke over here. Damn, we got something for me. Marowak. Hey, hit it up. Dire hit? Excuse me? Dire hit? This is her ace, level 51? Never mind. <laughs> I was worried for a moment. I mean, I didn't expect the wing attack to kill. I know Marowak's bulky, but still, goddamn. Butterfree, this is what you do at the end. You send in Butterfree. This is what you do. You send in Butterfree. You just sat me sit there with this Waba Fett. Now you send in fucking Butterfree. Nah, bro, get out of here. Get out of here. You're a tough one. You definitely won. Here's Soul Badge. Take it. Hey, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Thank you, Janine. You're so tough. I have a special gift. It's Gust. TM06? <laughs> do we have that written down in our guide? TM06? We actually did not. That's a brand new TM. He said it's growl. Well, I'm excited for TM06. I'm going to really apply myself and improve my skills. I want to become better than both father and you. Okay, hold on. Time out. Step one to becoming both better than father and me. You need to start giving out better fucking TMs. Like, immediately. Instantly. Make no doubt about it. Giving out growl. You didn't even use growl. <laughs> what is that supposed to be? Toxic normally? I think so. I think so. Well, we have, I believe, one Kanto badge left. I can't see my Kanto badges. Okay. Well, I believe we have one Kanto badge left. Um, and it is sitting just north of Fuchsia City in Celadon City. And I think that we are going to probably end up doing that tomorrow night. However, I believe we missed out on our Maya Angelou Wisdom quotes. I think the last two nights of Late Night Crystal, we've just been bugging and zooming and trying to get stuff done. So tonight we are going to wrap up tonight's episode with... We're almost done with chapter two of this book. God damn. Um, but tonight's quote... It's from chapter two, love. And the quote is, we are stronger, kinder, and more generous because we live in an atmosphere where love exists. We are stronger, kinder, and more generous because we live in an atmosphere where love exists. 
I can tell you, first thing that pops into my head, Call of Duty. I've been really wanting to get Modern Warfare 2, the new one, slap a couple first game of the day episodes on there. But, you know, just now reading that quote makes me think of, like, it was a noticeable difference. It was a long time ago when I really shifted focus, um, not content creation wise, just like in my own gaming life from like Call of Duty and I mean, I, I'm not going to say FPS, but I guess from Call of Duty being my main game to just everything else, just in general, it was just so much happier and just I felt more love in my life. I know that that's not really a deep reflection on that quote. Um, I'll leave that up to you guys, but just here wrapping up first thing that came to mind. So there's a lot to unpack there. So I wanted to make sure to mention to you guys, um, but before I forget tonight, um, well, first things first, we need an encounter here, but I wanted to make sure to mention to you guys that, oh, look at this fucking YouTube, get out of here. We still need to come up with another boon for our late night series. Um, I feel like most people have kind of <laughs> gathered, understood that, uh, I mean, you guys are loving late night yellow late night crystal um, I think a lot of people have put six and seven together and gotten 7800 and realized that we may be doing a late night emerald Shh, spoilers. Spoilers, spoilers, spoilers. but we haven't come up with a boon for it um, I had it as a question of the night a couple episodes back and I don't know maybe I worded it weirdly um, I probably should have gone back to check Damn, I don't think we have a Voltorb. I don't think we have an Electro either. I don't think we have. I think this is a brand new encounter. Damn, we're still getting brand new encounters. It's crazy. I feel like we did catch an Electro though. Anyways, um, yeah, I left it as a question of the night a couple episodes back. You know, like, what do you guys think our boon for um, the next series is going to be? Because, you know, the idea is that we have one per series each nuzlocke we beat we get a new boon so we beat late night yellow and we obtain the ability to take one of our mons from that team with us to late night crystal and that's where winston the pirate became our starter so that's permanent we're still gonna have that on this one moving forward but if we beat late night crystal we need a new one so i was trying to ask you know like what do you what do you guys think what's your recommendation and everybody just said <laughs> emerald I was like, well, I wasn't asking what game to play next. <laughs> but, like I said, that was probably on me. I probably worded it weird. You know, I'd be writing these questions up at 1 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> During the study of this Pokemon, it was discovered that its components are not found in nature. So does that mean that Voltorb's an artificial Pokemon? It's a man-made Pokemon? Huh. So anyways, yes. Let me know. I'm going to make it the question of the night for this episode as well. Let me know what do you guys think our next boon should be if, if we should be so lucky enough to beat Late Night Crystal. And I know some of you guys are sitting there thinking, what do you mean lucky enough? Uh, you guys have been harking from the comment section since, oh shit, Bill, my bad. What's poppin', bro? Are we full? Okay, 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 I got you. That apparently Red is going to be an absolute monster, and we need to basically have a team of 100s to take him on. <laughs> so, uh, Late Night Crystal's about to get pretty serious <laughs> here pretty soon, goddamn. Um, hold on, hold on. I gotta change me box. Change me box before I forget. Um, but anyways, one of the ideas that I had for a boon I was thinking was like a first aid kit, a med kit type thing, but it is a one-time use. I think some people have probably suggested something similar to this, um, but it's like a one-time use. You can revive one Pokemon, which I know is like, oh, that defeats the purpose of a Nuzlocke, but it's late night. You know, that's the whole point in the series is that it's just chill. We just want to sit back play a little bit of games you know sometimes the battles get a little intense but most of the time we just chilling you know um the whole point in the late night series is because it's nostalgic 
Can we get a surfing encounter here? No, we can't. Can we fish here? At the very least? I know there's grass. No, I don't want to do that. Because aren't our super rod encounters just all Dragonites? Should I take on red? I, I could get a fourth Dragonite here. <laughs> I could get a fourth Dragonite? How many more encounters do we have? Can I get two more Dragonites? Damn, if I would have caught that one before, I would have had five. Take on red with a full team of five Dragonites? Hmm. That'd be the dream. That'd be the dream. Let them know who uh, the best trainer in the in both regions is. Um, but anyways, back to the boom. <laughs> the idea was basically like a first aid kit, but it's like a one-time use kind of thing. You know, it's not. I know the term first aid kit implies that there's like, I don't know, like more than one thing in there. Like you know, you got your band aid, you got your. Anyways, the idea is that you know you could revive a fainted mon. But only once you can revive one fainted Pokemon one time. It's kind of like Money in the Bank from WWE, where I would basically always have one revive on me. That one revive is the first aid kit. So in my mind, like let's use Winston for an example. You know, it was very, very sad when Winston died. But that was not like a first aid kit situation. You know what I mean? Like Winston got fucked up and it sucked, but in my mind, the first aid kit situation is like, if we're in a battle and we lose a Mon, and it's not looking like we're gonna win this, but damn, if I just had Benny back, you know, mid battle, boom, then and there I can revive Benny and use my one first aid kit to continue. So in my mind, it's like an emergency situation kind of thing, you know? It's an emergency, you pull out your first aid kit. That's why a first aid kit's so tiny, it's not meant to cure whatever ails you it's just meant to patch you up in there and get keep you going until we get to the pc pokemon center we can rebuild a new team you know so i don't know something like that um let me know i guess you guys let me know what you think of that if you think that's dope or if you have any other suggestions because if we continue late night we're gonna have to have boons <laughs> to keep them going or maybe we could do like three or four or five and then clear it and then we're back to no boons and have to keep going. I don't know. I'm <sighs> brains running wild. Brains running wild. Um, what evolves into Furret Centret? I don't think we've caught a Centret, but we might have. I feel like I've said Centret on the late night Pokey Rep <laughs> quite a few times, but not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. I see Seedra, I see Spiro, I see Snubble, but I don't see it. Centret or Furret. So Furret, welcome to the PC box, my boy. Or my girl. You're gonna love it in there. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We proved this in last night's episode. The poison gas never fails. I think it just does something to them. Like they just think the wild Pokemon thing's like, damn, I'm never gonna be able to cure this. I better hop in this Pokeball. See? The fuck is up with that? You click poison gas and then go with the Pokeball immediately. <sighs> Alright. It lives in narrow burrows that fit its slim body. The deeper the nests go, the more maze-like they become. It's the long body Pokemon. <laughs> it's the long body Pokemon. <laughs> you know, I could name this thing Ivy. And that would be the exact same thing. She is so long. <laughs> She's so long. She's such a long dog. She lays out so long. Damn, we made it? Hey. Shout out to anybody else that's ever gone up cycling road backwards before. Shout out. I know you guys noticed that. <laughs> We're going up backwards. So this is still Route 16. You still handing out a fly up here? If you cruise down cycling road, you will end up in Fuchsia City. What if you cruise up Cycling Road? So I am not 100% sure what this route is, but I'm gonna get the encounter here. Oh, Roger. Well, that's dupes. We already have a Charmelon in the PC. A Shelter? A Shelter though? I'm pretty sure we did not caught a Cloister. And you know what? I'm gonna add him to the list as well. I'm gonna add Cloyster to the list as well. I don't think I've, maybe once or twice, like in an egg lock, maybe a long time ago. 
I feel like I have a memory of using it. Um, and I'm not saying that like I want to use any of these Pokemon because they're like, oh, Cloyster's so good. You know, it's just, you don't see them used all that often. I would just like to use a Cloyster, you know? You know? Clamping onto an opponent reveals its vulnerable parts. So it uses this move only as a last resort. Vulnerable parts. <laughs> uh, let's name this Shelter. I'm going to name you Percy. How you doing, buddy boy? I'm going to name you Percy. So let's jot you down so we don't forget you. <laughs> but you know what? Now that I think about it, waiting to do Celadon last maybe not might not have been the best idea because the department store is here the game corner is here <laughs> our celadon city encounter is here but i mean they have tms available you know a ladybug nah we got one of them i know for an actual factual we got one of them you i know you gotta have more this is not just a pond stocked full of ladybug don't give me that hold up grimer have been appearing lately See that pond out in front of the house? Grimer lived there now. Where did they come from? This is a serious problem. Oh, so Grimer has been randomized into Lady Ladybug? So normally you would only ever find Grimer here, and now it's just pure Ladybug madness? Well, okay. <laughs> okay, that's how you want to be. <laughs> I mean, I think that's the first time in a long time I've skipped an encounter, but uh, alright, whatever. Who are you? Team Rocket's hideout is in the basement of the game corner. Oh wait, that was three years ago. Oh, okay. Shit, my bad. In the basement of the game corner. Um, actually, speaking of the game corner, I want to go and see their TMs, because that's what we were just talking about. I want to go see what do y'all got for sale. Oh, we can get an encounter here too, right? It's a static mod. TM32. One thing at a time. Hold on. TM32, we do not know what it is, but I'm gonna jot down next to this. Oh shit, this is in Celadon Game Corner. TM29 is Rock Slide. TM15, we do not know what it is, but I'm gonna jot down Celadon Game Corner. <laughs> 7,500, oh my god. And then, Kangaskhan, Kakuna, and Dunsparce. <laughs> oh, didn't we just catch a Kangaskhan? The cheapest one? I don't really wanna get that many coins for a Kakuna, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Wait, I'm lost here. Well, the Kangaskhan wouldn't be awful, so we would need 11,222 coins. I don't know if I'm going to get that. <laughs> That's a lot of moolah. Can we still head down there and say hello? Hey, underneath this poster, there's nothing. Whack. Whack, the game corner was better when I could do a little bit of grinding. Damn, $10,000 is 500 coins? Yeah, we ain't getting that shit, bro. We ain't getting, we ain't, uh, we ain't, we ain't getting that, we ain't getting that, we ain't getting that. That would be $30,000 for that TM. <sighs> that would have to be the only way that I would go for that is if it is Earthquake, I don't even remember what the TM is anyways, but the TM itself would have to be compatible with 8 and then be randomized into Earthquake in order for it to be compatible. But I feel like, what are the odds of that happening? Like realistically, what are the odds of that happening? I don't think they're very good. Okay, well, we know there are two new TMs awaiting us there. Let's check out the... <laughs> Mart up here and see what they're hiding from us. We need to get some more Ultra Balls and uh, maybe some more Podions too. What y'all got up here? Y'all don't sell four stores in here? Bro. 
Bruh. Uh, I'm just gonna, yeah, I'm just gonna. <laughs> we should be good with that. We should be good with that for now. Because, I mean, before we take on red, I'm gonna have to buy four restores. Like, I'm not gonna not be ready to go to take him on. If he's supposed to be as big and bad as everybody's saying. Let's see what we got here. TM10. Now, I know from forgetting <laughs> that you can read the description here. TM10 is psychic. We already have that. Attack the Maid Lower Special Defense. TM11, we do not have. Steals HP from a sleeping victim. I'm going to take a stab in the dark and say that that is Dream Eater. I'm going to jot down. It's at the Celadon department store tm17 we do not have lowers the foe's accuracy um i'm gonna guess it's sand attack no because tm22 is sand attack can there be two of the same move in two different tms two two of the same two different two different tms with the same move but i'm sure there's another move i'm just not thinking of that lowers the foe's accuracy tm18 we do not have boost water type moves for five turns. I'm gonna guess that is rain dance. I need to jot that this is in Celadon department store for both of these. Yo, I could write a game guide, but it would only work for this game, <laughs> this randomized game. TM37, double slap, we already have that. Okay, well, not awful not awful well actually kind of awful i'll take that back <laughs> i take that back it's kind of awful oh well um is the guy still up here does he still give you an eevee can we go up here and uh speak with him wait did we get an encounter over here round seven we've never been here right Oh, well, that's a dupes. Oh. <laughs> well, that's definitely not dupes. It's definitely retribution. Uh, this is big, 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 big. Uh, what's the word? National Park vibes. Uh, could you imagine if we pulled up on red with three Dragonites? A Titar, <laughs> an Articuno. <laughs> uh, yo, battle me, bitch. Thank you. Yes. Oh my god. You know, I would say I'd want to put Tyranitar on the list, but I know for a fact I've used quite a few Tyranitars. I use Tyranitar every fucking day in Pokemon Go. <laughs> it will not stay still, even when, while it's a pupa. It already has arms and legs under its solid shell. Ugh, imagine how uncomfortable. Damn, imagine how uncomfortable. I'm gonna name you just nice and simple. Mary. So that when we have a mighty T-Tar, people can say, who did this to you? Mary. <laughs> um, so I believe is that all of our encounters in Kanto? Did I miss any? Did I forget any? I don't think so. Wait, are there items up here? Why do you let me walk all the way around here? There's nothing up here? Oh, I've been fooled. I've been had. Unless this Eevee is still here, but I feel like this Eevee is not still here. I feel like there's definitely just a... Who the fuck is he? What's up, bro? You think you give out free Pokemon? Let me recount a terrifying tale. Once upon a time, there was a little boy who was given a new bicycle. He wanted to try it right away. He was having so much fun that he didn't notice the sun had set. While riding home in the pitch black night, the bike suddenly slowed. The pedals became heavy. 
When he stopped pedaling, the bike began slipping backwards. It was as if the bike were cursed and trying to drag him into oblivion. Well, I'm not gonna shriek. The boy had been riding uphill on cycling road. <sighs> That's what I just did. <laughs> For listening so patiently, you may take this, TMO3. Okay, well, it's like uh, the TMs in here are like peeping bugs and grounded. <laughs> if you guys don't know, we have a grounded series over on Nappy the Great with my boy Trey. The one that our rival in our crack deglog is named after. If you've never heard of Grounded, it's a pretty wild fucking series, but links in the description and whatnot. <laughs> JK, we already have Dynamic Punch, so. I mean, TMO3. <laughs> it's Dynamic Punch. <laughs> it's a terrifying move. It really is. Well, I think that now we have just one thing left to do here in Saladin City, and it's the thing that we came here to do. And that is to whoop ass and burn this gym down. <laughs> Lord Sauron is leading the pack and he is ready, ready, ready. Ready, Freddy. Ready to go. And to be honest, I feel like this is long, long, long overdue. They should have just given me all eight of my badges the moment I stepped foot in the region. Like the moment my foot came down, all eight should have just risen out of the gyms. Shot through the ceilings. <laughs> Can I kill this tentacruel with Psychic? Yo, Lord Sauron walks in and just annihilates. I love it. I love it. I just imagine he walks in and one after the other. Look at him just all fall at his feet. What the fuck? Yo, Middle Earth will never be the same. Middle, oh, that's it? Middle Earth will never be the same. Look at, look at this. Look at what, what is, what's going on here? What is going on here? We're going to psychic this bully dog. Oh, water gun. Out of here, bro out of here get him out of here too how annoying i know yo i fucking know do we really need to i think we should be good but you know what just to be safe i'm gonna save my game because only you can prevent lost save data look at this with 245 hours and 53 Seconds? 53 minutes. <laughs> I got so confused for a second. That's just because of the speed up. Could you imagine playing this game for that long? You better have level 100 every Pokemon, even Magikarp. Hello, lovely weather. Isn't it? It's so pleasant. I'm afraid I made those off. Oh, my name is Erica. I am the leader of Celadon Gym. Oh, all the way from Johto, you say? How nice. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Girl, I don't think you understand. I don't think you understand the predicament that you are in, Ranger Wayne. <clears throat> you know, I gotta say... Oh, she left the Pidgeot. I gotta say, it is a little jarring going back and forth from like blue to weaker gym leaders but I've also never in my life intentionally done Johto out of order I feel like every Nuzlocke every LP I've ever done I've always taken like a, a similar path or a somewhat same path um, all the way through Kanto I've never done it the way we did it in late night crystal this time around um, I say intentionally because I'm sure when I was a kid I didn't do it right. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is why we rock psychic. Is it enough? Is it enough? I know him only is kind of bulky. Mmm, but Lord Sauron infects the minds of men. And it's even harder. Oh, of course. Damn. This is no good. Alright, is this her ace? A level 60 Corsola? Dang, out of all moves you could have used, you live that hit and then you pull that out? What the fuck? Why are you hyper potioning this Corsola? Come on now. Come on now.
Are you gonna do it again? Or can I use this faint attack? <laughs> and then we get the crit. He have just done that and ended it for us earlier. Ooh. A Sparky boy. Did she even have a single grass type? She had two level 60s. Run me my badge, Erica. Run me my badge, Erica. Not like I didn't know I was gonna walk away with it, but run me, how, how, tell me. It doesn't even affect Lord Sauron. Doesn't even affect him. How does your town live? Cause the special stat? Okay, I'll give you that. We get to stepping. We said we wanted a Sauron episode. We got ourselves a Sauron episode. God damn it. Oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I shall give you Rainbow Badge. Hey, thanks. Is that all 16? That was a delightful match. I felt inspired. Please, I wish you to have this TM. It's Giga Train. It's a wonderful move. Please use it if it pleases you. Oh, it is. We actually already have Giga Train. Losing leaves a bitter aftertaste. But knowing that there are strong trainers spurs me to do better. Yeah, okay. Well, giddy goddamn. If that ain't 16 badges, I don't know what is. Well, I think that that just leaves one final thing for us to do. And if I'm not mistaken, I think that we need to ascend Mount Silver. And take on red. Dun dun dun. This is you see? <laughs> I talked to this guy because I talked to the other guy last time. Uh, okay. Hi, I'm back visiting my hometown. It's been quite a while. That's it? That's all you gotta say? Alright then. I believe this is going to be the last episode of Late Night Crystal. We have one thing left to do that is to scale Mount Silver and take on red whoop his ass so if you guys are hyped for some late night crystal if you guys have been watching from the beginning and you're here for the very end the finale and of course if you want to show your support as a proud one of the Navy nation make sure to like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated now i did go ahead and get our squad leveled up to what i'm hoping shall be enough to defeat red um we have been <laughs> hooting and hollering about his level ever since episode one night one of late night crystal and according to my calculations which i'm no math whiz i will say it now i'm expecting red to have a 95 a 98 and four level 100s so here's the hoping it's somewhat near that or somewhere around there because i got our entire squad up to level 95 up first in our quick team recap, we have Derek, our Dragonite, level 95, holding the scope lens, rocking Outrage, Hyper Beam, Bone Club, and Thunder Wave. I told you, we went to the mountains to train, and Derek came back with a wonderful move, and I thought to myself, you know what? Fuck it. It's late night crystal. Let's slap Hyper Beam on Derek as well. I want to get off one Hyper Beam with Derek against Red. Here's the hoping. <laughs> Up next, we have Lady Ramla, our Crobat, Lady of the Reach at level 95, holding the Army of the Coin, Rock Wing Attack, Bite Fly, and Confuse Raid. Then we have Julian, our Shiny Tentacruel, all the way from the Lake of Rage, level 95, holding the Mystic Water, Rock and Surf, Acid Barrier, and Hydro Pump. Then we have Xavier, our Hypno, level 95, holding the Twisted Spoon, Rock and Psychic, Headbutt, Poison Gas, and Hypnosis. Up next, we have 8, our Steelix at level 95. Look at his fucking defense look at his defense that's insane that's insane i've only ever seen numbers like that on like a blissey's hp or something like what the fuck anyways he's level 95 rock and slam crunch rock their own cut holding a quick claw and last but certainly not least we have lord sauron our houndoom at level 95 holding the charcoal rock and flamethrower punch psychic and faint attack and last but not least, we have the brick piece at level 95 in our party being a rare chunk of tile. So if I'm not mistaken, don't you have to go down here and get an invitation from Oak? The guy at the door said that you needed to have all eight badges, but oh, I never battled you. <laughs> Did we uh, go past you, bro? 
Get this out of here. <laughs> Bro, we got a level 95 Dragonite, dog. Even Lance is shaking in his boots right now. There is no stopping us. No, not at all. You know, we could have just flown down here. Lady Ramla knows fly. We just went over it. But, anyways, I'm pretty sure you gotta go down here and speak to Oak. And then he'll let you go to Mount Silver, right? Wow, that's excellent. You collected the badges of Jim's and Kanto. Well done. I was right in my assessment of you. Tell you what, Nappy. I'll make arrangements so that you can go to Mount Silver. Mount Silver is a big mountain that is home to many wild Pokemon. It's too dangerous for your average trainer, so it's off limits. But we can make an exception in your case, Nappy. Go up to Indigo Plateau. You can reach Mount Silver from there. How's your Pokedex coming along? Let's see. Current Pokemon completion level. 246 Pokemon seen, 79 Pokemon owned. To evolve, some Pokemon grow, others use the effects of stones. If you're in the area, I hope you come visit again. Trust me, Professor Oak, I love getting stone, bro. And you stuff nothing in your trash can, dog. What are you doing? Where did, where did your trash go? Do you have a compost pile somewhere? What's 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 going on here? Um, so yeah, I guess we're gonna fly back to <laughs> Viridian City. And you know, Oak, I'm gonna tell you this, bro. Um what do we have one two maybe encounters left do we ever talk to this guy oh <sighs> i must have dozed off in the sun i had this dream about a drowsy eating my dream weird huh huh what's this where did this tm come from this is spooky here you can have this tm Shh. all the way up to the last episode we still getting tms tm 42 we don't have it yet <sighs> imagine that tm 42 is spikes all right well, whereas in Late Night Yellow, I feel like a majority of our TMs were kind of trash. I feel like we started off very, very strong in Late Night Crystal and just very gradually that then turned into rapidly <laughs> lost the quality of all of our TMs. And now we are stuck with spikes and growl and a bunch of repeats that we already have. Um, I think there's a couple items in Mount Silver. Um, because as of right now, we are currently missing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 TMs. Now I know we never went to the World Islands. I'm sure there could be some TMs in there. But if they're not there, where, where could the missing TMs be? Route 28, survey says, it's a totodile, but I'm pretty sure we have a crocodile. Um, I know that you could probably look up all of the TM locations and just go figure it out. Yes, we do have a crocodile named Patty. We knew that, we knew that, we knew that, we knew that, we knew that. But I'm down for whatever may pop up over here, whatever else may pop up over here. Is it really just all totodiles? I feel like I remember there just being like Ponyta in this grass normally. Is that weird? That I only ever remember Ponyta? Boltor? We definitely caught one of those in last night's episode. So I'm not falling for that, bro. Definitely not falling for that. Whoa, Silver Cave. This is my Silver Cave encounter? I didn't even know that was a. Well, Winnie definitely existed. <laughs> so that's dupes for Silver Cave. How do we get up there? Do we have to go all the way around? It's a Togepi! Well, I know for a fact we definitely don't have a Togepi. I don't think we have a Togetic either. We do have a Togetic named Wendy. Never mind. It doesn't count either. Goldeen? Really? After all of this, we don't have a Goldeen? We don't have a Goldeen or a Sea King? This is our encounter. What can I say? This is our encounter. Level 95 Hypno with Poison Gas. It's only made possible by way of the Brick Piece. Almighty Brick Piece. During spawning season, they swim gracefully in the water, searching for their perfect mate. Let's jot you down. What are we naming this Goldeen? 
I'm going to name you Lucy. We had Mary in the last episode, and now we have Lucy the Goldie. <laughs> oh, God. I don't know where I get these names from. I feel like they're somehow oddly fit and at the same time are like the most basic names ever. But I don't know. It's weird. I really like giving human names to like animals and Pokemon. So this is our silver cave encounter? I can't poison gas you, Magnemite. We have a Magneton named Magneto. So, sorry bud. You will not be our silver cave encounter. If I can do anything about it. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just walking at this point. That species still in silver cave. Nothing over here? No fucking way! I would scream louder, but <laughs> it's almost 1 a.m. and I don't want to do that. <laughs> Holy shit, we just got a third Master Ball. <laughs> oh, there's a Pokemon Center up here. Hey! Trainers who seek power climb Mount Silver despite its many dangers. With their trusty Pokemon, they must feel they can go anywhere. Fuck yeah. Hey, we can still get a Silver Cave encounter, and we have a fresh master ball so i want something to pop up try me try me double triple quadruple dog try me because i'm ready bro oh dear you found me please don't tell anyone about me i'll keep you this for keeping my secret please <gasps> we were just talking about finding more late night crystal tunes TM forty seven? We don't have it. Uh, you're a celebrity? Well what did you give me? TM forty seven is Crab Hammer. Aw. Rest in peace, Winston the Pirate. Rest in peace, rest in peace, rest in peace. But we have crab hammer. Can anyone learn it? Derek can learn it. Ramla can learn it. Ramla can learn it. What's a fucking rock type, yo? What is a fucking rock type? Oh, this must be the fly girl. She's a fly girl from In Living Color. That's why she's got a fear. <laughs> can we get another master ball? There ain't nothing over here. Is this where one of the days of the week people show up at? Honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you. That's who I thought that was just now. I was like, what the fuck? Who is this? Um, so we're in the Silver Cave area, right? So we still need to get a Silver Cave encounter. Sorry, Stephanie. Do we not have a Magic Arp or a Gyarados? We don't have either. Wow. What are the fucking odds? After all this time. This is the first Magikarp we've encountered? All this fishing, this is the first Magikarp we've encountered? Should I Master Ball this Magikarp? I'm kind of tempted just to say I Master Balled a Magikarp. Fuck. Never Master Balled a Magikarp before and it won't happen today. This weak and pathetic Pokemon easily gets pushed along rivers when there are strong currents. You didn't have to be that mean. You didn't have to call it all that, say all those names. I only have one name for a lady ghost, and it is a very strong and powerful name. You know, you could call her Queen Magnolia. Makes sense to me. I would love and respect that. Mount fucking Silver. Ooh, here we go. Oh, we need fun. <laughs> Do we really need flash in here, bro? Do we really need flash in here? Wait a minute. This is our first encounter. Do we need waterfall in here? Am I really unprepared? That's dupes. I know we got a... Whatchamacallit. That's dupes, too. That's species. Yo, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I am 100%. 100%, 100%, not dealing with flash. Not dealing with Flash tonight. Let us go.
go and see a picture of this cave so that I can know where I'm going. Mount Silver? You do need waterfall. Julian. Julian, my boy. This is honestly the only issue that we have, dog, is that you don't know waterfall. Like, it drives me bonkers, bro. How do you not know waterfall? All these are dupes. All these are species. We ain't catching none of you. That's not dupes, and that's not species. And we caught it. Our Mount Silver encounter is a fucking venonat, bro. <sighs> Pretty sure that's our final encounter is a venonat. The small bugs it eats appear only at night. So it sleeps in a hole in a tree until night falls. Wow. Well, I'm gonna give you a name that honors the hole you live in. <laughs> we have Silver the Venonet. I think that might be our last encounter. Isn't that fucking crazy? Uh, let's see here. We have to get Waterfall. That's why they have that Pokemon Center there. A Miracle Berry cures all status problems. Hmm. Interesting. Um, so I can't even get up to this right now. <laughs> Honestly, I need to go get Waterfall before I progress any further into this cave. I was gonna say, why the fuck can't I go down? Get the fuck out of here. Another Twisted Spoon. Okay. Xavier already got that. Oh, this sucks though. We have to have Waterfall to get up here? Can anyone on the team learn Waterfall right now? Because I really don't want to have to face a team of hundreds with Derek can learn Waterfall. I might have to get rid of Hyper Beam. Uh, the only reason I want to keep Thunder Wave is because if we're facing a team of 100, then let's say he has a fucking Mewtwo or something, you know, I definitely want to cripple that as much as I can. So as much as I want to get a Hyper Beam off, we have to teach it Waterfall. I felt really bad about getting rid of, um, whatchamacallit, Wing Attack 2. Because I was like, damn, this is his only stab move. I'm going to get rid of it. I feel so bad. But... Well, it's not his only stab move, but... Alright, we're gonna need to, um... Do a little something-something here so that we can... Figure dig where we're going in the dark here. Um, let's see here. Oh shit, are we doing it? Are we actually making the walk? I'm, you know what's crazy is I'm using the items. Like, if I can just get to this next item, I know where I'm gonna be. We're gonna be good. Look, check it. <laughs> How is he doing it? Wow. I just had the whole thing memorized, bro. That's all. That's all it is. I just got the whole fucking thing memorized. I feel like there's a hidden item around here somewhere, but I'm not risking it. Well, I guess I could go check it out. Since I'm gonna loop back around anyways. A Carbos, damn. I'm looking for Master Balls, bro. Raises the speed of a Pokemon. I'm gonna give this to Derek. Derek is our new fly boy on the team. You know, talk about fly girls. He's our new fly boy on the team. And Lady Ramla is the fly girl. Why can't I go up? I'm supposed to be able to go up. Oh, am I lost? We ain't lost. 
Wait a minute, we might be lost. Where the fuck are we supposed to go? Oh, never mind, I found it. Never mind, I found it. I found the way. Wait. <laughs> I think I found the way. Okay. What? There it is. Fuck yes. I was like, come on, are you serious? I can't get through this bitch? What? Get the fuck out of here. I couldn't have had Pinsir as my first encounter. I couldn't have had Sand Slash as my first encounter. I would have loved to have had Lickitung as one of my first and my last encounter. How appropriate. Pink Apricorn right before Lickitung. How appropriate. But you know what? We taught Derek Waterfall, so we're fucking using Water Vault, damn it. Take me up this bitch. Show me what's up here. <laughs> Red, I hope you can hear my bag. All the stuff inside of it. Clinging and clanging and banging and janging around. A king's rock? Hold up. We can toss a couple of this shit. We got a couple. We can toss this. Get rid of that too. I was going to say, we got a couple things we can get rid of. Dang, I don't think this room is on any maps. <laughs> we just discovered something new. I mean, I know this game is 20 something years old, but I don't think anybody's ever been in that room before. That's a brand new thing. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, bear with me. We're almost there. We were just feeling our way around through in darkness. But I gotta check. I gotta check. I gotta check. I know you, uh, diehard red fans. Like, are you serious? You still, you still not there yet, bro? Mystery berry. A self restore for PP. Can I give it to? Who's been using moves? Who have we been battling with? Oh, we've been running from every battle. Okay, well, never mind. Is this another secret room? Oh, bitter berry. But I don't want to leave this bitter berry behind. I mean, to be honest, it probably would get tossed. So I'm not super mad about it. Sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, 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 okay. Guess what? There's only one door left for us to go through. And can you guess where it takes us? Fuck. Is the peak of Mount Silver considered a different area? Fucking Raikou. I already got one of you, bro. Out of here, dog. Level 51 Raikou just pops up right before red. Well, I'm going to save my game because only you can prevent lost save data. Hot fucking damn. Well, I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of nervous. <sighs> All right, you guys. Derek, Sauron, 8, Xavier, Julian, Ramla. We are relying on you in this battle here. Please and thank you. Give it all you got. I was gonna say, I wanna stand next to him. Damn, this Raikou is persistent. Pose for the thumbnail, dog. All right, buddy. School boy, Veronica. Yo, the music. It's the only reason I came here.
That's the best part. Good tune, oh my god, I could do that all night. Alright, lantern, lantern, lantern. <laughs> we are starting at level 100, and hey, we're going in here with a handicap, we're not even full HP. Dang, Derek? Dang, Derek? Yo, this spark's gonna hurt. Hold on, Derek. You got it, buddy. You got it. You got it. You got it, buddy. Bam! Smack that lantern. For some reason, I was expecting it to hit twice, like boomerang or something, but just one bone club. <laughs> just one smack. Wow, okay. Lanterns are gone. I hope he has all Johto Pokemon. And a Pikachu. Oh, well, never mind. Oh my god. <sighs> Do I click waterfall? Do I click waterfall? It's not stab. It is quad effective. Or do I go out to eight right now? <gasps> I get it. It's not that I wasn't expecting the waterfall to kill, I was just expecting the golem to live and explode <laughs> more than anything else. Oh, he doesn't have imposter, never mind. Level 98, okay, cool, 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 cool. I like this, I like this, I like this. Um, it's a fucking ditto, I should be able to smack him, right? And just smack him up. He didn't die. He didn't die. Do I have to click Outrage? I think I have to click Outrage. He has Waterfall. Or I could just hard swap to 8 right now. Because he has what? Thunder Wave? Hyper... Hyper... No. Thunder Wave, Waterfall. Waterfall would hurt, but... I don't think it would be terrible. I just don't want to be Outraged, that's all. And I think he's gonna click... Oh! I thought he was gonna click Outrage. Okay, so the waterfall could be a problem. Do we click rock throw? <laughs> a level 95. He outraged the steel type? Oh, outrage is special. Fuck. I keep forgetting. But I still resist it, so. Why not? Hey, fuck that, Ditto. It's locked in, too. You ain't healing, bro. Look at this purple Dragonite. I love the purple Dragonite. God damn. Oh, look at 8. Level 95 Steelix. Killing a level 98 Ditto Dragonite with Rock Throw. Only here on Late Night Crystal. Only here on Late Night Crystal. So what is that, number 3? He still has three more. Okay. Schoolboy Veronica sent out a Poliwrath. Whoa. He's looking extra hench here. A level 100 Poliwrath. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Cool. Um, he's going to go for a water type move against eight. I know that. Oh, no. He might do fighting. But either way, Julian's got this wrapped up. Like, what's the issue? Where's the issue? What? Red just double swapped on me? Oh, Pidgeot, I ain't worried too much. I ain't worried too much. I ain't worried too much. Level 100 Pidgeot, I think we're gonna need to Hydro Pump you, bruh. I should've clicked Barrier, though. But you know what? I have faith in Julian. Julian's killing this Pidgeot. You don't need the Barrier, Julian. You don't need no goddamn Barrier. Hydro Pump this bird again. I almost clicked surf too. Hydro pump it again. You got this, Julian. I know you do. 
I fucking know you do. Julian, no, Julian, no, Julian, no. Julian, no, Julian, no, Julian, no. You can't do that. You can't do that. We are on the top of the world right now. Literally. All eyes are watching. And you're up here on top of this mountain missing hydro pumps? Getting wing attacked? Excuse me? Hit him with it again. We have one hydro pump left. I hope he doesn't have a Pokemon that needs to be hydro pumped. <laughs> Since I just wasted three of them on his Pidgeot. But how very anime of you to have a Pidgeot. Ariados. Okay. Alright. Sigh of relief. At least the Ariados was the weakest one. And I was right. 95, 98, and 4, 100. Um, but I know this bitch gets psychic. Um, Sauron. <laughs> psychic that. Oh, I didn't see what he did. I was so good. I didn't click. Speed up this entire battle. I think he agility. Which we still outsped, so. But what you gonna do with this Ariados, bruh? Other than say, return! Take it right back in that Pokeball. But his last Pokemon's Bully Rat. We gotta swap. We gotta swap, we gotta swap, we gotta swap. Hey, you can't double predict this. Oh, please don't hurt Julian. Please don't hurt Julian. I know he's he only has moves by level up double slap. That was a crit hit three times. Whoa, that could have been. We have one max potion. Julian, you deserve it, buddy. You fucking deserve it. After everything you've done, not just for us in this battle, but in total submission, bro, it's not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Critical hit. Chill. Why is he gonna get my. You're gonna give Julian shaking baby syndrome, dog. Don't be clicking submission. My. Whoa. So he has mind reader, hypnosis, submission, and. I forgot what his last move was <laughs> but I can't do anything to him here hold on who do we need to bring out here I can't remember what his last move was I'm gonna bring out Xavier I feel like he hasn't been here in a while is, is he gonna click submission is it gonna hurt Xavier my boy eat it up eat it up eat it up You know, he actually had a really crazy team, too. Because in the manga, Red started off with a Poliwhirl. And now look at him with a Poliwrath. And a critical fucking hit from Xavier. You know what this means, ladies and gentlemen? We just beat Late Night Crystal. And Xavier, well, you could say Xavier has many different forms. He's a psychic type. He can traverse through many different multiverses, but Xavier is the first Pokemon to make it through both Late Night Yellow and Late Night Crystal. I wish Winston the Pirate would have been the first actual Pokemon to make it through both, but sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. Sometimes it just doesn't. But, like I said, we just beat Late Night Crystal. Goddamn. 10,000. I should have had Lady Romla go up in there. That's crazy. They only let you battle him once. Fuck. It's crazy they only let you battle him once. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think with that, we are wrapping up yet another late night series here on the channel. I gotta say, a series that just came off a whim. I just wanted to play yellow version chill and kick it and play yellow version late at night you guys have really bonded to and i think we are turning into a new mainstay here on the channel so thank you guys so very much for your love and light and support um we do have one active boon available at the moment and that is to carry over a current alive pokemon from late night crystal to whatever our next late night series is Put a pin in that. I'll get back to that in just a moment. 
Um, but I say alive so that means anyone that's on our team or in our PC. Vote in the comment section below and whoever gets the most votes will be carried over into our next late night series here on the channel. Um, we will not find out what our new boon is for beating late night crystal until our next late night series as well. But bring back that pin real quick. Our next late night series on the channel. I know that we did late night yellow and then we <laughs> finished it in the very next night we went to late night crystal. Um, but I don't know if you guys know this, but there's a new Pokemon game coming out next week and that's kind of where I want to focus a lot of my attention on. Um, I'm hundred percent spoiler free on it. Well, I'm going to say like 98% spoiler free. Some things you just can't avoid, but like 98% spoiler free. So I'm very much so looking forward to diving into that game. Um, and I don't want to have to stop and play some other game when all I want to fucking do is play the new game. You, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So what I'm going to say is, yes, I'm going to confirm our next late night series will be late night Emerald. And as of right now, I will tell you that I have it planned for episode one of Late Night Emerald to go up on Monday, November 28th. Now, that is tentative. It may or may not happen, but as of right now, as I'm planning out projects and schedules and whatnot, I believe Monday, November 28th is going to be the day. So that gives us two full weeks without a late night series but we've had two full months of late night <laughs> which is fucking crazy thank you guys so much again for your support thank you so much for your love and light i'm gonna stop running my mouth now late night emerald on monday november 28th vote for who you think we should carry over into late night emerald and on the 28th we will tell you guys what our second earned boon is in our late night series with that, I'm going to get up out of here and take my black ass to sleep. If you guys enjoyed tonight's episode of Late Night Crystal, if you enjoyed us taking on Red, if you enjoyed Late Night Crystal, and you want to show your support as a primer of the Nappy Nation, make sure to like button down below for us, because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. Thank you so, so much for your love and light. And until we see each other again, be safe. I'm out this bitch. Bye. This thick ass Flintstones trash can is just not letting us live. Um, I don't think a water gun is going to kill Roger. One singular water gun is going to kill Roger, but the only issue is, what do we do? Do we click smoke screen? Do we just click scratch from the get go? Um, let's see what happens. Let's see what this will be heal spam. Well, I definitely think a water gun could kill from there, being five above. I don't think a scratch is going to kill from here. <sighs> Do we click smoke screen? Do we click smoke screen and hope that the water gun misses on the first turn? Well, let's see. I was going to say, let's see if we outspeed him. That did nothing. Fucking nothing. I should have clicked smoke screen. If I was going to live on one, I should have clicked smoke screen. <laughs> I should always trust my gut. I should always trust my fucking gut. What am I supposed to do here? What am I? What? What? What, what is the play? What is the play? What do we do here? Somebody has to die. Because I got into this battle on accident. Because I didn't do grinding.
All right, this is it. <laughs> We've just wasted all that shit. Gimli, my boy. Roger. No fucking way. I mean, I'm clicking flame wheel at this point. I should have clicked smoke screen again, actually. That was a crit. No fucking way! No fucking <laughs> Oh my god, yo, 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 yo. I'm just gonna say it right now. That was my bad. Uh, that was my bad. I shouldn't have wasted all those potions. I shouldn't have gone for that at all. I shouldn't have done any of that shit. I was just... I was acting without thinking. And I said it. I should have clicked smoke screen. I clicked it once. And he fucking... Uh, missed move twice. Gimli didn't deserve that. I really wanted to use that primate. That was... Uh, bad decisions. Bad plays. The fact that I didn't grind. Bad decision. The fact that I sped up trying to hatch an egg and got into a battle, bad decision. The fact that I chose to heal spam, bad decision. Wasted potions just to get critted, which I say all the time is that that's what you're begging for. Um, I should have just clicked smoke screen. I should have never gotten into the battle. I should have grinded. <sighs> stupid, stupid, fucking, stupid, fucking happy. Well, at least Silver was defeated. <clears throat> Sand attack. You gonna do it again? He growled. Whoa. Whoa. He growled. He lowered my attack. Okay, so level 33. I'm not mad at. I'm really not mad at. Oh, he lived? Since when? A magnitude nine. Are you kidding me? You know, I think I said this in Late Night Yellow. You know, sometimes it really sucks having a grass poison type for that reason. I mean, a magnitude nine, I mean, that's still really high, but god damn. Ugh, Ursula. We had a leaf stone for you and everything. Had a leaf stone for you and everything. I was just trying to get everybody a little bit of shine, you know? Get the fuck out of here, bro. You didn't have to kill my fucking victory bell like that, you stupid ass. I'm not good enough yet. All right, this badge is yours. Didn't have to kill my fucking weeping bell. We had a leaf stone we were gonna use. You guys are here getting scoop. Getting the scoop of things. Um, I think, inadvertently, I kind of, sort of... That wasn't my fault. I shouldn't have done that. That was stupid. Veronica did not deserve that. That was my fault. 100%. You know, Switch training this entire time, I've been, like, doing this mental check every time a Pokemon comes up, thinking, like, what can it do to Veronica? What can it do to Veronica? I even mentioned how little HP Veronica had. Um, and there were a couple I think I clicked confusion on just to get a little bit of experience But you know now that I'm thinking out loud the whole point in switch training is to switch the Pokemon out Not to leave them in. I should have seen that come in. I should have known better Dumb 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 dumb. Veronica didn't deserve that. Veronica did not deserve that <sighs> Such a bad trainer Awful trainer. It was awful Awful trainer is awful. Awful trainer is awful. 
And we're gonna go out to Winston. Recover all you want. Defense curl all you want. He tried attack and Winston the pirate didn't get caught by it. Look at Winston leading the pack. God damn. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. And you know why I don't like this. I'm not playing any games. I would go out to Sauron, but I don't like this. That's why I don't like this. Winston, Winston, Winston. Wow. Wow. I wonder if he would have lived that from full. Um, I just wonder. Wow. I should have swapped. I should have swapped. Why didn't I swap? And now here we are. I never even thought about this day coming. I just never, never crossed my mind. Never thought it would ever be possible. This can't be happening. I fought hard, but I still lost. Wow. Now I just have this image in my head because of what she said. You know, I won't lose this time. You know, like, anime with me for a moment. You know, like, we're just going back. I have to go back. I have to go back. We made it all the way here, and I have to go back. You know, like, we're battling our way up the tower, and everyone's taking hit after hit after hit, and now this evil Team Rocket member vows to get revenge, and she's, like, right there around the corner, right around, uh, right stops just right before our goal. Freeze, burn, paralysis, and then explosion. Winston held up his big claw. The moment we saw that fortress light up, I'm going the wrong way. The moment we saw that fortress light up, Winston quickly scuttled us behind his massive claw. And he took the hit for us. And when the light faded, all we saw was just the blackened husk. <laughs> that was Winston, the motherfucking pirate. Don't you ever forget his name. Don't you ever forget his name. Dang. Excellent work. Keep it up. Keep it the fuck up. Get the, get the Magmar out of here. She's got two Mons left. She has the best Elite Four team I've ever seen. Azumarill. I was 61. Fuck. Whoa, 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 whoa. Our team is not prepared for this at all. Ramla, you might have to carry for a moment. Oh my goodness. Ramla, I need you to take a hit. Oh my god, he doesn't go for anything crazy. Okay, wait, wait, wait. He's locked in. Oh my god, he's locked in. Okay, I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. I have to pay attention. We still have horn attack. I have to pay attention. And we don't necessarily want him to flinch either. I would rather take the rollout. Rain stop. Fuck yeah. I can't believe we outspeed this Azumarill either. <laughs> Judy, go ahead. Shit. I see you. The oh my god. Technician Max. Or oh, Technician Pansy used a Max Potion. Oh my god. Wait. Does it tell you when it's no longer locked into rollout?
it never tells you when they're no longer locked into rollout. <sighs> Judy. I feel like our wall has fallen and I'm so very sad that it was Judy <sighs> I fucking love right on oh my god should have thought about that the moment I saw the max potion I should have thought about that <sighs> Julian Get us out of here, bro. Is he a fairy type in this game? Stop fucking rolling out. What is every Pokemon in this game? And she has an entity. Okay, well, Azumarill's not the worst Pokemon. You know, I shit talk that Azumarill. <laughs> I was talking about how good the rest of her team is. And I was like, Azumarill, mm, well, she already had for alligator. She already had water type, which is honestly my only grievance with it. But that Azumarill just took it to heart. To get their heart. But I would still say she probably still does have the best Elite Four team I've seen so far. That makes me so sad. Judy's passing makes me so sad. And then you use Stomp. Judy's signature fucking move. She never even got to Earthquake. Fuck you, pansy. All right, that's two encounters that we just uh, <laughs> lost out on. <laughs> Don't you worry, we got ourselves a green apricorn. Haven't been back to Azalea Town in 20 episodes, but who knows? Who knows? Maybe we'll get that green apricorn over to Kurt and then come back <laughs> and check on it. Yo, what I don't understand is why did they code the game like this? You know what I mean? Like this, I, I mean, I guess the, the whole idea of gym leaders having stronger Pokemon based on like where you start out, you know, I guess that came later. And I guess ultimately, oh, chill, 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 Ben, Ben Hameen, help us out, Ayutame. I guess that whole notion, oh my God, hold up, who's taking, it's supposed to be you. Oh no, I healed the wrong person. Oh no. <sighs> I don't think I've had a another lock death that made me feel more defeated than this one right here I was just talking about this goddamn controller and the button sticking and it's <sighs> I keep losing Pokemon to Golem <laughs> Why is this Pokemon the bane of my existence? I love you! <laughs> like, I fought to use a golem on the team. What the fuck? I did go to heal him. Honestly, I probably could have... I... <sighs> I think I opened the menu to swap to Ben Hameen. And then I closed the menu and went to heal. And then when I opened the menu through the healing selection, it was already on Ben Hameen. So I clicked up on the controller, but this whole fucking controller just sticks. So it didn't move, and I healed Ben Hamin, because that's where the arrow started. And unfortunately, Seven passed away. 
so happy to have all this buff on the team too and now look what the fuck happened and to add insult to injury we got a crit not that i honestly think it matters but why 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 is it even necessary why <sighs> Seven, bro. That was not right. That was not right. I don't care what you say. That was not right. He did not deserve that. Xavier, bro, we haven't seen you in a while. Get your long nose ass up here. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. I will take it. What is that, number three? Blue has the most insane team that we have fought so far. What the fuck? His team is but Scizor, Dragonite, Blastoise, Weezing. Yo, this dude is the greatest gym leader that has ever lived. Ever. Oh, he's clearing stat changes? He is the greatest gym leader ever. Yo, that was a crit. Yo, I kind of want this Weezing to stay in because I'm pretty sure I can belly drum on him again. Even if he... Well... There's gonna be one thing that will stop us from belly drumming. I don't wanna say it. <laughs> I'm thinking it, but I don't wanna say it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Perfect. Good, 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 good. He's gonna click it again. I know he's gonna click it again because I'm gonna heal right now. You little whore, bro. You little whore. Smoke screen? No, we're not doing this, bro. We're not doing this, bro. We're not doing this, bro. I thought it, but I didn't say it. I thought it, but I didn't say it. I thought it, but I didn't say it. But Benny's got it. I know Benny's got it. I know Big Benny's got it. I know Big Benny's got it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's bananas. It is only when it matters. It is only when it matters. <sighs> it was a crit explosion too. If only I had a Steelix. If only I had a Steelix. Hey, we're level 40. Oh, you wanna learn slam, bro? Come on. Yeah, let's go ahead and get rid of a uh, tackle. <laughs> So he still has two more Pokemon, right? What the fuck are we supposed to do? I'm so upset about Benny.